Chu Xian, your misbehavior has brought shame to the family from now on. You've been evicted from the ancestral family house. Is it, is this my destiny? Three days ago, I was a successful lecturer who was admired by thousands of people. Hear the applause. Two days ago, I transmigrated here and became the 13th young master of the Chu family of the three great families in the state of Qing. I was expelled from my ancestral home just now because of a sneeze at the banquet. To this abandoned house on the edge of the Chu family's land. God, save me. Who is it? God in the fairy? Goddess? Oh no. Oh no. The wind blew the tablecloth. Thirteenth young master, help me. Butler uncle? I have already asked the servant to prepare the furniture, and I will send it over in a while. Thirteen young master, you can eat first. Thank you, butler uncle. You are still good to me. Hey! Thirteen young master. The master has had a problem with you for a day or two. You don't know how to pay more attention. This time the master is really angry. Just stay here for a while. Wait for the master to calm down. Uncle, why does grandpa hate me so much? This, this has to start with your father. Your father is the third oldest in the family. He had always been doted on and had been the most outstanding talent in that generation. He was the master's favorite son. If there was no accident, he would have been the head of the Chu family, but he did not listen to the master when it comes to marriage. After privately marrying a folk woman, that is, your mother, your father began to have a bad relationship with the master. Shortly after you were born, he took your mother away from the Chu family and disappeared. Till now, we don't have any news about them. What a bloody family plot. Thirteenth young master, there is still something to do in the main house. I will go back first. The servant who cleans up the yard will be here in a while. Thirteenth young master, the house is cleaned inside and out. The furniture is also arranged. Wow. Awesome. You have worked hard. We have to go back to the housekeeper. Goodbye. I did not expect. It's such a delight to clean up this yard. Ding. You've stayed at home for a day. The system rewards you with indestructible body technique. What? Who's talking? System? Is it really true? The system reward range has been bound to the entire courtyard. During the stay at home, the system will increase the reward level according to the accumulated time at home. However, once one leaves, the records would be reset and the score would have to be recalculated. Is there such a good thing? No need for daily tasks? The rewards have been distributed today, and we look forward to seeing you next time. Shit. Nanny. Um? What time is it? The sun is so big. It seems like I had a strange dream. What? Who put this here? This, this, isn't it a dream? The indestructible body technique is the top defense technique of the mortal realm. The mortal realm is the basic realm of cultivation, which is divided into three stages, body refining, meridian opening, and chi gathering. Only by breaking through the mortal gate and stepping into the profound realm could only truly begin their path of cultivation. Above the mortal realm were the profound realm, spirit realm, void realm, unity realm, true realm, emperor realm. In this way, my current body should be in the mortal stage, so the system will reward me with this exercise. Anyway, I have to stay at home and practice. Chi sinks into the Dantian and concentrates on three inches and two-point division of Governor's Vein. Fortunately, I learned some Meridian knowledge when I talked about health before, otherwise, I wouldn't understand it. Phew, I didn't feel tired at all. Instead, feeling better. It seems that the exercises in this world can really be practiced, but still have to work and rest. Let's take a pill to make up for it. 
The first day is the exercise. The second day is the chi gathering pills. I wonder what the third day reward will be? Congratulations. You have been home for three days, and the system will reward you with a phantom dagger. Nice. It's a pity it's a little smaller for chopping vegetables. Congratulations, you've been home for four days. The system rewards the exercise, Dragon Python Spirit Fist. Wild Snake Mane. Golden Snake Independence. So tired. With this attack and one defense techniques, self-defense will be not be a problem in this world. But, I should still learn about the history here. Otherwise, it will be embarrassing if you can't catch up with other people's words. The Qin Kingdom was one of the nine countries of the southern region. The Qin Kingdom had once been a strong dynasty. In the end, it had perished under the joint efforts of the Qin, Chu, He, and Zhao families. Now the Qin state is governed by the Qin family as a royal family, and the four great families are jointly governed. Thirteenth brother. Hmm? This voice, Chu Yun? Thirteenth brother. How are you? Sister Yun? Isn't there a servant to deliver the meal? Why are you here? I could have come long ago. Since the thirteenth brother was demoted, the trivial matters at home have been constant until today, and since I have time, I decided to visit thirteenth brother. Sister, you don't have to trouble yourself. Wait, I'll get you a chair. Thirteenth brother, you have to bear with it for a while. When grandpa's anger subsides, I'll go and beg grandpa to let you return to the ancestral home. Oh no. You don't need to do that. I like this home. You don't have to beg. Today's food is so delicious. I don't know if it's because I have Sister Yun to accompany me. Sure enough, it's still my old thirteenth brother. Accept any injustice. The optimist who does not compete with the world. Not at all the arrogance like other noble sons. But a little more humane. Thirteenth brother, I'll go and beg grandfather. He'll definitely agree. He won't be angry with me. Don't worry. She must have thought I was being polite to her. Ding. You have been home for five days. The system rewards you with the cultivation base for one year. This feeling. True chi is rising in the body. Could it be I have reached profound realm? Huff, it's the fourth time. Still stuck there. You can't raise your breath again once you reach it. It seems to be the right place to reach profound realm. However, although the breath cannot be improved, the mental power is getting stronger and stronger. I can faintly feel a closed door getting closer and closer to me. And this feeling is gradually clearing up. Phew. No rush, no rush. It's only a few days. Ding. You've been home for five days. Congratulations on obtaining the secret book, The Bewitching Technique. Another spirit technique. This system is full of tricks. But that's what I want, and the kills are not overwhelming. Hmm. I have mastered the general principles and methods. It's time to practice. It's a pity. This courtyard is empty expect me. But, although I can't practice mind control, I can try. Or a search. Everything has a spirit. Although no one is there, there should be many things with life nearby. All living beings this feat should be able to perceive. Got it. Wherever my true chi can reach, I can sense even outside the confines of the compound. Flower. Bird. Fish and worms. More birds. This. It seems I shouldn't use it randomly. Seeing something irritating to the eyes hurts me. Thirteenth young master. It's time to eat. Um, it seems a little early today. And, it's usually two people. How can I feel the anger of only one person now? He he. Thirteenth young master. Please eat. Oh. Thank, wait. This meal.
poisonous goose eggs. There's really something fishy. Then don't blame me. I'll take you as my first test subject. Who asked you to come today? It was the order of the head butler. Humph, I had given you a chance. If you don't want to tell the truth, then I'll see for myself. Uh, ah. Uh, tell me, who asked you to come here? I'm a cultist. No one asked me to come here. I just saw an opportunity to control you and gain the favor of the heretic elders. That is why I came here. Cult. The minions of the evil imperial court. Evil Imperial Court The Evil Imperial Court is a very special country in the southern region. Everyone in its territory practiced evil arts, and not many laws were enforced within the country. Every day, evil cultivators would fight and devour each other in order to become stronger. Because of the popular customs, there are not many people here, but their strength should not be underestimated. Among them, the evil king's lineage is even more terrifying, and it is a treat to the entire southern state. Apart from the evil imperial court, cults are spread all over southern region and are mixed among the people, so it's hard to tell them apart. Although the strength of the cult in the district is not enough to shake the Chu family, it would be very dangerous if the evil imperial court was behind it. Although I don't care about these things, if the Chu family is really targeted by the evil imperial court and the city gate catches fire, it will definitely bring disaster to my fish pond. So, are you really acting on your own? No one instructed you? Of course. Although you have been demoted, you are after all the direct line of the Chu family. If we control you, we will have the opportunity to control the Chu family. Such a good opportunity, if I tell others, how can I credit? I have been in Chu family for many years, waiting for such an opportunity. Phew. That's okay. After all, he can't tell a lie since he is under my bewitching technique. Although there is no danger for the time being, it is still necessary to remind Grandpa how to do it. Damn it! With the golden bell hood, there is nothing I can do. But, how can I let the Chu family know that he is a cult? Although the dragon python spirit fist can kill him in one blow, but the traces left on the corpse will reveal my strength. Once exposed, I will definitely be recalled to my ancestral home. System and yard secrets can no longer be used. Long live the evil king. Here we go. Damn it! Keeping him will cost my life. Kill him. Destroy my secret. What a dilemma. If this continue, he will break this. Thirteenth young master. It's time to eat. Just in time. God is helping me. Love live the evil king. What? Evil king? There are cultists? Thirteenth young master should is in danger. Let's check it out. Young master, are you all right? Thirteenth young master. Ah. Kill. Well done. As long as someone sees it, the news will go back to the Chu family. Next. Die for the evil king. It's time to find a home for this one. Thirteenth young master, we are here to help you. Damn cultists. Wah. Help. Help me from this monster. Shit. He is really trash. I don't want to save him at all. What a waste. I would never want to admit that I knew him if he was out there. Wah. Don't chase me. Kill. Don't do it. Thirteenth young master, don't be afraid. We are here. Let's take him back to the master. Oh no. You knocked out yourself? The thirteenth young master has never been disappointing in terms of disappointment. Let's get him back first. Call the doctor to check the injuries of the thirteenth young master. Um, okay. Done. I successfully fooled them. I can't collapse just from that. Next, just in case, I should do this. Sorry. Cultists. 
Although what you did to me is not a crime worthy of death, but as a member of the cult, I'm afraid that you have done more than this one evil deed. And your spirit is already ruined. Leaving your life is also a waste. Let me free it for you. That way, you too can my secrets a secret. Ding. On the sixth day, the system will reward a box of great profound pills. Great profound pills. It is an auxiliary medicine pills for breaking through the profound. It's time to break through to the profound gate. I must succeed this time. Rubbish. What a waste. My son Chuluo was so heroic. How could he give birth to such a loser? Family head Chu Tianming can't even handle a cultist. Instead, make a fool of yourself. Fine. There are also talented people among the youths of my Chu family. Not like that trash. Young Master Chu Ching. Thirteenth brother. Sister Yun. You came. It's so nice to have you, Sister Yun. I can talk with someone while eating. Since you don't want to go back to your ancestral home, so I can only find time to see you. You are here alone. We always can't take care of you, like the cultist yesterday, how dangerous he was. Thirteenth brother, you have to be more careful in the future. Sister Yuan is worrying too much. That little thief. I heard that someone was so frightened that he crashed into the wall. Thirteenth brother, are you okay? I was just kidding. Drink some water. Hey, almost exposed. The waste persona cannot fall. Fortunately, I choked. So lucky. Oh yeah, 13th brother, grandpa is going to hold a family competition. Competition? Yeah, grandpa suddenly called everyone to announce the event. Big brother, there is no restriction on bloodlines. As long as they work in the ancestral home, they can participate. Even servants and craftsmen can participate. All can participate? I'm afraid it's not just for the purpose of fighting. Sister Yuan, come with me. Um? What's the matter, Thirteenth Brother? Thirteenth Brother, this. Uh, yes, it was left to me by my father, and I asked someone to move it here. It's a good medicine pill. Look, how many boxes are there? Oh. Uncle is really amazing. Thank you, Thirteenth Brother, for the medicine pill. Ha ha. You're welcome. A contest where servants and craftsmen can also participate. The purpose can only be to find out the cult undercover in the ancestral home. It seems Grandpa thinks the same as me. A cockroach appears, indicating that there is more than one cockroach in the house. Ding. System daily rewards, a box of spirit-nourishing pills. Spirit-nourishing pills. The cult thing has come to an end for now. I should step up and break through. Damn. Winner has been decided. Both sides stop. The winner of the 13th match is Miss Chu Yun. Ha ha ha. Good. Yuner. Great improvement in just few days. My Chu family is getting stronger. Thank you, Grandpa, for the compliment. The 14th match will begin. Players from both sides, please come and prepare. Gardner Ding Xiuqian against. Young Master Chu Qing. Young Master, the florist chooses to hold a weapon. Please choose a weapon. No need. I'll take care of him like this. He he. Exactly what I want. If I can directly abolish the rising star of the Chu family, I don't have to go undercover. I can just go back and ask the evil king for credit. No more pretending. It's showdown. Die. You bastard. It's evil power. Chinger is in danger. Sure enough, there are cult undercover agents lurking. May I ask who is your master? From there did you learn this? A gardener do not possess such skills. What? This young boy has such power. He's a cultist. Protect the young master. Catch him. Wait. The competition is not over yet. No one is allowed to enter the ring. Ah. Oh. No. Ah. Be honest. 
Don't move. Ding Xiuqian fell off the ring, so the winner is Young Master Chu Qing. Big brother, are you okay? I don't know there were more cultists. Thirteenth brother was almost killed by them last time. Sister Yun, thank you for your concern. I'm fine. Do not worry. That's right, thirteenth brother. It's hard for him to be alone in courtyard. He also encountered the cultists. If not for his reminder, I'm afraid that the ancestral home will also be subject to misfortune in future. After the competition, I must go visit 13th brother. Who still doesn't work. The profound realm is really bottlenecked to break through. It's really not that easy to break through. Ding. Today's rewards have been generated. One copy of Dust Assimilation Technique. Please check it. Good. I'm also tired. I can't break through. Let's see what's today reward. It can hide one's aura and could be used to become the same as the surroundings. It turned out to be used for hiding one's aura. But no one cares if I don't hide my aura. Never mind. Just practice to relieve boredom. Anyway, I won't be able to break through the profound realm for a while. Thirteenth brother. Ah. Uh, Sister Yun, why is she so early? Sister Yun, morning. Thirteenth brother, I'm here to say goodbye to you. What? Goodbye. I see. You have also broken through the profound realm. According to the regulations of the ancestors, you can go down the mountain for training. This is a good thing. This is also thanks to thirteenth brother's medicine pill. That's right. The big brother said that he wanted to see you. After the competition work over, he will come. Sister Yuan has gone down the mountain. No one will accompany me to talk and eat in the future. It's just goodbye for those who are ecstatic. Today's reward is Thunder Rolling Finger Condensing spiritual power into thunder and gathering at your fingertips, it can increase its power as the realm improves. It looks good. Sister Yun said goodbye and made me feel lonely. Long night, no heart to sleep. I'll just practice all night. Collecting aura at the nodes, condensing into electricity, gathering electricity into thunder. In front is the ancestral land of the Chu family. It looks like it's here. Chu Chiolua's trash son lives in this yard. He he. It takes no effort to get it. Let's go. Noise? No one should be coming. I started to break through after training the thunder rolling finger. You cannot forcibly interrupt the process of breaking through, otherwise the meridians will be destroyed. So late? Could it be Sister Yun? No way. Even a servant wouldn't come at this hour. No more thinking. I have to concentrate. I don't care even if it's the king of heaven. Be careful. You go set up the spirit ceiling net. I'll go to the house to find someone. Got it. No problem. Um. There is fire. Haven't slept yet. Breath flowing at high speed. There is no movement. Is this... Is he having breakthrough? Isn't Chu Chiluo's son a waste? How has he reached the point of breaking through the profound? Brother, done. What's going on in the house? He seems to be breaking through the profound. Profound? That trash? Humph. Let my poison dart see if he has a real breakthrough or a fake one. No. If you suffer an attack during the breakthrough, you will be stupid at light or dead at worst. He is an important hostage for us to persecute the Chu family in the future. We can't kill him yet. Got it. I'm glad you've thought of everything. What? Why is there no movement? The breakthrough was not successful. Not only is there no movement, but now I can't even feel the aura. As if no one was ever here. Humph. Pretending to be a ghost. Let me see. Lee Fan. Don't be impulsive. 
Chew family trash. Are you there? If you're here, don't you know how to come out and welcome the two grandfathers? Lee Fan. Uh, uh. Disrespectful words. Noisy. Disturbing the quiet. Who the hell are you? Come out and fight. Bastard. Who I am. Of course I am the master here. You came to my house uninvited in the middle of the night. Shouldn't you introduce yourself? And now you're asking me who I am. Are you polite? You, are you a human or a ghost? Why can't I feel any aura from you? Humph. It's okay to tell you since you are going to die. Dust assimilation technique, have you heard of it? Dust assimilation? You said you can't feel my aura. Anyway, you have arranged the spirit ceiling net, and no one can perceive it outside, then I'll let you feel my aura. You can't leave this yard anyway. Even if you know, there is no proof. What? This aura. It's definitely not someone who just broke through the profound realm. Probably already at the upper level of the profound realm. I've answered enough questions. You can think about this in the underworld. Dragon Python Spirit Fist. It was cool. But the aftermath is problematic. How to remove the corpses from the yard? Can't wait until tomorrow to call a servant to clean it up? Should I bury the corpses? I still want to live here. Ding. You killed the cultists who tried to disturb your lifestyle. You are rewarded with a spirit-devouring flower. Spirit-devouring flower. So cruel. So clean. I don't know if I should be afraid or happy. But fortunately this thing recognizes me as its master. After eating a person, the spirit devouring flower can save the memory of the person it eats for a period of time. Then I can read these memories with bewitching technique. Wait. Don't go back yet. She gathers in the two veins, the heart guards the spirit cover. The three souls and seven spirits show up quickly. Third brother. The second one was caught undercover in the Chu family. He may not come back. More than a dozen brothers were arrested by the Chu family. What? Brother Ding. Brother. This is? Poisonous smoke. We will use this. I investigated and the guards here in the ancestral land of the Chu family are the weakest. Let's dive right in from here. We are here. Third brother. Let's go. Okay brother. What a vicious plan. Once the poisonous smoke was released, it would be difficult to completely clean it up. And it could cause lifelong damage to cultivators. They were trying to bring the Chu family down. Fortunately, they did not succeed. Good flower. These two elixir are your reward. Go to sleep after eating. A dozen cultists. Looks like this competition was quite fruitful. But this pissed them off. There may be more retaliatory actions to come. This time, fortunately, the breakthrough was successful at the last minute. Otherwise, although I have broken through, but I feel that the speed of the danger approaching is not slower than the speed of my improvement. In a blink of an eye, I have been living here for more than a month. The system has rewarded countless medicine pills. There are also several top-grade treasures. But these external things are not the biggest gain. The important thing is, my inside view appeared. Since breaking through the profound, I can see my inside view. The beginning was just darkness. I didn't even realize it was my interior scene. Slowly, a ray of light began to appear. And it get brighter and brighter over time. Finally filling the whole space. Then something started to appear. It was like a grain of sand. And now, it's already a grain of sand. 
Yesterday's reward was this book of Immovable Mountain Technique, which is both a physical defensive technique and a divine soul defensive technique. It can just improve the practice of interior scenes. Every arrangement of the system is very scientific. It seems like it can read my mind. Even better than I know how far my cultivation has reached. This is an extremely powerful defensive technique, even when one reached the Emperor realm. It came just in time. I don't have to fear of revenge and backlash from the cult. Family head. Family head. A letter came from bottom of the hill through the pigeon. What? Stuart Sue has. Barry Stuart Sue generously. Support his family. Any other news? About a dozen people in the Chu family's juniors have been injured, and the list is still in the verification and statistics. Damn cult. The crime is unforgivable. This time, my Chu family as the vanguard united with the three major families of Qing to attack the cult. Now the Great Zhou Kingdom and the Purple Moon Kingdom have also joined. Let's see how much longer they can run wild. Thirteenth Brother Sister Yun You're back so soon? Yes. I miss Thirteenth Brother, so came back early. I brought Thirteenth Brother a pot of good tea from the bottom of the mountain. Try it now. I am not thirsty, Sister Yun. What happened down the mountain? Tell me now. You can't drink it if it's cold. Drink now. Drink now. Ah. Sister Yoon. Don't. Sister Yoon. No. Sister Yoon. Ah. It scared me. It was a dream. I was practicing, wasn't it? When did I fall asleep? Huh? Wait, why is my face so wet? And it has a bad smell. Meow. Ah, who are you? Ding. The system detects that you are prone to depression and you need to relieve your mental stress. System will reward you with a pet, a heavenly spirit cat, to relieve your stress. It sounds nice. You are afraid of me being depressed, not afraid that I'll be scared to death? I'm not against pets. But this guy pissed on my face the first day. I have to train him well so it won't happen again. Meow? After a few days of cultivation, my interior is no longer a grain of sand and like a small piece of land. And it is no longer the texture of sand, but fertile soil. But apart from this little land, it was still empty. A vast space that spreads infinitely. Holy shit! I just said there's nothing here. But, what is this? Could there be UFOs in the interior too? And in groups? Sure enough, hundred causes must have consequences. My karma is coming. It wasn't the UFO that broke into the interior. It was reality that entered the interior. I'm warning you for the 109th time. Don't think you can do whatever because you look cute. In the future, when I practice, no. Meow. Uh, forgot to put food for you. Sorry, it's my fault this time. Haha, <laughs> no one is perfect. Meow. Hey, after getting food you really not even glare at me. It's not a reward. It's clearly retribution. Oh? Who is it? The servants never knock on the door. I told them to call me, and if there is no answer... Put down the food and leave it in the courtyard, and assassins won't reveal their presences. I should be on guard while opening. Coming, coming. Thirteenth brother. Long time no see. Are you okay? Big brother? Brother, please drink tea. Thank you, thirteenth brother. Ha ha, Sister Yoon said before that you were coming. I didn't expect it to be today. I'm ashamed. I should have visited you long ago. But I've been so busy with things. If you hadn't discovered the cult this time, the more than 300 people in the Chu family would still be kept in the dark. If any incident happened, the consequences could have been disastrous. Ha ha. I didn't do anything. You're too kind. In fact, this time, I want you to come down the mountain with me. What? 
Down the mountain? Right. Down the mountain. This time, the three major families of Qing, together with the Great Zhou and the Purple Moon, will destroy the cult together. This way, your own safety is guaranteed. Secondly, there are masters, will receive achievements in this. And after that, Grandpa will be happy, and he will remove the punishment from the 13th brother. But, my cultivation is not enough to go down the mountain. 13th brother, as long as you want to go, I can plead with Grandpa, even if I have to issue a military order. I understand Big Brother's kindness, but still feel a little disgraceful. Even if I really go down the mountain, I will shame myself there. You. Shame on me, shame on me. I didn't expect that 13th brother's ambition is so majestic. It was me who underestimated the 13th brother. Thought of these little tricks to excuse you. 13th brother, we may not able to see each other for a few months, so take care of yourself. Brother, you also take care. And also, it's not that Grandpa doesn't like you. Don't hate him. Okay. Big Brother. Phew, it's finally over. Mission successfully. I was so nervous. Chu Ching? Humph. No wonder the two boys never returned. It turned out to be his help. After I get rid of that waste, I'll clean up you also. Now that Chu Ching is gone, I can continue now. Lu Chang, third level of Spirit Realm Vice Sect Leader of the Heretic Cult. Make good use of that trash son of Chu Chiolua. Although he is a waste, but still he is Chu Chiolua's son after all. If he dies, that old ghost Chu Tianming will not feel good, right? What if Chu Chiolua is still alive and returned to the Chu family to find out that his son had been expelled by that old ghost Chu Tianming, which resulted in his son being killed by the cult? Would he still be able to stay peacefully in the Chu family? Perhaps, he might even fall out with that old ghost Chu Tianming. Although Chu Chiolua's son had been expelled, if he wanted to return to the ancestral home, the servants would not dare to stop him, right? Even if he could not return to the ancestral home, releasing poisonous smoke outside the ancestral home could still affect the Chu family's ancestral home. What a good opportunity. Humph. Third level of spirit realm is indeed not something to brag about. It shouldn't even be the cultivation level of a vice sect leader. But if we talk about the concealing, then I am not modest. Even a fifth-level expert in the spirit realm cannot detect my movements. This is the reason why I was promoted to the position of vice-sect leader. It is no exaggeration to say. If I want, then no one able to discover me for three years. But it looks like there are no guards in this yard. I don't need to use stealth. Hee hee. Let's get started. Transforming Chi into a ghostly rope. Ah! Help! What a monster! Hee hee! How can a loser escape from the grasp of my chi binding rope? It's totally impossible! Huh? Why is this guy getting thinner and thinner? Could it be he is using bone shrinking technique to escape? Shit! What is going on? Blow up? It doesn't make sense! What kind of technique is this? He should be in Qi Gathering. He escaped from a third level spirit realm cultivator. How can that waste? Meow. This little paw was terrifying. Don't blame the vice sect leader. The kitten slaps the face really fast. Meow. If one day it falls on my head, I'm afraid I can only admit defeat. Now what should I do with him? Should I hand him over to the Chu family? There is a risk of exposing myself that way. In that case, it is better to kill him. Flower. Come out to work. Good job. Now let's take a look at his memories. A vice sect leader. I have been lurking in the Chu family for more than a month and I have gathered some information. All the information I have collected is in this letter. Very good. 
as expected of our man. Keep lurking. This poisonous smoke is the material deployed by the headquarters last month. You two use it carefully. Thank you, Vice Sect Leader. This Chu family ancestral home is some kind of dragon's den. How come there's no news from them? I'll go and see for myself. It turns out that they all belong to the same group who came to me before, absolutely, it's all fate. Well, they all are destroyed by me. But this cult is too monotonous. Even the vice sect leader only has the poisonous smoke. You killed a heretic who tried to destroy your secluded lifestyle. You've been rewarded with a soul seed seal. The land in the interior is getting bigger and bigger, and there have been irregular changes. Maybe this is because I have practiced more complicatedly recently. But other than that, there is nothing else. It means that there is still a lot of room for me to improve my cultivation. However, I can clearly feel the enhancement of spiritual power. I have recently obtained two new techniques, but there is no way to experiment with the soul seal. Imperial sword art is a high-grade imperial martial art. It is said that if you can enter the emperor's realm early, you can rest easy even if there are evil cults coming to attack again. Although the road is far away and seems endless, I will continue until I reach my target. He he he. What happened to Lu Chang? Why is there no movement at all? Was he discovered and killed by the Chu family? Impossible. The Chu family did not have any fights. Then what happened? Lu Chang hasn't done any movements. Did he betray us? Impossible. Who will accept the people of our cult? Betrayal will not end well. I think Lu Chang might be waiting for a chance to release the poisonous smoke into the core of the Chu clan. Master, the Chu family is too deceitful. We should report to the royal court and make them send strong men. If we let the Chu family bother the king's court, are we not useless then? Will the king's court still value us? The Chu family is really deceiving people too much, so inform Lu Chang. Don't keep waiting for an opportunity. Act now. Chu Qing, the rising star of the Chu family's generation, is in charge of this action against our cult. That old devil, Chu Tianming, wanted to use my cult to sharpen his younger generation, but I didn't know if Chu Qing died, what would happen to the old devil. Tell them to find Chu Qing's location, and I will personally take his life. I do not know where Lu Chang is now. He is acting alone again, but this time there is no means to contact him. The only way is to use the messenger bead, although it can be used only once, but now is the time. It's just that, this bead is a single-use item, although it can confirm that the message has been sent, we will not receive a timely response. Brother Lu, please act quickly when you receive the message. Oh. You came just in time when I was feeling hungry. How timely. Is there a happy occasion at the ancestral home today? The food seems to be richer than usual. Oh. By the way, young master, you don't know yet, do you? The eldest young master led the clan down the mountain to eliminate the cultists and did a great victory. I can't tell you how happy the master is today. There is also a banquet in the ancestral house to celebrate. Great victory? So fast. Lu Chang may be dead. Really? Dot, but at least that means he did not betray us. That's not the point. But until now, there has not been any fights in the ancestral land of the Chu family. That's enough. Do not care about Lu Chang. The joint campaign by several major families has greatly weakened our cult. A total of one stronghold and four virtual realm elders were lost. Point one of them is the elder of my Chu County branch. Half of the losses were caused by the Chu family. It seems that their strength should not be underestimated. Let's not take any action against the Chu family for the time being. Report the Chu family's actions to the evil king. Let the evil court take care of them. Our guns can be turned to other families first. What? The ancestral home of the He family was infiltrated by cultists? Yes. Poisonous smoke and fire were released into the family's ancestral land. 
one-third of the area was destroyed. The herbs in the fields that used to make elixirs were also ruined. Hundreds of people were killed and injured. Who would have thought that three days ago we were celebrating? The cult's revenge came so quickly. Duh, all the descendants near the ancestral land have returned. The ones who are farther away are already on their way back. Good. Remember to strengthen patrols and guard posts. The Chu family must not repeat the mistakes of the Yi family. Yes, sir. Fifteen additional sentry posts have been added to the ancestral grounds, and patrols of the ancestral home have been changed from every three hours to every two. Good job. Where is Chu Qing now? The eldest young master took the lead in the cleanup campaign and went to Bohuai country, which is far away from the ancestral land. He is still on his way back. By the way, several virtual realm elders in the clan are traveling with the young master, so there should be no accidents. Okay, then I'll be relieved. There is just one thing I can't understand yet. The target of the cult was clearly the Chu family. Why didn't the cult come after us? Instead, they went after the Yi family. Could it be? They won't retaliate against our family, right? Don't worry, young master. Now most of the masters have returned, and it's not so easy to make a sneak attack. Moreover, the gains from this cleanup were also great. We killed some and captured some of them alive, and up to four to three of their cult forces escaped, making their losses up to 60%. The foundations of the cult in Qing were already shaken. Oh, Big Brother is really amazing. It seems that no one will bother me anymore. We are safe. Yes, young master. Looks like it's over for now. Six months later. Meow. Damn it. Ha ha ha. Blackie failed again. Meow. No. I let it go on purpose. Humph. Blackie. Although I didn't open my eyes. But in the past six months, I have reached the virtual realm. Movements within a radius of a hundred miles can be perceived by my mind. So don't lie to me. Huh. What? Oh. Dear Way. If love is poison, you are my antidote. Without you, I would die. You are bad. I was a lonely iceberg, but you set me on fire. I hate that. I was a scared bird, but you made me feel safe. Disgusting. Shit. This is fucking expired dog food. Seeing him like this hurts my eyes. He makes me sick. Way. You are the cleaning cloth and I'm dirty water. I'm sure to be attracted to you. Just go away. Hee hee. If something is meant to happen, then why don't we let it happen now? Don't want it. This bullying is too much. Old Seven knew I was in confinement here. And yet, he still came here under my nose to disgust me. Then you can't blame me for being ruthless. Go away. Ah, uh, what's wrong? What? What? Hey, is someone here? Where? There's nothing? He. Did you just make me feel the pain of love? What? That's not important. Let's continue the sweetness of love. Shame on you. Holy shit. Is he numb? How can he be as cheap as a mule? Way. Let's bring our hearts closer together. Don't let this barrier stand in the way. Oops. Vomit, 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 vomit. I can't take it anymore. You guys forced me to do it. Ding. You've been here for six months. You've been rewarded with the Tianji Blade Sutra. Keep up the hard work and keep digging for fun. That's good. I'm no longer afraid that I'll be bored if I get insomnia at night. What? Elder Chu Yueshing has fallen? Elder Yueshing is a master of the Void Realm. He is also top in the Chu family. How can he? 
All because of Black Moon House, they revealed the whereabouts of the elders. Black Moon House. There it is. I should take this opportunity to snoop around. Isn't this Black Moon House a minion of the cult? Why are they selling us out? Don't you know, young master? In fact, we also buy cult information from the Black Moon House. Everyone knows that the Black Moon House has a black heart, but as it is too mysterious and powerful and its influence spread throughout the southern state, no one knows where its headquarters is. Thus no force or dynasty would ever dare to attack the Black Moon House. Does the Chu family have any countermeasures for this? The Chu family recalled all of their descendants to the ancestral home to prevent themselves from being assassinated by the cult. Moreover, the Qin royal family, together with our family, negotiated with the Black Moon House, paying them a certain price so that the Black Moon House would not accept commissions from the evil sect in the near future, and would make us the first to receive the information in case of an attack by any powerful person from the evil court. Now that the Qin family has a plan to deal with the situation, there will be no need to worry about a sudden attack from the evil sect. Then I can stay at home and cultivate. Ding. You have been cultivating at home for seven months. You are rewarded with a small five-element formation and a formation array. It turned out to be a formation. The only one who can set up a formation in the South State is a true realm powerful cultivator. I am still trying to master my cultivation. It's just that the lower the cultivation level, the weaker the formation that is laid out and the weaker the formation that is made. Let me try it out. The strength of this formation can trap, or kill, even if it is in the realm of harmony. As long as the attacker is not above the fourth level of the realm of conformity, there is no need to be afraid. I've been here for seven months, and I'm getting closer to the one-year period. A year's reward will definitely be beyond the emperor's scriptures. I guess, at worst, it will be at the level of the heavenly scriptures. What? Chu Qing was attacked by three elders of the evil sect and a vice master and was heavily injured by them. It must be someone close to Chu Qing, a spy from Black Moon House. Give me the information of the attack. Let me go and meet the cult myself. The voice is so loud, it seems to be really angry. The fact that they forced Chu Tianming to act, could it be a ploy to make the tiger leave the mountain? They are likely to send the strongest cultists here again. I should be vigilant. I should activate the formation every night, so that even if there is a battle, the noise wouldn't go out. Ding. You've been cultivating for eight months. You are rewarded with a thousand silk spirit nets. Binding and sealing weapons of imperial class? With the spirit net and the formation, even if a strong person at the seventh level of the harmony realm comes, it will be enough for me to make the opponent suffer. Is Chu Chiluo's son living there? Yes. I have a bold idea. Forget about that Chu Chiluo's son, the most important thing is. You say, if I give Chu Chiluo a grandson and the old man of Tian Ming a great grandson, what would happen? Isn't it exciting just to think about it? This woman is so damn evil. If that happens, will the Chu family kill me? Or will they kill Chu Chiluo's son, or Chu Chulo's grandson? And one day, when Chu Chiluo comes back and finds out about it, what would happen? Damn it! I actually felt a little anticipation in my heart. Ahem, now let's get down to business, shall we? Let's not make a big deal out of it. You don't understand. Since we are here, we should hold Chu Chiluo's son in our hands. In case we are exposed, there will also be a hostage. Will Black Moon House sell our actions as information to the Chu family? How could those black-hearted people at Black Moon House sell our whereabouts to the Chu family? They will sell the information to the Chu family only when they suffer a serious injury to sell it at a higher price. That black-hearted Black Moon House provoked many troubles in secret in order to maximize its profit. Humph, another deadly cult is here. Can't you bypass me? Why are you targeting me? There are two strong men at the level of the virtual realm. It seems that this operation has cost a lot of money. So handsome, as expected of Chu Chiluo's son. 
What? This woman with a colorful face and that ugly guy are cultivating evil skills and making people afraid? Little boy, come with me. I will love you very much, and I will definitely give you a big fat body. Damn it. You are a pervert. Go to hell, old witch. Disgusting. Terrible. How old is he? Escape. I must escape. This woman died for sure. The mission was not completed, but she was caught in a second. Array? Is there a strong man here? How is it possible? Could it be that Chu Chiolua has returned? In that case, let's use poisonous smoke. What? How does it taste? I guess it's terrible. You've come to disturb me over and over again. It seems that you cultists want to die. Soul Seal. What is this? It was obvious that he had hostility in his heart and wanted to kill me. But now, there is no hostility, no desire to resist. Does this kind of soul seal allow me to feel his state all the time? And it seems to be possible to use the soul seal as a medium to send a ray of one's own spiritual will into the body and roam freely. I don't know if it's a violation of the house's requirements for the spiritual will to leave the courtyard. It is better not to risk leaving. If I violate the requirements, it would be a waste of this long stay. What is your purpose in coming here? In order to cause damage to the Chu family, the evil cult brought us wisp of poisonous magic smoke to contaminate the area, which is extremely difficult to eliminate. Once people below the profound realm inhale the magic smoke, they will become confused and fall into madness. Once the servants of the Chu family land are seriously injured or killed, it would definitely be a big loss. The cult was really ruthless this time. It brought the poisonous magic smoke which is extremely difficult to make. In that case, return to the cult's lair, release the poisonous magic smoke, do a sneak attack to the cultists, kill as many as you can, and never reveal everything about the Chu family. This is the third time we've moved, and it's not over yet. You shouldn't have come to this cult if you wanted to be comfortable like a cow or a horse. It's not as comfortable here as those famous sex. We're not cows or horses. The agents at Black Moon House are living beasts. If our location was revealed to those old men of the Chu family, will we be able to survive? What the hell? You can discuss it in private, but I'm still here. You think I'm already dead or something? What is the matter with the Chu family? Wait until the two come back, then we will see. The vice patriarch of the Qing cult is here. Purple Moon House cultist patriarch is also here. Oh, dear. What brings you two here? The helmsman's welcome is so warm. The two of us were just passing by and came to celebrate with you. Vice patriarch of Qing? Wang Tu? What are you doing here? Well, I heard that Zhu Chang and Zhu Yan had gone to the Chu family and you were waiting to hear the news from them. The vice patriarch and his guardian are such big officials, but they still have to come and listen to the news themselves. The cult is really a place for cows and horses. The helmsman's men are really straightforward. Ah, there are not many of such men nowadays. Killing one more will not make them less. I'm sorry, gentlemen. Helmsman, we haven't heard from Zhu Chang and Zhu Yan yet. Although it's been a while, but Chu Chiluo's older son is not there, so it should not be a big problem. In fact, I am more concerned about why the Patriarch of the Purple Moon is here than about them. It's also because of this matter. Do you know that the Purple Moon cult has suffered heavy losses recently? Your Honor, why don't you tell us more? Because of that old devil Chu Tianming, I lost an entire branch of the Purple Moon cult. The helmsman who was at the fourth level of the virtual realm, and is my brother, and many of his elders, none of them survived, all fell. How could that be? Unlike Qin, which is ruled by four families, the royal family of the Purple Moon is very strong. After the last incident with the Chu family, the royal family of the Purple Moon cult gathered its strength for the first time in order to befriend the Qin cult, but they struck a thunderous blow to the Purple Moon cult. Brother Wang Tu, 
How about we join forces to kill that old devil Chu Tianming? No way. If it wasn't for the strong realm of Chu Tianming, killing him would be just a dream. The patriarch may not be clear about the situation in Qin, but there is only one strong person in Qin, and this strong person is still in the Qin family, and we cannot use him. Damn it! If I don't kill him, I'll have to take half of his life, and I'm prepared. This is... Magic smoke. Exactly, even if I can't kill that old man, I'll make him lose his flesh. It is better to wait a little longer, when Zhu Chang and Zhu Yin come back. Elder Zhu Chang is back. Why are you the only one back? Where's Zhu Yin? And what about the Chu family? What's wrong with this guy? Helmsman, we have found an important information. I have come back to report. In case there is a change of plans, Zhu Yin is still lurking in the Chu family. That's not the case. Gone. Helmsman, quickly noticed that there's something wrong. Zhu Yin is lurking? Her face reflects light at night, Helmsman. Open your eyes. Look at me. Just now the Vice Patriarch noticed something was wrong with me, Vice Patriarch. It's up to you. Find out what's wrong with me. Yes, he is really not right. Great, Vice Patriarch. Helmsman, your man must have a stomachache. Elder Zhu Chang definitely ate something bad. Look, his face is blue. You're too wise, Vice Patriarch. The cult relies on you. Tell us the information. Tell us and go continue working. You guys are working too hard. The Chu family has recently. Damn it, run everyone. It's over. Zhu Chang, you. Zhu Chang. You. Something is not right. You die. What a speed. No, he put magical smoke in my chest. Ha ha ha. What a cult. What a patriarch. You can't even resist a single punch from me. Damn, Zhu Chang, are you crazy? You're going to ruin the Chu County branch. Chu County? A mere county of Chu? Who can defeat me in the whole Qin cult? Ha 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 crazy. Motherfucker. He is crazy. Zhu Chang has gone crazy. Hurry. Kill him. There's no need to panic. The eight evils of Chu County. Zhu Chang, I have brought you up since you were a child, but I didn't expect you to repay me like that. When you pooped your pants, I changed them with my own hands the first time you entered adulthood. I let you choose the girl you liked, so you can't blame me for disregarding you. Master, stop talking nonsense with him. He is already a dead man. I'm going to launch the formation. Take away everyone. So much bullshit, but still can't resist a single move. It's like... There's an ancient comic book in front of me. What is this, brother? How could you do this? He no longer cares about his life. Only attacking without defending, burning his young life to forcibly raise his cultivation. In the end, he will only explode and die. Don't get close to him. Get out. Right. Brother, what did you say? A death sentence? Don't leave me behind. Disciples can belong anywhere. If you want to die, die by yourself. Don't take us with you. Thinking you can catch me, good luck. So many elders couldn't catch me. You think you can. Do it. Brother, I didn't expect it to be you in the end. What the hell? Let go of me before saying anything. You. How about letting him go out first? It's a life or death situation, and you're willing to stay with me. Oh, let me get out of here. Let go of me if you dare. Or I'll show you what Bolt is like. I can't imagine that the vow of living and dying together, not being born on the same day, but to die on the same day, brother was serious about it. There's no vow between you and me. What bad luck. How can you be unreasonable? So how about letting me out first? I feel a little extra. 
The time has come. Brother, it's nice to have you with me. Looks like it's time to move again. I do not have to leave home. Just stay indoors, fight against cults, and be rewarded for 10 years of cultivation. Awesome, Xu Chang. That's it. After breaking through the void realm, it seems that the speed of my growth is slowing down. At this rate, if I stay at home for a year, I can probably get to, still not good enough. I'm afraid it's still not enough to deal with the evil court's top fighters. Damn, not strong enough, Krypton gold pills to power up. I'm going to get stronger and become the number one man in Qin. No way. What? Is there any conflict with the medicinal property? Shit. Why doesn't it stop? Sure enough, I can't eat, talk, or run, so I'd better get some sleep. So quick. This is, hopefully. That old Chu Tianming should be almost the same, right? Well, wouldn't I be one of Qin's top powers? Ha, 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 I really want to have a few more cults. The cults of Chu County are the best. Coming here to eat, eat and sleep. It's been a long time no see. Well, Wang Tu, I came out to greet you in person. This old man really appreciates your visit. That is, that is. That's bullshit. You know what happened to the Chu family. If it wasn't for the information you would sell to me, you'd wring your head off. Master Chu, calm down, calm down. Cough, Wang Tu, you sent me a letter saying that you have important information about the Chu family? Yes. Forget the formalities and make an offer directly. Ha ha ha, Master Chu is really cool. Then I'll be honest, I'll sell it for. One million spiritual crystals. Little bastard. What did you say? Why don't you listen to half of it? If you think it's worth it, then pay. Master Chu knows the magic smoke? This is a half. Go on. I've heard that a cult protector came from Purple Moon Kingdom. Why did you stop? Keep giving it. A full million. Just tell me, traitor. According to accurate information, the cult's guardian has brought the magic smoke from Purple Moon Kingdom. And the cult in Chu County will launch sabotage in the land of the Chu family. That's it? You charge me one million for this? Are you kidding me? Do you think I am stupid? Well, Master Chu, I haven't finished talking yet. If it's just that, I'll be ashamed to take 300,000. The Chu family's defense is tight, and the two of them are not to be feared. I also know it, but this time they are not afraid. This time, the cult got two hidden treasure suits. This information, is it true? Can I sell you a fake information business? If the information is wrong, my Black Moon Tower will not only refund the money, but also pay three times the compensation. In addition, I happen to have one magic weapon to deal with the magic smoke. I don't know about Master Chu. Lord Wan Lu, I'm sorry, but if I find out this hidden treasure suit were sold by the Black Moon Tower in the future, I'm afraid you will never be able to use this three fingers again. I've an urgent matter to attend to, so I'll take my leave. Goodbye, Master. Who the hell happened to be there? This black-hearted Wang Tu absolutely takes both sides. It will be too late to go back now. This is exactly what Wang Tu came up with, to sell two pieces of information for one million. When I'll be free, I'll crush your Black Moon Tower. Chu Xian, I heard that cults ordered some strong people to wreak havoc in Chu County. I was wondering why recently I've seen some elders of the cults next to my broken yard lately. Butlers have been patrolling everywhere lately, and I heard that the cults has obtained a magic weapon that can hide their whereabouts. Is that so? It seems that I should be more careful in the future. Is it a suit worn by the clansmen who patrol, using it to conceal their whereabout? This thing cannot be detected by those below the third level of the Void Realm, and I'm afraid there is no further need to change defenses, Brother Chu Xian. Come back to the ancestral house with me. I will plead to Grandpa. 
Sister Yoon. I'm fine here and the recliner is very comfortable. I won't be going back. I don't want to go back and see Chu Tianming's stinky face. Please forgive me. But. The clan land is not safe. How can it be unsafe? The cult has taken action. This place is so far away from our home. It must be unsafe. The owner of the Black Moon Tower told Grandpa himself. What? The cult branch has been blown up. What else can they do? I heard that there is a big man in the cult who came to Chu County with magic poisonous smoke. That magic poisonous smoke is vicious. If you touch it, you will die or be disabled. When did it happen? Lord Manlu said that he would arrive today. No wonder the housekeeper came out. Damn, why didn't he change the signboard of Hyula to Hyksenlu if Zhu Chang hadn't blown up the Chu County subreddit in time? I'm afraid the clan area would be full of smoke by now. Thirteenth brother. Don't get angry with grandfather and go home quickly. Say something nice to grandpa and he won't leave you alone. With so many groups patrolling the land, what can a cult do? All right. Eh? What are you doing? Then I'll stay here with Brother Thirteen. I'm not going back. Huh? Yun Mei, you are a girl and still too young. Why do you want to live with me? Be obedient. Go back to your home and live. I am fine. So what if the cult's people come and the clan elders were not there? What should I do? It doesn't matter. Nothing would happen. Chu Xian is getting more and more humorous, I hope. What's the matter? Brother Chu Xian can't stay in a safe place obediently and hiding like a kid. This girl really cares about me. Just kidding. How dare I move? I'm not good enough to fight the cults. I can protect myself. You can go back? No, I still have to stay here. It's really comfortable, Chu Xian. Hey! You're getting a little too self-conscious. What a lovely kitten. Brother Chu Xian, is this yours? You're not listening to me at all. Gentlemen, fortunately, the cult has not launched an attack, and we still have time to prepare. Although only some low-level clansmen were arranged to patrol the periphery of the tribe, we still need to pay more attention. We can't just defend. We need to lure the enemy deeper. As long as there is a cult that enters the clan, shoot and kill them, let these bastards know how powerful we are. Um, master, what's the matter? Little Thirteen lives on the edge of the clan now, don't you think? I have asked that girl Chu Yun Mei to go find Chu Xian and come back. If they come back, there is no need to talk. Given his temper, if he didn't back, that's his choice. If he dies in this way, then his life was a waste anyway. Good morning, Thirteen Brother. Why are you up so early? Although I haven't seen any cultists lately, I still have to practice hard. She is at the second level of the profound realm. No wonder the old man loves her so much. Thirteenth Brother? It's Brother Thirteen. You are usually negligent in cultivation. Why do you have such a book? Don't you think about whose yard this is? It was my father who lived here before. Let's practice according to this in the future. This is a good thing left by my father. Then, I'll respectfully accept it. How long has it been? It's been three days. He didn't drink a single drop of water or eat a single grain of rice. He didn't even go to his room. As expected from the family master. Can't you lower your voice here? Do you think I'm deaf? Damn it, either come or don't come. Why is this cult so hesitant in dealing with official matters? It's been three days, three days. Not even a single cultist appears. Shame on you. Do you not have the ability to fight an old man face to face? You are a bunch of cowards. Elders from the virtual realm and above, go out and see what's going on with those idiots of the cult. The old man is really angry. The cult destroyed? According to the Lord, there was internal chaos in the cult. Zhu Chang was responsible for it, and the original site was blown to pieces. 
not to mention the poisonous magic smoke, half of the lives of the guardians of Purple Moon Kingdom were blown up. It is said that Zhu Chang died in an explosion, and his blood and bones smashed all over the guardians. Now the whole guardians are also insane. Master, are you going to compensate the Chu family? Compensation? Compensation is absolutely unacceptable. The wrong information will not only be considered our fault, but will also destroy the reputation of the Black Moon Tower. Don't you want to be promoted in the future? This. You and I don't want to lose the year-end bonus, do we? Well. I heard that the headquarters of the Black Moon House is laying off employees recently. After working for so many years, I will have no worries about eating and drinking for the rest of my life, but you are still young, master. What to do? Well, the solution is up to you. Me? Although this time the information was wrong, but if we use more useful information to exchange with the Chu family, not only will we not have to compensate, but we can also save our reputation. The cult is dangerous, but I still need you to go again, the sooner the better. The old man should soon know about the cult, and I am afraid that the Black Moon House will also take action. I am now in the Combined Realm, and Sister Yun will break through to the third level of the Profound Realm soon, and it will not be easy for the evil sect to invade. If I can gain control of the Black Moon Tower, then I can control everything, but unfortunately I don't have the opportunity right now. Come in. Here's today's meal, young master. This boy. All right, leave it here. I'll leave now. Not that easy, apart from the cult and the Black Moon Tower, how many other forces are there? My lord. My lord. What's the hurry? Did the cult attack us? No, no, it's good news. What? Did you discover anything? There was an explosion on the cult's branch in Chu County, Master. Explosion? Yes. The house was destroyed, the windows were broken, the yard was full of corpses, and the walls were covered with blood. What did the Imperial Examination reveal? Not only did they find traces of the magical smoke release, but also found traces of the helmsman's power and the cult's elder's self-explosion. The cult must have encountered an unexpected for and had no choice but to flee. He confronted the cult branch himself and still defeated it. The first thing you need to do is to get a good idea of who that person is. This person's cultivation must be extremely high, and this way, we no longer have to worry about the problem of magical smoke. Hey! Ha ha! Black Moon House! That black-hearted Wan Chang! Let me see how you will end up. You! Follow me to Black Moon House! Yes! I'd like to see how he's going to pay this much compensation. On the verge of breakthrough. How do you feel? Brother 13, your courtyard is really a treasure land. I feel that I have progressed much faster in my practice here. If you want to break through, you should return to your ancestral home. You can't break through here, and I can't protect you. Can Brother 13 sense my upcoming breakthrough? Nonsense. I am poor at cultivation. If it's not too late, go back. This is a serious matter, and you can't be selfish. By the way, do not let that old devil Chu Tianming see the gong method I gave you. Thinking of him makes me upset. Yes, Brother Thirteen. That's good. Someone is approaching the courtyard. Grandfather? What's this old man doing? Are you an idiot? Can't you even be polite when seeing your elders? You are afraid I'm going to disgrace the Chu family if I don't bow to you. You're too rotten to carve. And you've got a mouth. I think you don't want to go back. Hmm? Yuner, you appear to be on the verge of breakthrough, don't you? Yes, Grandpa. It's all because 13th brother has been taking good care of me these days. As expected of my Chu family's good girl, when Grandfather dies, the Chu family may have to rely on you. I have several brothers older than me, and I look up to my older brothers. The others are okay. But if everyone were like your thirteenth brother, I'm afraid the Chu family is finished. Chiluo would be sorry to be your father if he knew what you were like. What? This strong aura. What do you mean? 
Not good. Although it was only a weak aura, this aura seemed to be the true chi of a strong person in the compound realm. How is that possible? There is no one this strong besides you and Qin. Is it possible? No, maybe it was an illusion. The aura is fleeting. I don't seem to be approaching the master realm anytime soon, so it's not surprising if I get it wrong. I don't understand what you're trying to say, master. This is not something that can be discussed in front of the younger generation, later. I understand. That's all. I still have business to do. Yuner, come with me. We will go to the Black Moon house again. All right. You son of a bitch. Admit that you are wrong and get punished with 50 sticks then you can go back to your ancestral home. No, I'm fine here. Don't bother grandpa. Ha. Thirteenth brother. Fifty already? Grandpa is already giving you a step down. I'll deny that. We don't know who our friends and foes are, so pay a little attention here. Although he's rotten wood, I can't let Chin Luo's bloodline get extinct. Yes, sir. Brother Wan, the information we received from the Black Moon House made me suspicious for the first time. The information can't be wrong, it's just that there must have been an accident with the cult. How could the information be wrong? What are the cult bastards up to? That black-hearted one has cheated me out of a million spirit crystals. Now you must spit out all of the information and pay me three times as much. Let's see if you can get away with it. Sis Brother Wan, the Black Moon House has always been a reliable source of information, but this level of detail? The compensation is small, but the loss of the reputation of Black Moon House will have heavier consequences. Brother Chu, there's an important piece of information about the cult. One million spirit crystals is not expensive, right? One million is not a small amount. Is it really worth a million? They are extremely frugal with their money. What about it? If there is any movement from the evil king's court towards the Qin or Chu families, we will notify Brother Chu as soon as possible, without delay. You bastard, if it weren't for this time, would you delay telling me if there were any changes in the evil court? How could that be? Brother Chu, we at Black Moon House have always been credible. The first vice patriarch of the evil sect and his guardian have already come to Chu County. Brother Chu, isn't this information worth a million spirit crystals? The first vice patriarch is at the peak of level 8 of the Void Realm, and the Guardian is also at level 7 of the Void Realm. What is their precise location? That's another piece of information. Just one piece of information about coming to Chu County is not worth a million spirit crystals, but the information from the Black Moon House is certainly a little faster. But I can guarantee that the Chu family will receive information about the other party's arrival in Chu County within a day. This is where they are currently hiding. Thanks a lot. I'll go first. Now that we know where they are, let us go first and catch them off guard. Vice Patriarch Zhang Kuei. Master, Zhu Chang suddenly went insane, and we have no idea why. Chu County Helmsman Tung Qian, I suspect that it has something to do with the Patriarch of the Purple Moon Cult, but I don't understand the other party's purpose in doing so. What about Zhu Yan? Is she dead or alive? I don't know. The cult has suffered significant losses this time. The Chu family is to blame. The entire Qin cult lost a fifth of its power because of them. How did the Chu family discover the presence of the cult? I don't know. Maybe the Black Moon House gave them that information. The Black Moon House is not that strong, moreover, even if they got that information. For the greater good, how dare they sell the information so easily? Get ready, you will come with me to the Chu family tonight. My lord, the Chu family land is full of strong people, in case. The old man Chu Tianming has already left the clan. How about taking this chance to break into the Chu family? I'm confident that if I go, I'll be able to get out. My lord, you, have you broken through? To the ninth level of the Void Realm. You will accompany me tonight to break into the Chu family. This is the life-saving weapon. The transporting pearl? That's right. Even if we are surrounded by the Chu family elders, within a second, we will be able to escape. 
We can certainly put a lot of pressure on the Chu family as long as we don't stay there and instead just break into the Chu family's territory and return in one piece. This time, the goal is to break into the ancestral home of the Chu family. We don't need to enter. We just need to break into the home to achieve the goal. There ought to be several Chu family elders nearby. How about killing them one by one and going directly to the ancestral house of the Chu family? You are fearless because you are so powerful, but I am not as powerful as you, so why not be cautious? Is that where Chu Chiolua's son lives? It should be. Although his son is a bit of a waste, he is still Chu Chiolua's son, so there may be some benefits if he is under our control. Master, do you mean to include him in our sect? There are two plans. First, control Chu Chiolua's son, help him break through the profound realm, let him return to the ancestral house of the Chu family, and become a pawn of our sect. Second, bring him into the sect, teach him the evil skills, and make him a killing knife of the sect. If Chu Chiolua's son practices evil skills, becomes an evil cultivator, and slaughter indiscriminately, let's see how the Chu family will react. Or, if Chu Chiolua is alive while Chu Chiolua's son is in our sect, someday he will come back. Then we'll let his son go and meet with him for a while to see if Chu Chiolua will kill him. Master, what if Chu Chiolua is not dead and sees that his son has been forced to join the cult and goes crazy and destroys our cult? What are you afraid of? That won't happen. How could he kill his own son? If this happens, he will kill the leader who caused his son to be captured by the sect and forced into the cult. What do you think Chu Chiolua will do when he learns that the old ghost Chu Tianming is to blame? That's right, no matter how you look at it, the cult will not lose. Go, catch Chu Chiolua's son, I will take Chu Chiolua's son away in front of the Chu family and make old ghost Chu Tianming mad. Oh my god. Are all cult members mentally ill? Why do they want to be targeted before they act? I'm not going to leave the yard and I'm not going to stop you from doing anything. But this is the time of your death. You can't blame me. The men are at the ninth level of the Void Realm, which is nothing, but the strength of the visitors has soared again. Maybe next time it will be the strongest person in the realm. Let's try not to kill these two people and benefit from the Soul Seal again. That's him. Do it. Not good. This aura is from the compound realm. The Chu family has a strong man at the level of the compound realm. Who is he? Not good. My spirit is also suppressed. I can't activate the escape bead. You, are you in the compound realm? Master. Meow. Are you cult members mentally ill? Why do you feel the need to target me? Simply because my father's name is Chu Chiolua? Where are they? What happened to Wan Chang? Was the information wrong again? I must get the crystals back. This black-hearted. It's impossible to be a mistake. You must understand that Zhang Kue is a living person, and he must have left when you arrived? There is a certain delay in any information. It cannot always be in time. Did you sell him the information that I was going to murder him? We at Black Moon House are always credible, so if you buy information from us, there must be an interval of more than one day before we can sell your information. Brother Chu, Zhang Kuei suddenly left, and his hiding place must not be far from the Chu family. Don't you want to know where he'll go? I'm going to see the Chu family. If the information is incorrect again, you must provide an explanation. How can the information be wrong? I have always been truthful and reliable, never gave you false information or cheated you. Who are you? Ah, you are at the ninth level of the Void Realm. Your strength is not bad. This man must be a big shot in the cult. If I kill him, they will definitely send a stronger one. I'm in trouble. Even that cat is stronger than me. How could his strength be this bottomless? Zhang Kuei, the Qin cult's first vice-patriarch. Your status is not low. 
By controlling him, the cult wouldn't be able to harass me, and I would be informed of the cult's plans in advance. Don't be afraid. I don't even have the heart to kill a chicken, so why would I hurt you? Anyone who says such things is not a good person. Chu Chiluo also said similar words before, but in the blink of an eye, dozens of cult martial artists were slaughtered. The first vice patriarch, he is valuable, killing him would be a pity. The vice patriarch has value, so it would be a pity to kill him, but what about me? For the next period of time, there will be peace and no more harassment from the cults. Ding! You have subjugated a powerful cultist without leaving home, and you will be rewarded with ten years of cultivation and the heavenly golden pupil. The eye pupils that can see through all illusions and have the ability to see the laws of heaven and earth. I can also project two golden lights from my pupils and kill people with my eyes. I also broke through to the eighth level of compound realm. If there were a few more cult powers. I cannot have a chaotic heart. I must be stable. Only by being stable will I be able to live a long and safe life. I cannot take any risks. Besides, it is said that the strongest man in Qin was not the one in Qin's royal family, but it was a mysterious strong man from the Black Moon House who was located in the Qin branch. The Black Moon House is intriguing. This aura is Chu Tianming. Has he been informed of Zhang Kuei's attack? You guys go. You know what to do now, right? If you need anything, I'll tell you what to do. Take it. Use this to avoid detection. I would like to see if Black Moon House can really detect everything. Thank you, Master. He's really come back. If I can get him on my side, then getting a promotion with a higher salary isn't a pipe dream anymore. Lord Wan, do you think it's easy to deceive the Chu family? Or, do you want to throw the reputation of the Black Moon Tower into the mud? Patriarch Chu, what do you mean? What do I mean? You received a million spirit crystals from me, and the two pieces of information you gave me were all wrong. We had been patrolling the clan area last night, but Zhang Kuei never appeared. No way. Information in Black Moon Tower is always accurate and up to date. How can it be wrong yet again? Can't be wrong? Then where is Zhang Kuei? He isn't in the hiding place you mentioned, and he didn't break into my Chu family's land. Where is he? He didn't infiltrate your Chu family's property? Are you certain? I personally did patrols for inspection all night. What do you think now? Lord Wan, the information is wrong. Shouldn't you return the crystals? Patriarch Chu, wait a moment. I'll go check the news. What happened to Zhang Kuei? Didn't he want to break into the Chu family's land? Did he suddenly change his mind? It doesn't make sense. Where is Zhang Kuei? I don't know. You say you don't know? You must accept responsibility for making mistakes over and over again. Really, I really don't know. Last night, Zhang Kuei was clearly heading to the Chu family. His whereabouts have not been found until now, and he seems to have disappeared suddenly. Use your men to check his whereabouts for me as soon as possible. Yes. That bastard Zhang Kuei... How come he didn't break into the Chu family's land? I must appease Chu Tianming so that he doesn't make a fuss, otherwise I won't be able to get promoted. Brother Chu, please don't be upset. I've already given orders, and the men are looking for Zhang Kuei. Lord Wan, Zhang Kuei is cunning, and the Black Moon Tower has made mistakes in information twice. As a result, the Chu family couldn't get rid of it in time. What do you think? Brother Chu, don't worry, Zhang Kuei won't survive. Since the Chu family entrusted the Black Moon Tower to help remove Zhang Kuei, the tower will certainly assist the Chu family in removing him. Zhang Kuei's own strength is not weak, and he is carrying the escape bead, so it won't be easy to kill him. All you need to do is block Zhang Kuei after he activates the escape bead, and it will not be difficult to surround and kill him. Then I'll be waiting for the news from you, Lord Wan. You remained at home and did not leave. You made the Black Moon Tower, which is famous for its true and accurate information, make mistakes in information with a small move. You will be rewarded with the technique of replenishing the spirit and the truth technique. What? 
The Black Moon House information was wrong? Could it be Zhang Kuei's information? I gave them the invisibility charm in order to test the Black Moon Tower. It appears that the Black Moon House is not all-powerful, and they cannot find all information. The technique of replenishing the spirit is a powerful secret technique that can repair the damaged souls. It's an extremely powerful soul healing technique that belongs to a tier of divine magic. The truth technique is also a secret technique of the same level. It makes people utter the truth. It's a secret technique that refers directly to the great Tao of heaven and earth. Ha ha ha, got two secret techniques at the same time. Sure enough, staying at home can actually do a lot of things, and there is also a lot of fun to be had. You are in a happy mood, and you have realized that there are all kinds of fun to be discovered in the house. You will be rewarded with seven colored divine light. Today is a great day. I received the seven colored divine light. Whether it is an attack against the physical body or an attack against the soul, the seven colored divine light can defend against it. With the seven colored divine light, I can be more at ease at home to cultivate. Where is he? I have no idea. Lord Wan, are you kidding me? Brother Chu, don't misunderstand. I have ordered an investigation, and I will obtain accurate information regardless of life or death. What's going on with this bastard Zhang Kuei? Did he really disappear into thin air? Even if it means dying, the Black Moon House can still get information. Lord Wan, it has been three days already, there is still no news. Should I doubt the information from the Black Moon House, or should I doubt your ability as Lord Wan? Brother Chu, don't worry. The intelligence of Black Moon House is unparalleled, and my abilities as Lord Wan are not lacking either. Then I'll just wait a day. Take care on your journey, Brother Chu. Where is Zhang Kuei? Regardless of whether he is alive or dead, there must be an explanation. I think Zhang Kuei is most likely dead. Are you sure? 80% sure. What if he didn't die? I will check again to be sure. The miserable life of the evil king of the evil cult? He castrated himself in his youth to cultivate a powerful technique, but found that his enemy's techniques were even stronger. He also married the woman he loved. The evil king became mentally unstable, insane, and twisted. He even sacrificed millions of people to restore his manhood. This evil king invented the blood demon technique that has since been passed down. With this powerful blood demon technique, he restored his manhood, killed his enemies, and claimed the woman he once loved. As a result, the woman coldly said, compared to him, you are too weak and boring. The evil king went mad on the spot and died. Yeah, that evil king was really miserable. Thirteenth brother, the master wants you to go back to the ancestral home. Back to my chief grandfather, Chu Tianming? Why did they suddenly ask me to return to the ancestral home? I don't want to go back. I am living well here. I've been living on my own for a while now. If I go back to my ancestral home now, what's the point of having left it? Thirteenth brother, the master said he won't hold your past mistakes against you and that you can come back to the ancestral home now. I said, I won't go back. I'm comfortable living here. Okay, I'll go back and report to the master. Since you refuse to go back to the ancestral home and choose to stay here, as a reward you will receive a box of premium tea. The system's random reward is back. Harmony Realm is achieved by channeling spiritual energy, while True Realm is attained by comprehending true meaning, which requires high level of intelligence and enlightenment. Wu Jin Tea can help people comprehend the true meaning of heaven and earth and break through the bottleneck of the True Realm. I have already reached the 8th level of the Harmony Realm, and am about to step into the ninth level. The True Realm is in sight with Wu Jin Ti. One can perceive the true meaning of heaven and earth in advance, greatly shortening the time to break through. True meaning can significantly improve the comprehension speed, making cultivation more efficient. Let's brew a pot of this tea first and taste it. I broke through directly to the ninth level of the Harmony Realm. The True Realm is just around the corner. 
what will make you come back to the ancestral home? Don't worry about him. If he likes to stay there, just let him be. Brother Chu, according to reliable intelligence, Zhang Kue is dead. Are you sure? Who killed him? The intelligence from the Black Moon House is reliable and unlikely to be wrong. It is highly probable that Zhang Kue was killed by a Nanqing. Even if he didn't die, we just need to kill him. Once he appears, the Black Moon House will take action immediately. The information provided by Black Moon House cannot be incorrect. In terms of how Brother Chu obtained intelligence, I can take on a commission task from Brother Chu. How about compensating me as a private individual? Since Brother Wan has said so, I won't pursue it any further, but I want to entrust Brother Wan to find out about my son Chiloa. No worries. I will handle this personally and will seek assistance from the Black Moon House. As soon as there is any news, I will inform Brother Chu immediately. Thank you, Brother Wan. You've been at home for ten months, reward, Xuan Huabel. Xuan Huabel, a low-grade weapon, with fire that can burn heaven and earth, the power is unparalleled. Another weapon, a year's award, at worst, it's a heavenly classic. Not even a magic technique as a reward? My realm has also advanced to the first step of the true realm. A few more cups of tea could result in a breakthrough. Thirteenth brother, I've reached the triple Xian realm. Thanks to Steward Uncle's insights. Steward Uncle deserves to be the one who dominates over Qin State. Thirteenth brother, you need to have some shame, work hard in your cultivation, being lazy won't get you anywhere. You can't let down Steward Uncle's teachings. You have no idea how comfortable this kind of easy life is. Working hard in cultivation every day and suffering is not fun. Good timing. Try this tea. Okay. This tea tastes great, and it seems to have some special effects that make me feel more energetic. Maybe there's something else in it. This is what my old man left behind. It's definitely not just an ordinary tea. Uncle Steward left behind, no wonder. In the future, let her drink the Enlightenment tea every day, and it will be no problem for her to break through to the true realm. By the way, Brother Thirteen, did you leave the courtyard? I didn't see you leave the courtyard. I was practicing. Hmm? Thirteenth brother, I haven't seen you practicing, and your strength hasn't increased either. You don't understand. I am cultivating my heart. The higher the level of the heart, the higher the level of the realm. So, brother thirteen, is it because your mental state is not high enough that your strength is so weak? Is this the cultivation method passed down by steward uncle? It's so strange. Yes, it's a secret technique passed down from my father. It may seem weak in the beginning, but once you understand it, you'll soar to the sky. This technique is not something that anyone can practice. It's very demanding, and if I hadn't returned to the ancestral home, I wouldn't have been able to cultivate it. That's why it's so powerful. With this excuse, they won't urge me to return to the ancestral home, right? I understand. I won't pressure you to come back to the ancestral home, and I won't allow anyone to disturb you either. Zhang Kue is not dead, he is still alive. Where is he? Zhang Kue had previously appeared briefly, but we were unable to kill him the first time, and he escaped. Fortunately, we did not announce Zhang Kue's death to the world. I only told Chu Tianming. Keep investigating his whereabouts for me. I don't believe he has truly disappeared. Thirteenth brother, I am almost at the fourth level of the profound realm. I'm going back to my ancestral home to prepare for my breakthrough. Go on, go on. I'm leaving, thirteenth brother. Be careful on the road. When Chu Yun advances to the fourth level of the profound realm, this old man, Chu Tianming, should no longer have any intention of marrying her to the Qin family. Alas, which book shall I read today? Wait. This feeling. Turning things into reality. This is the sign of the true realm. Below the true realm, it is almost imperceptible. It is something that the spiritual power has created. 
You broke through to the true realm. While staying at home, you were rewarded with the Golden Rock Pit. Another pet reward? The Golden Rock, an ancient beast, with extreme speed, can reach the nine heavens above and the nine ghosts below. My strength is at the true realm, but my strength still feels puny. I do not know when I'll grow up. Meow. Coo. All right, all right, don't fight here. I will take you for a stroll around the yard. Colts no longer bother me now that I've reached the true realm. Maybe, with the reward of one year of residence here, I can directly break through to the Emperor's realm. Once I advance to the Emperor realm, I will truly fear nothing in the southern state. Oh, it's so nice to stay home. This potted plant needs to be trimmed. What a comfortable life, but there's just one missing thing, a beautiful maid. You trimmed the potted plants, enjoyed yourself, and got into a happy mood. You are rewarded with 10,000 spiritual scriptures and 10,000 sutras. Another bonus reward? That's cool. The 10,000 spiritual scriptures is a record of all the spirits and heavenly treasures in the world. If I become familiar with the All Souls canon, I can recognize any spiritual object and any natural treasure in heaven and earth, even if they are extinct. The effects and general uses of each spiritual object are recorded in the All Souls canon. The 10,000 Sutras is an alchemical scripture that contains countless recipes and numerous alchemical methods since the beginning of time. Lost recipes and lost alchemy techniques can all be found inside this book. The books are quite thick and are perfect for passing the time. This alchemy method can be learned by Chuyun. I should find a few potion recipes and teach them to her, along with cultivation tips. After Chu Yun learns it, her position in the Chu family will leap ahead of Chu Qing, and she will not be under the family head. Chu Tianming would not want Chu Yun to leave the Chu family if he knew that. The right protector fell in the Chu county of Qing, the matter is related to the Chu family. Yuan Chong Didn't the right protector die during the explosion that happened in Chu county? No one knows the truth? Besides, if it weren't for the destruction of the Chu family, how could the church have come to this? The Purple Moon cult elders have lost more than ten of their elders, and even their sect leader has been severely injured. It all started when the Chu family destroyed the cult's layout. Call all the elders here. It's on the account of the Chu family. Brother 13, I've broken through to the fourth level of the Profound Realm. Wow, you had the breakthrough so quickly. I went through this book a couple of days ago and found the pill recipe left by my father. I put it in the training tips for you. Go and take a look. Pill recipe? This is. T. This is the recipe for alchemy on how to prepare the void compound pill. If the void compound pill is made, Grandpa will have a chance to advance to the compound realm. Was this alchemy not passed down from the third uncle? Could it be that this alchemy method has a special origin? Do you refuse to learn it? Or will it bring the Chu family's misfortune? Why are you sneaking around? Maybe there is something wrong about the origin of this alchemy method? I already know this alchemy method. My father taught it to me, although I was too lazy to learn it. There is no problem with its origin. However, this alchemy is extremely valuable in southern China, so proceed with caution. If it leaks out and is coveted by the powerful forces in the southern state, the Chu family will face a catastrophe. Especially if they are targeted by the evil court, the consequences are unimaginable. I'd better learn it in secret, and then go out for experience, and find a secluded place to make the pills. If it doesn't get out, there won't be any trouble. It's better to be careful. This is a jade talisman left by my father. I do not practice, so I do not use it. You may take it. Then I will contact Zhang Kuei through the Soul Seal and ask him to protect Chu Yun secretly. Zhang Kuei's strength is at the ninth level of the Void Realm, and under the control of the Soul Seal, he is absolutely loyal so she should be safe in Chu. Once the arrangements are made, I will be able to stay home in peace. Who's going to pay back for the Purple Moon Cult's misfortune? 
The overall strength of the Chu family is certainly not as strong as the Purple Moon cult, but it is not weak, and the Qin state is not our territory, so I'm afraid that if we go there rashly, we may meet with misfortune. That's right, our main priority is still the Purple Moon cult. How can we leave the Chu family like that? Also, don't forget, the Chu family has ruined our layout for years. Once the king's court becomes free, it will look into the matter of the Chu family, so do we have to wait until the king's court orders us to act? Moreover, it is not necessary to fight with the Chu family. I heard that Chu Chiluo's son was expelled from his ancestral home. Since the Chu family could not help him for the time being, we will arrest Chu Chiluo's son so that we could vent our anger a little. Chu Chiluo's son was expelled from his ancestral home, so what's the point of arresting him? How stupid. He is Chu Chiluo's son, not the son of some random cat or a stray dog. Even if he's a loser, as long as he's Chu Chiluo's son, then he's worth something. Chu Chiluo may not be dead, he might reappear one day. If we send his son to the king's court as a hostage, it will surely scare him. In that case, let's do that. Then, I'll leave it to Elder Yuan Chong, who is the best at concealment. I will complete a year here soon. The cult hasn't done anything recently. I guess they have finally matured. Finally, I can quietly wait for a boundary warning. Invasion by powerful people. Damn cult. Here we go again. His strength is at the third level of the Void Realm. He must belong to the senior level of the elders. Why didn't Zhang Kuei send me a message? And why is he coming directly to my yard again? I'm not to blame if you come here on your own will. There isn't even a strong guard nearby, so it's easy for me to act. Are you Chu Chiluo's son? That's right. What the hell did my father do? Why does everyone want to arrest me? Then, take this. Not good. Chu Chiluo's son is a decoy. Which cult are you a member of? I was curious. Is everyone aware of Chu Chiluo's son's identity? A void monster that appeared out of nowhere? Did Chu Chiluo leave it for his son? There is no one else nearby, so it is not an ambush. Find a chance to catch him. It doesn't matter if you don't say anything. How come that monster suddenly disappeared? And it appeared so abruptly, could it be? This is the method of turning things into reality. It's a technique of the true realm. You, are you Chu Chiluo? The fact that Chu Chiluo and his wife disappeared while exploring the ancient sites is all fake. Or maybe Chu Chiluo got a great opportunity to avoid being targeted by big forces, so he lied about his disappearance even his appearance has been changed a bit. If you discover such a big secret, you will be murdered to silence it. My name is Chu Xian, the son of Chu Chiluo. Don't be afraid, I won't kill you. Come on, tell me, which branch of the cult are you from? I'm not a member of the Qin cult, I am Lu Yuan, an elder of the Purple Moon cult. Your Purple Moon cult came to the Qin cult's territory to arrest me. What is your objective? The protector of the Purple Moon Kingdom died in the Chu Kingdom, and the Vice Patriarch suspected the Chu family, so he sent me to capture you as a hostage. So that's what happened. Last time Zhu Chang's anti-killing operation had outstanding results. Even the protector of the Purple Moon Cult had been killed. The evil Purple Moon Cult is targeting me, so don't blame me for taking action. Plant a soul seal and infuse spiritual power. It can guarantee that he is always at peak output, even if he is in the ninth level of the Void Realm, it will not be easy to kill him. Pretend to covet the throne, fight against the Purple Moon Cult, and kill as much as you can. Yes. Maybe if he works a little harder, he can severely damage the Purple Moon Cult. The Chu family will face much less pressure. That should allow me to live in peace for a while. The Evil King's court will be nothing to fear as long as I break through to the Emperor Realm. Lu Yuan is back. Where is the man? Didn't you catch him? Did you fail? Humph, you don't have the right to ask me to do anything. Yuan Chong is a nobody. From today onwards, I will take the position of leader. 
Did Lu Yuan go mad? Who dares to covet the position of leader? Who gave you the courage? I, Lu Yuan, have a great chance to break through the compound realm. I must be the leader, who supports and who opposes me. That guy who grew stronger by chance believes he is the king. How arrogant. I can't believe he is actually coveting the position of leader. How dare you? You're courting death. What did you say, Lu Yuan? We're all brothers, but some jokes are off limits. Zheng Tu, you are a piece of trash. It is an insult for me to stick together with you. Shit. He really went crazy. Speak, who supports me and who opposes me? Whoever supports me shall live, and who doesn't shall die. Even the leader wouldn't dare to say such arrogant words. How dare you? You think you're the king of the court? So what if I'm against you? Good, then you go to hell. Ah, are you crazy? Well, how dare you disobey me? How dare you prevent me from killing? Die. Fuck. Lu Yuan, stop now otherwise don't blame me for the consequences. How dare you? Those who follow me will live, while those who oppose me will perish. If you dare to oppose me, you will perish as well. Really crazy, do you think you are the evil king? Kill him. He's gone insane. Kill him. I will kill you first. His chi is too powerful. He really became stronger. No wonder he went mad. Or perhaps he is being controlled by someone and is out of his mind. Let's suppress him together. Die. All of you shall die. No. Lu Yuan, that son of a bitch is going to blow himself up. What's going on? A strong man is attacking the Purple Moon cult? Who did that? Where are the others? Men. That son of a bitch, Lu Yuan, did that. Lu Yuan? Lu Yuan is this powerful? Where are the others? All dead. I am the only survivor. All dead? We lost at least 70% of the elders? With such heavy losses, how are we supposed to compete with other cults? Don't stand still. I think I can still salvage the situation. Oh, I forgot. Quickly take the potion and explain the process. You've stayed at home and killed enemies thousands of miles away. So, you will be rewarded with 10 years of cultivation plus a box of heavenly lightning flash. The result of this anti-killing battle is good. I received 10 years of cultivation and rose to the third level of the true realm. As expected, the higher the realm, the slower the increase in strength. The heavenly lightning flash is a one-time explosive spiritual weapon that contains a trace of the power of heavenly thunder and has a restraining effect on evil cultivators. When activated, the explosion is powerful enough to strike a strong person at the first level of true realm. After destroying the Purple Moon Cult, I should be able to stay in peace until the end of the year, right? No one will be sent again, I hope. John Kuei? Is there another powerful man coming? Master, what's the matter? Yuan Chong, the Purple Moon Cult's Vice Master, and Lu Wang, the Qin Cult's Master, are secretly working together. The plan is to raid Chu County with powerful people, aiming to surround and kill the strongest people of Chu family. Why the hell are they still blaming the Chu family? Once the plan is successfully implemented, even the Chu family will suffer heavy losses. Chu Qing and Chu Yun will be in danger. The Chu family can't be in chaos. This is not a good thing. It will affect my peaceful life at home. Find a way to report it to the Chu family, and at the same time disclose the goals of the cult and the time of action, and the Chu family will naturally respond. Your mission is to protect Miss Chu Yun, understand? Yes. Master, buy all kinds of spiritual pills and heavenly materials for Chu Yun in secret. Allow her to obtain them by chance. Consider how to do it properly. Yes, Master. Try to swap this for pills. 
the strength of the two pythons reaches the fifth level of the compound realm. Although they cannot last long, in the state of Qin, they are still invincible. When I get close to Chu Yun, one python will be incorporated into her body. What about the other? The remaining one is for you to keep your life. Thank you, master. Do your best. Yes. Chu Tianming has also taken a half step into the compound realm. With his current state, he can definitely break through with just one Xian pill. But I'm not going to give him the pill. I should give it to Chu Yun. This cheap grandpa has always hated me, and he annoys me every time he sees me. And his talent is not as good. How could my father break through the compound realm and the true realm? Could it be that the techniques practiced by my father are stronger? If there was such a powerful techniques, wouldn't my father have passed it on to the Chu family? Relying on half of the scriptures, he could break through to the compound realm, and even break through to the true realm. His talent was really awesome. You've been home for 11 months, and you will be rewarded with the refining map. It is an enhanced version of the refining map. It just so happens that the effect of the previous refining map is much weaker, and it is almost about to lose its effect. My spiritual will is no weaker than a martial artist at the fifth level of true realm. This refining map, even in the Emperor's realm, has limited effects. However, I am concerned that they will be able to obtain the enhanced version of the refining map at that time. I will think about how to use this version of the refining map and then place it in the southern state of the land. It is definitely a top treasure. I almost died the last time I was surrounded by a cult thanks to the beads of evanescence. That cult, I must say, must be uprooted from heavens and earth. But the Black Moan House is black-hearted. They sell the information for a very high price. We can only rely on the Chu family's information system. Chu County is part of the Chu family, and their information system is still very adequate. However, due to the lack of spiritual and even precious weapons, it is difficult to detect the important strongholds of the cult. Young Master Ching, someone sent you a report. Who sent it? Not the other three cults, and naturally not the Black Moon House, so I don't know. Ask the fourth uncle to come here. Yes. Ching'er, what's the matter? Chu Chiohai, the fourth son of Chu Tianming, at the first level of the Void Realm. Fourth uncle, what do you think about this? The credibility should be high, and in any case, it is important to be cautious. This is not something you and I can handle, so I will go back to my tribe right away. Now. Four of the pills were ruined, and the remaining eight pills, five of which were ordinary. However, three of them have reached the level of excellence. Great, I will summarize the process, then improve the next alchemy. This is the tenth time, the first nine times, six failed and three succeeded, but the Dan pills were of average quality. Finally, a good product. But the last pill was used up, so I should find a way to get some more pills. The good thing is that there are still a lot of spirit crystals, I can go out to purchase some. Once the profound Dan is skillfully refined, the next step will be to refine the spirit. What? What is this, unknown force? It appeared to be a python. Is it possible? Storage bag? But, there's no one around here. So many spiritual pills, and millions of spirit crystals. Who gave it to me anyway? Grandpa? Not likely, he had no reason to give it to me secretly. There is also an unknown power lurking in my body. I'm afraid that some senior found out that I was making pills and left these pills to test me. I should keep making pills. You stay here and protect Miss Chu Yun. I'll go back to the yard. We should know our next plan. The big brother Chu Xian needs to hold his legs well, and the cult doesn't matter. Master. Miss Chu Yun seems to have quite a talent for alchemy. In a short period of time, she was already able to refine the pills. Very well, continue to provide her with the materials needed to make the pills. Back then I did not kill Zhang Kuei, 
it was indeed the right choice. He is an obedient dog that works for me. Use this to improve your strength. These two dogs work for me, and they will not betray me, so naturally the stronger they are the better for me. Yes, master. Our two family united with the He family and took the initiative to surround and eliminate the cult and brought victory. I heard that the fight was so fierce that the head of Chain, Lu Wang, did not hesitate to use the treasures of his family however, he was unable to withstand the siege of the two great families and Lu Wang was severely wounded and fled, while the rest of the cultists were almost completely destroyed. If the information wasn't obtained in advance, the Chu family wouldn't have been able to seriously defeat the cult, then it would be a real waste. The elders there all fell, and the treasures of the sect were destroyed, bringing the Purple Moon cult to the brink of extinction. Great, for a short period of time, the cult will not probably be able to do anything. You can thwart cult conspiracies, and strategic without leaving your home, you are rewarded with celestial exploration skills. Oh, here comes the reward. By using celestial exploration skills, I am able to peek at all secrets, explore the root, know the origin, and know the past life of living beings. This secret art is so powerful that it can reveal the roots and origins of a living being, and even its past lives. Mastering the celestial exploration skills means that no one, no matter who they are, will be able to hide their identity from me. Meow? This sky spirit cat, a beast of heaven and earth, with the power of a divine beast. This cat is of extraordinary origin, and it takes too much power to explore its origin. With the strength of my current realm, I can't stand it for long. The sky golden rock and the sky spirit cat are not ordinary beings, their level is too high. It seems that I can only explore their origin, their strength is about the same, or lower than me. Within a short period of time, the cult would no longer be able to stir up trouble and chain. Let me quietly wait for the year's time. Chu Yuan, the third senior of his generation. Thirteen, look what you have become. Are you worthy of the third uncle? Why did this nagging guy come back from his training? Can't you be a little more useful? Don't you want to get stronger and look for uncle and aunt who disappeared? You, you're so disappointing. The person I admire most is the third uncle, and I have been training with him since I was very young. I can say that all my skills are taught by the third uncle. Get up. Third senior, are you trying so hard to kill me so you can inherit my father's legacy? How can you think of me like that in your heart? I chew you on. It's not like that. I just don't want you to bother me. Third senior, everyone's lifestyle is different. That's the way I choose to live, and I think it's fine, and that's it. Besides, when my father was around, he didn't even control me like this. You, you. Huff. There must be something on this guy's mind. Among his peers, Chu Yuan is the most gifted, with a cultivation level at the first level of the spirit realm. Chu Tianming certainly looks forward to Chu Qing, but in regard to cultivation, he is far behind Chu Yuan. But what he cultivated was not the Chu family's methods. Was it because he had a chance to practice other techniques, or was it passed down from his own father? 13. So you want to live without fighting and live in peace? Perhaps it is the right choice. He looks like he wants to say his last words. Did something happen? I'll be leaving again in a few days, and I'm not sure when I'll be back. I'm not sure if I'll even return. I am keeping an eye on Uncle San and Aunt San's matter. If there is any news, I will let someone inform you. As for our relationship, I will always. Although the siblings in the Chu family don't disagree much, in order for you to live peacefully, you should still practice this technique well. After reading it, submit it to Grandpa. Your position in the Chu family will be much better. Break through to the profound realm as soon as possible. I don't know what's wrong with him. Could it be that he broke through? It's very possible. This specially made animal skin material is usually used to record martial arts techniques and such. In addition to being able to preserve it for a long time, it can also store mental willpower. This is actually an imperial scripture. But it's not complete, it's only half an imperial scripture. 
Even so, it is extraordinary. The Chu family has relied on half of this true scripture to establish themselves in the Qin state for thousands of years. Practicing this half-imperial scripture is hopeless, but breaking through to the true realm is not a problem. After that, breaking through to the emperor realm. According to the historical records, the reason why there was no emperor in the southern state after the great battle of Nanjiu was due to. However, this half-imperial scripture is useless to me, and the pills are only useful for breaking through to the profound realm, which is common. But relying on this technique to gain the attention of Chu Tianming is actually my intention. It seems that he wants to stay away. Did he offend a powerful enemy and want to avoid trouble? The important thing is to bring it to the attention of Zhang Kue and ask to take a shot at saving him. Rascal. Huh. The fact that Chu Tianming is so enraged must indicate that this is a serious matter. Let's go back to the ancestral house and see what has happened. Meow. It seems like they want to kill Chu Yuan even though they are so far away. Can they hear me? Would that old man be so ruthless? Breaking off the engagement. Your fiancé is Princess Qin Kiyun of the Qin Kingdom from the Qin family. This is going to smack the Qin family in the face. Qin Kiyun's mother was the one who was abandoned by Chu Chiolua in their broken engagement. If Chu Yuan breaks off his engagement, how can Qin Kiyun's family just let it go? I don't care if you like Qin Kiyun or not. As for me, I will arrange for you to marry her no matter what. We shouldn't have let our third brother educate our own son in the first place. Chu Chiu from Chu Yuan's father, what did you learn? You even learned how to break off an engagement. Didn't Chu Yuan get along well with Qin Kiyun? They seemed to have a good relationship. Why did they suddenly want to break off the engagement? If the Qin family finds out about this, won't they be furious? My third son ruined a marriage contract, and now my third grandson is also ruining a marriage contract, and it's the daughter of the previous victim. I have already notified the Qin family and also told Kiyun the truth. In my eyes, she is just a younger sister. You, you. Grandfather, father, and eldest uncle, today I am here to bid farewell. I am leaving the Chu family. What are you talking about? The siblings of the Chu family have always had very little conflict and mostly maintained good relationships. The eldest in the Chu family, Chu Chiu Chang, since the incident with the third brother Chu Chiolua, the atmosphere in the Chu family seems to have been slightly distorted. You are not allowed to go anywhere. I will immediately inform the Qin family to proceed with the marriage. Master, someone from the Qin family is here. Who is here? It's Qin mother and daughter. What? What a talented person. As expected of a man who worships his own father, they have even learned how to break off an engagement. Chu Tianming would probably have burst a blood vessel by now if he wasn't a cultivator, wouldn't he? I wonder what will happen to Chu Yuan. Will he be confined? Will they still force him to marry the Qin family girl? The question is, the Qin family girl, does she actually want to get married? Are they all doing it willingly? Such backwardness. Since Chu Yuan has returned, he should know the consequences he will face, right? Uncle Chu. Are you going to break off another marriage in the Qin family? Absolutely not. The decision of whether to call off the wedding or not is up to the Chu family, and they will fulfill this engagement. But as for me, Chu Yuan, you, shut up. Grandpa, the forcibly grown melon does not taste sweet. If you want to know, ask the girl, Kiyun, if she likes me or not. I like him. What? Did you hear that? If you dare to disappoint me, I'll break your legs. Don't speak or interrupt us. We can't destroy the marriage. If we start this now, cracks will start to show in all the four families. Once the cracks appear, it also means that the four families will gradually lose their unity. Don't let the so-called marriage contract bind you. We have only met a few times. How could you possibly like me? I liked you the first time I saw you. Doesn't make sense, do I really have such great charm? 
I like someone else. It's impossible between you and me. Enough. Do you think that my daughter, of the Qin family, is not worthy of marrying a man from the Chu family? The matter of Qin Pingxiao's rejection from your third uncle will not repeat itself again. You will have to marry Qin Qiyun no matter what. Lock him up and let him reflect on his actions. Grandfather, father, uncle, I, Chu Yuan, am not as talented as third uncle. But when it comes to the matter of love, I will not lose. None of you can force me. What did you even learn from third uncle? Only learned how to call off an engagement, huh? Take him away and lock him up. Let him reflect on this. Kiyun, you are a good person. You can find someone better goodbye. Bastard. Bring the man back. No one in the Chu family's third generation is good. Chu Chiluo's son, was he driven out of the ancestral home by you? Yes. I'll go take a look and see how outstanding Chu Chiluo's son really is. What does that mean? You two follow up and watch over the woman when she sees Chu Xian. Make sure she doesn't go crazy. Are you Chu Xian, son of Chu Chiluo? Who are you, auntie? Did you just call me auntie? You and my dad are of the same generation. Instead of auntie, I can't call you a sister, can I? You. Is the Chu family trying to break off the engagement? Have you thought about the consequences? It's true that the Chu family was wrong in this matter, but as you have seen, the person has already escaped. Even if we can catch the person and force the marriage, it's not fair to Qin Kiyun. Besides, even if we use force. If Chu Chilua has wronged me, then let his son pay. Crap. Auntie, how old are you? You've got a daughter, but you look so young. Seems to me that you want to be a cougar. No wonder my dad didn't want you. How dare you? Uh oh. What are you saying? Since Chu Yuan is unwilling, then let Chu Xian marry my daughter. What? But, niece Qin Kiyun. I like him, as long as he looks good. Does she have a double personality? I disagree. What qualifications do you have to disagree? I'm just a loser. If your daughter married me, wouldn't that be a shame? How do you say the words, I'm a loser, with such conviction? How can your daughter face others if she marries a loser? Do you still want to lose your face? You are her mother. My father dumped you, and you let your daughter marry a loser like me. What will people think of you? They may believe that your daughter is undesirable and can only marry a loser. Auntie, it's okay that you were dumped by my father, but do you want your daughter to have a reputation of being unwanted and married to a loser? You. The Chu family's third generation is a shambles. If she gets mad, we will not be able to stop her. You're right. You're not good enough for my daughter. Let's go. You rejected the woman who came to marry you. You are rewarded with the heartless fire. There's a reward for that? Qin Kiyun seems like a good girl, but somehow, I feel that there is something wrong with her. The Celestial Exploration Skills Technique Qin Kiyun, her mother is Qin Pingxia, her father is Hong Fei, she is the fox demon's soul and the emperor demon's reincarnation. In the recovery stage, well-behaved on the outside, charming and ruthless on the inside, good at charming, likes good-looking men. The soul of the fox demon, the rebirth of the emperor demon. Was she once a strong person in the imperial realm? No surprise she said she liked me, I know I'm attractive, there's no need to be modest about it. Oh, the state of Qin is about to change. However, because it is impossible to investigate her origins further, we must be cautious of this young lady. And if Chu Yuan breaks up the marriage, Qin Kiyun will hold a grudge against him, right? I should warn him. There, there. View system rewards void heart fire, burning heart, burning fury. The void heart fire causes heart anger. It can instantly make people violently angry, and their bodies will explode and die. It can be fueled by anger, and it only takes a little bit of anger to ignite, and once ignited, it cannot be extinguished. How strong? 
It's almost impossible to prevent who in this world cannot get angry. Like an unnoticed direct killer. This time, Chu Yuan's case does not seem to have caused a big fuss. The two families, Chu and Qin, more or less, still had some rift. With the revival of Qin Qiyun's emperor's soul and the release of her talent, her strength is going to grow by the day. The Chu family will increasingly regret that they did not marry Qin Qiyun into the family. It appears that the reason for the southern state's lack of an emperor is not as simple as it appears, but how did Qin Qiyun come to be? There is so little information in the southern state, even in the codices, not much mentioned there. Qin Qiyun is a fox demon. Why was she reborn into the human race? Qin Pingxia had been dumped. Why is she still willing to let her daughter get married to the Chu family? There must be a conspiracy behind it. I must remain stable. As long as my strength goes up, what scheming, they will not be able to resist a punch from me. You've come back quickly. It seems that Chu Yuan has been informed. But I don't care how Chu Yuan responds or what ideas he comes up with. Brother Kun Wu, your lifespan is nearly over. After the completion of this matter, I will present you with the complete blood spirit pearl with both hands. It will allow Brother Kun Wu to live an extra 10 years and D increase the likelihood of a breakthrough. Hu Quan Cult Leader, are you really willing to give up the blood pearl? I, Hu Quan, have brought my cult to this point. The source of everything is the Qin family. I can't bear this rage. You are really willing to give up the blood spirit pearl just to kill a few Chu family elders. Are you really willing to do that? The main target is Chu Chiolua's son. As long as I capture Chu Chiolua's son, I will have plenty of ways to get back at the Chu family. Furthermore, I intend to exact vengeance on Chu Chiolua's son for my cult, and I want to see if the Chu family is still righteous. Okay. I'll do it. After the job is done, I'll give you the other half. I've been stuck at the peak of the Void Realm for too long, and I don't have much time left, so this is my opportunity. The Chu family is not weak, and Chu Tianming is as powerful as I am, and he is holding a treasure weapon. I'm not sure I can beat Chu Tianming if I fight him. Furthermore, I am getting older, and my strength has dwindled, but as long as I'm not surrounded by Chu family elders who are at the 8th level or above of the Void Realm, I'm confident that I can escape. This trip is just to capture Chu Chiolua's son and kill a few Chu family elders along the way. I only need to sneak into the Chu family's territory, capture Chu Chiolua's son, and kill a few Chu family elders on the way back to Chu County. There is no difficulty. And by the time the Chu family's strong elders come to the rescue, I would long have returned to the Purple Moon cult and successfully gotten the Blood Spirit Pearl. Is there any reason to be concerned about the Chu family's strongest elders once I reach the Compound Realm? And even if I don't succeed, I won't be alive for more than a few years, so what's the harm in trying? Time flies really fast. Before I knew it, I'd been living in the yard for almost a year. From the mortal realm, I have broken through to the true realm. Who would believe it? In seven days, it will be one year. There shouldn't be any accidents, and I sincerely hope no one will bother me. What's the matter with the cultists? Why do they always come after me first whenever they come to the Chu family? You're Chu Chiluo's son? I am indeed Chu Chiluo's son, but I don't understand. Why do you cultists always come after me? Did my father dig up your cult's ancestral graves? Well, I'm not a cultist, but I was hired by the cult. Be a good boy and come with this old man. Neil Keep kneeling and don't even dream of running away. What kind of strength is this? The legendary emperor's realm? Is he really Chu Chiluo's son? You've got to be kidding. The Chu family is filled with terror. What is the purpose and the explanation of you coming here? Are the cultists that stupid? They're about to get destroyed, but they don't even stop. They still have to come and bother me. 
Could it be that these evil cultivators, after practicing the evil methods, have damaged their brains? This person's skills are so trashy that he is stuck at the peak of the void realm and has never been able to break through. Even if his skills are not too bad, after such a long period of accumulation, no matter how suitable the environment to advance, he would still be a waste with no value. Besides, his life expectancy is not much, he will die soon. Should I help him break through? It's simply just a waste of resources. Allow yourself to shine brightly for the last time in your life, and your existence in this world will not be in vain. It's over. He ordered me to go to the evil king's court to make trouble, isn't it strange? I was given a few of these things, but I don't know what they're for when you reach their lair and see anyone, throw this in his face. Who would have thought that as my life was coming to an end, I would go to the royal court to cause havoc? Stop. I can't disobey that insidious will anyway, so let's just do a big thing. In the history of evil cultivation in the southern state, and even in the history of cultivation in the entire world, I will leave a great reputation. This is the world's holy land of evil cultivation. No evil cultivator dares to violate its majesty. Today I come, Wu, will break into this holy land of evil cultivation. What did you say? Are you out of your mind? Does practicing evil exercises ruin your brain? I won't become like this one day, will I? Remember, my name is Kunwu. I want to shine at the last moment of my life. Let all the evil cultivators in the world remember that there was once an evil cultivator named Kunwu who bravely broke into the evil king's palace. Even after my death, I want my name to be remembered in the history of southern China. Come out for me. Presumptuous. How dare you break into the evil king's palace? Come on. What's it? I come who will die magnificently, ha ha. An evil cultivator who would never dare to enter the evil king's palace. What kind of insidious cultivator is he? As an evil cultivator, I want to infiltrate the evil king's court's holy land. Remember, my name is Kunwu. What happened? An evil cultivator at the peak of the void realm, with a short lifespan, broke into the palace, killed the guards of the compound realm, and seriously wounded two true realm elders. In the end, he let out a roar and blew himself up in the evil king's palace. Before he died, he said, Remember, my name is Kunwu. Bastard! Bring me his relatives and children, I want them to die. Unfortunately, he is a lonely man, and he doesn't even have a descendant. What? Hey, did you hear that? Kunwu, a void realm evil cultivator with a short lifespan, broke into the evil king's palace and killed several of them. Damn, it's so amazing, this will be recorded in history. I'm excited to hear about it, I'm going to do the same near the end of my life. With your strength, forget it. That bastard Kunwu, did he go mad? He was asked to arrest someone. Why did he go to the evil king's palace? What happened? Why did Kun was suddenly rush into the palace of the evil king? Did he have a brain problem on the way? Or did he encounter some kind of stimulation at the Chu family? If people know that I instructed Kun Wu to go to the Chu family and ended up going to the evil king palace, it will be a problem. Fortunately, no third party existed in the conspiracy. The Black Moon Tower shouldn't know about it, right? There is no possibility of leaking such a confidential matter without a third party. It's none of my business. I've never seen Kunwu. I have never seen Kunwu. But there's something wrong with the Chu. Why is it always related to the Chu family when something bad happens? Why would I have ended up like this if it hadn't been for the Chu family? The Purple Moon Kingdom's cult was nearly destroyed. All these evil king's courts will regard me as incompetent. If it weren't for incompetence, why would that happen? The Chu family. Founded by chance in a monument when I was in the profound realm, and it's called the Blood Devil Bead. It contains demonic blood. Once leaked, everyone under the true realm will be demonized. Once demonized, they will become demon slaves. The demons are the great enemy of the human race. 
Whether the humans are good or evil, the demons will wipe them up. I will wait a little while before making a decision on whether to implement the plan. You stayed at home, and in a single thought, you ship the evil king's court, stunned the world's evil cultivators, and you will be rewarded with access to a secret realm of chance. Ship the evil king's court and shock the evil cultivators in the world? That old man Kumwu is quite strong. In the secret realm of chance, one can set up a secret realm in the northern state without leaving home, and leave it to those who are destined to obtain the inheritance. Anyone who gets a chance must be someone with great luck. He will become Chu Xian's successor, and as long as Chu Xian is willing, he can instantly seize the successor's cultivation, and even control his life and death. As long as you have enough opportunities and secret realms, you can give orders to people all over the world without leaving your home? Furthermore, no successor can betray me, even if the successor truly wishes to disobey, I can revoke his cultivation at any time. Those who can enter the secret realm of chance are all lucky, isn't this a protagonist character? It's interesting to be behind the scenes and give orders to cultivators all over the world without leaving home. If any successor dares to deceive his master, I will instantly destroy his entire cultivation. You can even reward your cultivation base to other successors, which is wonderful. But that's not suitable for implementation for the time being. My strength is still a little too weak, and it doesn't make much sense to arrange it. Let's wait for the one-year period. In two days, it'll be the one-year period. I wonder what reward will I'll get. You have stayed at home for one year, and you will be rewarded with the Jade Void Immortal Scriptures plus 100 years of cultivation. Skills and cultivation will be directly instilled. Not only was I rewarded the Immortal Scripture skills, but also a 100-year cultivation base reward, there is no need to worry about reaching the Emperor's Realm. Receiving Rewards, 4th Level of the True Realm 5th Level of the True Realm 8th Level of Divine Soul The fundamental sign of breaking through the Emperor's Realm is the transformation of spiritual will and condensed spiritual soul. Even if the physical body is destroyed, as long as the soul escapes, you can live a new life. The power of the soul is pervasive, and it can also communicate with the heavens and the earth and blend. It seems that a new small world has been built with my soul as the center, and in this small world, everything is up to me. I am the master of this small world, its supreme law. The regional laws of the southern state seem to be broken in several places. Perhaps this is the true root cause of the absence of emperors in southern part. Maybe some people have condensed their souls, but because they didn't integrate into the laws. If you can't build a small world of your own, you will only be regarded as a half-emperor. The power of my soul is not bound by the laws of Southern State, but the rules of this vast world are higher-level laws. This is the ancestral home of the Chu family? There are indeed some figures in seclusion, just a little bit away from breaking through to the compound realm, however. Are there really no powerful people in the compound realm to conceal the Chu family's heritage? Is it because of the cultivation technique which makes it impossible to break through to the compound realm? Or is the talent too poor? However, no one is weaker than Chu Tianming in strength. This is the strength of the Chu family's hidden cards. At the core of the Chu family's ancestral house, is there a space underground? Sure enough, this place used to be a historic site, and the Chu family relied on it to develop, but it doesn't seem to have much value anymore. After the construction of the small world is complete, the 12-mile radius will be my empire. It just covers the land of the Chu family. The description of the emperor's realm in the cultivation world is I am the emperor in the domain, and all laws are irreversible. It's true. This is the power of the emperor realm. One thought can determine the life and death of creatures. Why did I suddenly break through? Me too. And the aura didn't leak out. Looks like we can stay in the Chu family. Those clan elders have broken through? It must have been influenced by the power of the soul. Under the influence of the soul's power, due to a little leakage of the aura, several clan elders broke through uncontrollably. 
In the core of the Chu family's ancestral home, there is a precious weapon that seems to inspire and absorb the aura of several clan elders. It seems to absorb the aura of the strongest persons in every realm and transmit it to a certain place. It's interesting that the Chu family lacks a powerful person, but I'm afraid they were deliberately suppressed so that no strong person could break through, and any strong person who did manage to break through would leave. But, as an unpopular junior, I didn't have access to these secrets. As long as it doesn't interfere with my own home, it's fine. To begin, the treasure collection aura function has been disabled. You advance to the Emperor Realm, you are rewarded with the Great Luo Heavenly Scripture plus the Great Luo Divine Law plus the Great Luo Immortal Scripture. So it turned out to be an updated version of the Great Luo Heavenly Scripture. Claiming the Reward Oh, the second level of the Emperor Realm. A hundred years of cultivation is obtained without much effort. Now I finally have a little more confidence. In the southern state, I am the only one in the Emperor Realm. Unless someone from outside the southern state at the Emperor Realm or above comes after me, I have no fear in the southern state. Now I don't have to worry about the evil court. If they come after me, I can kill any cultist. You too, little kitten, break through quickly. You are already at the ninth level of the compound realm and about to break through to the true realm. With your qualifications, it will not take you long to break through to the Emperor Realm. It won't take long for all of you to break through to the Emperor Realm, I am confident about that. First achieve that goal, then break through to the Heavenly Realm. I shouldn't get ahead of myself, advancing to the Emperor Realm, it is nothing, but above the Emperor Realm there is still the Honorable Realm and the Heavenly Realm. If I cultivate for another 10 years, I might break through to the Honorable Realm. It should not be a big problem. With a few more system rewards, I will soon be able to advance. The secret realms are about to be discovered, and the rules of heaven and earth in the southern state are slowly being repaired. Qin Kiyun, the reincarnation of the demon emperor, has appeared, and it is clear that the southern state's current peace will not last. However, within at least ten years, there will not be too much turmoil. If I advance to the honorable realm within ten years, I will have the confidence to survive. As the saying goes, if I am the strongest in the domain, even the emperor will bow down to me. In this world, the honorable realm is also an absolute power. Comfortable. People's lives will be more comfortable once they have gained enough strength. Would there be any lack of servants or maids who can work for them? But beautiful maids are better for the eyes, unlike servants. How about hiring one and assigning her to the yard temporarily? If I leave her in the courtyard, she may attract some lucky people to come here. The men will be accepted as butlers, and the women will be accepted as maids. After all, I need some people around to listen to my orders and do things for me. After all, Zhang Kuei and Dong Qian are evil cultivators, so they are not well-liked, and their abilities are average. If I just have her around, even if she isn't of great use, she will attract people with great fortune to come, right? You have stayed at home for a year and a day, and you will be rewarded with a case of Emperor Pills. Finally, the Emperor Realm Cultivation Pills arrived. My life is so comfortable. Right, I should call Zhang Kuei here for a moment. Master, how is Chu Yun? In such a short period of time, Miss Chu Yun has already started to make spiritual pills, but the failure rate is a bit high. Not bad. Bring this emperor pill to Chu Yun. There are several pills, as well as an alchemy recipe, which I want to pass on to Chu Yun. Seems like you also have advanced to compound realm thanks to Master's pills. The Evil King's Court, on the other hand, has a rule that all evil cultivators who have advanced to the compound, they will not be allowed to leave the territory of the evil cult without permission. The purpose of that is to gather the strongest people to deal with any threats. Good point. Your aura of the compound realm is sealed, thanks to the invisible talisman. No one can find you unless you go to the Evil King's Court. Thanks a lot, Master. It's been a month since Kun Wu broke into the Evil King's palace. During investigation throughout the month, no instructions from a second party was discovered. 
I think it's because Kumwa's end was approaching, his mind was confused, and he wanted to be famous, so he went to the evil palace. He became indeed famous, not only in the circle of evil cultivators, but also in the other big forces, and even in the entire southern state cultivation circle. Now everyone knows the name of a ruthless person who bravely broke into the palace of the evil king. The name Kunwu will live on forever. Fankai Today, I'm going to break into the holy land of evil cultivation and enjoy the scenery of the palace of the evil king. What? This is crazy. I, Fankai, will become the second evil cultivator to break into the evil king's palace in thousands of years, and I will die without any regrets. Bastard! Ha ha ha, what kind of evil cultivator is that who does not even dare to break into the evil king's palace? How brave! I've always admired the courage of Kunwu. Another one? Did cultivators go mad? We, the three friends of the Ghost Mountain, will also break into the Evil King's palace today and die with no regrets. The three friends of the Ghost Mountain, haha, it is said that the majesty of the Evil King's palace cannot be violated. It is not only the holy place of evil cultivators, but also the base of evil cultivation. Today, we came to see for ourselves. Are you the three friends of the Ghost Mountain? Why did they also come to break into the evil king's palace? Don't they want to live? You know, the three Ghost Mountain friends have a limited lifespan, and there is no hope of breaking through. Three friends of Ghost Mountain, presumptuous. Do you really think that defeating the guards of the evil king's palace is so easy? Die. You're going to blow yourself up right away? You're crazy. In the past half a month, from time to time, evil cultivators came to break into the palace of the evil king. How dare they come to the evil king's palace when they want? Do you know who the master is? Let me tell you, the XX who broke into the evil palace was my brother, do you know? You guys stay right here and watch me break into the evil king's palace. My name is... Go to hell. Die. Die. Run away. The evil king is attacking. I'm not afraid to tell you that the one who was slapped to death by his majesty, the evil king himself, was my brother. Oh what? It was your brother. I'm so sorry. The real brave man is the one who attracts the evil king himself to fight. Oh. Could it be that there is a new evil cultivating method that makes people have problems with their brains after practicing? Why are there so many crazy people? It's all because of that bastard, Kumwu. This secret realm has been opened for nearly two months and has yet to attract people of great fortune. Is there no lucky person in this area? Or for those with great luck, the distance is too far and it will take a long time to arrive? You stayed at home and started a trend in the circle of evil cultivators with one thought. You will be rewarded with the heavenly mirror. A single thought has caused a trend in the evil cultivation circle. This matter must be related to Kumwu. I don't know exactly what he had done and how he caused a trend. This is the disadvantage of not having intelligence. This mirror can connect with the universal domain and transfer items. It can connect randomly to each domain and can transfer items, but not live items for the time being. You need to be strong enough to reach the heavenly realm before you can have the ability to transmit living things. It can be used three times a day to locate three places or creatures, beasts, humans, or any living being. After positioning, you can check the location at any time. As the mark moves with the creature, the location will also move. Let's try it first. Ma Kong, how are you? You. Why? Oh, why? Of course it's for exclusive use of the treasure. Sorry, brother. Your talent is better than mine, but I can't leave you alive. Got it. Oh, no. It's the Heavenly Tiger. I am only at the ninth level of the Profound Realm, but that Heavenly Fiend Tiger has strength above the seventh level of the Spiritual Realm. This is... 
Master, help me, please. Surprisingly, the first time I used it, I came across a scene of stabbing a brother in the back, killing, and stealing treasure. Don't panic. I'll teach you a way to easily kill the heavenly fiend tiger. Thank you, sir. Please tell me quickly. When the tiger comes at you, hold a knife in both hands, slide under its belly, and stab it into its belly with the knife, ripping it open. Remember, for any monster, its abdomen must be one of its weaknesses. Will that work? Don't worry, as the saying goes, if you attack them unexpectedly, you will be able to kill them in one fell swoop. How can there be any accident if your senior is watching over you? Senior is testing me. Yes, this must be it. Calm down. Do not panic. There is a senior watching. It's fine. Makong, this is your chance. Don't let the senior down. Go to hell. Help me. Please help me quickly. Alas. You have disappointed me so much, the hand holding the knife is not steady, the slide speed is not fast enough, and the timing is not accurate. Senior, I know I was wrong, please help me. It's too late. I am millions of miles away from you, and it will take a little time to transmit my power to you. But there must be another method which can save my life. Another method? Please give it to me quickly. You kneel down, kowtow, and call it father, the tiger will not eat his children. If you call it daddy, how can it have the nerve to eat you? Ah, uh, really useful? When the strong were weak, they were shamed and humiliated since ancient times. It's not shameful to kneel to save one's life. So don't feel burdened, this is your only chance to survive, I knows a lot about tigers and beasts. In that case, father, Father, I am your son. It works. Senior didn't lie to me. Dad, I am your son. My name is Mahu. Isn't the tiger intelligent? I called it father, so it should let me go, right? Seems like it worked. I survived. Father, please take care of yourself. See you later, father. Where are you? Roar, North State. The connected place this time turned out to be the Northern State. Shut down. It consumes too much energy. Below the Emperor Realm, it is impossible to activate the 10,000 Heavenly Mirror, and even at the Emperor Realm, it is impossible to last long. Let's make up for it. Turn on. How come there are no fish? Not good. Change the channel. Come on, let me have a little fun. In this mirror, I'll bathe in divine light, and I'll look super awesome at first glance, right? This place is weird. Let me try the spirit grass. Why is this place so lifeless? Could it be some secret place? Or a cemetery? Oh, there's someone in there. Who are you? I am a deity. I occasionally pass by when I am on a tour of the worlds of heaven and earth. Heaven and earth? You are unfamiliar with the worlds of heaven and earth? I have never heard of it. I only know of the nine regions and fifty states. He should be talking about the divisions of the world. I don't know which one of the nine domains the northern state is located on. The 50 states and the 9 regions are nothing more than a remote corner of the heavens and earth. How powerful is the land of the heavens and earth? This person in front of me who is bathed in divine light is unfathomable and at first glance he is an extremely terrifying person. It is impossible for even those who are in the heavenly realm to connect to this place. Even though this person was eroded by the deadly chi, he was still extremely powerful, far beyond the emperor's realm. But he seems to be trapped here, unable to escape. How do I get to the worlds of heavens and earth? You are still too weak and unqualified to know right now. Impossible. 
I, Rinchanha, when I was trapped in this place, I was already at the peak of the heavenly realm, and I was also the top of the strongest in the nine regions and fifty states. How could I be unqualified to know? The Pinnacle of the Heavenly Realm Even the strongest people at the pinnacle of the heavenly realm become trapped here, showing how difficult it is to escape. It would be nice to have a servant at the peak of the heavenly realm. If I plant a soul mark on him, he will accept it voluntarily. Let's fool him. The peak of the heavenly realm? A frog at the bottom of the well. The peak of the heavenly realm you mentioned is just a mere king's realm in the heavens and earth. Maybe you don't understand. At what level is the king's realm in the heavens and earth? I will tell you, today it is equivalent to the compound realm. So let me ask you, are you a mere junior of heavenly realm qualified to participate in the affairs of the world of heavens and earth? J just equal to compound realm? How powerful are people in the world of heavens and earth? No wonder, the nine regions and fifty states are remote corners. How long did it take you to cultivate to this level? It took mere 10,000 years. The qualification was so bad that it took 10,000 years to complete. Do you know that in the worlds of heaven and earth, you train to the king's realm in a mere hundred years? Oh, it's the heaven's realm for common people, all right? In the world of heavens and earth, it only takes 10 years for geniuses to reach the heavenly realm. 10 years. Impossible. I was once the famous Rinchanga, a great pride of the generation, but in the end, I was just a loser. Alas, the frog at the bottom of the well does not know the size of the world. It is really pitiful. What is the level of cultivation of you, senior? Fooling him went successfully. What can you do if you know? The difference between you and me is like the difference between the mortal realm and the heavenly realm. Please help me, senior. This place is a little special. For you, fortune and misfortune depend on each other. If you can comprehend the mystery here, you can break through the current bottleneck. I've been trapped here for over a hundred thousand years and have never been able to unravel the mystery. Instead, I've been corroded by death chi, and I'm afraid I'm on the verge of death. If you knew it was dangerous, why did you come? Do you know where this place is? I know, the barren ancient territory of the Falling God's Cave. Countless powerful people who explored the cave of the Falling Gods in the ancient kingdom have all fallen, and none have escaped from its traps. At the beginning, I thought highly of myself, thinking that I could get out of it, but in the end, I was trapped here. Since we met by chance, then it is fate, and I will give you some pointers. Dead Chi is not Dead Chi. Anger can also be dead chi, from living to death, the cycle of life and death rotate, you can get out of trouble, you can break through the bottleneck. Death and anger, what are the chances and where are the chances in the cave of the falling gods? Living to death, cycle of life and death? Senior, consider it carefully, don't just want to know the answer before you think. Everyone has a different interpretation. Old man, don't be impatient. You've been imprisoned for a hundred thousand years. What else can make you calm? I see that you have been fined for thousands of years. What's the hurry? What seniors taught you? Yes, what are you in a hurry for? If you can't understand it yourself, who in this world can understand it? Thanks for your guidance. The first step is completed. The next step is to solve the problem of dead chi erosion. In this way, there is no problem to have him as a servant or a disciple. The servants may be a little more difficult to deal with, but the named disciples shouldn't be a big problem. The key is that there must be no rebellious mentality when planting the soul seal on him, otherwise, with his strength, if he has a little rebellious mentality, I will be unable to plant the soul seal. I hope you will have realized by the time I see you again. Yes, Master. Shut down. Ha, the locator mark of the heavenly 10,000 mirrors, even those at the peak of the heavenly realm cannot detect it. It is worthy of being produced by the system. Ding. You crossed the border and fooled Rinchanga. You will be rewarded with the heavenly Yin and Yang book. Here comes the reward. The heavenly Yin and Yang book, 
It includes the cycle of life and death, reversing death into life, and turning life into death. By using it I will be able to pass through the paths of yin and yang, and can reverse death energy into vitality, or turn vitality into death energy. Oh! If Ren Chinhu cultivates this technique, not only can he solve this immediate crisis, but he can also break through and even get a glimpse of the yin and yang Tao. Heavenly Yin and Yang Book, read. Phew, I finished learning. The great way of Yin and Yang is a mysterious and incomprehensible force that governs life and death. My strength will be super strong once I have successfully cultivated it, and I will not die easily. I was just thinking about the method of resolving the dead Qi, but with this heavenly Yin and Yang book, it is no exaggeration to say that taking in Ren Changhe is no longer a big problem. To be able to plant the soul mark on him, he must be sincerely convinced and without any resistance. As long as the soul seal is planted, even if he finds out that something is wrong later, it will be useless. The mirror can no longer be used today, and I can't see Ren Changhe again so soon. I must give him some time to understand. If that's the case, let's just practice. Meow, hey. Is it finally his time to die? From now on, I will be the master of this yard. Reverse death into life, transform life into death. The cycle of life and death is endless. Meow, damn. Why is he alive again? Not fun. A few days later, damn. There's not even one ordinary person here. It's not fun. Shut down. It's been a few days. No one comes to this place. There is only sand, that sea, and these animals, like a deserted island. Purple Moon Cult. Damn it. Why? We were clearly badly damaged. Shouldn't our cult be repaired and rebuilt? But now... But now not only did the elders send a message to question me, but, but. Yes, it is all because of Wukuin, and that happened because I hired him. If the evil lord investigates further, I will definitely get involved. I will not let that happen. I must take the initiative. The Chu family. Yes, it's all the Chu family's fault. Oh, a commission from the Purple Moon Cult. Hu Quan. A million each, this, this is a huge deal. To investigate the fortification and topography of the Chu family's ancestral land. Not even the Qin cult leader, Lu Wang, targeted the Chu family with such a heavy price. What is the cause of Hu Quan's deep hatred for the Chu family? Doesn't matter. The reputation of Black Moon House is the most important. Anyone here? Finally, I was able to meet up with such a powerful person again. Du Yuan, a respected and powerful man in the Western State. Thanks to your guidance. Senior should come and visit more often. As long as he has the seal, I will be able to find him at any time. When I think about it, I am located in the southern state of the North Region, which is one of its nine regions, and Du Yuan is also in the North Region. But he has no background, he belongs to some family located in the West Region. There is still one seal left in the heavenly mirror of 10,000 days, I must use it carefully. Once all three seals have been used, I must retrieve one of them if I want to plant one again. But for now, I am unable to retrieve the seal from either Ren Changhe or Du Yuan. Someone is infiltrating the Chu family? And he does not belong to a cult. He is at the second level of the spiritual realm, using an equipment for hiding his aura and concealing his body, and he is also carrying a probing spirit instrument. They are all high-end products. The Chu family probably doesn't have them. He is a spy from Black Moon House? I was worried that I don't have a capable servant at the Black Moon House since he came to my door himself. I will not be polite. Is he here because of a commission? To explore the Chu family's land. Why does the cult keep on targeting the Chu family? I am not far away from the position of elite intelligence spy. After finishing this task, I will be promoted and my salary will be raised. 
then I will be able to go back home and get married. But I still need to investigate carefully. I must not reveal my identity as a Black Moon House intelligence spy. Otherwise, I will have to commit suicide. Here's the layout of the Chu family. It doesn't seem normal. A large tree planted alone on a small mound of land. And a guard who looks like a fool. And even a trench was dug. Since when is there a big mountain in the Chu family? Something's not right. There were obviously no mountains outside the family land. According to our information, the Chu family's land is only 12 miles. How can a mere person at the spiritual realm be able to detect the techniques of someone at the emperor's realm? Let's trap him here for now. Since the Black Moon House has accepted the commission, it must be completed, otherwise their reputation will be damaged if one intelligent spy falls, they will send a stronger one. If I keep fishing like that, I will catch the biggest fish at the end. It's been three days, and there is no feedback yet. Did something happen? Or, is it possible that the Chu family's land is loose on the outside, but so tight on the inside that it will take more time to investigate clearly? The commission must be completed as soon as possible, in order to highlight the ability of the Black Moon House. Something is definitely wrong. Whether he has completed the task or not, he must return to report his progress when he receives the order. But what ability does the Chu family have to keep Xiao Quan? Although he is not an elite intelligence spy, he is an old one. Send another elite intelligence spy to carry out the mission. Oh, in the meantime, let's find out what happened to Xiao Quan. Brother Wan, it's been a long time since I entrusted the Black Moon House O with the mission. Is there no result yet? Master Hu, don't worry, our Black Moon House word is always reliable. If you wait two or three days more, you will get the results. The Black Moon House is known for its efficiency, so it's not that difficult for the Black Moon House to find out the layout of the family, right? I hope that Brother Wan can complete the task as soon as possible. Three days, I'll wait three more days. If there are still no results, I'll cancel the mission. Don't worry, Master Hu, my Black Moon House is known for its efficiency and stability, so you can rest assured. If the employer cancels the mission due to efficiency issues, we will definitely be affected again. We are going to get promoted again soon, so there mustn't be any trouble. I should hurry up and urge the spies to perform their tasks. Damn Chu family. Two of my top agents have gone missing one after the other. This is ridiculous. This time I will do it myself. Let's see what secrets Chu family is hiding. To make me move personally. A proud moment for Chu family after all. Let's see how long they last. Three decades. The promotion I've been waiting for is almost here. At this point, I can't afford to make a mistake. Even if the Heavenly King Lao Tzu came today, he would not be able to stop this. I told you. I said everything. I told you everything I know. Please stop hitting me. The Lord of Black Moon House is in the Chu County? Night, yes. Tell me the objectives of your mission, now. It's U Quan. He spent a lot of money to buy the Chu family's topographical defense map. Hu Quan. The head of the cult in Purple Moon Kingdom? When did my Chu family provoke such a person? Has there been any movement in the cult recently? Recently, a man named Hu Quan has been making a lot of noise. It has become a trend and has brought a bunch of crazy people in the cult. They are proud to break into the evil king's palace. You have secretly taken control of the Black Moon House in Chu County without leaving home. You are rewarded a communication charm refining method. Communicate on charm? The child and parent communication symbols can exchange messages, with the parent symbol serving as the foundation. The parent symbol is the primary control symbol, capable of receiving messages from all of the child symbols and controlling the message and movement of each child symbol. 
A single parent talisman can generate hundreds of child talismans, and the higher the refining level, the more child talismans that can be generated the lowest level of the parent-child communication symbols can communicate with each other within 30,000 miles. Good, good. Just in time to use them, I need them for the spies of Black Moon House. As long as the parent symbol is in my hand, the child symbol's information is within my reach. I heard that the Black Moon House is still using the demon birds as a means of communication. If they sell information to some big power, while they don't know about the existence of the parent talisman, I will be able to grasp the entire sect information invisibly. I should refine a set to try out first. Refining them is not that difficult, but doing a lot of them is troublesome. It would be nice if I could take in a talented disciple to refine the communication symbols for me. As long as it is successful, I will be able to know the world's affairs and the secrets of various sects without having to leave home. Why hasn't the secret realm attracted any person of great fortune yet? I'm very short of manpower. Master, you asked for me? I wanted to give you these talismans, take them back to Wan Chang, you know how to use them. Now that this parent-child communication symbol has appeared, it will have a huge effect on the transmission of information. If the parent-child communication symbol is known by the elders of the Black Moon House, it will attract attention, so I will not use it widely. For the time being, I'll only make a few of them and use them wisely. The strength of Black Moon House is still unknown. I think it's still not safe for those at Emperor Realm. Let's talk with Du Yuan how enjoyable is the feeling of being a senior. Senior, I have recently encountered a matter that I am hesitant about, and I would like to ask you for some advice. Tell me. There is a big family in the Western Island. Among their descendants there is a former genius, but three years ago, suddenly, he was crippled and his cultivation became stagnant, and recently he cancelled his engagement. How can there be a template for such a person? How does he expect them not to bully him? In order to heal him, the genius's father went out to find medicine for him and then disappeared, with no one to protect his family humiliated him. Finally, three days ago, the genius suddenly burst out. He pushed his pride aside and said he would leave the family. That family issued a killing warrant, saying that as long as the genius is killed, there will be a generous reward. My family was moved and found traces of the genius, but I still can't make up my mind. I don't know what to do. This genius is really something. Maybe he is a person of great fortune and has some old master with him. Geniuses like him don't die easily. Do not get involved in this matter, or you will be in danger. Senior, how can you be sure that there will be a disaster? From genius to trash, and then from trash to genius, there must be a secret. Wait and see, those who participate in the siege will not end up well. The more famous the cultivators who participate in the siege, the more they will eventually fall or be annihilated. I will listen to Senior. I will prevent them from participating. Should the next secret realm of opportunity be set up in the northern state? I have a feeling that that genius will soon be famous in the northern state and will advance rapidly. It's been half a month. After the Purple Moon cult obtained the map of the Chu Fam L.Y., how come there has been no movement? Are they waiting for a bigger opportunity? It's been a few days since I've talked to Du Yuan. Thank you, Senior, for stopping my family from participating in the siege. That genius swept away the enemies from all direct, and almost all of the other gen uses fell. It was just as you expected. Senor, I plan to take a long trip soon to start planning for the Ancient War Demon Land competition. Ancient War Demon Land? Yes, the Ancient War Demon Land in the southern state will certainly be opened in a few decades. Du Yuan is going to participate in the competition at the Secret Realm of Opportunity? The Secret Realm that even the strongest people at the Honorable Realm are tempted by is certainly not simple. The Southern State In the ancient times, a war between humans and demons broke out. As a result, the spiritual veins of the Southern State collapsed and the laws were left incomplete. But now, the vitality is slowly being restored. Once cured, the ancient war demons would be back in this world. 
I plan to go to the southern state to set up something in advance so that I can have a little bit of an advantage when the war demon land opens. Come to the southern state? No. Not yet. I can't let him come until I increase my strength. Now is not the time for that, little do. If you want to get an advantage in the southern state, you first need to improve your cultivation. Senior, the southern state, with its collapsed veins, incomplete rules, and lack of heritage, it shouldn't even have an emperor realm, right? You little boy. How stupid you are. You only know that, but you don't understand the reason. Let me ask you, why did the southern state's veins collapse? And why were the rules incomplete? Of course, it was because the war that happened in the ancient time. Well, if that's the case, what kind of powerful people can see the veins and rules of the earth as if they were invisible, trampling on and destroying them at will? Could it be because of the heavenly mirror? Of course. You may be stupid, but you could see right through it. You are not that hopeless. Since you know it's the work of Heavenly Mirror, do you think you can still go into this mess in the southern state? Thank you, Senior. If it weren't for your guidance, I would have gone and died without a grave. It doesn't matter. Since we have met, then it is fate. I hope you will concentrate on your cultivation and not have other thoughts. That's all I have to say today. I'll see you again. I'll take it to heart. Thanks, Senior. He he. Another lame one. Shut down. Although I prevented Du Yuan from coming to the southern state, but he is not the only one who knows this news, I need to improve my cultivation as soon as possible. But it's also important to have someone at my back. I still have one more chance to connect today. Ren Changa. Start. This is. How foolish. Senior. 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 Help me. I am too stupid to understand the mystery, and I have lost more than 200 years of my life. This scene looks familiar. In my previous life, I think I saw a movie called The Earth's Breasts Cover. Hey, it's okay. It's fate that you and I met. I'll take you as my disciple for now. Are you willing? I am willing. I am willing. Even though you are a named disciple, you must still accompany me to inspect the heavens and worlds, but your cultivation is still shallow and your qualifications are insufficient. I will make an exception and give you a soul seal. It will allow you to wander between the worlds. Take it into your soul. Disciple understands. Steady. It may seem like I'm taking advantage of it, but he is not losing out either. With the heavenly Yin and Yang book, not only will he escape death in a thousand years, but he will be among the top at the heavenly mirror in no time. Ding. You didn't leave home and cross the border to receive disciples. You are rewarded with a hundred years of cultivation plus a hundred techniques of divine arts, medium. Great. Now the breakthrough to the honorable realm is in sight. The hundred techniques of the divine arts are even more essential for me to strengthen my spiritual cultivation. However, it's better to solve this problem first. You are my disciple. This technique is called the heavenly yin and yang, and with successful cultivation, one can reincarnate life and death, reverse death into life, and transform life into death, and gain a glimpse of the way of yin and yang. Thank you, Master. Learn carefully. This master is really like a god. This technique is the way to solve my calamity. How much have you understood? Master, this disciple is stupid. I have only understood less than 10% off what you taught. 10%? I don't understand how hard it is to understand the heavenly yin and yang. He is at the peak of the heavenly realm. How could his comprehension be so poor? Could it be... The heavenly Yin and Yang book is more mysterious than I expected. Why hasn't he said anything? He is not regretting taking me as his disciple, is he? Let me first explain to you the mystery of transforming death energy into vitality. Thank you, Master. For transforming dead energy into vitality, you first. It's not easy to be a teacher you should just practice and learn well. 
Yes, master. I was also a top talent in the 50 states of the nine regions I, Rinchanga, am not inferior to anyone. I won't let my master down. Receiving the reward read at Third level of the Emperor Realm, Fourth level of the Emperor Realm, Fifth level of the Emperor Realm. The higher the cultivation level, the slower the speed of cultivation. It took a hundred years of cultivation to break through the three levels of the Emperor Realm. This middle part of the hundred techniques of divine art is comparable to the previous part. The soul read at. Defense techniques and the soul attack techniques have been added. The soul spear. This spear does not hurt the body, only hurts the soul. It is impossible to defend against. The god refining map that was rewarded last time doesn't have much effect now. When will there be a new one? Contact Wan Chang Crooked, Wan Chang, ah. The government has been collecting information about the ancient war demon land and whether there are strong people from other states coming to the southern state. Then keep an eye on the Black Moon House to see if anyone at or above the Emperor Realm has come to the southern state. Yes, Master. Wan Chang's position in the Black Moon House is a bit low after all. It is absolutely necessary to further expand my control on the Black Moon House. When Wan Chang is promoted to the elite landlord and takes control of Qing State's business, I will start fishing for big fish. Control of the Black Moon House is just around the corner. Vibration Master, with my current authority, there is no way to inquire about relevant information in the Black Moon House. As expected, get promoted to elite landlord as soon as possible. I will give you a soul seed. Then go to your boss, the bronze landlord. Fortunately, there is still a long time before the opening of the war demon land, and there will be no strong men from other states coming over for the time being. I can also stabilize for a period of time and improve my strength. Then I should go and give advice to Du Yuan and Ren Changa to stay behind. Master Yao Xiong, Black Moon House Bronze Landlord Wan Chang that murderer, I knew that he had no good intentions finding me now the seed is controlling my soul, there is no way for me to resist. Do you know the information about the ancient war demon land? Master, I don't know. Sure enough, the intelligence level of the war demon land is not low, and even the Bronze Landlord is not qualified to know the details. Only when it is exposed can these landlords be able to access it. You take this soul seed and go give it to your boss, the Silver Landlord. As long as he is not a strong person in the Emperor Realm, he will not be able to resist. Yes, not good. Seems like something big is going to happen to the Black Moon House. Master, I don't know the information of the ancient war demon land. Yao Xiong that bastard. How dare he screw me. Fan Chao, Silver Landlord of the Black Moon House. Even the Silver Landlord does not have access to the information about the ancient war demon land. What is this composition system of the Black Moon House? The Black Moon House is divided into departments, the Logistics Department and the Security Department. The Logistics Department is responsible for providing various resources for the Black Moon House, such as alchemy, weaponry, etc. The Security Department, whose main duty is to protect the safety of the Black Moon House, is a military department specially trained by the Black Moon House. Among them, the Landlord Department is the main department responsible for the operation of the Black Moon House. In the entire southern state, there are seven Silver Landlords. Then take this soul seal and go find your boss, the Gold Landlord. Yes, the Black Moon House is in big trouble. Master, what can I do for you? Bao Hong Yin, Black Moon House Gold Landlord, female? Nice and round, I uh, know. I mean, what a great aura. Ahem. Let me ask you, how many Gold Landlords are there in the Southern State? Three. Fan Chao, you idiot. I will give you a good death. But one thing is for sure, this little guy is really good at what he does. I'm afraid no one can detect anything unusual about us. I never thought that there was such a person in the Chu family. It's so terrifying. I never thought that someone had the capabilities to infiltrate Black Moon House. In the Black Moon House, are there any powerful person at the Emperor Realm in the Southern State? 
there is one landlord living in the southern state. Rumor has it that he is only half a step away from reaching the emperor realm. Just half a step away, generally speaking, the security department and the Black Moon House is stronger, which means that people at the emperor realm may exist. Forget about it. If he is truly a powerful man in the emperor realm, I am afraid I will be unable to control him. And once I'm exposed, my current achievements will be lost. About the ancient war demon land, do you know anything? Yes, master, I know a little. According to the legend, in ancient times, there were demons roaming the world, extremely powerful. The ancient war demon land was the battlefield in the southern state when the demons invaded the north in the ancient times. As a result of the Great War, the earth veins of the southern state collapsed and the rules were incomplete, so all the strongest people above the Emperor Realm left, which is why there are no one at the Emperor Realm in the southern state today. And the ancient war demon land vanished in the torn open space, with the collapse of the earth's veins and the rules remained incomplete. According to the calculation, when the southern veins are restored and the rules are perfected again, the ancient war demon land will reappear. There must be many treasures and legacies, so all the major powers will send people in to explore. Of course, there is still a long way to go before the reappearance of the war demon land. In 20 to 30 years, the probability is that there will not be a major power to set foot in the southern state soon. 20 to 30 years. Looks like there is still time for me to get stronger. But I can't rule out the possibility that there are still cultivators like Du Yuan who would come to the southern state in advance. All right, I got it. You should pay attention at all times. Once there is someone above the Emperor Realm in the southern state, please let me know as soon as possible. Yes, Master. Take this communication symbol to keep in touch at any time. Yes, Master. Two months later. How boring. Can't I find a woman suitable for me, Chu Xian, in the whole world? Hmm? Here comes the food. Shut down. That's a new person? A woman? Let me check her background and see what her objectives are. Su Xianer, 16 years old, with great fortune, has the Taiyin Xian body, a concubine daughter from the Su family in the central state, to escape marriage contract. She escaped from the Su family, mistakenly entered into the ancient fragmented teleportation array, and came to the southern state, disguised herself to hide in the Chu family, to avoid being tracked. Here she comes, this lucky one, and she is a woman. This way, I will not be recognized, right? It's all my sister's fault. How dare she throw her unwanted marriage contract onto me? And that old man who can't make decisions. I can't believe they agreed. I must cultivate here to reach the Emperor realm. Then go back and see if they dare to force me again. Humph. I found out. The job of delivering meals to the good for nothing young master of the Chu family is the most leisurely. Except for meal time, the rest of the time can be used for cultivating. That punk. What? Su Xiener, from the Su family in Central State, is the Su family's concubine's daughter, who escaped the marriage contract and arrived in the Southern State by mistake via the ancient fragmented teleportation array. What? You. Don't come near me. I lack a maid right now. Would you like the job? I. Isn't the one living in the small courtyard supposed to be the trash of Chu family? What's going on here? Who is this person? This is your chance, you have a special Taiyin Xian body, but your cultivation techniques cannot bring out the characteristics of this body under this young master, reaching the heavenly realm is a matter of course. I got exposed. How did he know where I came from? Who is he? To be his maid? Wouldn't that be suitable for him to do whatever he wants? Should I resist? But how? If I refuse, what will happen? Will he use force? Tain body? Is that my body type? This person knows everything. He must be a strong and powerful person. Is this my chance? You are lucky to be here. This is your chance. What are you hesitating for? Do you think I want your beauty? She looks pretty. 
No, I dare not. Senior, it is just, do you think that because you come from the Sioux family, being my maid is an insult to you? No, it's not. Sue Senior pays respects to Senior. Very well, from now on, don't call me Senior, call me Master. Yes, Master. He looks so handsome. If the person I was going to was going to marry was so good looking, I wouldn't have to run away from home. Get up. Yes, Master. I've only been in the southern state for a few days, but I've already become someone else's maid. Besides, he doesn't look like an old master. He seems to be 25 or 26 years old, right? You stayed at home and took in someone with great fortune. You are rewarded with Taing Su Immortal Technique Book plus a secret realm of chance. Sure enough, there is a reward. Taing Su Immortal Technique is the most suitable technique for Su Xian's Taing Xian body. She will have the ability to use the talent of her Taing Xian body to its fullest extent. Come here. Yes. It's over. He is finally going to do that to me. Bye bye. My innocence. Since you're my maid, I will help you with your cultivation. Third level of the Void Realm. This technique, it is a legendary technique that is above the divine method. For cultivating this technique, it is out of reach even to those in the heavenly realm. Thank you, Master. Very well. Practice hard. I took you as my maid, so do well. Just help me organize the information and so on. Did he take me in as a maid, just so I do these odd jobs? Is he really no going to do anything? Master is so good looking and powerful, I won't resist. I will teach you the method of hiding the aura, so even if those in the honorable realm will not be able to see through you. Not bad, she is pretty, with outstanding talent, doing odd jobs and running errands is very suitable for her. In the future, she can be given the responsibility of running errands regarding the Black Moon House. Her strength is still a little weak. But it doesn't read eight matter, with her talent, plus the practice of Taing Su Immortal Technique, she will soon be able to improve. This is Black Moon House Information. Master, are you a senior in the Black Moon House? Not yet. I just helped him in some matters. Master, the Sioux family must have commissioned the Black Moon House to find out where I am. Will I be detected here? I'll be safe? Right? Don't worry. In this southern state, Black Moon House will not leak your information, so you will not get exposed. With a maid, you can really relax a lot. Continue with this outfit. You look good. He is really treating me like a handyman. Sir, who is she? One of the Black Moon House's golden landlords in the southern area. Golden landlords. Read it. She won't find out who I am, will she? Uh, my dear. Why are you nervous? Hey, here you go. You will be responsible for contacting her in the future. You will sort out the useful information and tell me. Aye. That's right. You are a perfect fit. It's only a matter of time before I get hold of the entire Black Moon Intelligence Network in Southern State. Not only will you not reveal your whereabouts when you come into contact, but you'll also be able to keep track of the Sioux family's movements. Isn't it perfect for you? Yes. Thank you, sir. Two years later. Time flies so fast. It's been two years. Sister Yuan has come back twice. Although the quality is not as good, but it's much better than the ones from Tian Ding Mountain. I didn't expect this girl to be so talented. Sir, there seems to be some changes in the Qing family. The Qing family? Changes? I'm afraid it has something to do with Qing Kiyun. The head of the Qing family was abdicated. It is suspected that he was forced to do so. The new emperor has not yet been chosen, and currently there is no head of the family. That's all? Yes. The Black Moon House is also investigating the details. But the Zhao, he and Chu families do not know this information yet. The situation in Qing will change. Even the situation in the entire southern state will change. The demon emperor will reborn, the soul of the fox demon. But I don't know, 
in this life, will she be a human or a demon? From today onwards, I am the Empress of Qin, the head of the Qin family. Who is against it? Who supports it? The ancient land of war demons will be made available. This is a chance for the Qin family to shine. Anyone who refuses to accept me is welcome to come forward. As long as he can defeat me, he will be the Qin family's leader. No one is speaking out. Since everyone supports me, from today onwards, I will have the final say in the Qin family, and I will also have the final say in the Qin country. Now, follow my order, everyone donate a drop of blood to open the altar of the Qin family. Kiyun pays homage to Ancestor. Kiyun, you are finally here. Are the ANC, are the Ancestors still alive? Actors still alive? According to the legend, the strength of the Ancestors is as high as the heaven. Ancestors, the Qin family has declined and the Qin country has long since fallen, but I want to restore the Qin country's prestige and revive it. Get up all. Just now, the ancestors have bestowed the inheritance to restore the glory of the Qing family, so you should work hard to cultivate. I'll give the inherited techniques to Pingxia and have her teach it to everyone. And more. Recall the men of the Qing family who are in Great Qian. The Zhao family, He family, and Chu family were originally the subordinates of the Qing family. From today on, the state of Qin will no longer be ruled by four families. But, I'm afraid that Great Qin won't let the men of Qin family return. Doesn't matter. I will solve the problems personally, if they don't agree. Two hours later. Laws of Southern State are incomplete. There is only one way to enter Emperor's realm. Rely on the power of the Demon Fox. The Qin family is going to rebel. Recall the soldiers. Become subordinates? The men of four families are hostages in Great Qian. How dare the Qin family challenge it so openly? It seems there will be a good show. Ding. Your maid Su Sienner, with your superb training methods, breaks through the compound realm and you will be rewarded with 10 years of cultivation. Oh ah. Uh, cultivation. I feel like I'm doing it again. Wait. If I teach Ren China the skills, will I be rewarded with cultivation? Su Sienner breaks through the compound realm and I get rewarded with cultivation. It seems that teaching disciples is a shortcut to improve one's cultivation. Hey, hey. Sir. I. Congratulations. Today is a great day for you to break through the compound realm. But you shouldn't be arrogant and impatient. You have to go much further. What? How does he know? Is he that good? Uh, ahem. How about that? Are you ready to go now? Or is there someone here who can fight me? The Emperor of the Great Qian. It's so busy here today. Evil King. Are you here to take advantage of the fire and loot? An enemy's enemy is a friend. Today we will fight and destroy the Great Qian together. Little girl. I'm afraid I'm going to disappoint you. For our evil King's court. The best script is of course to kill all of you. Wrong answer. Uncle. Little girl, the one who can judge whether I am right or wrong has not yet been born. You, you, everyone here, listen up. I declare that from now on, the Qin kingdom will no longer serve Qin. No more sending experts here as hostages. I, Qin Qiyun, am here today to take the throne of the emperor. What did you say? 
Qin Qiyun has become the emperor? That's right, and she also brought back the masters of the Qin, Chu, Zhao, and he families from the Qian kingdom. All information is written here. She alone defeated the ten great masters of the Qian kingdom, and the evil king also was severely injured. It is indeed the reincarnation of the demon fox. The level of her improvement is really fast. It seems that the situation of ruling the Qian kingdom by the four families is coming to an end. The empress of the Qian, she is so domineering and powerful. Yaha! Do you want to be an empress too? No, I just want to be with you. Remember, the empress and the emperor are just titles. The most important thing is strength. If you're strong enough, what kind of empress can't you suppress with one hand? Yes, sir. He. -he. But I have to say, this Qin Kiyun is still. Hmm. There is someone outside. Qin Kiyun, what are you doing here? Chu Xian. I am now the Empress of Qin, and I want to marry you. Marry Chu Xian? Marry me? You must be joking. I am the Emperor now. Of course, I can't be someone if I don't have a harem. Come on, let me take advantage of you. What? Now your third brother is not here you are the only one in the harem. Don't you want to think about it? You won't have such an opportunity in the future. Die. Humph! I didn't think you'd be such a strong horse. No matter, let's see how you can escape from my hand. Ah! Great Chain Empress! Kneel! He can suppress me with one word? What kind of strength is this? Empress of Great Chain? Who gave you the courage to act presumptuously in front of me? Kayu knows her mistake. It must be cheap for you drink the tea made by this girl. Let me ask you. The ancient land of war devils, do you know anything about it? I, although I have past life memories, I know very little about it. It's okay. Tell us as much as you can. In my previous life, I was the demon pet of the great Qin Emperor. Even though I was a demon pet, I was at the ninth level of the Emperor realm, and the strength of the Emperor was even more unfathomable. The emperor doted on me, and I was never far away from him. Until. Before the big war, the emperor left some magical treasures for me and quickly left. There was disturbing news at the end of every day. Soon afterwards, the war between humans and demons broke out in full force, and there was no news from the emperor. After that the ancestral land of the great Qin was invaded by the demons and several elders, and I took our clan to transfer. But in the end, I fell while fighting against a powerful demon. Fortunately, I had my soul fragment left by the emperor with me so that I could reincarnate. I was born in the Qin family from Qin Pingxia. After that, you know the rest. This matches her results of the source exploration. She did not lie. It looks like there's no need to worry. She is honest with me. Before the emperor left, apart from the treasures, did he say anything? No, the emperor was furious as he walked away. And he left quickly. That's right. He seemed to keep talking about traitors. Human traitors. Someone from the human race has rebelled? It seems that there are many secrets related to this ancient war that are still not known. There are lots of secrets, and the only clue to these secrets is the Qin emperor. All right. Qin Kiyun, go back. Don't tell anyone about what happened today. There is no time to delay. I'm afraid that there are many masters who covet the ancient war demon land. Come on. Master. What are your orders? I want to know all the information about the ancient Qin Emperor. Yes, Master. I'll go check it out. Humph. This is my first opportunity in the war demon land. I must not miss it. Three days later. The great Qin emperor was the only monarch in history who united the southern states and built an empire. Southern state unification. I'm afraid his power was at least in the heavenly realm. 
So previously, the southern states were unified, huh? Wasn't the war between humans and demons launched against Chain? Then a traitor to the human race is a traitor to Chain, right? It seems that the water in the ancient war demon land is even deeper than expected. That it even caused the emperor to fall. Before the reopening of the ancient war demon land, I have to advance to the heavenly realm. Master, dinner is ready. Oh, I am coming. Hey, hey, hey. What am I eating today? Master, something is wrong. Let this little brother talk to you. Young master, the empress has returned the fiefdoms and the masters of the Chu family. Chin Kiyun, what's happening? Isn't this a good thing? Those people are back to their land. That's true. But think about it, young master, isn't the great Qin Empress deliberately ignoring us? The master is now enraged. He believes Chu Yuan has offended the Empress by rejecting his marriage. I'm so angry. Bring Chu Yuan to me. This unfilial son. What is the Chu family's situation now? Why didn't he come back yet? Arrest him and give him to the Empress to make amends. Needless to mention the Qin state. If this goes on, the Chu family will be left out by the He and Zhao families. If any powerful enemy really attacks us in the future, our Chu family will be alone and helpless. What would we do then? Oh, the Chu family head wants to arrest his grandson Chu Yuan? Interesting. Lord, fortunately we are located in the interior of Qin State, so we don't have to worry about the troublemakers on the border. Recently, the Zhao and He families have risen very rapidly, probably due to the benefits from the Qin family. Report the Qin family sent a notice, the border affairs will be the responsibility of the Chu family. The Chu family shall take care of it, and the Chu family should kindly accept that. What? It seems that the Empress is still angry with the Chu family for repudiating the marriage. Ugh, what a blatant slap in the face. Oh, the old man is ranting again. Let me see what today's information is about. No way, it's really interesting. At present, the situation in Qin is very turbulent, and people from all walks of life are frequently causing trouble at the border. As a result, many of Qin's soldiers have been killed or injured. Little Qin's son, come at me. Shameless cult, I will not share the same fate as you. This situation did not last long in Qin, however, because a powerful man from the Nine Swords Mountains stepped in and killed many enemies. You rats, don't run wild. Not good. He is a true realm powerhouse. He is from the Nine Swords Mountain. He is Hong Fei, the great elder of the Nine Swords Mountain, Hong Fei. Then let's run quickly. Now Qin Kiyun almost stepped into the Emperor realm. If not for the deep heritage of the great Qian and the evil king's court, they would have been swallowed up. There is also that true realm powerhouse Hong Fei. Surprisingly, he turned out to be Qin Kiyun's father, who was a backwards family member. But, Hong Fei's age when Qin Pingxia got pregnant was still small, is this the magic of love? But all this seems to be arranged in advance, could it be the work of the great Qin Emperor behind Qin Kiyun? Moreover, the Nine Swords Mountain existed before the War Demons, so could it be that the Nine Swords Mountain were a supporter of the great Qin Emperor? It seems that the water in the southern state is indeed a bit deep, but it is also becoming more and more interesting. When their strength is improved, I will let Du Yuan and Ren Changhe come to the southern state. No matter how muddy the southern state's water is, or how dangerous this chess game in the southern state is, I will turn it over with one hand while staying at home. Then I can get the system's biggest reward. He he he. By the way, it's time to explore that unknown space underneath the ancestral home. As I expected, this is the same as the Zhao and He families. There are some inherited powers, and if these powers are instilled into those who are above the third level of the compound realm, they will be able to quickly advance and step into the true realm. According to the records, that ancestral house of the Chu family is an ancient site, and the Chu family has become what it is today through the excavation of ancient sites. 
Forget it. Let's wait for Chu Yun to open those sites when she comes back. Your Highness, I have a report about the battle at the border. Speak. There are constant sneak attacks by cults on the border, but with the revelation of our family background. Get to the point. How about the battlefield at front? The frontal battlefield has won a complete victory, and the cult is no longer able to organize large-scale attacks and has now gone into hiding. Ching Pingshan. Humph. A group of wicked and immortal cockroaches tell the front lines to not only pay attention to cults, but also to pay more attention to those who buried nails in our Qing country. Yes, your highness. At the moment, Qing is rising too fast. When I get a firm foothold, it will be time to attack with full force. It will be the time for those cockroaches to die. Your Highness, I still have the matter of the Chu family to present. My clan and the Chu family have been married for generations and are also family friends. If we exclude the Chu family at this time, I'm afraid. All right, don't mention the Chu family's affairs again. Keep everything as it is and let the Chu family take care of itself. Also, don't interfere with the Chu family. Yes, Your Highness, I will take my leave. From Her Highness's attitude towards the Chu family, it seems that she is still upset about her marriage's initial rejection. No one can disobey her. Anyone who does not comply with the clan will be killed or crippled. I have said everything that needs to be said. The Chu family may wish for their own good fortune. This old man with dementia doesn't really know what the Chu family is like. Their depths are endless. In our great Qin Empire, you must obey the rules of our great Qin Empress. General Li, do you understand what I mean? Your Majesty, I don't disagree at all, just... Stop talking. Take a look at this letter. Surrendering in the open, but secretly collaborating with the enemy. Remove him. Put him to death. Your Majesty, forgive me. Please forgive me. Your Majesty, Your Majesty. Today, the Qin Dynasty is in its peak. I don't care if you were royals, nobles, or overlords in the past. Since you have joined the Qin, you must be loyal. If someone violates the rules, it will be his end. We will follow Her Majesty's orders. Today, you will practice the Chu family's magic fist a thousand times and the Chu family's magic leg two thousand times. If you are lazy, you will be punished by kneeling in the ancestral hall for three months. I hope you can do it. Please don't worry, I won't hold back my family. Have you heard the news? The Zhao and Yi families have been taken to the capital by the Qin family, leaving the Chu family alone. Is that true, the Chu family is so lazy now? I see a bright future for them. It's better to go to Zhao He's house to sweep the floor. There is no future for doing it here. Yes, let's resign and go. Okay. God. Why do you treat my Chu family like this? Ding. The old man's mission is completed today. As long as he doesn't come here to nag me, he can just shout the sky down. Let's use the mirror to have some fun. Shall do. You have to solve the problem of your mouth when you eat. At your command. Oldrin, it's not right for you to do that. You have to do this, 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 oh. So it is like this, 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 I understand. These two little guys have also broken through the emperor realm, not bad. The three year period is about to end. Why hasn't someone with great fortune appeared yet? I'm a loser. Eh? Rubbish. I'm rubbish. I'm that kind of loser that resembles a wood that can't even be burnt to set fire. How can a loser like me be worthy of a girl like her? It's all my own fault. I'm just a loser, the worst loser in the world. It appears that those who are fortunate are all useless at first. Where did you come from? Leave it to me, sir, and see if I... Brother, do you have any wine? He is a stupid drunk. It's okay, you go to practice. Is it because this person is very talented that sir did not expel the drunken man? I'm not sure. I have no money with me, so I'll trade this useless sword for wine. Your sword is a mysterious one. It's a loss to exchange it with wine. 
Brother, I'm a big loser. What's the use of having a good sword? Do you know what a loser is? It's me. Look at me and you will know, he he. I can see that you are indeed a loser. Your whole body is full of the smell of wine. If you say that you are not, even the cockroaches in my courtyard will not believe it. Not only are you a loser, but you're a loser who's been dumped by a woman. Crap, stop pestering me. Not only do I know this, I also know that you were dumped by your childhood sweetheart. Stop hitting him. Your hands will hurt. Moreover, your childhood sweetheart's new lover crushed you to punish you for daring to think that you are worthy of this beautiful woman. What a miserable loser. How do you know? Who are you? I am the guiding light for those who have lost girls and the savior of losers in both the heavens and the earth. Meeting me is the best opportunity of your life. The savior? Are you the savior? That's right, I'm the savior. Can I really change? Can I really stop being a loser? This gentleman is so skillful. With such a majestic aura, will he lie to a loser like me? It's better to think about trying to do it. Young man, kneel and accept me as your master. Spell it out. I am your disciple, ding you. Greetings to the master. Very good. From now on, you will be my disciple, Chu Xian. If you respect your teacher, I will ensure that you will be transformed and reach the top. I will follow the teachings of my master. Ding you, an abandoned disciple of Nine Swords Mountain. Possessing the supreme talent of swordsmanship Tianqin Sword Vein, his sword veins are not yet open and his meridians are blocked so the cultivation is extremely slow, so he is regarded as waste and abandoned by his childhood sweetheart. Good. Ding. You stay at home and accept the first disciple who is extremely talented in the way of swordsmanship and you will be rewarded with the Tong Tian Sword Art. Hey, I found a treasure. Master. Can you really make me stronger? Do not doubt your teacher. You think I'm just a loser and good for nothing? It is you who is a loser. You are a piece of shit, but I can turn you into gold. If I'm really a piece of shit, then I might as well be dead. Don't think, concentrate, and calm your mind. Yes, master. Ding you, today is the day you are reborn. Tong Tian sword skill. Open up for me. I have reached the first level of the spiritual realm, and I can now understand all the sword moves that I could not understand before. I can also understand the thou sand variations of the most mundane sword moves. Master is simply too awesome. Ding you, I've passed the Tong Tian sword skill into your head, so steady it well. Huh? Ding you advanced, but now he seems to cultivate the sword. Master's methods are simply unheard of before. Which realm could such an unnatural person be in? Ding your disciple Ding Yu, under your guidance, has rapidly improved his cultivation and advanced to the spiritual realm. You are rewarded with a hundred years of cultivation. This hundred years of cultivation has come at the right time to help me break through the emperor realm and advance to the honorable realm. The honorable realm. Success. After reaching the honorable realm, my soul was sublimated again and my domain power underwent a metamorphosis. For cultivators below the emperor realm, the domain power of the emperor realm is like the sky, in which people below emperor realm can be ravaged and suppressed at will. The cultivators are just like ants. But the power of the honorable realm can build its own rules within the domain, it can connect heaven and earth and form its own circle. Because of this, it is as easy as turning the palm of one's hand for those at the honorable realm to suppress those at the emperor realm. Sure enough, every time the realm is raised, the dominance over the lower ranks will go to a higher level. Let me check how powerful my soul and domain power got. The current power of my domain has really lived up to my expectations. It can cover a radius of 50 miles, and no one in my domain will be able to detect my techniques. Cool. The current rules in the southern states are incomplete. However, because of the system, I can directly bypass these incomplete rules and make significant progress. That's why my domain power is several grades stronger than cultivators of the same realm. 
Although I can't say that I am invincible in the honorable realm, there is no pressure for me to deal with anyone below the sixth level of the honorable realm. The rules of the great Tao, the top level techniques, the heavenly secret arts, and the powerful soul are all gathered in my body. I am worthy of being the son of the system, and this small southern state is within my grasp. Ding you have advanced to the honorable realm, and your strength has further increased, you will be rewarded with the holy master aura and the heavenly regret phase technique, haha, <laughs> double happiness. Cool. Holy master aura. Holy master aura can help people to understand better, get enlightened, and enhance their qualifications. This was really what's missing. I will use this aura to teach my disciples. They will get twice the result with half the effort. Let me take another look at this heavenly regret phase technique. I hope it is a powerful technique. Heavenly regret phase technique, its power can shake the sky, shake one's great Tao, subdue the domain, and break it. As long as it is system production, it must be a good product receiving the heavenly regret phase technique reward. The heavenly regret phase technique is really strong. It is too dominant. It's awesome. Fortunately, there is an array. Otherwise, a large number of weak small chickens will be scared to death. It is not an exaggeration to say that the power of the enemy's domain can be shattered by this aura. If the heavenly regret phase technique is combined with my holy master aura, the result will be an extremely arrogant tool. I should find old Ren to try, he he he. Ren, how are you doing? With the guidance of my master, I have been able to keep my body intact, but I still need some time to get out of this predicament. Huh? Is this the aura of the master? It's so powerful. It's so domineering. I'm sure I've worshipped the right person. Oldrin, seeing that you have regained your vitality and returned to the peak, do you still have any questions? This disciple is stupid and still has some puzzling points. Then it's just the right time to use my holy master aura, he he he. Don't be discouraged, your master will help you. Thank you, master. Master is a genius, but I, the self-proclaimed supreme arrogant guy, should be nothing more than a useless bundle of wood in his presence. Thanks to my master's kindness, I was not trapped to death in that cave. Changa, don't hate yourself, how old are you? If you don't work hard at a young age, you will be sad when you grow old. Pay attention to your lessons. I am saying this so that you can keep your strength and improve, to return to your original state and advance to the right realm, so. Master, really, I'm going to cry to death, woo woo woo. Today is a good day, all of my wishes have come true, both now and in the future, it would be even better if there were a few more disciples of great fortune. But a disciple of great fortune is not as common as cabbage, if the time has not yet come, it cannot be forced. I should use the heavenly mirror of 10,000 days to connect with Little Dew and show him my incredible powers. Stop, don't run, you are the one who helped Xiao Liang escape. I said it was a misunderstanding, I didn't come here to save Xiao Liang. Xiao Liang? Is that the orphaned son of a large family from the West? Xiao Liang, who appears to have the protagonist's halo. Du Yuan is not a liar. It seems that he happened to be involved in the Xiao Liang incident. Let's see what's going on. Anyway, since I'm here, it will not be easy to kill Du Yuan. Humph. It's my Xiao family business. You, just a small cultivator, dare to intervene? If you have nothing to do with Xiao Liang, let us arrest you, and when my Xiao family discovers the truth, we will release you. You think I am a fool? If I let you catch me without a fight, I will surely die. These two are both in the second level of the honorable realm like me. It is not a good idea to fight recklessly. It is better to find a chance to escape. Du Yuan has a great talent. He has crossed several realms and killed many enemies. How come he is forced into such a state by these two people? Oh, I see. It's because Du Yuan's weapons are not as good as his enemies. Humph, you're not the only ones in the western state. You Xiao family. Don't be aggressive. The Xiao family does not dominate the western state, but you as a small cultivator should not provoke them. 
This small cultivator is indeed tricky, but Xiao Liang's escape is ultimately related to him, so he must die. It's time to take action. Little Du, what is happening here? This, this, where did this person come from? What kind of heavenly technique is this? Even the rumored legendary cultivators in the heavenly realm can't do this, right? Master. Master, Du Yuan is in a bit of danger. Can Master lend a helping hand? Huh? Really? For these ants? It's over. We are finished. That strong man in the sky and the small cultivator know each other. And we have become ants. Ants? In my master's eyes, I can't even beat ants. So, who am I? You two little ants, why are you making things difficult for Du Yuan? Senior, it's all a misunderstanding, a misunderstanding. We have no intention to be enemies of Brother Du. Is that so? It's true. Senior. In front of such a powerful senior, we two ants would never dare to lie. You are saying it was a misunderstanding. Little do, are these two people's words true? Master, this, this was indeed a misunderstanding, master. Du Yuan is so careful and cautious, he knows that the Xiao family would not spare him if these two got killed. If I let them go, they can let the Xiao family know that there is an unknown power behind him, which is a good idea. I see, I'm too lazy to move my hands, and crushing these two ants will get my hands filthy. Yes, we are ants, we dare not dirty the senior's hands, we shouldn't have made things difficult for Brother Du, it was our fault. There were ants at first, but now he thinks crushing these ants to death will dirty his hands, and I couldn't even beat these ants, rounding it up, so my hands are also dirty. Ugh. I am still too weak. Without the protection of my master, I'm nothing but a little ant. Little do, what do you want to do with these two ants? Master, don't let this misunderstanding dirty your hands, and these two ants have realized their mistake, so it's okay to spare their lives. I just need a little compensation to mend the wounds of my young heart. This guy looks good, but in fact, he has a monkey spirit. If that's the case, then you two little ants, as compensation, hand over everything you have to little do, then you can go away. More grace from the seniors. We little ants, can we get out now? It was terrifying. What a fearsome person. Could he be a long-lost monster? This kind of power is not even available to those in the heavenly realm. Don't think about it. Let's go back to our clan and report to the elders. This horrible being can only be befriended, not fought. Master. Master saved Du Yuan from danger, but I know my talent is limited and my strength is that of an ant. But I still want to repay my master for saving me from danger. I am willing to be a slave or a servant to do even minor things for my master. Du Yuan is pure and thoughtful, so I can save a lot of worry if I accept him. Forget it, our meeting is fate, you can just run errands for this deity in this world. Du Yuan greets you, your majesty. Dean you stayed home, and you fooled a servant of the honorable realm with your tongue. You are rewarded with the heavenly purple flame plus flame spirit cone. My throat was about to be burned, so it wasn't a waste of time. People with great luck are really rare, it would be perfect if they could appear in groups. There's still one more chance to use the heavenly mirror, so let's use it. This kid has reached the third level of the compound realm at a young age, and his skills are also at the level of gods, and his aptitude and talent are definitely above Su Sinner. Huh? How come the more you look at this kid, the more familiar he looks? Isn't this the abandoned son of the Xiao family, Xiao Liang? Could it be that he is the lucky son of the western region? Is this the soul of a powerful man from the heavenly realm? Or a lovely character? This young man is extremely fortunate. Master, if you take another two or three strikes, you will fall into a coma. You must leave the western region as soon as possible. Yes, master. I'll leave as soon as possible. The Shao family, I will definitely seek justice. 
Cultivate hard, rely on strength to speak, as long as you break through the heavenly realm, the Shao family will naturally respect you. Master, don't worry, I will reach the heavenly realm within a thousand years and help you rebuild your body. Thousand years? This kid is a bit crazy. But as a son of luck, it's not impossible. How is this possible? It took geniuses in the nine regions and fifty states a hundred years to reach the emperor's realm, a thousand years to the honorable realm, and a ten thousand years to reach the heavenly realm. Moreover, the heavenly realm is a natural abyss, and countless strong and arrogant people have been stuck in front of it for tens of thousands of years. If there is no great opportunity, no matter how strong the talent is, it is impossible to break through the heavenly realm in ten thousand years. Is it so difficult to reach the heavenly realm? However, don't be discouraged. With my guidance and your outstanding talent and profound luck, it is not a big problem to break through the heavenly realm. In my generation, there was once a person who achieved the heavenly realm in 10,000 years and was invincible in the same realm. He broke into the devil kingdom alone, killed three in and three out, and everyone retreated under his might. Now I'm afraid he is gone. Master, who was that man? That is Renchanga, who shocked the nine regions and 50 states 100,000 years ago. Old Ren? This beauty turned out to be the same generation as Old Ren. Listening to the beauty's tone, Lauren really wasn't bragging. Who was gossiping about me behind my back? Master, I will definitely be like Changha, and L will shock the nine regions and 50 states. This young man is really bothering me. That bastard Ren Changha now has an inferiority complex and is useless. How dare he still take him as a role model? Who is talking about me? Didn't he finish yet? It is necessary to take action and bring this guy to my side. The nine regions and fifty states are just remote corners of the worlds of heavens and earth. As for where the worlds of heavens and earth are, it doesn't matter. Fooling is the most important thing. I believe you should leave the western state and travel to the southern state, where the rules of heaven and earth are insufficient and the strong people in the emperor's realm will not easily set foot in there. Moreover, the war demon ancient land is about to open, and it will restrict the powerful people above the emperor's realm to go there. If you go to the northern state, you can avoid the Shao family, and secondly, you will find great opportunities. Yes, master. Pursuer from the Shao family? Such a skill that even those at the heavenly realm do not possess, could it be the Shao family ancestor? No, the ancestors of the Shao family have no reason to chase after me, a descendant with talent. Besides, the ancestors of the Shao family definitely do not possess such supernatural powers. Who the hell is this? He, I bluffed two more, even the old Ren who was stronger than me was fooled by this trick. Please, stop it. Don't panic. I am a deity patrolling the worlds of heavens and earth to find the one who has a great destiny, so don't be suspicious. The heavens and the earth? Could it be that this unknown powerful person is a transcendental existence above this space? I, Lu Pia Piao, would like to pay my respects to the senior. I hope you'll forgive me for offending you. I, Xiao Liang, pay my respect to the senior. No problem. I see that you too look tired, and this gentleman is still injured, so I don't blame you for being cautious. Thank you for your understanding. I have been living in nine regions and fifty states, but I have never seen such a transcendent existence. I have never heard of the heavens and the earth, so I wonder if you can explain about it to us. You are too weak to know. That's normal. The worlds of heavens and the earth encompass everything. I have never been to the nine regions and fifty states where you are located. Can you tell me about it? I will tell you everything I know. Among the nine regions and fifty states, humans own five regions, demons own one region, monsters own one region and another region has a mixture of all races. Among the nine regions, only the ancient wasteland is mysterious. It is rumored that the ancient wasteland is larger than the other eight regions. Many powerful people in the heavenly realm have explored the ancient wasteland, but they can only explore in the borders, and even in there, countless people have fallen. 
and it said that only those at the divine realm can enter the ancient wasteland. But for some reason, those at the divine realm don't come out from the ancient wasteland. The ancient wasteland? It turns out that the true depths of the water are in the ancient wasteland. No wonder such a strong person like Ren Changhe is trapped inside. Because the ancient wasteland is so mysterious, let us place the road to the worlds of heavens and earth there and say that only those in the divine realm are qualified to travel there. Little girl, what you know is merely the surface after all. We met because of fate, so let me give you some hints. The nine regions and fifty states are just a remote corner in the heavens and the earth. The divine realm you speak of is just a mere local emperor. This deity can destroy countless people in this realm with just one breath. Is the divine realm so bad? You can destroy people in it with a single breath? Are the nine regions and fifty states just a remote corner? How powerful and vast are the heavens and the earth? In our eyes, the ancient wilderness is mysterious enough. I dare not think about the heavens and the earth. Until now I thought Ren Changho was my role model, but now I see that he's just the same as me. And we are just frogs in a well. Boy, are you scared. Ren Changho was fooled by me. You should use your brains. Thanks for your guidance. You youngsters, work hard. If you want to go to the heavens and the earth, you must first go to the place you call the ancient wasteland. It turns out that the mysterious ancient region is the way to the worlds of heavens and the earth. No wonder it is rumored that only people in the divine realm can enter, and they don't leave the ancient wasteland. It turns out that they have gone to the worlds of heavens and the earth. The senior clarified the confusion. I will not be able to know such a big secret without you. Thank you. Little girl, you are welcome. I see that you are in the form of the soul and a little weak. Could it be that the senior wants to help me rebuild my body? Because you are a soul, this could be considered a disaster or good fortune. It is entirely up to you whether it is a disaster or good fortune. Is it a disaster or luck? I don't know how it could be luck. Please give me some guidance. Well, this deity will give you some pointers. Whether or not you understand it all depends on you. You are in a state of divine soul. Disaster means losing your physical body, while luck comes from exploiting the soul. The soul is the source of enlightenment. If you use your soul to enter the great Tao and introduce the rhythm of the great Tao into your soul, then your soul will change and will have the rhythm of the Tao. The rules of heaven and earth are all within your soul. The soul introduces the rhyme of the Tao. As expected of the senior, it really wakes up the dreamer with one word, but how to lead the Tao rhyme into the soul. The rules are not lightly transmitted. The great Tao is everywhere. Flowers, plants, wood, and stones are all Tao. Take your time to feel it. Our meeting is fate. I will give you something to restore your soul. Xiaoliang and this girl's destination is the northern state. To ensure that the girl doesn't lose control until the time comes, it's not too much to plant a soul seal. One drop can restore your soul. Do not take too much. You cannot bear it. Yes, senior. Ding. You have been able to get a servant from the heavenly realm with your skillful planning to trick and your perfect tongue. You will be rewarded with the method of entrusting the soul into the Tao. Master, you are truly the most powerful man in the world, a peerless master, with heavenly methods, supreme in the world, respecting the old and loving the young. Why is he playing with words in front of me? You can say, what's on your mind, don't worry. Master, to tell you the truth, this master and his disciple are currently being hunted. Although you have given me guidance, I still can't protect my disciple all the time. I would also like your advice so that in the future I can lead my life, be self-sufficient, and improve myself, so that I do not bother my master with everything and am worthy of him. Good boy. You know how to respect your masters and respect your morals. You will become a great master in the future. This is my father's own secret technique for concealing the aura and invisibility. It is a low-level technique, but it is ideal for you. Thank you for your help, master. Your master's techniques are really divine. You should know this well. Then tell me a few more compliments. 
the two of us, master and disciple, would like to know what is the name of this respectable master. We really appreciate the master. We hope master will tell us. My name? That being said, I have fooled a lot of people. It is time to get myself a name. Just call me. Immortal, eternal and immortal, unparalleled in elegance, great and virtuous, supreme and holy, the first Taoist of all heavens and worlds. How awesome! I, Lu Pia Piao, Xiao Liang, thank the supreme saint, the first great Taoist for his gift. Well, here's goodbye, see you soon. Read at. Greetings to the supreme saint, the great Taoist. I should hurry up and take a look at my spirit sending technique book. By using this method of entrusting the soul to the Tao, the soul can be entrusted to the Tao, relying on the Tao to survive, it can adjust part of the power of the Tao for its own use, depending on the strength of the soul realm, I can also separate the soul, and store them in the Tao items produced by the system are really awesome. The soul is in the great Tao, and if it does not collapse, the soul will not be destroyed, making death extremely difficult. With this technique, I will be able to do everything with half the effort. I am truly deserving of being the system's son. Ha ha ha. I feel good. I feel like everything will be fine. Disciple, your master is happy today. This sword will be given to you as a gift. This sword seems to have a spirit attached to it, sharp and restrained, and entwined with laws. It is really extraordinary. That's a divine weapon. This foolish boy probably doesn't know that. Master, you are biased. Xiao Ding got that divine weapon. I want something too. Huh? A divine weapon. Such a great kindness of the master. This disciple will never forget that. Come on, young man. Don't be hypocritical. Sienner, don't be impatient. I will give you this long whip. You must practice diligently with it. Don't be lazy. Yes, master. The three-year period is approaching. It is time to meet the one-star landlord of the Black Moon House. The next day, Bao Hongin of Black Moon House would like to see the master. Master, the one-star landlord doesn't see people easily unless it's a big deal. Humph! Take this and go see him. Yes, master. Half an hour later, you are truly a divine person, knowing that my life expectancy is short, you have given me a perfect emperor pill and helped me break through the emperor realm and renew my life. I will do my best to serve you. He meant that broken bill. It was almost out of date. Tell me all the secrets you know about Black Moon House. Yes, yes, yes. Senior, there is a serious hierarchy in the Black Moon House and their system is very strict. All I know is that my boss is at the third level of the emperor realm but where the headquarters are located and who is actually in control are not known to someone at my level. But there are some other hidden forces, and I know a little about them. But I don't know if Senior. Of course, with such a state of mind, you would not be concerned with such trivial matters. However, I recently found a suspicious record in the Black Moon House, and I wonder if I should say something, Senior. Go on. Back then, you must have heard about the ancient demon war. According to the Black Moon House archives, the forces involved in the war came not only from within the southern state, but also from a variety of external sources. And the target was the Qin Empire at that time, and it seemed to have succeeded, but who was the mastermind at the beginning? There was no record in the Black Moon House. This old man is really useful, if not for his poor qualifications, I would have really accepted him. All right, you step back and remember to be on call. Yes, 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 I'll be waiting. Dean, you stayed in the house for three years, made persistent efforts, and continued to stay in the house. You were rewarded with the Divine Dad clothing and the Soul Chasing Dad bow. The Divine Dao clothing containing the supreme Tao rhyme, can use the power of the Tao to protect the body, unparalleled. Defense The soul-chasing Tao bow utilizes the power of the great Tao and the laws as a bow and arrows, with each arrow being a peak strike, regardless of distance or space, you only need to lock your mind, and its power is dependent on your own realm. I love all of them. 
With the power of the great Tao clothing added to my body, my defense coefficient has risen up. The most important thing is that I can use it and pretend to be a god. And this bow, it's the perfect weapon that I've been dreaming of. Finally, I have a weapon that can kill enemies thousands of miles away without leaving the house. It's just that the power of this bow is related to my own cultivation. Now that I am at the first level of the honorable realm, I can't use its full power, so it seems that I have to increase my strength to use it to the fullest. Master, it's time for dinner. I have no time. I'm studying. Oh? This is a monument that hasn't been explored yet. The highest level I can practice now is the compatible pill. I have to work harder. As long as I become stronger, Brother 13 won't be bullied at home. Such a golden opportunity. I must go to explore in order to become stronger. For my 13th brother, I will even break through the tiger's den. Is this heaven? Fluorescent fungus. It is specialized in strengthening the bones and the body. Thousand layer snow lotus. It can renew life and dispel poisons. Brother 13, I will give these to you as soon as possible. I will make up for you. This plant to my left, this plant to my right. That plant to my left, that plant to my right. Wait, this smell is. Is it from that herb over there? Could it be that herb? Could it be? The legendary mystic heart herb, which can boost cultivators' natural ability. Is it true? Brother 13, your fortune is finally here. Little girl, you stole my herbs, so shouldn't you give me an explanation? Hey, where did you come from? This monument has no owner and can be found by those who are destined, so what makes you say it's yours? Who said this is an unknown monument? This is clearly my herb garden, and you will be mine as well. Final. Pervert, take this slap from me. You who? Little girl, you're feisty. I like that. Shameless pervert, receive three more slaps from me. Little hoof, wait until I catch you. Yuck. Shameless pervert, how disgusting. Good job. Stop this little hoof from escaping and let's see where she can go. Get out of my way, or don't blame me for being rude. Then don't blame me for being rude. Little beauty, you should run. Why aren't you running? Give me the legendary mystic heart herb, and I will not give you a hard time. Instead, I will spoil you. Many women will envy you. You're so delusional. You think you are worthy. You are not worthy. You don't even know the reputation of my young master, Song Pang, of the Nine Swords Mountain. Ha, then. You're even less worthy. You have a sharp tongue, then I will have to use a little trick, then you will obey me. Hold her. You. If you dare to touch me, I will kill myself on the spot. Even if I die. I will never let you touch me. You make me even more tempted when you say that. I'm coming. Who is here? How dare you offend me in the Nine Swords Mountain? Nine Sword Mountain? What the heck? Senior Mask. I remember the last time when I was chased by the Pig King. It was Senior Mask who helped me. I, Chu Yun, thank the Senior for saving me. There is no need to be too polite. I am also ordered by my master to protect Miss Chu Yun. Thank you again for your help. Miss Yun, you are welcome. Miss Yun, I'll take care of the rest for you. In just one move, he broke my trapping technique, and he's at the third level of the true realm. I am finally out. Since Senior Mask is so powerful, wouldn't his master be even stronger? Do you want to do a few more tricks? I wouldn't dare. 
I will forgive you because it's the first time. If there's a second time, we won't be able to guarantee safety of the Nine Swords Mountain. Take that scum with you. Get out. I will tell the truth to the clan about what happened today. Goodbye. No way. Sir, let's read it after dinner. No hurry. Wait until I finish reading the information sent today. It seems that Xiao Yun's outing was a wonderful experience. But with the size of Nine Swords Mountain, it will be a matter of time before Xiao Yun's identity is found out. I'm looking forward to the revenge of Nine Sword Mountain, he he he. Master, your disciple Ding Yu's cultivation base has been consolidated, and he wants to find an opportunity to prove himself. Xiao Yu, do not rush. The teacher understands what you think, but you still have unbroken shackles. Shackles? Yes, let me ask you, do you still have fantasies about your childhood sweetheart? Are you still thinking of starting your apprenticeship early? To get rid of the shame of the past. Have you ever thought about the supreme sword you carry? Master, I. Shall you, do you know why there's such few people who can be called the best swordsmen in the world? Do you know why countless sword warriors have spent their entire lives in vain? Is it because they don't have the qualifications to carry the supreme sword? No. From ancient times to the present, there are countless people with outstanding talents, and there are a lot of people who are stronger than you. But they all failed, and these people failed because they didn't understand. The true almighty way of the sword. Master, I apologize for my previous reckless behavior. I know I was wrong. I beg master to teach this disciple. The true supreme sword path. I can instruct you, disciple. However, the path of the true supreme sword is a cruel and tragic one. Are you certain? Master, even if it is an endless hell, this disciple is determined to do it. Okay, I will teach you the three major levels of the true supreme sword path. I call them the three levels of Kendo. Kendo, three levels. Master, then this first level is. The first of the three levels of Kendo is, forget about your beloved. Forgetting my beloved? I ask you, if there is someone in your heart, how could you still hold the sword? Well, can't they coexist? Coexist? How could the sword not be the only one? Could that sword still be pure? What will happen to your sword if your beloved falls into the enemy's hands? And if your beloved wants to kill you, what will happen to your sword? If the parents, relatives, or the friends of your beloved want to kill you, what will happen to your sword? What about the true supreme sword path? I. Master. The disciple is enlightened. Good. Now I'll tell you the second level. Don't lose focus if you see a beautiful woman. Seeing a beautiful woman, not getting distracted. Look here. Who did you look at first? Beauty. If you fight with this woman and she flirts with you, and you think she is very charming, what will happen if you are distracted? Then I will not get distracted with the beauty. Master, I dare to ask a question. If I were a woman, wouldn't I have to worry about this problem? There are handsome men as well. If you interrupt again, I won't teach you again. This disciple wouldn't dare, wouldn't dare. Now for the last level. It is also that last level that countless people have been unable to break through in their entire life. Once you break through this barrier, there will be no more rivals in this world. Remember it, the last level is, if there is no woman in your heart, draw your sword and you will kill even an immortal. No woman in the heart, draw the sword and kill the immortal. Master, I was one step away from going astray. Fortunately, you stopped me in time and led me to the true supreme sword path. I will never forget this kindness. In order to make Xiao Yu forget about his scumbag ex, I even fooled him with a few words, but it was exhausting. Forget about your sweetheart. Forget about your sweetheart. Forget about your sweetheart. Xiao Yu, can you practice your sword without making noise? 
correct. My head has nearly exploded in the past three days, so let's take a look at Oldrin and change my mood. Oldrin, how are you doing? After meeting the master and receiving his guidance, I improved a lot. Master has become stronger again. Is there no upper limit for his strength? Okay, keep it up. You must know that hard work alone is useless. I will obey the instructions of my master. By the way, Oldrin, does the space you're at have a thousand-year-old heavenly realm martial artists? Yes, master. What? I thought Xiao Liang was talking nonsense, but I didn't think it was really the case. Some old monsters use secret arts to be reborn for some reason. They possess enlightenment from their previous life, so it's possible for them to achieve the heavenly realm within a thousand years. I see. However, this method has a fatal drawback, as practitioners who rely on their past lives have a weak foundation and need to spend more time to strengthen their foundation. Otherwise, it will be difficult to break through the realm of the previous life. It seems that Qin Kiyun reached the half-emperor's realm by this method. Are there any other reincarnated people from the time of ancient demon war? But master, there is another extremely rare situation. It is to cultivate in a special secret place where a thousand years is only one year in the world. This disciple came here to investigate solely because he had heard of such a secret location in the ancient wasteland. It's nothing more than a small secret place of time. As expected of the master, what I have been seeking in my life is nothing more than a grain of sand in the eyes of the master. Oldrin, I have some important matters. You have to practice hard and don't slack off. Yes, master. Thirteenth brother, I'm back. Sister Yuan is back. You haven't eaten, have you? Come on. Brother Thirteen, don't do anything else. Let me show you a treasure. Chuanqing grass, in fact, is a treasure. But I can't use it, so you can use it yourself. I'm not interested. This is for you to hone your skills, Thirteenth Brother. Don't be polite or I'll become enraged. I really can't use it, thank you, Yun. Use it yourself. I really can't use it. Thank you, Yan. Use it yourself. If Brother Thirteen does not succeed in breaking through, his life will be as short as that of ordinary people. I can't imagine Brother Thirteen with gray hair after a century. This is for the Thirteenth Brother's sake. We have to do it the hard way. Thirteenth Brother, what is that behind you? My hand, how? No, no, that's out of my control. Let's go. No, no, no. Sister Yun, I know you mean well, I know that you want the best for me, and I know what you've been through for the Xuanqin grass, but I really don't need it. Thirteenth Brother Thirteenth Brother's road is in this small courtyard. Sister Yun, do not worry, your Thirteenth Brother is not a waste. Oh, Thirteenth Brother, so it was you just now who moved my palm. Yuner, stop hitting me, keep it a secret for your Thirteenth Brother. My Chu family has finally risen. Spread the word. Only defective pills from Xiao Yun can be sold on the black market. All others are strictly prohibited from being sold. Those who disobey will be punished according to the clan's rules. The old man finally relied on Xiao Yun. Now that Xiao Yun is home, she can open up the ancestral house and get the details in there. Master. Miss Chu Yun's room has exploded. And Miss is nowhere to be found. What? The alchemy has blown up the room? Block these news immediately. No one is allowed to enter or leave the Chu family. Tell all the elders of the Chu family to wait for me near Chu Yun's room. The four elders will go with me, and the rest of you will patrol outside. If you find anyone suspicious, subdue them immediately and bring them to the dungeon. I will deal with them when I return. Yes, Master. The four elders, listen to my orders. We must retrieve Chu Yun at all costs. Yes. Pay attention to your surroundings. Don't take it lightly. It's not normal here. What is that light in front of us? Yuner? 
Yuner is fine. Ha ha ha. She's fine. But master, Miss Yuner, what is this? The emperor's weapon recognizes its master. What a powerful aura. Yuner, it's me. Grandpa is here to see you. Grandfather? Huh? Where is this? I was clearly in my house, and what are these floating things? What's going on? So she doesn't know either? Yuner, do you really not know how all these things happened? I was in my house, oh, right. It was a voice that brought me here, and that voice was kind, like. Could it be, the ancestors call? Master, look at those floating clusters of light, that's the inherited power. This should be. Our Chu family's heritage. You all listen to this order. The matter of the M Emperor's weapon must not be told to anyone, or else all of the four elders will be dealt with according to the highest rules of the family. We will inform the others after the breakthrough. Yes. Yuner. Grandfather. You scared Grandpa to death. Woo woo woo. It's great that you're fine. Woo woo woo. Grandfather, I'm fine. I'm still feeling fine. Of course you feel great. The Emperor's weapon recognize you as the master. Woo woo. My Chu family has finally truly risen to the top. The ancestors of the Chu family, we finally did it. We did it. Woo woo. Yuner opened up the details. Then why did the old man cry? Huh? Is it finally here? Your Majesty, this is a letter from the Chu family asking for help. It is because the Nine Swords Mountain and the Chu family had some small conflicts, so. so. Nine Swords Mountain and Chu family. Your Majesty, should we? I have my own thought about the matter. You may leave now. Yes. Tell Nine Swords Mountain that if Song Yiming dies, replace him with another patriarch and pretend that nothing happened. Panger, are you sure that girl is an alchemist? Dad, it's true that the scent of pills made by this girl is identical to that of the Tianding Mountain women she's very talented. All right, my Nine Swords Mountain is short of alchemists. Let's go set this marriage. Is there any news from the Empress? No, Master. How did the Yuner get into trouble with Nine Swords Mountain? The Nine Swords Mountain wanted Yuner as a bride just a few days after the rise of my Chu family. Yuner will be able to take over his family head if she grows a few more years. Besides, the young patriarch of the Nine Swords Mountain is famous for his ugly appearance. What should I do? I should let Yuner run away. Yes, let run. Little beauty, I'm here. Where is Chu Yun? Who is this? Why did he call me? Yuner, didn't I tell you to hide inside? I want to see the procession. No. It's very risky. Daddy, that little hoof is right there. That's her. I'm sure you all know why us father and son are here. All that happened in the past stays in the past. As long as Chu Yun comes to us. I. I. When did my dad's aura change like this? Does my mom know? Grandpa, do real masters use this kind of aura to scare people? Grandpa can't understand it either, but I am shocked. I know you're afraid this time. Look at me, little hoof. I know you're afraid this time. Look at me, little hoof. Die. You heartless beast, you have no right to touch Miss Yoon. Don't spout nonsense using your hideous face. Father, I'm your son. Grandpa, I don't understand. I am shocked. How dare you call me father? How could I have given birth to such a beast like you? No, you don't even deserve to be a beast. You're just a piece of shit. Dad, stop. I will see our ancestors. You're a piece of shit and you want to meet why our ancestors. You think you are worthy of that. I'd better send you to hell. Uh, if you keep hitting him, he will become a crumb. 
This also will pollute the environment, so why don't you change the place? Thank you, Miss Chu Yun, for your kindness. I will fucking kill him when I get home. Little shit, hurry up and thank Miss Chu Yun. Your Majesty, Patriarch Song Yiming returned with his son, but his son was a bit miserable. He was beaten like a piece of shit. Oh, is he a kind hearted person? Big handsome man. Song Yiming suddenly lost his mind. Does this have something to do with Chu Yun? Just how is that possible? I'll have to ask her in private. You think, uh, was it possible that it was the Empress Aura? That Empress is certainly powerful, but the Patriarch of the Nine Swords Mountain isn't as afraid that he would do something crazy like that, is he? Moreover, the relationship between the Qin State and the Nine Swords Mountain is extraordinary, and it is even more impossible for them to turn against the Nine Swords Mountain for the sake of the Chu family. It's hard to say, one can't imagine the power of that Empress unless he sees it with his own eyes. Was it really the Empress who was the secret deterrent? Does she still has romantic feelings? Still thinking about Chu Yuan? That bastard Chu Yuan. The third brother is away from here. If he comes back one day, it will be very unbearable for him. Hey, have you heard that the new master has fired the first three leaders in the office and the old master himself, he was the first to get punished? I was there the whole time cursing the old master for his incompetence and disgrace, and being unworthy of staying in the evil king's court. Yes, he was kicked out of the cult directly afterwards. Among all the people of the cult, he had the most miserable end of all. If it wasn't for the Chu family, how could he end up in such a miserable situation? It's all the Chu family's fault. I've always been the only one to kill and take away treasures. When have I ever been robbed? I want to take revenge. I want my name to be known in the southern state. The Chu family. I will contaminate the Chu family with this demon blood pearl. It will cause the Chu family to transform into demons. And anyone who transforms into demons will be killed, and everyone will attack them in groups. This is the iron law of the human race. There is no exception in any force, even if it is the evil court. If they find demonized people, they will kill them immediately. When the Chu family gets destroyed by my demonization, my name, Hu Quan, will certainly spread throughout the southern state. Cough, it seems that I won't live long, but even if I die, I will drag the Chu family with me. This is my last madness as Hu Quan. Patrol well, the elders of the Chu family are all in retreat at the monument sites of the Chu family. We can't afford any mistakes. Yes. The Chu family. In 15 minutes, it will turn into demon blood, tainting the entire Chu family. What? How did I come here? I couldn't resist at all. What kind of strength is this? How did I come here? I couldn't resist at all. What kind of strength is this? For so long, I have waited for you. Since you were provided with the fake map of the Chu family, you haven't moved. I almost forgot about you. I didn't expect you to appear so unexpectedly today. This strong demonic aura, are these blood beads condensed by the demon blood? It's not just ordinary demon blood. This guy, quietly, wants to cause trouble for the Chu family all of a sudden. It's too late, the magic blood pearl has been activated, no one can stop it now. Swallow him. A powerful demon soul. Demon soul. He, the deity has finally come out, juniors of the human race, kneel down. You are too beautiful, little human girl kneel down and do not enrage this deity if I am happy, I may spare you. He is probably at the peak of the honorable realm, or maybe his soul is at the middle level of the heavenly realm. When he gets at its peak, I'm afraid he will be the strongest demon of the heavenly realm. Can you deal with such a powerful demon soul, master? Boy, you have such good skin, this deity wants it. Humph, how presumptuous. Would I still be afraid of a mere demon soul? I am a strong person in the heavenly realm. How could such a mere soul be so arrogant? Forbidden law of heaven. What? My power wasn't helpful, even all the secret techniques have failed. My soul is losing its mind and consciousness as well. How is it possible? Who is he and why is he so powerful? 
Isn't this place the northern region in the southern state? I'm not happy. I'm not happy with this. I escaped the invasion of the southern state, but I'm going to die here. Why am I not in the southern state? Who took me out of the southern state? He compressed and suppressed the demon's soul simply by raising his hand. His power is incredible. Are these demon spirits related to the demons in the battle of the ancient land of war? Just a ray of his divine soul is so powerful, he is not considered a weak person in the heavenly realm, right? His demon soul is very likely to belong to the strongest clan of the demons who invaded the southern state back then. I must know the hidden secrets of this battle. In particular, how true is the news about the presence of traitors from the human race? It's a shame to directly kill such a powerful demon soul. But I must suppress him and keep him under my control. There appears to be no Buddhism in this world, or the demon soul would be transformed into my own loyal servant. You suppress the demon soul in the heavenly realm with just one hand, and are rewarded with the three generations of the Buddhist scriptures and a purifying crystal pagoda. Sure enough, the system identified him as a heavenly realm demon soul, so it is clear that this demon soul, when it was strong, was a powerful creature in the heavenly realm. The three generations of the Buddhist scriptures are divided into the Lantern scriptures of the past, the Tathagata scripture of the present, and the Maitreya scripture of the future. The three classics contain many Buddhist magical powers and practices, and the power of the Buddha's pagoda has the effect of enlightenment. Receive and instill the Buddhist scriptures of the three generations. This golden brilliance seems to contain some kind of mysterious power. Purifying Crystal Pagoda the greatest treasure of the Buddhist sect. It can purify the world's defilements, purify demonic energy, and purify all defilements into pure Buddha power. It can also suppress all the demons and monsters. Go in and be enlightened. After your enlightenment, there will be one more loyal Buddhist disciple under my seat. If the teachings of the Buddhist martial arts are spread out, it will definitely be a huge counter to the demon race. But the demon race will struggle ferociously, right? They might even try to eat themselves to get stronger before I make a move. Staying at home, spreading Buddhism, and becoming a saint and an ancestor. The rewards given by the system should not be bad, right? Don't make a fuss, it's just a little demonic soul. You must be in the heavenly realm if you can easily suppress such a powerful demon soul, right? Master is really powerful. I must work hard to cultivate and strive to break through the first level of the sword path as fast as possible. In a short time, I will be able to completely forget about her, and I will be free from the misery of love and only focus on swordsmanship. Let me out, damn it. I am a divine soul in the heavenly realm and my magic power is beyond imagination, but this vast golden light can suppress me. When did such a powerful and mysterious force appear in the human race? If this continues, I will definitely be tormented by the murmur and lose my mind. Let me out. Human race boy, do you want to set off a war between the two races? My demonic clan is strong. Once a war begins, the five regions of the human race may not be able to survive. Please let me go, please, I can't stand it anymore. Hurry up and stop that voice. I'm going to collapse. Master, can I call you master? Forgive me. I will consider you as my lord and be your servant. Is that all right? Master, please forgive Mordor. Making a powerful demon into a Buddha gives you a sense of accomplishment. What would happen if the demons were turned into Buddhists? It's exciting to think that there will be no more demons in the world, only Buddha. Let's take it step by step. No rush. After the transformation of Demon Mordor, I can learn more about the situation of the Demon Clan and then plan slowly. After Mordor is transformed, he will not be known as Mordor, but as Buddha, the first Buddha in the world. Forgive me. I can't stand it. Does the enlightenment of Buddhism rely on constant nagging and whispering, causing people to collapse and then gaining enlightenment? Who can bear the constant buzzing in the ear? Merciful Buddha. Merciful Buddha, who let you in with your left foot first? Your Majesty's eye. This is.
Looks like I'll have to walk in with my right foot first since tomorrow. I really don't know when the evil king and the old one will come out of Qin Kiyun's shadow. Is it true that Qin no longer has jurisdiction over Chu County? Will the Qin family exclude the Chu family? Is this accurate? Your Majesty, it is true and not fake or fabricated. Chu County is located in the interior of the Qin state with an excellent geographical location. If I sneak into Chu County secretly and then control the Chu family, if I do that, I will have a secret pawn to counteract Qin Kiyun. Compared with Song Yiming, how strong are you? Not as good. Song Yiming's failure to propose the marriage shows that the Chu family still has something to offer, so let's forget about those subordinates. I'd better go and check it out personally. The Chu family really didn't set up any ambushes. I hadn't seen a single powerful man even after wandering around for so many days. In that case, let's take this small courtyard as a base to facilitate future actions. Let me realize the strength of the Chu family. I am a little sleepy. Oh? A person at the middle level of the Emperor Realm with an evil aura? The sleep aid is here, he he he. What does this mean? Where am I? Are you the evil king? This person seems to be scolding me, but why don't I dare to be angry at all? What kind of realm is he in, to be able to do such a thing? I was brought here unnoticed, although I am at the middle level of the Emperor Realm. Why don't you reply? This villain is indeed the evil king. This villain deserves to die. Just now, I could not help but admire your magnificent strength that I forgot to answer your question. There must be some hidden guidance for me to come to Chu County to visit you. I want to hear the truth. This villain was ignorant and did not know his status. I was trying to control the Chu family and backstab the Qing state. If you are honest and answer my next three questions truthfully, I will consider sparing your life. Yes, yes, yes. This villain will definitely say everything he knows. First, do you know the great Qin Emperor? This villain knows that it is rumored that Emperor Qin once ruled the southern state and established the largest country in the northern region, the Great Qin Empire. Second, how much do you know about the ancient war demon land? Rumor has it that the ancient war demon land was the battlefield with the ancient demons when they invaded the southern state. Oh, since those who participated in the battle at that time were all powerful people in the heavenly realm, the battlefield was trapped in a certain space, and the rules of the southern state were therefore incomplete. However, it is reported that the ancient war demon land will be opened in 20 or 30 years. It seems that this evil king does not know much about these events of the past. It seems that this evil king does not know much about these events of the past. Yes, my uncle, but he's always in seclusion. The old evil king? Then I should give him a double soul seal and control the old evil king along with him. Well, you can go now. This deity will give you a gift. Take it back and show it to your uncle. Old evil king, you are blessed. What a beautiful evening. The Lord has been incredibly nice to me, and I can still sense his concern for me. So, I must do my best to implement the master's orders and not disappoint him. Let's go straight home. Huh? Why is there so much noise around my evil palace? What happened? Get away from my face, Brother Li Xiaoliang. Why hasn't the evil king shown up? Sai, Empress Qin beat him up just now and he's sulking in his house. Really? I had intended to use the evil king to add oil to a torch. It appears that it's no longer feasible. Brother Li, this is not a problem. The evil king is not at home, but I have the solution. Tell me quickly, my cousin was killed by the evil king last month, and his house was full of banners on the second day, and he is now a model for evil cultivators. I want it as well. It's easy, you should get a package. What package? There are packages, Brother Lee. Let me show you the list. Here you go. Ah, uh, this. Is this okay? Brother Lu, look at this package A. Half-day trip to the Evil King Palace. The cost is 2,000 spirit crystals and also comes with a small snack. All right, that's good. 
Brother Lee, look at package the evil palace's warriors will escort you all the way. The cost is 8,000 spirit crystals. You'll definitely know the situation of evil warriors here. All right, all right. But regarding this last item, I should first talk to you seriously about its cost. If meal B is like this, then meal will be incredible. Keep talking, brother. For five minutes, observe the evil king using the footpath. The price is 500,000 spirit crystals, and there is also a gift of the evil king's chopsticks. Because space is limited, pre-order as soon as possible. A perfect package. It's impeccable. It was made for me. He he he. Then, I. Finally, the evil king's back. You're a bunch of ants, and what do you think my evil palace is? A public toilet? There's also a collusion between those from inside and outside. Today, I will convert you into groups of ants and moths. Die. This. Is this a battlefield? The evil king even attacked his men. I have to hurry to the palace to inform them. The evil king has gone crazy. Your majesty, your majesty. The evil king is slaughtering without mercy. The majority of our most senior evil cultivators have been killed or injured. I'm afraid if you don't stop him. It's useless to find me. Go find someone who can suppress my father. Your majesty, the old evil king. It's bad news. The evil king has gone insane. He slaughtered the evil cultivators outside the palace as well as his own people willy-nilly, and our high-level evil cultivators suffered heavily. If you do nothing, our evil king's court will be empty. I beg your majesty, the old evil king, to take action. The situation is just getting worse and worse. If I had any children, I wouldn't have passed the throne my nephew to him in the first place. What a sin. I'll go and subdue that crazy dog. Ha ha ha. I will start with you ants and rectify the evil king's court. Ha ha ha. Uncle. What the hell are you doing? Under the Lord's commands, I have to rectify the evil king's court. Eh? Lord? Yes, the Lord also gave me a gift and instructed me to return and show it to you. Look at my forehead, uncle. Your forehead? What the hell? It's so dazzling. Uncle, how do you feel? Very good. I'm going to rectify the evil kings. Let's get it done. I thought the evil king's court would come at me and cause trouble after that, but I didn't expect that there would be no movement. I'm a little disappointed, but Xiao Yu is progressing rapidly and is now at the third level of the Void Realm. I am very pleased. These two little ones have also increased their cultivation base greatly. There are also Old Ren and the others. Everyone is improving. It appears that I must also advance otherwise. Being a teacher would be a waste of time. Dean, you have been in the house for five years, enjoying the fun life of seclusion, you are rewarded with a small world. This system understands me well and knows what is missing and what to send. Portable small world, it can grow, open an entrance into real space and close it at any time, adjust the time difference with reality, require spiritual or Tao rhyme nourishment, cultivation resources are everywhere. In addition to countless heavenly treasures, hee hee, little baby, hee hee. Let me see you, little baby. This system production is really awesome. I was being happy with myself and forgot to let Xiao Yu and Su Xiener in with me. Inside the small world. Master, what is this place? It's exquisite. Master is amazing. Without a doubt, this is one of his finest works that's right, and there's an extraordinary amount of spiritual energy here, and I can't think of anyone else who has that kind of power except Master. Do you see the huge tree in the distance? Do you know what it is? 
Ah, uh, tree? I was not paying attention to it because I was so excited. It is super big. It is almost surging. Master, please explain to us quickly. That is an ordinary tree, although it does not emit any spiritual energy, it is indeed the most precious treasure in this small world. It cannot be destroyed by any means. At this time, this ordinary tree is still a sapling, but it is going to shake the world when it really grows up. If you take the wood and make it into a weapon, it will be extremely sharp and cannot be destroyed by any Taoist weapon. Amazing! I want to do that. This tree is nothing. There are more amazing details of the small world you are in now. This world is more abundant in spiritual energy than the southern state. The rules of heaven and earth are self-contained and complete, and there are natural materials and treasures everywhere. If you stay here for a year, only one day will pass in reality. It will greatly increase the speed of your improvement, and it will not take much to break through the emperor's realm. This is the rumored secret realm of time. Master is amazing. What realm is he in exactly? This world is unbelievable. I must practice the supreme swordsmanship here so that I can go to Nine Swords Mountain and slap them in the face. I will pay back all the humiliation I have suffered in the past. I must take advantage of this chance, and when I succeed in breaking through, I will undoubtedly track down and eliminate each member of the Sioux family one by one. These youngsters seem to be in a bad mood. Master, I. Sir, I. You have to be free of external emotions to reach the top. It is good to have motivation, but not to be too obsessed with desires. Do you understand? Like ordinary trees, you have just sprouted and still have a long way to go, so you have to hone your skills. Yes, master. But the two little ones are missing. Where are the two little ones? What? You really don't know? They went down to play. You two little ones. Both of you, stop. I let you two go down to have fun, but why are you bullying others? Meow meow, I didn't do anything at all. Cha cha cha, I was just kidding with them. He he. They were both scolded. You two have to be kind, the monsters and spirit beasts here are not your opponents, it's okay to fight, but do not lay hands on them, you hear? Meow. Chirp. You are the big brothers here. You have to protect the little brothers, okay? Don't gloat on them. You should cultivate instead. Yes, master, sir. But before practicing, we still have to eat. That's right, master. I have seen that sheeps here are quite fat. That sturgeon is good too, sir. Hurry up, you too. I'm ready. Ding. You are enjoying the cozy time in the home, and you have realized that you can also enjoy luxury in the home. You will be rewarded with treasure collection and the time illusion. Enough rest. Keep going. Give me your full strength. The time illusion was really awesome. With just one illusion, the two little ones fell down easily. But although though using this approach in the honorable realm would require a great deal of divine souls, it may be done somewhat easily in the heavenly domain. Sir, it's time for dinner. I don't have time, I'm practicing. Time illusion, the art of the avenue of time, can be placed in the avenue of time, leaving an illusion in reality, the illusion is no different from the real deal. This technique is a technique of the great Tao, unless someone can attack me within the great Tao, it is absolutely impossible to hurt me. This kind of secret technique is not even available to the martial artists of Heavenly Realm. It's just that my current cultivation base is too low, otherwise. Otherwise, I would have created a low-profile version of Time Illusion. It is said that Diane County is rich in medicinal herbs, so how come I can't find any good ones? I can only pick some ordinary ones first. Little girl, don't be impatient. Take your time. I don't mean any harm. I just want to make a friend. Even I don't believe that. I'm telling the truth. Humph. 
Another bad person. I have amassed senior to protect me, so I'm not afraid of his evil intentions. Please, let me through. Miss, please. Thank you. Such a strong personality, I love it. This. This Xiao Xia Wang has always been known for his cruelty and hard hands. It's a shame she's in front of him. There are too many young girls who have been tortured by him, and he usually makes them surrender by force, but today is the first time that he pays so much attention to etiquette. I'm afraid I'm going to need a new way to satisfy my own evil pleasure. Miss, please stop. My name is Xiao Xia Wang, but I don't know your name yet. I don't want to talk to you at all. Can you please stop pestering me? I was indeed rude. I'd like to apologize to you. Why are you so weird? I'm going to collect medicine. Please don't follow me anymore. Is the little miss an alchemist? Are you done yet? Why are you talking so much? I just admire the little miss, and I have no bad intentions. And I have a lot of top-grade medicinal herbs here, all for you. I don't want anything from you. Please get out of the way. Let me be your bodyguard in that case. You shouldn't be out in the woods by yourself. No need. Then I'll guard the way ahead for you. No need. Great acting. Xiao Xia Wang's acting skills are very good. I almost believe that he is really a good person. Or is he really in love? Is that love at first sight? Is it unrequited love? I've finally arrived in Chu County. According to what I've heard, the Chu family is marginalized in the Qing state. Although I am a low-level alchemist, it is a benefit to the current Chu family, and they will gladly accept me. This time I must seize the opportunity. The road to the rise of my strength starts here. Stop, who are you? My name is Wang Luo. I am an alchemist. I came here to join the Chu family. Are you an alchemist? Prove that. Okay. This is an elixir I created that can be used as proof of my entry into the city. Please, come in. Thank you both, sir. Second brother, do you think this person can be hired by the Chu family? I've seen a lot like him. By looking at his poor look and tattered clothes, L know that he doesn't have much ability. That's not necessarily true, so let's make a bet. Okay. I said he can't do it, so let's bet 50 spirit crystals on him. Okay. Is it you, Wang Luo of the Wang clan, who has come to join my Chu family? That's right. I heard that the Chu family is recruiting talents, so I came here to join. Then can I see the elixir that you have made? Yes. This is the elixir I made, and the success rate is about 15%. I, Wang Luo, came from an alchemist family anyway, and a small family in the southern state like this will not be arbitrary. These spiritual elixirs are far too common in our Chu household. Yuner, this young brilliant alchemist, has already trained many talented alchemists for me, and there are many alchemists like Wang Luo now. Given his poverty, I should give him some spirit crystals and get rid of him. Mr. Wang, take these spirit crystals and find another place. We can't accept you. What? My son, please. You. You consider me a loser and look down on me? In that case, I will teach you, Chu family, a good lesson here. I'll show you what I can do. M. This time, I will do it. Come and see. Another alchemist has come to join the Chu family. He looks a little poor. Yeah, he doesn't look good. That's not important. When the pill is ready, let's see if you still say it or not. By then, as a guest of the Chu family, I can collect medicinal herbs to solve my physical defects. I just said physical defects, and it appeared at the same time. My body hurts like there's a fire in my bones. My physical defects prevent me from performing more advanced alchemy techniques, and my understanding of alchemy is a waste of elixirs, as well as a disgrace to the Wang family, but today, I must hold on. I must prove to these snobs that I am the best alchemist here. By making this elixir, my plan would succeed. Read at. 
Is it so hard for this person to make pills? Just for a mere elixir, you've worked so hard? Look at him, his face is red, he is obviously trying to save face. Yes, his endurance is not good either. So, he is a piece of trash. Shit, shit. That's him, the shame of our family. He was also defeated by the little pawn. No wonder the engagement was annulled. They were right. Get out of our Wang family as soon as possible. Our Wang family does not need trash. Funny guy, he made a spirit pill and blew up the pill furnace. This man is a liar. He wants to come to the Chu family to steal our food. Seems you didn't learn well when you were young. You're also a poor person. There is nothing more to see. Here comes my second disciple. Wang Luo, the contemporary son of fortune of the northern state, the son of a concubine of the alchemy Wang family, born with alchemy veins, has a very high talent for alchemy because of being poisoned at a young age. His alchemy veins were destroyed by accident. How come the children of fortune are all abandoned? However, it may be because he is the son of fortune, the family he belongs to does not have enough background and not rich enough, so can't bear the son of fortune, which is why he became an outcast. His natural alchemy is also a unique physique. If the Wang family discovered Wang Luo's natural alchemy veins, they would have already tried everything possible for him to improve his alchemy. What a tragic guy. Wang Luo's expulsion for failing to perform alchemy was a ruse devised by his fiancée and someone with a grudge against him. As expected of the son of fortune, he came to the southern state by accident and even went to the Chu's house. A small courtyard? Maybe I will have to stay in this small courtyard. I'll make some pills for the Chu family under the guise of repaying them for their reward of spirit crystals so that I can stay with them and have a place to stay. Young man, do you feel confused about your future? Do you feel that your life has lost its direction? Are you really willing to be a loser who was expelled, abandoned, and reduced to a good-for-nothing? Have you ever thought about rising to the top? To make the people who used to look down on you unable to look you in the eye? Senior, who are you? This deity is known as the guiding light of the lost people, the savior of the losers in all the worlds. Young man, as long as you are a loser, after you meet this deity, you will make those who have abandoned you unable to look you in the eye. Senior, I became a loser because of a physical handicap. No matter what the reason is, as long as you are a loser, you can be saved and reborn under this deity's guidance. Great opportunity. This is my great opportunity. Junior Wang Luo, pay respects to the senior. Kneel down and kowtow to your master, disciple. Disciple Wang Luo greets master. You didn't have to leave home, but a son of the northern state with great fortune has traveled over mountains and seas to meet you. You are rewarded with the divine void fire of the divine void fire art. Sure enough, the system rewards came, and the rewards are just right for Wang Luo. Get up. From today onwards, you are the second disciple of this deity. This is your senior brother, Ding Yu. Accepting disciples again? Although he is only at the sixth level of the profound realm, the fact that he is able to catch master's eyes is a sign of his extraordinary talent. You were originally born with alchemy talent, but you were injured when you were young, which caused the destruction of your alchemy veins, thus limiting your cultivation of alchemy. So that's it, that's it. Have a pill that will reconnect your broken veins and a treasure that can regenerate your broken veins. I can connect your broken alchemy veins with pills, but the connected alchemy veins will no longer be the natural alchemy veins that you were born with. You were born with natural alchemy veins, but then you will have acquired alchemy veins. It's quite good, but it will not be as good as the natural alchemy veins. How can I be happy if I can only have acquired alchemy veins? It's all because of that murderer. This deity has divine void fire, which can regenerate your broken veins, but you will have to suffer the torture of void fire, and it will take 49 days to complete the connection. If you don't have a strong will, you'll die, and there's no need to talk about the benefits of surviving, you choose. 
Master, I choose the divine void fire to regenerate my alchemy veins. Think well about that. Although the divine void fire can be used to renew and retain the natural alchemy veins, if you do not pass, you will die. Master, I, Wang Luo, will either soar to the heavens and live a proud life, or just dissipate into the world, never willing to live a life of mediocrity. Good. Junior brother, I support you. That being the case, let me pass you the divine void fire skill. It's so powerful, what level of skill is this? I was right in my choice, it was indeed a great opportunity for me. This wisp of heavenly fire energy, if Wang Luo is determined, he should be able to refine it. You can choose again, this fire is extraordinary. The divine void fire is too terrifying, with just a wisp of energy, it can burn the spiritual will. Wang Luo is only at the sixth level of the profound realm, how can he refine it and survive the burning torture? Master, I choose the divine void fire. If I miss such a rare opportunity, how can I rise to the top? How can I avenge my hatred? How can I trample the northern state Wang family under my feet? Good, then you can use this fire to renew your alchemy veins. You can refine the divine fire in this small world. Stop dawdling, concentrate on the preparation, and renew your alchemy veins. Yes. I will make those who once looked down on me, laughed at me, abandoned me, and humiliated me, to only look up to me and worship me. As a child of great fortune, you should be able to withstand this little ordeal, right? By refining the divine void fire, his strength will soar. The rewards given by the system should not be low, right? His alchemy vein started to connect as his aura grows stronger. He truly refined the divine void fire, as one would expect from the son of fortune. He also broke through to the spiritual realm. Under your guidance, your disciple quickly broke through the spiritual realm, subdued and refined the divine void fire with great perseverance. You are rewarded with a hundred years of cultivation and the hundred refining soul technique. The system's rewards will, indeed, be substantial. Receiving 100 years of cultivation and reaching through the sixth level of the honorable realm, today is an amazing day. The 100 Refining Soul Technique, huh? This is a very powerful method of refining the soul a hundred times in order to make it eternal and immortal. A soul cultivated by the 100 Refining Soul Technique, even just a strand, can last forever and rise again, restoring the physical body and returning to the peak. This divine soul skill integrates attack and defense together, and the use of divine souls is extremely mysterious. Although I am at the sixth level of the honorable realm, my divine soul power is no weaker than a cultivator at the ninth level of honorable realm. This disciple humbly thanks the master for his grace. You have such great perseverance, I haven't misjudged you. Because of Wang Luo's talent, there will be countless people seeking him, and there will be beauties that will be after him too. It's necessary to warn him. The journey of alchemy is full of endless temptations, sycophancy and flattery, and tampetitions of exotic treasures. Among them, beautiful women are the most difficult to guard against. Remember, to excel in alchemy, remove all women from your heart. If you get tempted by beauty, and your heart is no longer dedicated to alchemy, then your alchemy will come to an end. Since ancient times, those who have been obsessed with beauty and those who have been obsessed with love have ultimately died due to love and lust disappearing into the world. You must remember. I'll always remember that if I don't have a woman in my heart, I can make elixirs and will never be seduced by beauty. Good child. You have taken the path of alchemy and refined the divine void fire. They naturally will make the alchemy easier for you, but the battle will not be easy. As a disciple of this deity, your strength cannot be puny. You refined the divine void fire, and naturally I obtained this furnace and fan. As your master, I will hand them over to you. Thank you, master. Divine Pottery Furnace the Wang family's clan elixir furnace is just a semi-divine weapon. This is the scripture of tens of thousands of pills and spirits. How much content is recorded in such a small booklet? It's impossible to record such a detailed manuscript without having great means. 
I will pass on some secret techniques to you, such as the method of holding your breath and hiding your form, the skill of being as immovable as a mountain. I will call out Su Sienner and Ding Yu then teach you another technique. Today, I will pass on to you a great skill of the soul. You guys are practicing well, right? Yes. Let's find another apprentice. What a valiant and beautiful woman. The third level of the emperor realm. Huh? It seems that she is only in her twenties, but she has already broken through to the third level of the emperor realm. Reaching the emperor realm in the twenties, except for those who received certain special opportunities, no one can break through to the emperor realm at this age. This is a big hurdle. What is the identity of this woman? Luo Ying, a contemporary top talent of the Luo family, a family of human kings in the eastern region. The great Qin Emperor was reincarnated as a human soldier from the human king's bloodline. Damn. She's the reincarnation of the great Qin Emperor? Was the great Qin Emperor a woman? Impossible. Something is wrong. It is impossible to continue the exploration. The heavenly secret exploration technique was disturbed by the soldiers of the human king. Does Qin Kiyun know that Qin Ying has been reincarnated in the eastern central region and that she is a member of the Luo family, a family of human kings? The human king's family, also known as the human kings, are an unparalleled existence that leads the human race's rise and unifies a region. Put a mark on the mirror that refers to the last place she showed up. I didn't expect to find a connection to Qin Ying, an important figure in the ancient land of the war demons and an important person in the layout. Could it be that she wishes to take advantage of the king's family's power and return to avenge and rise again? Send a message to Bao Hong Yin first and ask her to inform Qin Kiyun to come visit me. It is still necessary to clarify the gender issue of Qin Ying. The great Qin Emperor in the description does not look like a woman. Your Majesty, Master Bao has sent a letter. Bao Hong Yin, the Golden Landlord of Black Moon House? Why did Chu Xian invite me to meet him? Although he is handsome, he is also terrifying. Didn't he notice that I'm now an empress? Does he want me to visit him and bow my knees? Does he consider me as his maidservant? If I refuse to go, what should I do if he comes to the great Qin Imperial Palace in person? Was Qin Ying, the Emperor of Qin, a man or a woman? What? Of course he was a man. The Emperor was an unparalleled man. Crap. Qin Ying was a man but now he is reincarnated as a woman. The heavens must have made a mistake. If Qin Ying's former brothers come back when the ancient war demon land opens, they'd learn that their former big brother has transformed into a heroic and ironic peerless beauty. I have another thing to ask. If you answer it correctly, you would be allowed to go back. Did you take charge of the Qin Empire to prepare for the arrival of Qin Ying? His backhand layout? Are you not afraid of me anymore? I will not betray the emperor. You're a loyal demon pet. I'm not a demon pet. I am now a descendant of the emperor. All right, you can go back now. The emperor has transformed into a woman. The information about the war demon ancient land is becoming more and more interesting as time goes on. Let's use the mirror and see what Qin Ying is doing. Over 200 years old, at the ninth level of the Emperor Realm, a gifted man of great talent. Cousin, the intense flame syrup you have been looking for, I found it for you. Hmm. He turned out to be an old dog. Cousin, I've exhausted all of my efforts and hundreds of battles to obtain this intense flame syrup. I only want you to be happy. Cousin, can you give me a smile? I'll be satisfied with just one smile. Ju Yuan Bai, get out of here. Cousin, even when you're angry, you're so beautiful, it really touched your cousin's heart. Go to hell. Cousin, you look so charming when you are angry. 
Just thinking about this, I, Chin Ng, who was once eight feet tall and a heroic man, but now I am reduced to a woman. My reincarnated body regained previous life memories while taking a shower at the age of 18. I finally succeeded. Wait. It doesn't feel right. Where's my manly body? How did I become a woman? Without a powerful body refining method, the king's bloodline will ultimately be unable to compare to previous generations of tyrants. The Luo family, a family of kings, is well known in the eastern regions and is the first family in the eastern region. Many talents have emerged from it throughout history, and Lu Ing is without a doubt the best of this generation. At such a young age, she is already a powerful woman in the third level of the emperor's realm. She is known as the Ice Beauty. Lu family's land. I want to meet the third lady. In this life, the reason why I became a woman is probably related to soldiers of the human kings. Inger, you are already number one among your peers. Don't exhaust yourself and damage your body. You are a girl, my dear child. Why did you engage in body refining exercises? Our Luo clan possesses numerous divine techniques, all of which are more powerful than those random body refining techniques. Listen to my advice. Stop refining your body, okay? I will not give up. Inger, why do you insist on training your body? Look at your skin. Look at your body. How many girls are envious of you? I don't want this fair skin. I don't want this enchanting body. I want to be a macho man. Mother, do you know any way in the world to turn a woman into a man? Inger, don't scare your mother. How could you have such a thought? You are a girl. Why do you want to become a man? It's overwhelming. Have you gone crazy? Come out. At your command. Hurry up and summon the family head and summon the elders. Inger may have gone insane. Mom, I'm not crazy. Miss wants to change your gender. This matter is top secret and must not spread. Female to male? Wouldn't it be enough to have sex reassignment surgery? Whatever happening in the southern state is not as interesting as Qin Ying's daily life, right? Maintaining focus on Qin Ying for such an extended period of time depletes spiritual energy. Let's take a few pills and get some rest. In the following time, most of Chu Xian's time was focused on paying attention to Qin Ying, and information about Black Moon Tower was no longer of his interest. Whatever happening in the southern state is not as interesting as Qin Ying's daily life, right? The Luo Family Scripture Pavilion Cousin Cousin, this is ice clear, which has a miraculous effect on refining the body, and it can also whiten the skin making it fragrant and charming. You, son of a, get out of my way. The way you look when you are angry is so enchanting. Cousin, will you marry me? If you agree, I can marry you and have our child take your surname, and I can also take your surname. Fuck you, die. Damn dog dares to confess to me, I'm also a man. You cannot ignore the method of body refining. It's time to show Ding Yu and Wang Luo how to refine their bodies. Today, I will teach you both the great art of body refinement. Master, what about me? You don't need to. Your Tai Xian body is already extraordinary. And besides, do you want to train yourself into muscular beauty? Then forget about it. I've taught you the divine sword body, which matches your natural physique. When this technique is completed, your body will have a vast sword intent, and no technique will be able to pierce you. I've taught you the nine refinements of the divine body, and the nine transformations of the flesh. When it is complete, it will be difficult for a divine weapon to hurt you. Thank you, Master. Should I pass on a great body refining technique to Qin Ying? It is better to continue observing Qin Ying for a while before moving forward. At the very least, I need to learn what happened in that battle in the ancient war demon land. mo 2 hasn't fully transformed yet, but it's almost there. If you participated in that battle back then, you should know a lot of its secrets, right? Cousin, I was wrong. It was all my fault don't go after your cousin anymore. I'm going to find you the greatest body refining technique, okay? 
Cousin, I will definitely locate a very strong, very fierce body refining technique for you. Okay, you said it yourself. If you can't do that, don't appear in front of me anymore. Sure, cousin, I will definitely do it. How pathetic. I, Chi Ning, have fallen so low. For the great art of body refinement, I even have to rely on my beauty to charm people. I'm not going home anymore. Staying home is uncomfortable. I miss the old times. I must find a place to cultivate and improve my strength as soon as possible because the items of the ancient war demon land must not fall into the hands of the enemy. Huh, these two are both at the fifth level of the Emperor Realm. Who is it that wants to assassinate me, an enemy from my past? No, no one knew that I would be reincarnated into the Luo family, so the attacker is an enemy of the Luo family? Qi Ning is a perfect match for this body refining technique. Her use of the power of domain has exceeded the perception of an ordinary emperor realm cultivator. The power of the domain can be split, a part is attached to the halberd, and a part is attached to the attack, and a part is attached to myself. There is no such thing as Emperor Realm power in general. Concentrating on myself, expanding the power of my domain, enveloping the enemy, or confronting the power of the enemy's domain. This will be more concentrated and potent. Qin Ying's power is so great that she defeated and suppressed two Emperor Realms. They haven't used any strong family techniques in their fights up to this point. Are they putting me to the test or luring me away? We can't continue to waste time like this. I will deal with you two right now. That's bad. I sense danger. Humph. I am a woman now. I can't burst out of my clothes while fighting. Oh, what a mistake. I should have found a top-notch treasure coat in my family to avoid exposing my body when performing this tyrannical technique. Killers. Assassins with assassination skills. They are all on the third level of the Emperor's realm. Could it be that Zhu Yuan Bai purposefully set up such a game, and then a hero appeared to save the beauty? I hope I am thinking too much, otherwise I'll chop him up sooner or later. Insignificant skill. We will find you quickly. A little smart. Regardless of whether it's Qin Ying or the assassins, no one can hide from Chu Xian's eyes. Read it. Could it be that Qin Ying isn't hiding nearby, but escaped by using a secret technique? Probably. Assassination failed. As expected of a reincarnated old monster, his method is brilliant and cruel. The two assassins seem to have escaped with their souls, but in reality, Qi Ning has used a secret technique to track the aura of their souls. How dare you assassinate my cousin? I'll find out who's behind it. The wind is howling in the central state of the eastern region, and a battle between the powerful cultivators of the heavenly realm has broken out. The king's family beheaded a powerful man in the heavenly realm with their domineering and powerful strength. The mastermind behind the scenes has yet to be identified. The king's family is so powerful, even with my current strength at the sixth level of the honorable realm, I'm still too weak in front of them. Even if I make it to the heavenly realm, I have nothing to be proud of. After all, there is still the deity realm above the heaven realm, and stronger realms above that. One month later, Ding Yu has already cultivated to the ninth level of the true realm. 
Wang Luo also stepped into the first level of the True Realm. Su Xian's strength has increased to the peak of the True Realm and is accumulating for the breakthrough to the Emperor's Realm. The small world is ultimately just a small world. Ordinary cultivation is possible, but breaking through a big realm still requires being in the real world. We must build a special domain in the space between heaven and earth that directly disregards the rules of heaven and earth in the southern state and obeys the great Tao. North Sea space the rules in heaven and earth space are perfect, and you can communicate directly with the Tao rules in heaven and earth to break through the emperor's realm. News from the Black Moon Tower? White Victory Mountain Read it. White Victory Mountain was once a powerful force in ancient times, with powerful beings in the heavenly realm stationed there. However, it was destroyed in the Great War and the sect fell into another space. The ruins of Baixing Mountain will appear soon. Will the ruins of Baixing Mountain be revealed soon? Baixing Mountain was once occupied by powerful cultivations in the heavenly realm, and it fell during the battle against the ancient demons. There must be a great opportunity in the ancient ruins. Several battles have taken place as a result of the three countries and three clans in the southern state sending strong people to fight or it. It seems that the water in the southern state is starting to boil. It's time to step in and earn a system reward. Shall you please go and do a small task for your master? Yes, at the command of the master. The ruins of Baixing Mountain are about to come into existence, so I want you to go for an adventure there and learn a few things. Yes, Master. Will you be afraid if the Nine Swords Mountain sends people there this time? This disciple will not be afraid at all. I'm rather looking forward to it. Good. It's time to put your past behind you. Whether you make a name for yourself or face disaster again is entirely up to you. Go out there and prove yourself. Yes, Master. I will not disgrace your name. The current Baixing Mountain is surrounded by a number of major forces, the weakest of which is also led by the True Realm's third level. Isn't that right? For small cultivators like us, it would be great if we could scoop up some leftovers. By the way, Floating Flower Pavilion hasn't come yet. Although the Floating Flower Pavilion is made up of all women, their strength is among the top forces of the southern state. Who would dare to underestimate them? That is, the major powers are all standing on the summit of a mountain, but that summit is still reserved for the Floating Flower Pavilion people who have yet to arrive. It is estimated that when the Floating Flower Pavilion arrives, the main show will begin. In the current three countries and three sects, there is a country that does not live up to its name and does not even have someone at the ninth level of true realm. You don't have to be like that, Lu Pingfeng. What about your three half-emperors? Aren't they still in the hands of my empress? You. Humph. I won't argue with you. Evil King, in the past there were only two countries and three sects in the southern state, but now there is one more country, don't you think we should do something? My evil king's court has always been righteous, and I disdain to bully the weak. Does he have any shame? It sounded like that sentence came out from the bottom of his heart. The absence of brainstem has a kind of simple beauty to it. It's a good thing that this evil king has a brain problem. Elder Qin, you seem safe and sound. Great, Nine Swords Mountain's forces are here. Nine Swords Mountain's in Jinkong. Sure enough, he really lives up to his name. Humph, now the Qin is relying on Nine Swords Mountain to support the situation. Wow, in Jinkong, the top of the Nine Swords Mountain. He is at the ninth level of the true realm. He's only 50 years old. I heard he was asked to be the patriarch, but he refused, pursuing the path of swordsmanship with all his heart, and his goal was to be the true strongest. Elder Chain, I'm honored. You're welcome. Please suit yourself. It's Brother Jian Kong. He's finally here. Grandpa, the precious treasure of the Baixing Mountain Monuments will go to a true genius like Brother Jian Kong, right? Maybe, after the monument is over, I will choose a day for you to marry Jian Kong. Well, it's all up to Grandpa. I heard that he was very close to a junior sister from the Nine Swords Mountain. 
I know, Grandpa, Brother Jiankong didn't keep that from me, so if there is one, let her be a concubine at most. Brother Jiankong is so powerful, and there are so many women who adore him, it's okay to marry a concubine, and she can also serve me. You've got a big heart. Grandpa, is it going to open? With so much vibration in the new room, it doesn't seem like it will be long before it truly opens up. Baixing Mountain, I, Ying Jian Kong, is waiting for you. Why haven't those women from the Floating Flower Pavilion come yet? They are so indecisive, they definitely need a man to make decisions for them. This man is a fool. The rumor that the evil king has a mental problem appears to be true. The women of the Floating Flower Pavilion aren't easy to deal with, and if they hear this, there will be a big battle. Don't you see that no one is standing on the mountain reserved for the Floating Flower Pavilion? No one dares to and he is still talking nonsense. What? Look at the top of the mountain. When did a man come? Who are you? How dare you stand on the top of the Floating Flower Pavilion's mountain? Do you want to die? Go, if you are a sensible person. Don't make the Floating Flower Pavilion fairies angry when they arrive. Get out of here, you bastard. Get out of here. He is a fool. Let me deal with him. He dares to stand on the top of the Floating Flower Pavilion mountain. Let him die. Kill him. Burn him into ashes. Fuck you, little piece of shit. I'll deal with him and establish my reputation as a cultivator in the third level of true realm. Humph. This. What happened? Who is he? He killed him in an instant, despite the fact that he was in the third level of true realm? What's going on here? I didn't even see what happened clearly. What's that? Is he a human? Dean you? Interesting. It looks like he changed, but trash stills trash after all. You're a 50-year-old loser who's only reached the ninth level of true realm. Ah. How dare this wild boy talk to Aang Jinkong like that. That's enough. You're the one who is a loser. Aang Jinkong will make wish for death. It appears that a cultivator with a low cultivation base will die today. You. Do you think that I, Ding Yu, am not worthy to talk to you like this? Do you think that you, Ying Jian Kong, are the star here? I, Ding Yu, came here today to make my name known to everyone, and I promised my master that none of you can stop me. What? She is Han Ying Ming, the saint of the Flower Pavilion. It's like a fairy coming down to earth. She is so beautiful. She is the girl of my dreams. Han Ying Ming, indeed, is as charming as a fairy. It appears that the master was correct when she told me to come first. To entice cultivators and weaken their defenses so that the floating flower pavilion can gain an advantage when the Baixing Mountain ruins are exposed. Women, get away from here. Don't mess with my sword. You can't confuse me. I only have a sword in my heart. You can't fool me. Give up. I am outraged. You, you startled me. I didn't even say anything and you made rude remarks. I, Han Ying Ming, have never seen such a rude wild boy as you before. Please first apologize to me. I don't want to. Just shut up. You're making me so angry. You can't seduce me. If you don't leave, don't blame me for being ruthless with my sword. You. If I don't kill you today, I, Han Ying Ming, will write my name upside down. Ding Yu. A mere outcast of the Nine Swords Mountain, you dare to act wild here. Don't be upset, Han Ying Ming. I, Jian Kong, will deal with this abandoned rude person on your behalf. Abandoned disciple? Ing Jian Kong, your sword is weak. To stand out for an irrelevant woman, you will amount to nothing. Your sword realm is nothing but rubbish. You even mentioned me. You little brat, today I will. Ding you, don't act wild here. 
I was going to teach you a lesson, as I always do, but seeing how stupid you are, I decided to tear you apart. Draw your sword, show me your skills. Ng Jian Kong is impatient. They were all called rubbish by Ding Yu, how could he not be impatient? And in front of Han Ng Ming nonetheless. Hmm. How dare this punk slander me like this, I have to tear him into pieces to end my hatred. Ding, you trash. Take my sword skill. Hmm? Mere tricks. Are you dumb? Why won't you show your sword? You're not worthy. Don't overestimate yourself. Enough playing with you. It's time to end it. this possible? How is this possible? Anything is possible. If you lose, you must accept defeat. I didn't lose. You must have used some kind of secret treasure. Oh, you can't even accept your loss. Let's fight again. Do you dare? What's going on? When did he get his sword out? I didn't see it at all. It's my fault for being careless at first. Now that I'm hurt, I'm sure I couldn't see his sword clearly. If I were you. Ding you, stop. It appears that the master was correct. How can you grow stronger if you don't forget about your sweetheart? Your sweetheart is just an obstacle. Ng Jin Kong, do you know why you lost? Because of her. Me? You have a woman in your heart. Woman? What nonsense. Women only affect how fast you can draw your sword. Your sword will be weak if you have a woman in your heart or a woman by your side, if you are concerned about someone. You will undoubtedly lose because you are slow in drawing your sword. Is this the reason? Am I really confused and slow? You stay away from me. I'll try again. All right. I'll give you time to recover. Half an hour later. Ding you. I won't be careless this time. I will never lose to you again. It's a desperate attempt. Take this very, why don't I want something bad to happen to Ding you? Ding you, be careful. This is the unique technique of the Nine Swords Mountain. This is also the only technique I will use to defeat you. This time, you will lose. By my one and only special technique. Well done. Give me that. Ah. Uh, where is he? He. You lost. If you want to kill me, ding you, just do it without saying anything. Kill you? You think you're worthy? People like you, who know nothing about swords, are not worthy of being killed by me. I, Ding Yu, am a man who wants to slay the gods. You are nothing more than a stone in my eyes. You understand? Slay the gods? This kid is insane. Is Ding Yu really that strong? Where did this kid come from? Who is his master? Is he from Da Qin, Brother Jian Kong? Unfortunately, the imprints of the 10,000 Days Heavenly Mirror have all been used up, and I'm not sure if Little Yu humiliated them all or not. Ding Yu stayed at home while your disciple, Ding Yu, crushed the most powerful cultivators in front of the Baixing Mountain Ruins with a single sword move, shocking all the strong people present. The Sky Peeping Mirror is your reward. I saved Little Yu from being arrogant and complacent through training. This result is not surprising given his strength, which is at the ninth level of the true realm. The sky peeping mirror can see into and track everything in the world, regardless of space or distance. Aside from not being able to transfer items, this mirror is simply a 2.0 upgraded version of 10,000 Days Heavenly Mirror, and it can also track targets.
Anyway, hurry up and show me how little you is doing now. You don't have to admit defeat, Ng Jin Kong. Looking at your Nine Swords Mountain since its inception, there has only been one person who can truly be regarded as a figurehead, the founder of the Nine Swords Mountain. It's a pity that such an arrogant person is not an evil cultivator. How come he's everywhere? You're so arrogant. What were you saying about my Nine Swords Mountain? Old man, are you not convinced? Do you want to fight me once as well? You. Forget it, forget it. It's not good for you to get angry at your age. That's right, that's right. Don't waste your words if you don't dare. Don't interrupt my rest. Ding you. Don't go too far. How did I go too far? I didn't take your man's life. Wasn't I already merciful? Brother Jin Kong, let's go. Don't be discouraged, Brother Jin Kong. If you seize the treasure of Baixing Mountain, you will undoubtedly be stronger than Ding Yu. Women have already ruined you, Ying Jin Kong. You'll never catch up to me. You, Senior Ding. Woman, stay away from me, or I'll draw my sword. All right, I'll wish you an early death. Good. I admire little brother Ding Yu's pride. Don't prostrate yourself in front of women. Talking about love is a waste of time. Seeking power wholeheartedly is the right path. This old bastard is talking a lot of nonsense. When Brother Jin Kong receives an inheritance at Baixing Mountain Ruins, you will be the first one to be killed. One day, I will tear this old man's mouth apart. I need a law enforcer like you in the evil king's court. Why don't you come with me to enforce the law and help justice? The evil king hasn't gone insane yet. He knows how to entice Ding Yu, a powerful cultivator. Ding Yu seems to have become a great prize for the factions this time. Don't listen to the nonsense of this evil cultivator. Brother Ding Yu, I am the prime minister of the great Qian Empire. How about you come to the Qian Empire? The Qian Empire's little princess has reached marriageable age and possesses natural beauty and talent. Her beauty surpasses that of Han Ming. In addition, I have a daughter who is also very beautiful and is proficient in all kinds of music, chess, and songs. Isn't it amazing to be surrounded by the two of the most beautiful women? In addition, you can ask for anything you want, whether it's spirit stones, pills, or imperial weapons. As long as the little brother joins me, any conditions can be met. Lu Pingfong, this old fox, even sold his own daughter. If we allow Ding Yu to enter the Great Qian Empire, our Qin will be in jeopardy. This insidious villain, Lu Pingfong, intends to use beauty to destroy my supreme swordsmanship. I remember my master's teachings. The supreme sword path, three levels of the sword path, are the true essence of swordsmanship. I am the one who wishes to slay the gods with a single stroke of my sword. This guy wants to destroy my ambition to reach the pinnacle of the sword path. Old thief. Want to destroy my ambition. Kill. Little brother, I'm sorry for being too rude. You're a wild child who has no idea what he's doing. I'm not sure I'll be able to kill you when the ancient ruins open. This guy is really stubborn, but I don't know if he is right or not. Ing Meng, what are you staring at? We've been here for a while. You didn't even notice. You just stared at the kid in front of you. Did you forget about the task I assigned you? Master, disciple doesn't dare. It's just that just now. Who is that kid? Why did he dare to stand on the top of my floating flower pavilion mountain? Master, what happened? He. In this case, I'll try and seduce him. What? The floating flower pavilion's beauty plan appears to have failed. And with the arrival of the floating flower pavilion, the major factions will begin to discuss the qualifications to enter Baixing Mountain Ruins. When the time comes, I am afraid that we, the small cultivators, will not have much of an opportunity to step in and gain opportunities. However, Ding Yu will not participate in discussions and will enter whether they agree or not. He also dislikes women. Mr. Ding, I am a small cultivator. I would like to join. Get out of here. Master, people just want to. Do you want to die? If you bother me again, I'll kill you. Okay, 
Brother, it seems that Dingyu is quite popular. And the fun is just beginning in the southern state. What? What happened? Chu Yuan went away for a few years and came back with a son? It's not going to be the same kind of bloody plot as my dad's, right? You still know when to come back. His strength is already at the first level of the compound realm, and he is unquestionably the most gifted member of the Chu family's generation. He will come find me soon. Thirteenth brother, I'm your third brother. Can I ask you something? A man who was once so vigorous and elegant is now in such poor health due to a word of love. As expected of my father's personal biography, I'm not ashamed to say that he is my own father's relative, he has learned everything about withdrawing from marriage, and now he is due to love, haggard to this point. Tell me, how can I help you? This is my son, Chu Pingfan, and I'd like to ask you to assist me in raising him and living a normal life. Pingfan, call him Uncle Thirteen. Uncle Thirteen. Well, good boy. He has a tiger's head and a tiger's brain, he looks dull and stupid, and he looks like he has no talent at first glance. It must be because of this that he was named Pingfan. Alas, the mother of the child is the daughter of a large family. We fell in love and became parents to Chu Pingfan. As a result, a powerful member from her big family came and forcibly took her away. I was not killed because my wife begged them. I'm going to the eastern state to tell them that Chu Yuan is not inferior to anyone in this world. Take care, third brother. I'll raise him. I'll give him a life-saving card as long as he doesn't come into contact with a powerful being in the heavenly realm. This power will keep him safe. Dad, are you leaving Fanner? Father is going to bring mother back. Fanner is a good boy. You have to listen to Uncle Thirteen. You understand? Hmm. Brother 13, I'm leaving. Take care of yourself. Pingfan, did you miss your aunt? Yes. Thirteenth brother, the third brother, everyone follows their own path, and this is most likely his path. Brother 13, Pingfan's talent is a bit. I will look for materials to make a talent-boosting pill. Read talent is not the only way. Pingfan, do you like knives very much? Yes, I like it. Why do you like it? Because the knife is very domineering. I like domineering things. You don't like swords? I don't like them. Thirteenth brother, let me tell you something. Last time when I went out to practice. Thirteenth brother, that guy was very bad, so I cheated him out of all his stuff and made a lot of pills. Thirteenth brother, these pills are for you. I don't need these pills. You cheated him out of all his stuff. Poor guy, he has nothing left now. All right, Brother Thirteen, I'll go back to the ancestral house first. Go ahead. It seems that he has adapted to the life in this small yard. I can't let him into the small world yet, because that world is dangerous. Even if he stays for decades, he is still a small child. Pingfan, come here. Uncle Thirteen. Pingfan, Uncle Thirteen will teach you how to practice with a knife, okay? Okay, thank you Uncle Thirteen. This ordinary knife is made by breaking off a branch from an ordinary tree in the small world. Here, this knife is for you. Everyone thinks he is stupid and has poor talent, but who knows, maybe that Chu Ping Fan has a rare ultimate talent. Only through extreme love can you become a powerful cultivator. And Chu Ping Fan, he has an extreme love for knives. And he was so angry, he wanted to prove that he wasn't trash, and he wanted to fight for his parents. The Tianji Blade Sutra can finally be used. Due to the harsh cultivation, there have been no suitable candidates for cultivation. There is no specific grade in the method of extreme Taoism. Whether it is strong or not depends on the practitioner. Pingfan potential is as equal to that of Ding Yu and Wang Luo. He is only six years old. He started practicing at the age of six. Under my own tutelage, there is no problem in breaking through to the Emperor Realm before the age of 20. A 20-year-old cultivator in the Emperor Realm. I dare to say that he will be the only one in the past and present. 
If a cultivator at the Emperor Realm who is under 20 years of age appeared under my own tutelage, the system's rewards will be absolutely generous. It is worth looking forward to. Ping Fan, 13th Uncle will pass to you the knife scripture. Thank you, 13th Uncle. Uncle 13, I like this technique very much, and I will definitely work hard to practice it. Ping Fan, one must also pay attention to relaxation during exercise and avoid going to extremes due to mental confusion. Uncle 13, I understand. I will definitely practice hard and have fun. Well, from today onwards, you will raise the knife. Raising the knife is the first stage of learning the Tianji Sword Sutra and the first step toward entering the Tao. Once an ordinary person succeeds in raising a knife, he will soar to a very high level. Which level will you reach when ordinary Tao cultivation is completed, the void realm? Or the compound realm? Or perhaps the true realm? Let's refine Ping Fan's body. Wang Luo set up an emperor-grade medicinal bath. If he bathes in emperor-grade medicine since young, even the young masters of prestigious families won't be able to do anything to him. Isn't the master directly improving his talent? I don't know what master thinks. I'm going to make an elixir to improve his talent. When I saw Ping Fan, I was reminded of how I was treated in the Wang family before. Ping Fan, come on. Uncle Wang, come, take this pill. Eat it. Think of it as candy. The pill for improving his talent is of little use to him? Why hasn't there been any change? There is no problem with the pill since I made it myself. Master, why hasn't there been any change in Ping Fan? Of his path is different from yours and different from the millions of martial artists in the world. How is it different? You will know later. Within three or four days, the Baixing Mountain Ruins will be opened. These old men, not surprisingly, were planning to surround and kill Ding Yu when the monument opened. However, this can't stop Ding Yu. Have you been converted? Just in case, planting a soul seal is more secure. My Buddha is merciful. Greetings to my Buddha. Get up. You created the world's first Buddha without leaving your home and rewarded the 24th grade Talian Buddha with a golden body, a treasure wand, seven treasure robes, and a hundred years of cultivation. As expected, Mordor was the first Buddha, and the reward was extremely satisfying, and it is suitable with Mordor. Now that you have entered my Buddhist gate, I will give you the golden body of the Buddha, the treasure wand, and the seven treasure robes. Thank you, my Buddha, for the reward. Your real name is Mordor, and now that you have converted, the worldly affairs are no longer your concern. I am giving you the name Namo Buddha. Thank you, Buddha, for giving me my name. You should condense your golden body and practice Buddhism diligently. Who is this? The weird clothes on his body and the treasure wand in his hand are all divine weapons, or even higher than divine weapons. Amit Ba Buddha. Master, who is he? A strong cultivator in the heavenly realm? The power in him is very strange, powerful, and vast, a power that we have never seen before. He is Namo Buddha, the Buddhist disciple under your master. He is a brother? Yes, and no, he has a different path than yours. I'll have to ask Namo Buddha about the war that occurred in the ancient war demon land when the demons invaded the southern state when he condenses his golden body. I received a hundred year cultivation base reward and advanced to the eighth level of honorable realm. The Baixing Mountain ruins are about to open. Let us explore the newness of the monument and begin watching the movie. The ancient monument is open. Let's enter. Nine Swords Mountain. Evil King's Court. Floating Flower. Be careful, Nine Swords Mountain and the Great Qian Empire are going to kill you. Why did I send a sound transmission message to warn this bastard? What does this woman mean by doing this? A kind reminder? Or, does she want to use this to gain my favor and get close to me? 
Dream on. Don't even think about messing with my heart. Hey. Surrounding and killing me? So what if they're at the middle level of the Emperor Realm? Baixing. The founder of Baixing Mountain. Their clan was named after him, Baixing. He was a well-known and powerful figure in the southern state's ancient history. Surprisingly, the sect he founded has been destroyed. For people at the middle level of the Emperor Realm. Are you really not going to make your move? There's no need for that. I don't have much animosity toward him, and even if I am, I won't risk annoying him. This king is ashamed to be associated with those who bully the weak with big numbers and take advantage of them. You are an evil cultivator, and you still talk about rules and justice? It seems that the evil king is really out of his mind. Evil king, do you want to fight for justice and help him? Although this evil king is righteous, he is not a meddling person. I will just despise you guys. The middle level of the emperor realm? You're just a bunch of losers who can't break through honorable realm. You are so arrogant. Young master is the one who is so arrogant. You are a rouge cultivator, so it was probably not easy for you to cultivate to this level. Why did you come? Do you want to die? Young man, don't be so arrogant. Since you want to die, I, Ding Yu, will be the one who kills you. He is just at the ninth level of the true realm. I have reached half-step into Emperor Realm. If four powerful cultivators at the half-step Emperor Realm surround him, how would he be able to kill them? The Nine Swords Mountain? I, Ding Yu, am curious, how exactly did I offend Nine Swords Mountain? Ang Jiankong is our grandson-in-law. Oh, I see, so it's for your loser grandson-in-law. It's no surprise that Ang Jiankong is a loser, his mind is full of women, it's strange not to be a loser. Screw you. Old man, you are far worse than my junior brother. Kill. I, Ding Yu, will strive to reach the pinnacle of swordsmanship. How could a few losers like you stop me? Today, I will kill the half-emperors. Stop him. If I say I will kill you, I will kill you, no one can stop me. The sword falls over the sky. No one can stop me. The pseudo-domains will be crushed. Ahem. Is being a half-emperor really so great? If I say I'll kill you, I'll kill you, you can't help it. He must be killed while he is injured, otherwise there will be endless troubles. I have time to kill one more, which one of you wants to die? Both of you, hold him for a second. It's not a big deal to hold him for a moment. The sword technique used by elders is naturally much stronger than Jin Kong technique. Nine swords mountain only sword technique? No. He has the Imperial Dan. Emperor Pills. Even the Great Qian Empire doesn't have that many of them. Even in the Heavenly Tripod Mountain, it is extremely difficult to refine the Emperor Pills, but Ding Yu swallowed two directly. What a fuss. It's just an Emperor Pill. It's not worth much. My brother made a bunch of them. What? There is even a Middle Grade Emperor Pill. Low Grade Emperor Pills are already extremely rare. You're really a loser. How can you make a fuss over a mere Middle Grade Imperial Pill? Hurry up. Nine Swords Mountain Elder, hurry up and use your sword, I'm waiting for you. Ding Yu swallowed the Emperor Pills, and his injuries have healed. It shouldn't be meddling in, but the Emperor's Pills was made by his junior brother. How strong is Ding Yu's master exactly? The matter has come to this, we have to do our best to kill Ding Yu, otherwise he will cause big trouble in the future. Ha ha ha. Not good, let's explore the ruins. The treasure was taken by someone? How can that be? I'm not going to play with you old bastards anymore. I'm going to find the treasure. 
Not good. They got away. Deep in the ruins of Baixing Mountain. Emperor Soldiers Top Grade Emperor Soldiers Because the Soul Seal has no effect on IQ, why does it feel like something is wrong with the evil king? Could it be that something is wrong with his brain after practicing evil skills? From the information obtained from the Black Moon Tower about Baixing Mountain, Baixing Mountain was a sect that specializes in body refinement, and even though it was severely damaged, it still left behind countless treasures like broken emperor weapons, various materials suitable for refining weapons, and many rare spiritual herbs in the medicine field. Medical Field I should bring some herbs back for junior brother Wang Luo to practice alchemy with. Han Ming. This field is mine. If you dare to take a step, don't blame me for being rude. This is not your damn home. Whoever sees this field has a share. Oh. Points. Surprisingly, I failed to break the sword light. Ding Yu is very powerful. If you mess up again, I'll kill you even before I finish picking the herbs. Ding Yu, I want the jade flower that has the magical property for stopping aging. Does he really think I'm unattractive? Why should I give it to you? I'll exchange it with you for an emperor pill. I wouldn't even look at what you're holding in your hand. I throw it on the ground and you actually want to trade with it. Middle grade emperor pills. What else can I offer in exchange if you wouldn't even look at the emperor pills? You Saint Maiden of the Floating Flower Pavilion, you are not short of herbs, are you? Take them out. If there is something I like, I will exchange it with you. Just barely. Forget it. I'll bear this loss, and I'll give it to you in exchange. You are a Saint Maiden of the Floating Flower Pavilion, and you're this poor. I'm really sad for you. The Small World the condensation of the golden body of Buddha is completed. Greetings to my Buddha. Um, tell me more about the ancient war of demons. Yes, my Buddha. Back then, there was a powerful cultivator from the human race who entered the demon realm to find us. The demon clan is a collective term with many factions. I am a great elder of one of the most powerful demon clan with a cultivation base of the eighth level of the heavenly realm. One day, a strong person from the human race entered the demon realm to help the demon race conquer the northern zone and the southern region and the high-ranking demons were tempted. We found out later that this was a conspiracy aimed not only at the northern zone humans, but also at the demons. What was the conspiracy? My Buddha, there was no king in the northern region. A struggle to become the first human king? Qin Ying, the great Qin dynasty's emperor. My Buddha, Qin Ying wasn't the only one involved in the battle to become the human king. Oh, who was the other party? A human in the deity realm. Surprisingly, a deity realm powerhouse was involved? Could it be that Qin Ying was a powerful cultivator in the deity realm when he was at his peak? The pinnacle of the heavenly realm is equal to half-step deity realm cultivator. The human at the deity realm, in order to further improve his cultivation, he planned the invasion of the southern region by the demons, which would put the people all around the northern zone in a dangerous situation. His primary goal was to reverse the circumstances and become a human king. By acquiring the fortune associated with being the first human king in the northern zone, he hoped to transcend the deity realm and step into a much higher realm. When Qin Ying discovered the plan of that man in the deity realm, he stepped in order to prevent the human race from falling into chaos and united with the cultivators in the northern region to block the invasion of the demons and to unify the luck of the southern state and condensed it into a treasure of chi luck. There were strong people in the western, northern, eastern, and central states who seized part of the chi luck of each state, condensed it into the treasure of chi luck, and sealed it into space. That directly destroyed the plan of the strong man of the deity realm. Oh, finally, because the demon race possessed deity realm experts, the deity realm experts of the human race and the demon race clashed. Following that battle, the entire battlefield became trapped in a spatial zone. In the ancient land of war demons, there are five treasures of luck in the northern territory. 
Is everyone planning to use the treasures of luck in the Northern Territory? Whoever wins the five treasures of Chi Luck from the five Northern Zone regions will be able to gain Northern Territory luck and the chance to be the Northern Territory's king. The demons do have a plan. The elders of the demons who died in the battle will be reincarnated and participate in the battle when the ancient land is opened. Is there a limit for cultivation level if you want to compete for the treasure of luck? Those above the emperor's realm can't participate. If one's cultivation exceeds the emperor's realm, the treasure of luck will not be able to recognize him as its master. Ding Yu is the son of luck in the southern region and also Wang Luo and Xiao Liang are the sons of luck in their regions. There are still two unknown persons from the remaining regions. They are all born because of the treasure of luck. If I can bring all the sons of luck in the five continents into my side, the first human king in the northern territory will be my subordinate and the rewards of the system will be incomparable, right? The battle for kings in the northern territory must be under my own control. The one who ascends to the position of the king of the Northern Territory must be one of my subordinates. I'll be the mastermind behind the scenes, the master of the king. If I want to control the war in the ancient land, I must first become extremely powerful. Here are some Buddhist teachings. Go ahead and learn them. I'll help him break through to the deity realm before the opening of the ancient land of war. Therefore, I'll have a subordinate at the deity realm to carry out my orders, and I'll be able to control the entire situation. Your Majesty, it's time to remove the Emperor of the Heavenly Mirror from Du Yuan's body, just in case. Keep this communication talisman, you can go to the South State and wait for the opportunity, remember not to expose yourself. Yes, sir. The seven-colored divine light activated. The heaven-shaking divine image appeared. Greetings, Senior. Are you Luo Wen or Qin Wen? Who are you? Don't worry, little girl. The deity can tell the origin of anyone with a glance. It's your destiny to meet the deity. It's a great chance. May I ask if you are the King of Luo? The King of Luo family? That little guy. I met him many years ago. He was indeed very talented. The king of Luo is only considered a child in this man's eyes? Who are you? Deity. It's been a long time, but countless people in various realms are calling me. The eternal, transcendent, handsome, unparalleled, mighty, virtuous, and holy number one Tao master of the various realms. Qin Ying respects the holy saint, who is extremely handsome, strong, and honorable. This honorable one has long been asleep and has just woken up. Your meeting with me could be called fate. I will make an exception for you and accept you as an indirect disciple. Are you ready? I'm extremely talented and have the bloodline of a king, yet I'm only qualified to be an indirect disciple. Do you feel that you deserve a better title? I dare not. Chen Ying greets master. Now that you are my disciple, do you have any requests? Master, this disciple lacks a strong body refining technique. Is this all you wish for? You might want to talk about the trap you set. Master is too scary. He even knows about this? Blessed Master, I, Qin Ying, have never been dependent on others for strength in my life. I will never lose to others in the same realm again. I will take back what is rightfully mine, and I will take revenge with my own hands. I'm happy you have such courage and insight because you are now my disciple. I can guarantee that you will only face people of the same realm there. However, whether you will come out as a winner or not, it completely depends on your own efforts and ability. Thank you, Master. This is your destiny. Would you like a body refining technique? This honorable one has many, but they are all too powerful in your current state. I have three body refining techniques that I invented casually in my youth. These techniques are a little inferior, but they are incredibly suitable for you to practice at your current level. You can choose one of these three body refining techniques, the 30 feet golden body technique, the 100 battle demon body technique, and the tyrant dragon body technique. Master, I choose the tyrant dragon body technique. 
When this technique is completed, it will allow you to obtain the power of a dragon and develop dragon armor for protection. It can be considered average. Thank you, Master. Since you are my disciple, I must tell you that the Nine Regions are just a small corner of the myriad realms. What is a mere king of the Northern Region? Even if someone becomes the king of the Nine Regions, they are nothing. You must keep in mind that if you cultivate carefully, you will be able to travel to the different realms with me. Whether it's the king of the Northern Region or the king of the Nine Regions, they're just steps on the path to cultivation. The Various Realms Cultivate diligently and don't be lazy. If you successfully manage to step into Deity Realm in the future, I will make an exception and accept you as my true disciple. I, Qi Ning, will definitely step into Deity Realm and become a true disciple of Master. After becoming the King of the Northern Region, I, Qi Ning, will definitely become the first King of the Nine Regions. Only then will I be eligible to become a true disciple of Master. I've made a mistake. I forgot to ask Master, is there a way to transform a woman into a man without being rejected by the Great Tao? The King of Mankind became one of my disciples. It's useless for others to fight for that position. Su Siener has almost reached the Emperor Realm. She will break through. Next is Ding Yu, and then Wang Luo. I'm going to transport Chu Yun into the small world. It is time for the Chu family to produce an Emperor Realm expert. A great battle took place in the ruins of Baixing Mountain. The soul of a deity realm expert has revived. Is that the remnant soul of a Baixing Mountain sect expert or an intruder? Blood soul devouring. Restrict him so that I can purify his soul. I, the evil king, will be the one who is always righteous. You bunch of despicable people don't really work together to deal with this soul. However, you are always on the lookout for me. You despicable bunch. Bah. Die. Not good. All of you must die. Not good. He uses a secret technique that splits the soul, tricking us into thinking that we have launched an attack and making us desperate. Your body is mine. Run away. Woman, stop being nosy. It's over. How is that possible? Hundred calcine divine wood, immovable mountain skill. Escape. I must escape. You want to get away? Do you believe you can? New soul blood. What exactly is this? What kind of hidden method is this? It's far too potent. He crushed the emperor's realm soul with the cultivation base of the true realm's ninth level. Hundred Exercise of the Divine Tree You want to fight? Come on! At this moment, Ding Yu seems to have some problems, as if the power of divine spirits had invaded, causing his spiritual will to surge. What are you looking at? Don't think I will make a move. If you won't do it, I'm leaving. The emperor's soul was refined, and his spiritual will grew stronger and stronger, almost reaching the true realm's limit. He has moved one step closer to the emperor's realm. This aura is very similar to the aura of the emperor's realm. There are living people in the historic site. How is it possible? There's someone in the historic site. Put down everything. The Empress of the Great Qin Dynasty sent me a letter inviting young master by Xiao Kong to the palace to discuss something important. Something important? Yes, please forgive me, young master Bai. But these ants. 
Hmm? Is someone coming? Is this place the deepest part of the ruins? Stop. What is it? Hand over all the treasures you've taken from Baishing Mountain or you'll die. Hmm. You don't deserve them. That bastard. He attacked me secretly. Sword intent. You stupid kid, you're so arrogant. Is the fight over yet? If that's the case, it seems like he hit me without use of force. What a powerful blow. It looks like the Great Qing Dynasty will have powerful cultivators again. Brother Ding Yu, you're in danger. Baixing Mountain Young Master, finally someone who can suppress me in Baixing Mountain Ruins has appeared. I can finally use this opportunity to test my strength, finally I can test my sword Dao, and maybe I can even break through my limits in the battle. I must provoke him to unleash his full power. Is that all you have, young master? Ha! This is just the beginning. Here he is. Very powerful. Arrogant boy. You're dead. Don't pretend to be dead. This technique won't kill you. Uh. Can't we just stop now? Humph. Let's go. Forget it. Let's warm up first. Boy. Are you satisfied now? I think so. What courage. It really deserves praise. So, look at my sword technique and decide whether it is worthy of making me brave or not. S. Oh, take this. Is that all? It seems that your sword is very ordinary. Humph, your trick is very ordinary. That fight isn't fun for me. Me too. If that's the case, then let's decide in one powerful move who will die. All right. Death to you. How could this happen? Ding you. He. Is he dead? Oh. I could really be hurt by your technique. I did not anticipate that. But you've really gone so far. Ding you. A little while ago. Humph. Arrogant bastard, are you dead? I haven't even used my full strength yet, and you? What? No, he's not dead yet. And the aura around him is like. He has broken some kind of shackles on himself by fighting me to death. Ding Yu was so terrified that he was able to have an enlightenment and break through his own shackles in the midst of such an intense battle. What a truly rare talent. But this genius is getting in the way of our plans, so he must die. Ding you. Die quietly. This is the legendary heavenly escape technique, the shadow of the waning moon. When did he do it? Bastard. Don't run away and fight me if you dare. Get back here now, he he he, that fool will definitely be angry to death. I would have gone back and fight him once more if it weren't for the fact that I had just broken through and my foundation was unstable. But one thing is for sure, that fool is very strong, and besides my master, he is the strongest person in the entire southern state. It is only thanks to his deathly blow, I was able to experience real combat. By being in a life or death situation, I was finally able to break my shackles. I finally understood why master sent me here. If you want to be strong, you must fight with the strongest, honing yourself by fighting to death to make a real breakthrough. I already broke through and I'm on my way home to report to Master. Oh, someone's coming. She is a woman? Did Shio come here to mess with my Dao heart? Huh? Is that Ding Yu from Chu Xuan's courtyard? I won't let you off. 
I won't let you get away. But now it's time to go home and consolidate my cultivation and report to master. Why is he talking so much? Forget it. I don't care about him. I'm just going to the ruins to meet with Bai Shao Kong. Young master Bai, please don't get angry. Your honor will get out of my way. If you stop me again, I'll hit you again. Shao Kong, why are you making a fuss? Your highness, you are here. Here she is. Young master Bai, it's been a while since we met. What's with that frown's face? Are you not happy to see me? Unfortunately, if it wasn't for that crazy guy named Ding Yu. I. Ding Yu? I just saw him earlier. Do you have a conflict with him? More than a conflict. But I don't care about that. Tell me which way he ran away. I'll go and kill him personally. He dares steal my treasures and play games with me. If I catch him, I'll kill him and then burn and dispose of his ashes. Dispose of his ashes. Dispose of his ashes. Old Bai, listen to me. We can't offend the person behind Ding Yu, so you'd better forget about it. What? I can't beat him with my fists? Sorry, we're really sorry for you. No one can handle him. We're not on the same level. Do you know what I mean? In fact, it's like he's in a different dimension. Thirteenth brother. Look at me. Look at me. Yuner, you. Did you gain weight? No. I've reached the ninth level of true realm. Amazing. Congratulations. Oh, the thirteenth brother, Yuvo changed. You are unhappy and hypocritical. You disrespectful little girl, look at my palm. Of course I'm happy, I was just teasing you. He he he, I know that, I was teasing you too. By the way, thirteenth brother, on the way back I met the little evil king again. Oh, he didn't do anything weird, did he? To be honest, this was a little weird, and he is also a bit mentally unstable. I came here today to meet you because I've heard so much about Brother Tai, the prodigal son. Nice to meet you. I also admire your fame. I've heard a lot about you too. It's an honor to meet you too. The prodigal son, oh my god. My evil king hasn't been normal since he met Miss Chu Yun, and today he paid a special visit to this number one scumbag in Qin. Oh, what a headache. To be honest, I came to look for Brother Tai because I fell in love and I hope Brother Tai can give me some guidance. Your Highness, I think I have guessed from your demeanor the problem. Is it possible that your problem is because your sweetheart treats you coldly and ignores you? Yes, yes, that's right. You are truly elegant. Thank you. Your Highness is in this situation because he hasn't found an effective communication method with her. I will show you how. First of all, we need to start with the appellation, baby, dear, sweetheart, these are all outdated, now we have to call her darling. Oh, that's nice. Hello darling. You are so pretty and elegant like a beautiful garden. That's right, it's good that you get it, but the title alone is not enough. What I'm going to say next is the most important thing. It's to create love words. Love words? Good. Love words. Your Highness, have you seen the fish in the pond? Fish? What do you think of when you see a fish? Boiled it, steam it, cook to eat it. Eat. Listed to me, Your Highness, I will create romantic words. Do you know why I love fish? Why? Because I want to be with you until death brings us apart. Mr. Tai. I got it. Why I have a bad feeling. Mr. Yuan has appeared in Ziyue County. Quack. 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 My darling Yuan. I'm coming. My darling Yuan. I suddenly fell. Why did I fell? You ask. I want to sleep with you. I'll tell you that much. Are you touched? Don't laugh at me. Thirteenth brother. What should I do, if not laugh? He's inviting you to bed. Ha ha ha. 
What? Miss Yun has returned. Why didn't you report that to me immediately? Humph. I don't care. I'm going back to the ancestral home to meet Grandpa. Please, don't forget to convey my greetings to the old man. Yuner, practice well. You are now the backbone of the Chu family, so don't be lazy. Thirteenth brother, I will not be lazy. But I'm not the Chu family's backbone. I'm bored. Before going to bed, I will use the heavenly mirror of ten thousand days. Who knows, I might find some kid with a great fortune. Oh, I found someone. No, judging from the aura he emits, he is not from the human race, but from the demon race. Among the demon race, the demon race with the most outstanding talents and with the highest status is the heavenly demon tribe, whose members look no different to the human race. According to legend, among the many tribes in the demon race, until now, only members of the heavenly demon tribe are able to break through the heavenly realm. Could it be that the heavenly mirror of 10,000 days have been randomly connected to the demonic zone this time? Let's use the heavenly secrets origin probing technique to find out his origin. Mo Wantian is a member of the heavenly demon tribe, but he is hated and disrespected by them because he has the human race's bloodline. He couldn't resist the humiliation any longer, so he decided to betray the heavenly demon tribe and is now roaming the demonic zone as an outcast. The ancient demon bloodline in his body is in the process of awakening. Thanks to the awakening of the ancient demon bloodline, he bears the fate of the demonic zone on his shoulders. Success or failure, I'll do it in one try. Demonic Devour The ancient demon bloodline awakening method is that cruel? In the end, the success of the ancient demon bloodline's revival depends on his own determination. He's a strong man. The wounds on his body appear to be disappearing. The revival of the ancient demon bloodline, it worked. Oh, it's done. It's time to act. The heavenly demon tribe, I will definitely come back one day. All of you will one day know that I am a real demon. I will develop the world's most powerful demonic techniques. This young man's insights must be broadened. He shouldn't develop demonic techniques just because he's a member of the demon race. It's time to refine this young man's insights. Amitba. Huh? Who is he? What is he doing? He's not trying to catch me, is he? The devil path has no future, young man. This honorable one says you have a lot of wisdom. Practicing Buddhism has an infinite future. Are you ready to enter Buddhism? Buddhism? What kind of faction is that? I've never heard of Buddhism. Or how much power does that unknown faction have? This senior looks very strong. But, no matter how strong he is, the ancient demons are much stronger, right? Ha! This kid has a strong anti-fraud instinct. I have to upgrade my game. Young man, our meeting was decided by fate. You are a wise man, so I made an exception and decided to accept you as my disciple. The demonic path has no future. Young man, don't walk on a narrow road. The nine regions are just a remote corner of the heavens and myriad worlds. You live in a corner, how can't even imagine the vastness of the world? The ancient demons of your demon clan, placed in the heavens and myriad worlds, are only in the middle and lower ranks. How can they compare to me? Buddhism is the right way and it's suitable for your talent. Don't miss the opportunity. The ancient demons placed in the heavens and the myriad worlds are only in the middle and lower ranks? Dare to ask the senior, what is the heavens and the myriad worlds? It is a vast and boundless world with countless powerful people. Only those who reach the deity realm in the nine regions have the ability to reach the heavens and the myriad worlds. Young man, joining the Buddhist path is the right path for you, and the heavens and myriad worlds are your journey. The small demon realm and the heavenly demon clan are mere stepping stones. Buddha's teachings are boundless and merciful. You want to take revenge on your clan, but no matter how strong you are, you are still a demon. What if you become a Buddha? 
If you turn demons into Buddhas, you will be the founder of the Buddhist clan in the nine regions and not just one of the mere chosen ones from the younger generations of the demon race. That makes sense. No matter how strong I am, I am only a descendant of the demon clan. What if I'll start my own clan? Senior, you said the Buddha's Dharma is boundless. How powerful is it? This very small Buddhist power is weaker than your demon power, but it can defeat your demon power. I can feel that this Buddha's power is only at the second level of the true realm. However, my demon power can be surpassed by that little Buddhist power. Buddhism is so powerful, what a great opportunity. I, Disciple M. O. Lantian, pay respects to the Master. Amitbha Buddha, excellent. Since you have joined the Buddha's teachings, you must obey the existing rules and regulations and get rid of the 3,000 annoyance threads. Yes, Master. As for the other rules and laws that L didn't tell him, I'll let him understand it by himself from the Buddha Dharma. Since you have just entered my Buddhist school and your level of cultivation is low, this entry-level monk's robe, Buddhist monk's stick, and bowl will be passed on to you. This is actually a heavenly weapon. It was my first time personally refining weapons, and I was quite satisfied with it. I made a heavenly weapon, which also had effects such as restraining your aura and hiding treasures. I will now teach you the Buddha's teachings. Praise Buddha. Get up. I finally brainwashed M. O. Wantian. It's a great success. Although he has the temperament of a monk, I feel that he also exudes a bit of a demonic nature. I hope nothing bad happens. You have a great desire to turn demons into Buddhas, and you have taken the first step toward creating a Buddhist sect. You are hence rewarded with the Buddhist scriptures. Even this kind of event trigger a system reward? I've received Buddhist scriptures. I'll give you Buddhist scriptures. You can use the knowledge in it to spread Buddhism in the demon zone and convert a group of believers. I'll obey Buddha. You should practice well. You took one of the sons of luck from the demon race as your disciple, turned him into a Buddha, and were rewarded with a secret realm of chance and a mystic realm of trials. There are rewards again, and it seems that there is more than one child of luck in the demon race. You can completely replicate yourself in the secret realm of trials, allowing you to challenge yourself, discover your own flaws, defeat yourself, and break through your true limits. The secret realm of trials is filled with all kinds of dangers, experts from various cultivation realms, cultivators who use all kinds of strange and powerful cultivation techniques where one can fight one-on-one -on -one or one-on-many. As expected from the system, now that I have a secret realm of trials, I can practice to my heart's content without worrying any more about being lacking combat experience. And in the secret realm of trials, there is no worry about any real injury or death. Let's set it up in a small world and quickly experience it. Choose one-on-one -on -one combat trials. No, the strength is the same as mine, the ninth level of the honorable realm, right? It turns out that my strength is indeed invincible in the same realm. The strongest experts at the ninth level of the honorable realm in the history of the nine regions cannot last a minute against me. Let's try against experts at the first level of the heavenly realm. I want to see if I can cross the boundary and defeat a heavenly realm martial artist. After 10 days, I should have set a record by becoming the first honorable realm cultivator to kill a heavenly realm cultivator. I will repeat all of the other trials in order to improve my ability to deal with various dangers, attacks, and combat situations. You did not leave home. But, you have overcome many dangerous situations and challenges in the mystic world of trials. You've gained a lot of combat experience, and you've been rewarded with thousand myriad battle insights. These kinds of events can also trigger system rewards. Myriad battle insights are a type of battle intent. It is as if I had been born with it. Now, I have the ability to handle all kinds of battles and have amazing battle awareness. El, no one can defeat me now. Let's call my disciples and get them to test it as well. I have opened a trial mystic realm. 
You can practice in it. You can increase your combat experience there, even to the point of defeating yourself and breaking through your limits. Master, as long as you can invite people to battle in the mystic realm of trials, can you also force them to accept the challenge? What do you want to do? I want to beat that bastard Ding you to death. He dared to make a wooden statue of me next to him. So every o time he opened his eyes, he would look at me. He also tried his best to ignore my presence to test his sword Dao ability. Okay, if you want to challenge him, I will make him unable to refuse. That brat, he really has been fooled to the point of absurdity. I must set the record straight. Ding Yu, yes, master. What is your understanding of the three stages of the sword path? Master, I feel that I have broken through the second stage of the sword path and am in the process of consolidating it. Master, I believe that I will soon reach a realm where I have no women in my heart and can slay the gods with my sword. Seems like you have taken the wrong path, Master. Please explain further. You avoid women, reject them, and don't let them come near you. This has created a barrier in your heart because you are afraid that if a woman comes near you, they will mess up your heart Dao. The method you have taken to break through the three stages of the ward path is the wrong method. Seeing a woman as a woman, but also not seeing a woman as the focus. There is a woman around you, but there is no woman in your heart. This is the correct method. Look, is she not a woman? She's a woman. Look again. Is she still a woman? Look, is that not a mountain? Yes. Look again, is it still a mountain? Seeing mountains as mountains, seeing mountains as not mountains, and still seeing mountains as mountains. These are the three methods of enlightenment. Seeing mountains as mountains, seeing mountains as not mountains, in other words, I should see women as women, see women as not women, and still see women as women? Master, I've got it. You're not a woman. E, you are a wooden statue. That wooden statue is you. In my heart, you are not a woman, but you are still a woman. Master, I've got it. Looks like he lost his way again? Never mind. Good. Such a great thought. Ding you, come, come, come. Let's fight. Tell me now, what am I? A wooden statue. Go to hell. You are not a woman in my heart. Although you are a woman, in my eyes, you are no different from a wooden statue go to hell. Sister Sue, stop hitting me. It will be the same, no matter how much you hit me. I've realized that I've reached the stage of seeing women as women and also not as women. I also believe that, in the master's eyes, you are a wooden statue. You are no different from a wooden statue. Go to hell. Oh. Say it again. Master, please save me. Sister Sue has gone mad. Next time, I won't go too far when deceiving my disciples. Ding Yu has gone down the wrong path again. I hope Wang Luo doesn't follow him. Master, do you see me as a wooden statue? Don't listen to Ding Yu's nonsense. So you really don't think of me as a wooden statue? Ding Yu is just a fool. Are you a fool too? Oh, I knew it. That bastard Ding Yu is too disgusting. In the days that followed, Ding Yu and Wang Luo went to the secret realm of trials to practice, and Su Xiener went there once a day to train. Su Xiener stayed by Chu Xian's side every day most of the time, organizing information, cooking delicious food, and playing with Chu Pingfan. Occasionally, she drags Ding Yu to the secret realm of trials and beating him up. Chu Pingfan stills practices with a knife and looks dull and clumsy, not like a clever child. The Buddha's teachings are boundless, you can understand it yourself. Try the secret realm of trials. You should go in and try it out. Work harder and become more skilled in Buddha's teachings. Yes, Buddha. Small world. Amitbha Buddha. In an instant, the subject of that trial, a strong creature from the demon race at the eighth level of the heavenly realm, was smashed to pieces. How strong? 
After the war in the ancient land of war is over, Buddha will return to the demon realm to help Imol Luantian spread Buddhism and transform demons into Buddhas. Space in Heaven and Earth Half a year later, Ding Yu's cultivation has been raised to the extreme. His foundation is also stable enough. It's time for him to break through the emperor's realm. At this time, Su Xiener was also in the process of breaking through to the second level of the emperor realm. Your disciple Ding Yu, under your teaching, has cultivated at a tremendous speed and broke through the emperor realm. You are rewarded with a hundred years of cultivation. My strength has gone one step further, and it is getting closer to the heavenly realm. As expected though, it is still not enough to break through to the heavenly realm. Space in Heaven and Earth Half a year after Ding Yu broke through the Emperor Realm, Wang Luo's power also accumulated to the limit and was about to break through the Emperor Realm. Void Skyfire Your disciple Wang Luo, under your guidance, has cultivated at a tremendous speed and broke through the Emperor Realm. You are rewarded with a hundred years of cultivation. I became another step closer to the Heavenly Realm. However, did not break through to the Heavenly Realm yet. Whether I can break through to the heavenly realm before the 10-year period comes or not depends on Chu Ping Fan. Or, trigger the system's cultivation rewards. The most likely to trigger the system rewards is M.O. Luantian. Now, the strength of M.O. Luantian has been raised to the sixth level of the true realm. Every now and then, Chu Xian connects to M.O. Luantian and teaches him the Buddhist scriptures. He also solves his cultivation problems. Although Imo Luantian is serious and seems to be a serious monk, Chu Xian feels that one day he would cause problems. Master, can I change my Buddhist monk's stick into a sword? Why change it into a sword? Master, I have always felt that people in the world are too greedy. I have some enlightenment in my heart, and I want to forge a sword of discipline. Imo Luantian seems to be very talented in Buddhism. Is this an insight? If you have this insight, you will be gratified by your teacher, so I will give you a sword. Thank you, Master. Are there any easier ways to trigger system rewards? The secret realm of chance rewarded by the disciple M.O. Luantian has not yet been arranged. When the arrangement is going on, there will definitely be someone with great luck to enter the secret realm and trigger the system rewards. What opportunities should I put in it? Cultivation is indispensable. Let's add something. To practice this skill, take a knife and castrate yourself. Cut off the roots of your thoughts, gather your willpower, and cultivate the peerless method. I don't think anyone would be so stupid to cut themselves with a knife after seeing this page, right? If you don't do that, you can never succeed in learning this skill. How can you temper your mind without going through the world of mortals? Those who were unparalleled in the world in ancient times worked extremely hard and gave up their desires. Those who can't do so are traitors. If you don't castrate yourself, you are a coward and a complete fool, but if you do, your mind will be intact and you are bound to achieve great things. Kowtow, kowtow three times and the skills will appear. There should be no one who would cut it with a knife after seeing the first page. Probably not. The next step is to prepare artifacts. Divine artifacts are a must. I have also prepared a unique weapon for warding evil immortal scripture holders, that is embroidery needles. Each embroidery needle carries a thin thread, and there are 9,000 needles in total. This is a complete set. The higher a person's cultivation is, the more embroidery needles he could use. This set of embroidery needles is a heavenly realm level artifact. As for other divine artifacts, Chu Xian left behind two long and thin sabers. In addition to the heavenly realm level embroidery needles, Chu Xian also refined a set of emperor realm level thin sabers. Once the artifacts were ready, it was time for the pills and the like. First, they are the spiritual pills for healing. The lowest quality pills that were provided were also emperor level pills. Wang Luo had refined some of them, and Chu Xian directly took a few bottles. There were various kinds of spiritual healing pills, including pills to heal soul wounds, mental wounds, and spiritual wounds. Let's place it on the border with the eastern state.
he was not far from the heavenly realm. Over the next few days, Chu Xian cultivated with all his might. Occasionally, he would give Imo Luantian some pointers. I'm enlightened. This monk is not in his right mind. Could it be that he misunderstood my words? Seeing women as women, seeing women as not women, and still seeing women as women, I'm starting to understand. This disciple is already beyond help. I shouldn't have gone too far in deceiving him. Please tell dear junior brother Wang Luo to refine lots of illusion pills for me. I will use a lot of illusion pills to stabilize my state of mind and try to break through the third stage of the sword path. A woman really appeared in an illusion. I'm still not strong enough. Under the influence of Ding Yu, Wang Luo also took the illusion pills to perfect the illusion pills refining and improve his state of mind. His intention was to reach a state where he has no woman in his heart and will naturally become a deity in refining pills. Damn. These two bastards are full of enthusiasm while falling into an illusion. It's not normal for there to be no beauty in their illusions. Unless, of course, they cut their own stems. Master, we have doubts. What are the things that is making you doubtful? Damn. Is this divine retribution? Master, every time I'm hit by the illusion, a woman will appear. How can I break this illusion? Me too, Master. You have a mental barrier. You're too obsessed with something that exists or doesn't exist. Either it exists or not, it's just like being true or false. It's all about the heart. If you are too obsessed with whether it exists or not, how can you be clear-minded? How can you focus on one thing and cultivate the great Tao? Thank you, Master. I understand now. Thank you, Master. I've understood too. I don't know what have they understood from our words. Chu Yun has returned several times during this period. Her goal is to break through to the middle level of the Emperor Realm. After all, one could not directly break through to the Emperor Realm in the Southern State. If she broke through the middle level of the Emperor Realm, she would technically stand at the top of the Southern State, for now. Emo Luantian had broken through the ninth level of the True Realm and began traveling through the Demonic Zone. There's no news of Xiaoliang, so he probably hasn't reached the Southern State yet. In the blink of an eye, Chu Pingfan was nine years old. He almost kept his saber for three years. Chu Pingfan is currently on the verge of successfully cultivating his saber. His cultivation will soon rise. This inexplicable aura is very powerful, indomitable, as if reaching the ultimate feeling. The saber especially seems to be integrated with Chu Pingfan. It's called the Plain Saber. Ding Yu once used Imperial weapons to slash the saber, but it wasn't damaged, not even a small gap. Master, can you give me a saber like Ping Fan? This wood is not suitable for you. So far, only Ping Fan can use the weapons made of this wood. Three years have passed since Chu Yuan left. The power left in Chu Yuan's body has not been stimulated, indicating that Chu Yuan has not encountered anything fatal and is still alive. Maybe he is in a difficult situation. Look at you. What kind of garbage did you give birth to? I've never seen such a useless person. He is a stain to our family. Meditate. Mortal realm, profound realm. Spiritual realm, it's been three years. It's been a long time since you've raised your knife. The transformation begins now. What kind of talent is this? What kind of cultivation method is this? Void realm, compound realm, true realm. After three years of cultivating the knife, he broke through to the true realm in an instant. If this spreads, the entire nine regions will be shaken, right? Chu Pingfan is only nine years old. Third level of the true realm. Your nephew Chu Pingfan, under your tutelage, entered the extreme path and instantly broke through to the true realm, becoming the ninth ever true realm martial artist under the age of ten, and you are rewarded with 300 years of cultivation. 
You have taught the ninth ever martial artist under the age of 10 to enter the true realm, and the first ever practitioner of the extreme path to enter the true realm at the age of 9, for which you will be awarded the Aurora Technique. Aurora Technique This is a speed technique. It can transform you into an aurora of light and travel millions of miles in an instant. When it reaches its peak, it can ignore space, prohibitions, and barriers, transforming into a ray of light that flows unobstructed. Uncle 13, I broke through. Dot Uncle 13, I broke through. Good, very good. Strive to break through to the Emperor Realm before the age of 20. Well, I will definitely work hard. In practice, it is also important to emphasize the combination of work and rest. If you only cultivate, it is not good. You are still young, so don't be obsessed with just cultivation. Uncle 13, I know. If you want to hang out, you can hang out and have fun too. You can ride it out and play. The Sky Spirit Cat is a miracle in heaven and earth. Its strength has improved rapidly, and now it has reached the first level of the Honorable Realm and the Golden Peng Peng, which shakes the sky, is at the third level of the Honorable Realm. With these two pets and Chu Ping Fan, who cultivates the extreme path, there is no danger in the southern state. Receive the 300 years of cultivation. My soul is transforming. My physical body is also changing. The aura of the Tao is infused, and the charm of the Tao has integrated into the rules. Also, the power of the domain is changing. I am the only one in the world. It is the heavenly realm. The domain power of the heavenly realm has more perfect rules, just like a small world. Within this world, my will is the rule, and within the domain, I am the heaven. This is the heavenly realm. There is an aura of destruction, coming from the rules of the great Tao. I would be going through a tribulation. Outside. I thought that when my breakthrough would occur, and also because of the system, there would be no tribulation. I don't want the tribulations of heavens to come more violently, and it also comes directly from the aura of the Tao. This is no longer a tribulation of the heavenly realm, but a catastrophe of a higher level. Time Board Capture After passing the last tribulation, Chu Xian's breakthrough was completed, and both the soul and the body have undergone transformation. I have been staying at this home for less than 10 years, and I've already advanced from the mortal realm to the heavenly realm. This speed is unrivaled, isn't it? You broke through the heavenly realm and became the youngest heavenly realm cultivator in history. Because of that achievement, you are rewarded with the expansion of the small world and an origin Tao crystal. I didn't expect that breaking through the heavenly realm would trigger a system reward. Besides, am I actually the youngest heavenly realm cultivator in history? After all, I have broken through the heavenly realm in less than 10 years. This is something that has never been achieved by any heaven-defying genius since ancient times. The first thing I have to do is to expand the small world. Don't panic. I'm just expanding the small world. Buddhist Dharma is unlimited. The expanded small world has been increased to the same size as the northern region. The density of spiritual energy within it has also increased, and the strongest beings in the small world have now advanced to higher realms. The expanded small world has been increased to the same size as the northern region. The density of spiritual energy within it has also increased, and the strongest beings in the small world have now advanced to higher realms. Origin Tao crystals can record the auras of Tao experts. And as long as the aura is recorded, the great Tao can be used as a medium for Tao experts to communicate with each other. As long as the origin Tao crystal is well maintained, it will have the ability to evolve the world into a great Tao world. As long as the origin Tao crystal is well maintained, it will have the ability to evolve the world into a great Tao world. I must endeavor to break through the deity realm as quickly as possible. The heavenly realm is no longer a problem for me. I wonder if there are any Tao realm experts in the nine regions? It will take a long time to break through the deity realm unless I receive a huge reward from the system. 
As of now, the only thing I can be sure of triggering the system reward is my disciples' rapid cultivation speed and quick breakthrough. Now, Su Xianer, Ding Yu, and Wang Luo have all broken through the Emperor Realm, the next reward for their breakthrough will only happen when they team up to break through the next higher realm, for now, only Chu Pingfan's breakthrough is in front of the eyes. Now, Su Xianer, Ding Yu, and Wang Luo have all broken through the Emperor Realm, the next reward for their breakthrough will only happen when they all break through the next higher realm, for now, only Chu Pingfan's breakthrough is what I am mostly focused on, which should be achieved. If I could nurture the youngest Emperor Realm expert in history, the reward would be enormous. I don't know when I will be able to attract more people with such great fortune. Over the next few days, Chu Xian frequently used the heavenly mirror of 10,000 days to randomly connect to various places in an attempt to find monsters that could be evolved after Chu Xian broke through the heavenly realm. The number of the heavenly mirror of 10,000 days marks increased to 9. Currently, there are still 6 unused marks. Chu Xian tried to transport living beings through the heavenly mirror of 10,000 days, but he could only transport beings under the true realm, and the consumption of spiritual power to do that was huge. This also means that he cannot take Yimou Luantian and send him to the small world to cultivate. As the milestone of 10 years of seclusion approached, Chu Xian also added entertainment to his schedule. For example, he asked Su Xiener to dance. Because of that, Chu Xian set up a guitar and taught Su Xiener the technique of singing so she could play songs to entertain him. His days became more and more comfortable. Ding Yu and Wang Luo spend most of their time cultivating in the small world to practice and improve their strength. Chu Pingfan trained diligently and managed to successfully cultivate his saber. He officially began to study the Tianji Sword Sutra. Chu Pingfan's daily life was very simple. He cultivates, plays with the heavenly spirit cat, carves statues, and eats spiritual pills as snacks. Chu Xian also passed the Aurora Technique to Chu Pingfan. Ding Yu and Wang Luo also practiced the Aurora Technique, but they found it hard. They couldn't master it for some time. However, Chu Pingfan easily mastered it. The 10-year exclusion milestone is approaching. I'm really looking forward to it. Qin Ying had already started cultivating the Tyrant Dragon Body Technique, and she had already cultivated to the fifth level of the Emperor Realm. At the same time, Namo Buddha cultivation has reached the ninth level of the Heavenly Realm. The ten-year seclusion milestone is approaching. My hard work in cultivation has brought me half a step closer to the second level of the Heavenly Realm. Your disciple, Emo Luantian, experienced enlightenment in the Buddha Dharma, and his cultivation increased. He has broken through the Emperor Realm. Congratulations, you are being rewarded with a Tao Seeking Mirror. What is going on? Emo Luantian has truly experienced enlightenment in the Buddhist Dharma and has broken through the Emperor Realm? Barren Mountain. He really has become a Buddha. Heavenly Eyes. Emo Luantian and Buddha were destined to be together. He has opened the heavenly eyes. It's amazing. He has been practicing Buddhism in the darkness, and his white clothes were like snow. Not a speck of dust could be seen on his body. Beyond that, he looked holy, and certainly not like an ordinary old man. Mighty Heavenly Dragon when I fooled him in the beginning, I accidentally said a lot of things such as the mighty heavenly dragon. And he really created a supernatural martial art using the words I said? Amitba Buddha. Let's receive the system's reward for Emo Luantian's breaking through the emperor realm. By using the Tao Seeking Mirror, you can find the great path. You can find the Tao and record the aura of the Tao that you find. Unexpectedly, it is a rare treasure that can explore the great path and those who have achieved it. It consumes a lot of energy. There is no hurry. I'll explore every day to see if I can find someone strong in the Tao realm. Through the Tao Seeking Mirror, one can discover a powerful Taoist and capture a trace of his aura. 
Once a powerful Taoist appears, Chu Xian can discover it through the Tao Seeking Mirror. After recording the strong aura of the Tao realm, Chu Xian could absorb this aura into the Origin Tao Crystal. Oh, he can then use the Primordial Tao Crystal to communicate with them. He could even secretly ask the other party to help him maintain the Origin Tao Crystal. With these two supreme treasures, the other party should not be able to detect something wrong. Next, Chu Xian would use the Tao Seeking Mirror every day with the intention of searching for the existence of the powerful Tao Realm. Nick Spang Ur Is it true that there is no Tao Realm in the Nine Regions? Since there isn't such a realm, there shouldn't be any strong ones in this realm. Have they all left the Nine Regions? Since they are not in the Nine Regions, where did they go? Could it be that there is an upper world? Sir, let me dance for you, okay? I am not interested in watching. Little Pink Fan, I'll show you a dance, okay? Aunt Sue, I don't want to watch. I want to practice with the knife. I let Chu Xian to come back to the ancestral home. Coming back to the ancestral home? I'm not interested. This is the master's wish. Could it be that you want to disobey the master? I live here very well. I'm not going back. You go back and tell him not to bother me anymore. You this. Just go and tell him not to disturb me. Otherwise, Xiao Yuner and I will leave the Chu family house with our belongings. Don't blame me for not saying hello in advance. Bastard, just let him stay there. Tomorrow, ten years will have passed. What's the reward for the first decade? Come on, dance for fun. Why did you suddenly ask me to dance? Is it possible that next, you would want to take me to bed? There's something wrong with this girl. Ouch. Dance well, don't make such childish movements. Daoyun tea. This tea contains Daoyun. Every sip is equivalent to Taoyun washing the body and soul. It can be described as a treasure. You can drink one cup a month from this tea. Too much isn't good for you. Yes, sir. The tea master drinks is really extraordinary. The ten years mark has come. You have been in the house for ten years. Please continue to set new records. You will be rewarded with the Chaos Indestructible Body and Chaos Clock. Indestructible Chaos Body is born from ultimate chaos. It is eternal and immortal. It can absorb all Tao into its body and transcend the tribulation of Tao. The Bell of Chaos is born from the ultimate chaos. It is eternal and indestructible. It can swallow the great Tao. The Bell can be transmitted for centuries. It has extraordinary defenses and can help its user to transcend and suppress the tribulation of Tao. Receive the indestructible chaos body reward. This is a far greater transformation than when I broke through the Emperor Realm, or even the Heavenly Realm. The power has reached an indescribable level. Time did not affect me. What's more, I was constantly absorbing the natural spiritual energy around me. Oh, I am able to absorb every type of energy. Whether it's spiritual energy, demonic energy, or other types of evil and poisonous energy, I can absorb them all and use them to cultivate without any problems. This is the advantage of the indestructible chaos body. I've also broken through the second level of the heavenly realm. In addition, my cultivation speed has increased more than a hundredfold. An ordinary second tier heavenly realm cultivator wouldn't be able to withstand one of my blows. But with my current strength, I still can't ring this bell of chaos. With the addition of the indestructible chaos body and the bell of chaos, my strength has increased by leaps and bounds. Even a heavenly realm expert can't kill me. So how strong am I now? The first choice is to use Buddha Namo to test my current strength. Buddha Namo, who had broken through the ninth level of the heavenly realm, he is so powerful that he is almost at the peak of the heavenly realm. With my cultivation in the heavenly realm, I have defeated Buddha Namo, who is in the ninth level of the heavenly realm. I am now certain that I am invincible in the heavenly realm. 
now that he has an indestructible chaos body, his body is no longer limited by the speed of digesting the effects of the spiritual pills, so he can swallow the spiritual pills easily. If the amount wasn't enough, the system would give him more. There was no need to panic at all. You have been home for ten years and one day. Congratulations on being rewarded with Heavenly Tao Artifact Scripture. Heavenly Tao Artifact Scripture is an artifact refining manual that contains many artifact refining methods, just like the Heavenly Pill Scripture. Heavenly Tao Artifact Scripture The difference is that this book belongs to the Tao of Artifact Refinement. Whether it's Emperor-level artifacts, Heavenly Artifacts, or Deity Artifacts, they are all out of the question. 2 Heavenly Level Puppets The current puppet power is only at the 5th level of the Heavenly Realm. The Origin Dao Crystal is undoubtedly the best place to nurture these puppets. I don't have any genius disciples who can refine artifacts. A slacker like me wouldn't bother to work hard to perfect an artifact. You have lived at home for 10 years and 2 days. Congratulations, you have been rewarded with a Heavenly Array Formation Scripture. Yesterday, the reward was about artifact refinement. Today, it's about arrays and restrictions. Could it be that the system wants me to be multi-skilled? The system really wants me to be an awesome expert who has really mastered a wide range of skills. Heavenly Array Scripture Today, I will explain arrays and restrictions to all of you. How much you can learn and whether you are interested in learning more, it is all up to you. Ping Fan, have you gained insight? I'm getting some of 13th Uncle Insights. The saber rises and falls, the saber is my array, the array is my saber, and everything is my saber. Is there something you don't understand? A little. Say it to me. You have lived at home for 10 years and 3 days. Congratulations on being rewarded with a box of heavenly mystery pills. After his body underwent transformation and turned into an indestructible chaos body, Chu Xian's consumption of heavenly mystery pills increased. His new consumption rate was no longer calculated by the number of pills, but by the number of bottles. Su Xianer and the other two had understood arrays and restrictions and were now in the small world. They each had their own understanding of how to use them in battle. Wang Luo was refining a special pill. Not only did he use spiritual herbs as ingredients, but he also used various materials to carve arrays into those pills. Dean Yu uses the heaven-reaching sword technique as the foundation for his sword array formation. Su Xiener also used her own insights to create her own array formation. Chu Pingfan has been practicing his saber all this time. When he took out his saber, it was like there was a huge array attached to it. Although not perfect, it was a good start and a foundation for his future accomplishments. Three months have passed. Chu Xian's strength continues to increase. He will soon reach the third level of the heavenly realm. Outside of the Chu County, on a desolate mountain. It happened again. Every time it happens, it feels worse than death. Damn it! The strange constitution appeared again. I don't know if I can survive this time. I'm relieved that I did not die this time. I thought it was my fate that I could escape from the monument, but who would have thought that? I'll end up like this. Now that my strange symptoms are breaking out and I have run out of pills, am I really going to die here? I don't want to. But now, all I have left is this small hammer stored in my Dantian. This is an artifact that I myself forged. What can I do now? Little hammer, are you making such a noise because you feel sorry for me? Thank you for staying with me to the end. I'm just a useless master. I am just a bastard from a family of craftsmen, and I have a strange disease, and I have been bullied since I was a child. The greatest achievement in my life is to be able to forge a weapon that is connected with my heart. I thought I could change my fate by going to the monuments, but... Now in this situation, what can I do? Little Hammer. You master, I... Really? Want...
Huh? Why is someone sleeping here in the middle of the day? No, it looks like he's going to die. Saving someone's life is better than increasing your own strength. You should not die if you meet Miss Yun. It just so happens that I have recently developed a new top quality soul restoring pill, so I'll let you have it. I have refined this pill for 7 days and 7 nights, and all the medicinal materials are of the highest quality. Whether you suffer from rheumatic bone pain or bruises and sprains, you will be cured with the medicine. Huh? Why is there no response? What kind of holy medicine for healing is this? The pain on the body has been reduced a lot, and even my soul has been nourished. Now I have regained consciousness, but I can't speak. Although I haven't given this medicine to anyone yet, the effect shouldn't be like this, right? Beautiful sister, keep going. Increase your strength. Don't pity me because I am dying. It won't let you. Stop knocking me. It hurts. I'll heal you. It's better to go home and look for an expert. I have a bad feeling about this. Thirteenth brother, I'm back. Yuner, why are you in such a hurry? Aren't I in a hurry to come back to see my most beloved invincible thirteenth brother? And I also brought back A. Huh? Why are there so many people in the yard? Who are they all? They are the disciples and the maid of your thirteenth brother. By the way, Miss Yuner is your martial aunt. You all introduce yourselves. I'm honored to meet my martial aunt. I am Wang Luo. Hello, martial aunt Yun. I'm Ding Yu. I have met sister Yun. I am the maid Su Xiener. Sure enough, you really are my thirteenth brother. You have accepted so many disciples. Lecturing and accepting karma is the solution to resolve doubts. By the way, Yuner, why are you carrying a sack on your back? Oh, I just chatted and almost forgot that there is still this big issue that has not been resolved. Brother 13, Yuner came to you because of him, he. So that's it. This person has a special physique, and this physique will make people's bones burn like fire, causing abnormal pain, and the weak-willed will die of pain. Wow, this guy is so miserable. He looks about our age, and yet he has to endure such inhumane suffering. Wow, this guy is so miserable. He looks about our age, and yet he has to endure such inhumane suffering. A powerful gift? Can it be as strong as my supreme sword path? It seems that the master is going to accept him as a disciple, but why are all of the master's disciples so strange? And this weird with the special physique seems to be dying soon. He seems to be just one breath away from ascension to heaven. It seems to be half a breath. The man called Thirteenth Brother is so divine that he saw through me with just one glance. If only I could open my mouth right now. But isn't the most important thing to do now is saving me? Stop talking about my body's constitution any longer and do something about it. Hurry up and get out of the way. If I let you discuss his constitution for a little longer, his condition will be really hopeless. Thirteenth brother, you will heal him. Master, sir, it is a great idea. Brother thirteen, holy lord. When I am cured, I must kneel down and count out three times to you. This pill is not enough to cure him completely, but it can bring him back from the brink of life and death. Come on, hurry up, I can't wait. It had to be Lord Thirteen who made the move and helped me, and now the feeling of being on fire all over my body has disappeared. My body is gradually regaining consciousness. It really feels like being brought back from the brink of death. I'm alive again. You're awake. I am still alive. I heard the conversation between Lord Thirteen and all of you, so I would like to thank Lord Thirteen for saving my life. You're welcome. No need to address me like that. My name is Chu Xian. Just address me as Master. Final, I don't know your name yet. My name is Xiang Xing. I'd like to thank you for saving me. From now on, I'd like to serve you as a slave and a servant to repay your kindness. Hey, you're welcome. Hey, 
I did it again, Xiang Xing, the concubine son of the Xiang family from the eastern continent of the southern region, because his mother took the fruit of fire, her bloodline was transformed, and he was born with bones of fire. He strayed into the ancient cross-regional formation and came to the southern continent of the northern region by accident. Xiang Xing, get up and talk. Yes, sir, is my special physique really a powerful gift? If it is a gift, why have I been suffering from it all the time? Your physique is called a natural fire bone. Only when I completely eliminate the hidden dangers for you, can you get rid of the pain of bone erosion, be completely reborn, and embark on a path you have never thought of before. Sir not only saved my life, but will also make me stronger. I can't repay such kindness even if I work like a cow or a horse. Siam 11, the process of removing hidden dangers will be extremely painful, you have to endure. Yuner, 13th brother will borrow some Dan medicine from you. Borrow Dan medicine? Huh? How did my Dan medicine come out on its own? He, he, I, the 13th brother, will remember Yuner's favor. I will be able to exchange her for handsome rewards later. Okay, brother 13, I still have more if it's not enough. With the help of Yuner's pills, Xiao Xing's pain can be reduced a lot. Go ahead. Oh, the pills and the spiritual energy have been absorbed by my body. Xiao 11, endure it. This time, it's really up to you. What an overwhelming spiritual power, as if it wants to tear my soul apart. But I have experienced countless times of pain and suffering. How can I give up at this critical moment? I shall be reborn today. Is this the potential of a natural fire bone? So strong. This level of talent is not inferior to mine. Is it over? Did I make it through? That's right, Sion 11, you succeeded. Sir, did I really succeed? Yes, don't doubt yourself, you succeeded. Master, I, Sion Xian, would like to ask you to take me in as your disciple. I have accepted you. Get up quickly. Ding. You have accepted a disciple with natural fire bones and are rewarded with the great sun burning technique. Thank you, master. I will not let you down. This is a book containing the great sun burning technique. You use it for cultivation and after fully stimulating your fire bone talent, I will teach you the way of refining weapons as your teacher. Great sun burning technique. Thank you, Master. I already know your origin, and you have a great karma, so you can only keep getting stronger to live up to your own great destiny. Master, what great karma did I have? You will know when the time comes, you just need to remember that there is a teacher backing you, and you don't need to worry about anything. Yes, Master. Go practice in the small world, if you want anything just tell the two senior brothers. Yes, Master, I'll leave now. I thought Xiang Xing's transformation process would take a long time, but I didn't expect him to complete it in such a short period of time. Sure enough, suffering is an indispensable accumulation for success. Oh. Moreover, Xiang Xi's talent is so high and his willpower is tenacious and even stronger than Ding Yu and Wang Luo. Good morning, Master. Good morning to you too, Xiao Xing. Xiao Xing, you have consolidated your cultivation well these past few days, and you have conquered the bones of fire, so you must continue to work hard in the future. Don't slack off. I will not fail to meet my master's expectations. Well, I have already sent the method of refining tools and some of its basic exercises into your mind. If you want to develop a full range of development, you should not be complacent because of your strong gift. This disciple will follow the teachings of the master. When you improve a little bit, I will teach you how to refine the mother-child communication symbols. Yes, master. Master has entrusted me with so many important tasks, so I must complete them perfectly to repay my master's kindness. By the way, Xiao Xing, that little hammer you have is quite interesting. As expected of Master, he even knows about this little hammer inside my body. Master, this small hammer was made by me when I was a child, and over the years it has already become the same as my heart. Although it is not expensive, it means a lot to me. 
Master knows what this little hammer means to you, but you have yet to discover the true power it contains. The true power of the small hammer? That's right. Huh? Master? Xiaoxing, don't panic. The core soul of your hammer is a special treasure. It's just that your initial refinement is too rough to bring out its full power. Er. Don't worry, Xiaoxing. Your master won't destroy the little hammer. I'll just give it a makeover. He he. The little hammer, it can also. It's been reborn. Well, here it is. The little hammer has directly become a heavenly treasure. Your little hammer has been refined by your master, and its transformation speed has been accelerated. If you continue to cultivate it in your body, its end point will not be as simple as a heavenly treasure. Aren't the heavenly treasures the end point? 2. Thank you, Master. Go back to the small world and continue to cultivate. After three months, I finally broke through the third level of the heavenly realm. In my mind just now, I simulated a battle with Namo Buddha and was able to defeat him in a minute. If I had used my trump card from the start, I could have defeated him in an instant. Ding your disciple, Emol Wantian, has spread the concept of equality among all beings. He killed a thousand demon guards. You are rewarded with demonic scripture. Huh? What's wrong with Emol Wantian? But according to what the system says, he killed 100 demons. Why isn't he acting like a good monk? I want to see, what the hell is this kid, Emol Wantian, doing? Amitba. You, you, you. You, you are a demon. You, you don't come here. Master, put down the sword and become a Buddha. Why do you still ask me to put down my sword? Didn't you kill all these demons? Goodness, goodness, this poor monk is just offering them a blessing. Ha! You are a pervert, a psychopath, a lunatic. Uh, this guy is really stupid, he is rushing to death. Stubborn. It seems necessary to purify your dirty soul. What do you mean? Purify? Amit Ba Buddha. What kind of palm technique is this? What? I am fine, right? Then doesn't that mean he is strong on the outside but weak on the inside? But there is a feeling that something is not right. Why am I lying on the ground? Could it be the palm of the bald man just now? Made my body die and left my soul behind? But why did he do that? Where did this baldy man come from? Who is he? Come here. I have specially left your divine soul to purify you. I wish you an early enlightenment and conversion to our Buddha. So you are waiting for me to come. Baldy, you are so cruel. Amitba, bald man, you made a surprise attack. What kind of hero are you? Let me out if you dare. Let's stand up and fight with real swords. I was careless. I didn't even blink. This battle doesn't count. I've won two out of three matches. Baldy. Baldy. Speak. Amitba, good. Baldy, say something. Why are you holding me captive like this? What do you think, sir? If a person fills 3,000 worlds with 7,000 treasures and gives them away, how many people will be helped? Sir must say, very much, honorable one. Baldy, stop talking. I'm begging you, my ears are about to burst from your talking. Besides, is your throat made of iron? Can't you even stop for a moment to drink saliva? Form is not different from emptiness. Emptiness is not different from form. Form is emptiness. Emptiness is form. I really can't take it. You are going to kill me. I'm begging you. Sir, your attitude is obviously insincere. It seems that your understanding of my Buddha is not thorough enough. I thought back then that I was as stubborn as you, 
but it wasn't until the appearance of my master opened up my eyes a little bit and made me realize. This demon M.O. Lantian, he still has the face to mention me. It seems that I have to find some time to correct this kid. If I let it go, I'm afraid he will go astray. If you can truly feel with your heart the Buddha way my master has created, then all that I have done today will be worthwhile. Amitba. Baldy, you bastard. I thought you were the only crazy bald man. But I was wrong. I'm sure your master is a man even more crazier than you. I'm also sure you are not from the same race as us. Presumptuous. How dare you insult my master? I will kill you once and for all. Poya Paramitha, Poya Paramitha, Poya Paramitha. What the hell is this? It's burning my soul. Ah. It's so painful. It's too painful. Kill me. Amitba, good, good. This M.O. Lantian is really too crooked. He has really grown too wild. However, the freed M.O. Lantian has already reached the second level of the Emperor Realm. I never thought that he could still achieve such accomplishments without the help of the small world. He is worthy of being a son of luck. However, Ding Yu and Wang Luo, who live in the small world, are still a bit behind compared with M.O. Lantian. It seems that the sons of luck still have to be raised to obtain the opportunities and transformation brought by luck through external stimulation. Little you, little Luo, come out, I have important tasks for you. Yes, master. Since the two of you have cultivated so far, one dare not say that you are invincible at the same level, but you are also at the top. However, it is not enough to always stay in the small world to cultivate. Oh, it's time to go and venture out. Your master also knows what happened to the two of you. You should go back to vent your anger. You should take this experience. But the most important thing on this trip is to overcome yourselves. This is the important task that master entrusts to you. Don't worry, master. We will not disgrace the name of our master. Also, don't panic when anything happens. You have your master behind you. Yes, master, I, Ding Yu, will not fail to meet your expectations. I, Disciple Wang Luo, will respectfully follow the teachings of my master. As your master, I will give you two a seal. If there is an urgent matter, use this seal on the enemy, no matter how far apart we are, I will kill the enemy with the seal. Disciple Ding Yu, Wang Luo, thanks the master once again. Remember to come back before the opening of the ancient land of war demons. All right. Sir. I also want to go back to my hometown to beat up the bastard who coveted me and avenge for the forced marriage. Who will serve me when you leave? What's the hurry? What strength do you have? When you reach the heavenly realm, you can just go back and suppress them, and it won't take long. All right. It's true that the heavenly realm is not unattainable, and cultivation in the small world will make things faster. As long as you are strong, you can go to the East Continent to find your parents. I want to seek justice for myself. I am not trash. Not trash. I wonder what rewards they will bring this time when they go out. Recently, there has been significant progress in the level and strength of Siam 11, and we can prepare for that plan. By connecting the Mistress Talisman with the Origin Dao Crystal and connecting it to the Avenue, it can carry a huge amount of information flow. But that's not easy. The talisman must be at least a Dao level instrument. I'll use plain wood as the core foundation of the Dao level instrument. I named this Dao level instrument as the Heavenly Dao Talisman. It's the Mistress Talisman of all communication talismans and controls everything. Master will make a Heavenly Dao Talisman. You stay here and watch carefully. Yes, Master. The refining is complete. And it is successfully connected with the second talisman. I think talismans can be classified as a low-level communication talisman, a high-level communication talisman, and the disposable communication talisman. The disposable communication talismans are classified as confidential types and are prepared for people with special needs. Xiangxing is really talented and thoughtful. 
The rest of the communication talismans will be yours to refine and study. Xiang Xing can be trained to be a person who is responsible for the implementation of the Heavenly Tao Talisman and the Heavenly Tao Plan. As long as the communication talisman is popularized and the plan is successfully implemented, no matter which force in the future uses the communication talisman, there will be no secrets not known to me. No matter who transmits the message, he must pass the Heavenly Tao Talisman. When my power increases, especially after I break into the Tao realm, the Heavenly Tao Talisman will be strengthened once again. That talisman will spread through the nine regions. You are calmly preparing huge plans. You haven't left your home, but are beginning to implement the Heavenly Tao Talisman plan. Congratulations! You have been rewarded with the Tao Intentions. Sure enough, it's always easier to trigger the system rewards inadvertently. Receive the reward. Break through the fourth level of the heavenly realm. I can even clearly sense the existence of the Tao, and there is a subtle Tao rhyme that nourishes me. It is as if my soul is the great Tao. Breakthrough to the deity realm is just around the corner. Let's see what Ding Yu is doing. Han Ming. Ming. Ding Yu went to the site of the floating flower pavilion? What are you doing here? Can I ask you a favor? Ding Yu came to ask me for help? What a good thing. You say, as long as I can do it, I will definitely help. Hang on me to try. Hanging on you? How? You don't want to help? If you don't want to, forget it, I'll find someone else. I would like to help. It's just hanging on him? In the whole southern state, except Ding Yu, who deserves me to hang on him? If you want to, then come on. Having a woman on your body but no woman in your heart? Master, I am still too weak to do it. I still need to continue to work hard to break the three barriers of the Supreme Sword Path. It's hopeless. I thought he was enlightened, but that's what it's all about. What the hell? I taught you so many words, you just remember this one sentence. This bastard. I will definitely break through the Supreme Sword Path Barrier. Ah. Ding you, you bastard, you bastard, you, I, Han Ming, Meng, am not done with you yet. It's hopeless, let's take a look at Wang Luo. He suppressed his cultivation to the true realm, and he is still wearing a mask. As expected of the son of fortune, he is well versed in the way of pretending to be a pig and eating a tiger. The Wang family has almost won the top three spots in every alchemy competition, demonstrating that they are the number one alchemy family in the northern state. This time the Wang family is one of the organizers of the competition, there must be more talented people participating. I want to crush all the geniuses, and even more so, I will rub the geniuses of the Wang family to the ground. I will make the Wang family become the joke of the northern state, that's for abandoning me, and for my fiancée who cancelled the wedding, I will make her regret that day. Alas, how boring, so he is just waiting for the opportunity to slap them in the face. Let's take a look at something else with the mirror. Qi Ning has already reached the fifth level of the Emperor Realm. It seems that she is about to break through the sixth level of Emperor Realm. Ren Chang's spiritual power has almost transformed, he is not far away from the heavenly realm. It's all normal, let's use the mirror and try my luck. Nothing to show again? What? Has it found a strong person? Just by searching, my soul power is already reaching its limit, let's record that aura into the origin Tao crystal first. I have to think carefully about how to fool the other party. Which Taoist brother is trying to spy on this old man? What kind of treasure did he use to record my aura? Let me deduce what kind of person he is. Will he be dejected if I talk to him or even kill me? It's terrifying. The opponent's strength is higher than mine. Taoist brother, can you talk to me? What do you want? Whether he is going to be a blessing or become a curse, why don't I just try? It is good to have a few close friends to discuss with. Taoist brother? Child, do not be impatient. Since you have a chance to come in here, then stay. 
This is your chance. Dare I ask the honorific title of the Taoist brother? Honorific title, huh? Countless little ones like you, or even better than you, have called me that before. Eternal and immortal, unparalleled in elegance, powerful and virtuous, the supreme saint of all the heavens and all the worlds, the first great Taoist. What an awesome title. But how come I've never heard of such a powerful man before? Child, practice well. In the future, there will be more people to exchange ideas here one after another. Is it a chance or a trick? Or is it a calamity? Do you want me to disclose this to a few close friends and discuss ideas together? What if it is really a chance? Let's try this next time. I finally found the first Tao Realm expert, indicating that there are still Tao Realm experts in the Nine Realms, but I don't know where they are hiding. There is no distance displayed on the mirror, which may be in an extremely distant place or in an independent space. This aura is sustained by the other person's Tao Rhythm, which is the same as using Tao Rhythm to help me nurture the original Tao Crystal. I have to keep up the good work, connect to a few more Tao Realm experts, and pull them together, and make this a Tao Realm chat group. A month has passed, and I still haven't found another strong Tao Realm expert yet. Then I will go and fool him again. How are you doing, child? Senior, I have some insights into the Tao recently, and I would like to ask you for advice. That's it? Is this all there is to the Tao Realm? Is your perception of Tao that low, you are even inferior to me? The cultivation techniques I cultivated and the understanding of those techniques were instilled into me by the system. Additionally, with the Tao intentions of the Divine Soul, my understanding of the Great Tao has reached a very high level. The only thing lacking is my level of cultivation. Nictikan's Orge Chu Xian only gave Ing Kong some advice and did not allow him to ask any further questions in order to avoid exposing any flaws. Ing Kong, on the other hand, immediately showed a great deal of respect. Thank you for the clarification. Ing, practice hard, the Tao is endless, you must always forge your own Tao rhyme so that you can go much further and understand the Tao more effectively. Please teach me, senior, how do I forge my Tao rhyme? It's straightforward, constantly consuming and condensing Tao rhymes. Every time the process of consuming and condensing a Tao rhyme is repeated, a new understanding of the Tao emerges. Continuous forging, like refining tools, is the only way to create powerful artifacts, and the same is true for Tao rhymes. With such repetition, one's own Tao carrying capacity will grow. Senior, I understand. This child is worth teaching. Consuming Tao Rhyme in battle is not the best strategy. Self-dispelling Tao Rhyme and condensing Tao Rhyme is the correct way. Thanks for the guidance. Ing Kong took a deep breath and shipped the Tao Aura around his body. The Aura was constantly pushing out and disappearing. One third of his Tao Aura was consumed in the blink of an eye. Sure enough, I succeeded in fooling Ing Kong. As long as Ing Kong consumes Dao Yun like this every now and then, it won't be long before the small world can be upgraded again. Dao Realm powerhouses are treasures. One is not enough, so we must find a few more to contribute to the growth of the origin Dao Crystal. The Dao Rhythm dispersed and vanished in an instant, and I had a hazy feeling that it had returned to the Dao. A wisp of Dao Rhythm from the Avenue Diffuse and Come. The bottleneck, which had not been loosened for years, has finally loosened a bit. Ing Kong is a hard worker. The Tao rules that overflowed from the origin Tao crystal began to gradually improve. Every once in a while, the small world will have new changes. Chu Xian asked Namo Buddha to cultivate next to the origin Tao crystal to feel the Tao rhymes at a closer distance, which would help him break through the deity realm as soon as possible. Your disciple, Ding Yu, mistakenly entered the ancient forbidden land, his luck soared, and you will be awarded 500 years of cultivation. The son of luck, as expected, must be released into the outside world. This could provide me with unexpected benefits. Receive reward, 500 years of cultivation. I have been elevated to the fifth level of the heavenly realm and became one step closer to the deity realm. 
The sword is as black as ink, with a fierce aura. It must be the sacred sword of this ancient forbidden place. Ding Yu has already cultivated to the fourth level of the Emperor's realm. That divine sword looks very fierce. But Ding Yu is the son of luck. How can he be so easily influenced by anything? Wang Luo has successfully entered the semifinals and raised his cultivation base to the first level of the Emperor realm. His performance in the competition was attractive and his actual cultivation has already been promoted to the third level of Emperor realm. As expected of my student, he is very good at showing off. Time flows like water and another half year passes. Siam 11 came out of the small world and started to accumulate, preparing for the breakthrough to the Emperor's realm. Su Sienner has already reached the fifth level of the Emperor's realm. The speed of restoring the rules of heaven and earth in the southern state has suddenly accelerated. I'm afraid it's related to Ding Yu. Thirteenth brother, I'm back. McEwit Crane, no. The rules of heaven and earth in the southern state are not perfect and you cannot break through to the emperor's realm here. You have to enter the space of heaven and earth to break through the emperor's realm. Sure enough, I guessed right, my thirteenth brother is very powerful. Another half year passed. Yuner first broke through to the emperor realm. One month after Chu Yun broke through, Xiang Eleven broke through. Following his breakthrough, Xiangxi's first task was to refine the communication talisman he had previously developed, known as the 10,000 Domains Talismans. Refining puppets, establish a communication talisman production line, and also conduct large-scale refining. Start selling communication talismans to Black Moon House. Yes. The restoration of the rules of heaven and earth in the southern state is accelerating, and the opening time of the war demon ancient land will be advanced. It is time to proceed with the layout. The plan will officially begin to be implemented. Once the Black Moon House launched the communication talisman, all the forces in the southern state bought it. Give me some more sets of the communication talismans. Black Moon House's power is so great that it can create such communication talismans. Chu Xian was waiting for the right time to launch the 10,000 Domains Talisman to secretly control the intelligence of the entire northern state. Less than half a month after the sale of the communication symbols, Chu Xian learned some secrets of many major forces. Qin Qiyun, for example, successfully recovered her Emperor Realm's cultivation by using Qin Ying's backhand method. Bai Xiao Kong, the young master of Baixing Mountain, has secretly left the southern state and entered the Nine Swords Mountain in the northern state to cultivate. Following the Battle of the Southern State, Nine Swords Mountain relocated its main forces to the northern state, where it is now the leading sword sect. The sect is known as the Nine Swords. In the past, Nine Swords Mountain older generations who were at the middle level of the Emperor Realm would travel to the Northern State Nine Swords sect when they reached a certain age in order to break through the Deity Realm. Chu Xian also learned some secret information about the Great Qian Empire. For example, the power and supporter behind the Great Qian Empire was the Great Qian Palace in Central State. The Great Qian Palace is the most powerful force in the Central State. It has been rumored that there is a deity realm cultivator. Not surprising, during the invasion of the demon tribe, the strong godlike human who lured the demons and was seeking the throne of the northern state, I'm afraid he was from the Great Qian Palace. Or rather, the Great Qian Palace was created by him. The initial implementation of the Heavenly Tao plan went smoothly. The first step was to start with the southern state. All the information transmission in the southern state is completely controlled, and they are under the supervision of the heavenly Tao talisman. I'm afraid some powerful people may still be skeptical of the communication symbols I've created. Following that, I'll allow the method of refining the communication symbols to be circulated. They can be so confident if they make it themselves, right? At that time, the true secrets will be communicated via communication talisman. A month later, a three-star building owner came to the southern state. He came for the communication talisman. Such an important communication symbol refining method must be firmly in hand. The three-star building owner came to the southern state to stay there. His cultivation base was on the sixth level of the emperor realm. 
Not too low. Master. Bao Hong Yin, how dare you screw me? Another half year has passed since the implementation of the Heavenly Dao plan. During that time, Chu Xian had a brief exchange with Ng Kong again. Ng Kong is an ascetic monk, and his Dao rhyme cultivated the primordial Dao crystal, and there have been some changes. The small world is nearing completion. Dao rhyme almost pervades the small world, and the Dao becomes more and more perfect. Namo Buddha, who has benefited from this, is only half a step away from the deity realm. The southern state is already under the control of Chu Xian, and he can find out what plans and actions each force is carrying out from the heavenly Dao talisman. Nine Swords Mountain and other major forces behind the scenes also obtained the communication symbols, which made their communication more convenient. Chu Xian learned that the major forces have already started preparing to return to the southern state. Do you on, you secretly enter the Black Moon House, become a guardian, and wait for your chance to come. Yes. Ding Yu has not yet come out of the ancient forbidden area. He was in the process of comprehending the great art of the Sword Dao. The Northern State Alchemy Competition is about to enter the final round, and Wang Luo has attracted the attention of all major forces. Many forces have thrown out olive branches. After all, on the surface Wang Luo is only a casual cultivator, a genius casual cultivator. The Wang family has also thrown an olive branch, and even intended to marry a first daughter to him. The moment Wang Luo's identity is revealed, the Wang family will definitely lose face and become the joke of the northern state. Wang Luo's former fiancé's family also threw an olive branch. Chu Xian was looking forward to the finals, how Wang Luo would perform, how he would crush the Wang family, and how he would make the Wang family and his former fiancé's family lose face. I'm afraid they will become angry from embarrassment. Would they even send powerful cultivator to attack and kill Wang Luo? Your disciple Emo Luentian's ancient demon bloodline has transformed and given birth to the Buddha's heart, and his chi has changed, affecting his demon chi. You are rewarded with the spirit of the Great Road Tour. Heavenly Demon Race his cultivation base is at the seventh level of the Emperor Realm. As for Emo Luantian, he is still a little bit inferior at the third level of the Emperor Realm. He cultivates the Buddha power, so the Demon Realm pills have very little effect on him, and he lacks the pills to restore his Buddha power. Now, Emo Luantian has gradually fallen into a disadvantage. Damn Baldi, how dare you kill my brother? Go to hell. Buddha? I want to see how you, a Buddha, can survive under my hands. Mighty Dragon Surprisingly, he had already broken through the third level of the Emperor Realm. From today onwards, that poor monk is no longer a demon, but that poor monk will be the demon Buddha. Emo Luantian really has a relationship with the Buddha, but he is not a normal Buddha, he is a bit devilish. Moreover, his intention to kill is not small. The Demon Buddha? It suits him well. From this battle with the Demon Buddha, I discovered his shortcomings, so it's time to make up for his shortcomings. For example, the method of refining the pills to restore his Buddha power. And such as forbidden techniques, formations, and so on. At the same time, it is time to give him a Buddhist status. This disciple pays respect to you, Master. Get up. Since you have been born with a Buddha's heart and have attained enlightenment as your Master, I will give you a Buddhist status today. Thank you, Master. Since you have mastered the mighty heavenly dragon technique as a teacher, you will be granted the position of Great Buddha. Thank you, Master. View System Rewards Spirit travels on the Great Dao for no more than a day. The gift of the system is really awesome. The Great Dao is everywhere and endless. Now, I have the opportunity to travel through the Great Dao which is equivalent to directly entering the Great Dao. It should be no problem to break through to the Deity Realm after traveling through the Great Dao. Receive the Reward 
Countless Tao rules, Tao ideas, Tao rhymes, is this the Tao? The great Tao is invisible, however I am on the invisible great Tao. The Tao rules, Tao ideas, and Tao aura around me are endless. There is no end and there is no limit. The Tao intentions around me, Tao rules, and Tao aura surged widely into the origin of the Tao crystal. The origin Tao crystal emits a hazy radiance while its Tao is being refined. The crystal now even contains a miniature form of the great Tao. Sure enough, it was the right choice to bring the origin Tao crystal. After the soul returns, the small world should be upgraded. Even as long as the accumulation is strong enough, you can come to the Tao through the origin Tao crystal. I hold the origin Tao crystal and the chaotic clock in my divine soul and with the Tao intentions in my body, even the experts of the Tao realm cannot threaten me as if I am no longer a divine soul, but a part of the great Tao itself. There's someone on the avenue. Those who can come to the great Tao are naturally exceptional individuals. Although I have created a great name for myself, it is only for the purpose of defrauding people. The person in front of me is a really nice person, not like me. The first thing I need to do is to ask for a wisp of his aura to be incorporated into the origin Tao crystal so that I can communicate with him and exchange ideas in the future. In this way, there will be a great person in the origin Tao crystal communication group. My divine soul is full of Tao intentions and intertwined with the great Tao, as if it's part of it. The man is walking slowly on the avenue and seems to be struggling. I can walk easily, so I can fool him, right? If I can trick him, I will. At the very least, I should not appear inferior to the other party in terms of seniority. Hong Yuan Chu walked step by step, comprehending the great Tao's path to compensate for any shortcomings in his own great Tao. Following that, he carefully opened his own great Tao path. I saw someone walking leisurely towards me. At first glance, the person seemed to be weak, but this man's strength is above mine. I, Hong Yuan Chu, greet my Taoist brother. I, Chu Xian, greet my fellow Taoist. Brother Taoist, how many Daewans have you persisted for? Hong Yuan Chu has progressed to the point where he can forge his own Tao path. This is known as the Tao Yuan realm. This level of expert uses their own understanding to forge their own Tao paths in the great Tao. He is indeed a great person. How many Daewans? I don't really remember. I was in seclusion for a long time, so I don't know how many Daewans I have persisted for. As I suspected, this is a fellow who has been in seclusion for many years and only recently came out of it. Brother Taoist, how many Dao Yuan have you persisted? It is close to two Dao Yun. I reached Dao Realm during the previous Dao Yuan, and El managed to open and tread my first Dao path at the end of that Dao Yuan. Then El opened my second Dao path. By the end of this Tao Yuan, I'll have trodden two Tao paths. The Tao path is difficult and the Great Tao is difficult. It's enjoyable to seek the Great Tao. Opening up the Tao paths is enjoyable at our current level. The path is beneath our feet and is guided by our own will. It will follow us wherever we go. Is opening Tao paths fun? I am not as good as you. Thank you for the lesson. I have a treasure. Just a wisp of your aura and no matter how much distance between us, we can communicate with each other. Moreover, the position between each other will not be disclosed and cannot be known. This is the treasure that directly communicates with the Tao. Fellow Taoist, why don't you leave a wisp of your aura and communicate with me? If you know other fellow Taoists, you can also introduce them to me. What is this treasure? At a glance, it is as if I see a newborn Tao. And, it has an inexplicable connection with the great Tao. He's stronger than I am, and his Tao path is wider than mine. That's incredible. If there are fellows or a few guys who have already entered the Tao realm, they can also join in if they want to be lively again after retreating for countless years. This is also a kind of Tao, and they can each confirm everything with each other. It is possible. The Source Primordial Tao Crystal's communication circle is finally expanding. Furthermore, there will be more experts in the same field as Hong Yuan Chu. 
As a big brother in the same realm as Hong Yuan Chu, wouldn't it be easy for me to con other powerful Dao realm experts in this way? Dao brother, where are you going? I'm going to walk around on this avenue. I haven't been here for a long time. This avenue is invisible, but there are sceneries that everyone must see. If you walk and see more, you will have new insights. What Dao brother said makes sense. Hong was too obsessed with clearing the way, but fell into a rut instead. Back then, the 36 stages of the Dao realm were like 36 mountains, and each mountain was higher than the other. In order to climb one, it was racking one's brains, comprehending all kinds of life, and even splitting off my reincarnation to cultivate for another life. After going through many difficulties, I climbed to the top of the mountain and achieved enlightenment in the Tao realm, but I got lost. The Tao realm, so it is originally divided into 36 levels. The Tao realm is more difficult than any other realm, and opening its path is a hundred times more difficult. The path is endless, and we must continue to search diligently. Yes, it's true. Chu Xian sighed and sighed as well, but he showed no emotion when sighing at all. After all, it only took him ten years to progress from the mortal realm to the heavenly realm. Furthermore, staying at home strengthens him. How could he possibly know how difficult it is to cultivate? I'll take my leave. His strength is far superior to mine. I still can't do it. He can easily walk down the avenue. But I can't stay here much longer. The Great Tao Realm Catastrophe will begin at the end of another Tao Realm, and there should be a talent in the nine regions who will gain great fortune, compete for the Great Tao Realm Opportunity, and become the rule creator of the next Tao Realm. My soul is back. Heavenly Realm 5th Level, Heavenly Realm 6th Level. The Source Primordial Tao Crystal returned to the small world. The ordinary tree grew back. Many plants and trees have further transformed on the mountain where the ordinary tree is located. The Tao rhyme is pervasive, the Tao intent is overwhelming, and it has actually transformed into a Tao tree. All the heavenly treasures on the mountain have become Tao fruits. A forest full of Tao fruits grew up. During the upgrading of the small world, and under the rhyme of the Tao, Namo Buddha began to break through the deity realm. Heavenly Realm 8th Level, Heavenly Realm 9th Level The spiritual power is transforming into Deity Power. Deity Realm Achieved Deity Realm 2nd Level, Deity Realm 3rd Level This power is invincible in this world. Don't get ahead of yourself. Be steady. I'm just a small shrimp in the endless years and among the endless cultivators. Not to mention those in the Tao realm, such as Hong Yuan Chu, the Tao realm alone is enough to inspire me right now. The Tao realm is divided into 36 levels, each of which is more difficult than the one before it. You have broken through the deity realm and become the youngest deity realm in history. You will be rewarded with a box of deity realm pills plus the rule of stability. I want to be the youngest Tao realm expert in history. I just want to set a record and let the other cultivators look up to me. The rule of stability is to be stable, safe, and everything is stable. If you master the rule of stability, you will be as stable as a mountain and cannot be shaken by any attack. Receive the rules. Deity realm pills are cultivation pills for the deity realm. Deity. Now that the small world has been upgraded, in the mountain area where the ordinary tree is located, a first-class Tao fruit heavenly treasure was born. Chu Xian waved his hand, turning this area into a forbidden area. In addition to the aura, the small world has already begun to be permeated with an extremely faint Tao rhyme. It has expanded more than ten times. It has exceeded the area of the northern state. The small world has infinite potential. Chu Xian is confident that as the small world continues to upgrade, it will eventually become a world that towers over the nine regions. In the small world, Namo Buddha is still in the process of breaking through. Under normal circumstances, it may take several years, or even more than a decade, to complete the breakthrough. This is a deity realm pill. It can help you break through. Thank you, Buddha. Greetings to the Master. This deity realm pill can help you break through and cultivate. 
Thank you, Master. The restoration of the rules of heaven and earth in the southern state have been accelerated, and Qin Ying's current strength has not yet reached the peak of Emperor Realm. Greetings to Master. I finally have the opportunity to ask the Master for advice on how to turn back into a man. Your cultivation is a little slow. I will give you two bottles of elixir as your teacher. Thank you, Master. How can I change? It won't take more than a few years to break through the Tao realm. It's time to find out the real mastermind behind the Black Moon Tower. The Heavenly Tao Talisman plan should also be accelerated in implementation. Before the opening of the ancient land of war demons, it should cover the entire northern zone, so I can spy on all the forces in the northern zone and control their movements. The two spirit puppets which were in the process of nurturing completed their previous nurturing due to changes in the origin Dao crystal. They have gained consciousness. Greetings to the Lord. The two spirit puppets are both in the second level of the deity realm. Your name is Chu Yi and your name is Chu Er. Chu Yi, Chu Er, greets the master. Go to the mystic realm of trials. There are two people in the Origin Dao Crystal chat group. One of them is a truly great person, an existence that transcends the Dao realm, Hong Yuan Chu. The other is the Dao realm cultivator, Ying Kong. Perhaps I can start with Ying Kong and learn more about Dao Yuan and the Dao realm through him. I will make it like testing him as a senior. Ying Kong, let me introduce you to my fellow Taoist, Hong Yuan Chu. He has already persisted for two Dao Yuan and has opened two Dao paths. Hong Yuan Chu? Could he be the legendary existence? He has been around for two Dao Yuans and opened two Dao paths. Who else could he be? Ying Kong greets Senior Hong Yuan. He he, Ying Kong is so respectful. Obviously, he has heard of Hong Yuan Chu's great name before. Thank you, Brother Ying, and thanks, Brother Chu, for your introduction. Ying Kong? I've never heard of him before, he should be unknown. Whatever the reason, being able to enter the circle formed by Chu Xian's great Dao treasure is regarded as a fortuitous chance, and he is regarded as a predestined person. That's not good. The powerful and virtuous Senior Chu is also a Dao seeker, and even Senior Hong Yuan Chu treats him with respect. I don't seem to respect him as much as I do for Senior Hong Yuan Chu. Thank you, Brother Ng, and thanks, Brother Chu, for your introduction. Thank you, Senior Chu, for introducing Senior Hong to Little Ng. You must be humble. You must be respectful. This is a superb man, and this is your greatest opportunity. You are welcome, Little Ng. Ng Kong is really a thoughtful man. He has changed his name to Little Ng to show the seniority of the other two members. You are welcome, Little Ng. How is your cultivation level, and how many levels of the Tao realm have you broken through? Could it be that my cultivation level is too low that L don't deserve to exist here? Should I lie? You wouldn't it be like courting death to lying in front of such big bosses? How is your cultivation level, and how many levels of the Tao realm have you broken through? I am stupid, I have cultivated nearly one Tao Yuan, and I am only at the third level of Tao realm. Ng Kong has actually been cultivated for nearly one Dao Yuan? How many years is one Dao Yuan? I am stupid, I have cultivated nearly for one Dao Yuan, and I am only at the third level of Dao realm. Above the average, that's not bad. Brother Chu, how about I invite other people to join us now? Sure. Our communication circle uses Dao as a medium, how about calling it a Dao communication group? Dao communication group? That's perfect. This is fellow Taoist Kuni. He has opened one Dao path and has been around for one Dao Yuan. This is fellow Taoist Ruoxian. He has opened one Dao path and has been around for nearly two Dao Yuan. He's from the same generation as me. In addition to the two Dao Yuan cultivators, there are also several Dao realm cultivators like Xu Yang, who is at the 30th level of the Dao realm and the same generation as Hong Yuan Chu, and is also Hong Yuan Chu's best friend. Piao Ruoyun, a senior disciple of Hong Yuan Chu who has reached the 29 levels of Dao realm. 
Wu Fangsuan, a junior disciple of Hong Yuan Chu who has reached the 28 levels of Tao Realm. Xixuan who has reached the 26 levels of the Tao Realm and she is the disciple of Ruoxian. Among them, Ruoxian, Piao Ruoyun and Xixuan are females. Ng Kong was so scared that he didn't dare to speak. In the Tao communication group, he was the most trash. Chu Xian entered the process of hard cultivation, constantly comprehending the stable Tao principles, and his strength improved rapidly. However, breaking through the Tao realm still requires a period of accumulation. And every day, as usual, he takes out the Tao seeking mirror and searches for the existence of Tao realm powerhouses, or treasures, or places related to the Tao. In the Tao communication group, everyone is acquaintances, so there's not much fun. If you want to have an active chat group, you have to bring people from all over and Tao realm experts from different races. Only then it would be interesting. I, the group leader, have worked hard to create this communication group. Under the nurturing of three Tao auras of the three Tao Yuan realm experts, the metamorphosis of the origin Tao crystal is accelerating. When it is further enhanced, it can develop more functions. For example, using the Origin Dao Crystal as a medium to transmit items through the Great Dao. Chu Xian even had a bold idea to open up a new Great Dao based on the Origin Dao Crystal and the Small World as the starting point. It would be on par with the current Dao. If the plan is successful, in the future, he will definitely be able to surpass the Dao Yuan realm. Half a month later, Chu Xian was cultivating, and the reward from the system came suddenly. Your disciple Ding Yu has been recognized as the master by the spirit of the earth's veins. His cultivation has soared and his luck has been transformed. You have been rewarded with a good luck charm. Huh? Ding Yu has been recognized by the earth vein spirit and his fortune chi has changed? The southern state border with the other states. Are you a man or a woman? I have no gender. If you want me to be a man, then I will be a man. And if you want me to be a woman, then I'll be a woman. Let me think about it. If you are a woman and you follow me around, how can I have no woman in my heart and draw my sword to slay the gods? But if I resist because you are a woman, it means that my realm is not perfect and I can't reach the state of having no woman in my heart. Can you be a man for a while and a woman for a while? Or, when I want you to be a man, you are a man, and when I want you to be a woman, you are a woman. Is he insane? How could such a strange request exist? It's over. I've chosen a psychopath as my master. I will continue to be genderless. That's fine too. Ding Yu is really hopeless. Receiving system rewards. Chi Luck Jade that can change Chi Luck, it can also manipulate Chi Luck. Chu Xian continues to cultivate well. At the same time, Xiang Xing was also refining communication symbols for the Heavenly Tao plan. The Black Moon House has no higher ranking landlords for the time being, but the interstate communication symbols have been sold to other states, especially those who form a group to explore. Everyone would have a communication symbol. Nowadays, communication symbols are even more in demand. It's so popular. The spies placed by some certain major forces in the Black Moon House have also quietly obtained one or two methods of refining communication symbols. They think that the only way to be truly safe is to refine their own. However, they did not know that even if they made the communication symbol themselves, they still could not escape the control of the Heavenly Tao Talisman. The first phase of the Heavenly Tao Plan has been completed in the Northern State. Everything is under the control of the Heavenly Tao. Heavenly Tao sees everything. Is it possible to use the Chi Luck Jade to change Su Xianer's Chi Luck and make her the daughter of fortune in the central state? In this way, among the five continents in the northern region, only the son of Chi of the eastern state would be left for me to control. My deity realm power is being consumed like crazy, and the power of my soul is also being consumed at a very high rate. It's much worse than using the Tao Seeking Mirror. Changing the chi of a state is too difficult. After all, the central state is the strongest state in the northern region. Who is the central state's son of fortune? Could it be Su Siener's fiancé? 
it was because of him that Su Siener escaped from the central state. The reason was that the man she was forced to marry was ugly and had a bad personality. He also had a bad reputation. Will there be an ugly monster among the sons of fortune? If it is really him, it will be a bit interesting. With the speed of cultivation of Su Siener as well as the heritage she possesses, she is not inferior to the son of fortune. As my own maid, how could she lose to the son of fortune? After all, there are too few people in the Dao Chat group, and most of them are acquaintances of Hong Yuan Chu. Only Ying Kong is a stranger. Your disciple Wang Luo, in the Northern State Alchemy Competition, pretended to be aggressive and revealed his face, shaking the Northern State, elated, his luck improved. You are rewarded with the Jin Tripod of Dad Luck. Hmm? The Northern State Alchemy Competition is over? Wang Luo successfully pretended to be aggressive and revealed his face, and has risen strongly? Master Wang, I, Wang Luo, have no relationship with the Wang family. You are not qualified to tell me what to do. Yes, what Wang Luo said is right. Your Wang family has expelled him, so he is no longer a member of your Wang family. Right, right, Wang Luo is not a member of the Wang family anymore. Master Wang, this is not the Wang family. The rules of the Northern State Alchemy Competition are not to be broken. Wang Luo's alchemy talent is so amazing. What kind of terrifying talent is it to refine the heavenly pill with the Emperor Realm cultivation base? The most powerful people in the heavenly realm will also treat him as a distinguished guest. He has almost no difficulty breaking through the heavenly realm. The Wangs have suffered far too much loss. The Wang family will become the laughingstock of the northern state, if not the entire northern region, as a result of this incident. The Wang family will have no future as long as Wang Luo does not die. This child must perish. Receiving the system rewards. Jin Tripod of Dao Luck. Jin Tripod of Dao Luck is entwined and can be used to refine pills, refine everything, and suppress Qi. Counting the Qi Luck Jade, Chu Xian now has two treasures of Qi Luck. One to change luck and one to suppress luck. Master, I don't know why, but for the past few days I have been feeling a little restless, as if something is happening to me. Sir, help Sienner, she's in a lot of pain. Sienner, don't panic, I'm here. When did this start happening to you? It's been a few days, and I didn't pay attention to it at first, thinking it was due to overzealous cultivation, but recently I've felt increasingly wrong, and that feeling is, well, desperate. Oh. Could it be because I used my chi luck to enhance the inner luck a few days ago? If that's the case, I should be the one who suffered the backlash. Why would it be Sienner? Something's wrong. I'll use my golden pupils to see what's going on. Someone's behind all this. Humph, to be able to do that and to deliberately choose Su Sienner to extract her chi luck. It seems that the person behind this is very likely to be Sien's former clan, the Su family. Of course, it is also possible that it is another powerful force that Sienner offended when she escaped marriage before the Great Qian Palace. But I, Chu Xian, don't care who you are. If you dare to mess with me, be prepared to be annihilated. Su Sienner, I thought highly of you when I was planning to marry you, but you cheated me and avoided marriage. This time, with the precious pearl of luck provided by your Su family, let's see how I will drain your luck and ruin your path. When the time comes, you will obediently beg me to marry you. What's this? What's going on? What's going on? Am I going to be possessed? Elder, you're... What are you doing here? Elder, it's an urgent message from the Dakian Palace saying that the person from the Dakian Palace has been seriously injured and crippled and the Chi Luck Pearl has been shattered. How could this happen? How could the Pearl of Chi Luck shatter? It seems that I'm not possessed, but I've suffered a backlash of bad luck as well. When Dakian borrowed the Pearl of Luck, he said he wanted to take that girl's luck and force her to come back, but the trouble became like this. 
Clan Elder, we must seek compensation from Great Qian, otherwise the loss this time will be immeasurable. And that damned girl, we must find her, bring her back, and deal with her according to the rules. Let's put that wild girl aside for the time being. Go directly to De Qian to negotiate, and we must recover our compensation. If you can, avoid mentioning the fact that I've faced backlash. This matter only needs to succeed, not to fail. Yes, Elder. It seems that the girl's luck is extraordinary. She can't be messed with. Sienner, how do you feel now? I feel much better now. That's good. The feeling of despair you just had was caused by someone who was trying to take your luck. But don't worry, I've taught those people a lesson just now, and no one will dare to think of hurting you again in the future. Thank you, sir, for your help, hee hee. You'll have to make it up to me with a big meal later. But before that, I'd better strengthen your luck, just in case. Let's go. Is this the power of luck? What a mysterious feeling. Thank you again, sir, and I'm sure you'll enjoy your meal today. Then, let's go prepare. We have a deal. Of course. This little girl has finally recovered her former vigor. However, if I want Sienna to become the child of luck, let's wait until I break through. After all, the Tao of luck is a mysterious thing. I can't fully grasp it yet. Sir, what are you whispering about? It's nothing. Hurry up and cook. I'll starve to death if I wait a second longer. Um. Sienna's meal was so delicious that I no longer want to cultivate. In that case, let's have some fun with the mirror. Oh? Non-human race? A little tiger? Or a Tao realm expert? Interesting. Hmm? Why do I feel like someone is spying on me? Hee hee, let's first take a wisp of his aura from him, move it into the origin Dao crystal, and then tease him. Who is it? How dare you take the aura of Master Hu Tai? Are you tired of living? He's still an irritable little tiger. It just so happens that the group's atmosphere has been a little stale recently. He can also bring life to the group, which is a good thing. Hee hee, this time the group will be very lively. Let's send him a message from the Dao group first. Hmm? What's the matter with my paw? Why does it have a Dao rhythm? Hello, little tiger. Damn, what kind of joke is this? Bastard. You wait for me. If I catch you, I will give you a good lesson. Uh, I'm afraid it won't be good if I went to meet him, and then I won't be able to go back. First of all, let's give the little tiger a group welcome party first. Little tiger, I wish you a happy time in the group. Ahem, I have new news. Our new friend, Hu Tai, has joined the group chat. You can start chatting now. Oh? New man? No, it's a new tiger. I just want to know, what realm is he at this time? Please warmly welcome our new friend, the cute and naive from the Heavenly Tiger Clan, Hu Tai, 16 level of the Tao realm, into the Tao group. I am so majestic, the number one member of the Heavenly Tiger Clan, you actually said that I am cute, how stupid, I'm going to. Come on. Bastard. If you've got the guts, you can fight me face to face. Don't hide in this bullshit Tao group, come out if you have the guts. Oh. So it's Hu Tai? That grumpy little tiger with a bad mouth is still alive? Hu Tai, you don't even know my name or the reputation of my heavenly tiger clan. I'm not sure how many rotten potatoes and rotten bird eggs you have in your group, but I'm going to tear you apart. How dare you talk to me like that? Are you tired of living? Hu Tai, you haven't fixed your bad mouth problem yet? Do you want me to help you fix it for you? D. Who are you? Piaoyun. Are you looking for a fight with this master tiger? You're called Piaoyun? Do you know who I am? Wait a minute. The name Piaoyun, why does it sound a ah? Bit familiar. This Piao are you o, Hu Tai. What did you say? Say it again, I didn't hear you. Piaoyun. Piaoyun. It is her. 
Who da? Say something. Why is there no sound? Who da? What are your current whereabouts? Let's get back on track. Let's have a nice, calm conversation. Make your voice heard. Piao Royun. It turned out to be Piao Royun. How could it be Piao Royun again? Back then, I used to be a happy little tiger. I played and danced happily in my forest until that woman appeared. This bitch. Is it possible for a small shrimp like you to enter Tiger Ty's territory? Hurry over here or I'll hit you until you count out to me. Oh. Really? Little tiger. Repeat what you said just now. Uh. What's wrong with you? Tiger. Do you want me to remind you again? Uh, uh, uh. Meow, meow, meow. Sister, I won't dare to be foul-mouthed again. Tiger Tai, are you still silent? Me. It appears that I need to speak with you again. Meow, 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 meow. Sister, I'm rambling because I'm short of oxygen. Please don't take it seriously. Ruoyun, is this the little tiger you caught and raised as a kitten? Yes, it's him, master. He's a cute but grumpy little tiger. When I first saw this little tiger, it was irritable and silly, with great luck. It was able to enter Brother Chu's Dao communication group, as expected, and its fortune was exceptional. Master is correct. If this tiger Tai hadn't had a lot of luck and with his personality, he would have been killed a long time ago. Tiger Tai, hurry and pay your respects to Master Hong. Tiger Tai pays respects to Master Hong. Just now I was a little rude and I hope you can forgive me. I don't care about you, little tiger. But it's a great chance for you to join the group, so thank Brother Chu. Brother, it's all right. Our group mainly focuses on communication. It's fake to be in this group. Besides, this tiger is also a young tiger and it's normal for the youth to be more hot-headed. Meow, 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 thank you, Senior Chu, for your understanding, I'm going to change my bad habit of saying whatever the hell I want to say. Junior Inkong, greet Senior Brother Tiger Tai, please take care of me in the future. Junior? Call me Senior Brother? That means he is weaker than me. Okay, Brother Ing, from now on, Brother Tiger will protect you. If you don't understand anything, just ask me, your Brother Tiger. All right, Brother Tiger. Welcome, Brother Ng. This Tiger Tai really climbed up smoothly. Forget about it. Let's practice. Ding. Your disciple Wang Luo was pursued by a powerful and managed to flee into an ancient forbidden land in the northern region. He obtained an emperor-level luck treasure, and you will be rewarded with Dad of Qi Luck Enlightenment. Wang Luo was being hunted and entered the ancient forbidden land in the north and acquired emperor-level treasure of luck, as expected of the son of destiny. He met with a misfortune and turned it into luck. If I can collect all the sons of luck, what will the system give me as a reward? Forget it, let's just look at the present. The food needs to be eaten bit by bit, and the road has to be walked step by step. Obtaining enlightenment and insights into the Tao of Chi Luck meant that I would be able to better use the good luck charm and the luck suppressing Tao cauldron. It is just around the corner to unleash the full power of it. Is this the Tao of Luck? Are these cloudy and foggy things luck? It really is ethereal. At my current level, fully comprehending this mystery is as difficult as ascending to heaven. However, because the system bestowed upon me an enlightenment of the Tao of Chi Luck, I have learned a lot about how to use a good luck charm and the density suppressing Tao Cauldron. If I can cultivate the great Tao of Chi Luck successfully, I won't face any crises and won't need to personally attack enemies. It's extremely frightening. I'm looking forward to the day when I fully comprehend the Tao of Chi Luck. I'm a lucky person. I'm like a son of luck. Is it because this myriad heavenly mirror has been used for a long time that it is always connected to the ocean? Should I send it back to the system for repair? Show me something good, stupid mirror. Hmm? Come to think of it, 
Since this mirror is always connected to the ocean, does that mean that the system wants to show me something hidden in the ocean? Could it be that my realm is still too low for me to know what's inside? If my guess is correct, then I have to explore the rivers, seas, and lakes in the nine regions. Myriad Heavenly Mirror, connect. Why does this scene look so familiar? What the hell is going on? Is that Hutai? How did the countless heavenly mirrors find the same creature twice? Is Tiger's fortune really that great? But on closer inspection, this one doesn't look like Hutai. This one looks even younger than Hutai. I'd better check it with heavenly secret origin probing technique. Hutai is such an idiot. I don't want to investigate the identity of another stupid tiger like him. Hua Tianya, the former young master of the Tianhu clan, the monster race's dominant race, was deposed as the Tianhu clan's young master due to his laziness and unwillingness to transform into a beastly form. Z, after losing his position as the young master of the Tianhu clan, his fiancée, the princess of the Qingjiao clan, broke off the marriage contract with him and he left the territory of the Tianhu clan in grief and indignation and wandered around. Tianhu clan I remember that Hu Tai is also a member of this clan, so these two stupid tigers must be related. In any case, these two stupid tigers can be considered as a fortune for me. And from my experience over the years, this Hu Tianya is a son of fortune, and if not, then a grandson of fortune. T, but why is this tiger still sleeping? What kind of dream is he having? Princess, don't, don't leave me. I don't want to change my form. It's just a rule left by our ancestors. It said that keeping the tiger's body is the safest and strongest method. If you encounter someone you can't fight, you can still pretend to be cute and survive. What I said is true. I really didn't lie to you. Maybe I should show you my cuteness. He he he. This tiger appears to have received an inheritance from Hu Tai, and his ability to survive has been etched into his bones. Hu Tianya. Wake up. Where did this great power originate? Who is this infinitely powerful man? What a terrifying amount of pressure. I need to hurry up and act cute in order to save my life. Meow, meow, meow. This is Utenya. Greetings to Senior. I didn't know Senior was here. I failed to welcome you, so I want to apologize. Ha, huh, I don't know if you have any order, Senior. Up. This junior will definitely do his best to complete it and will never dare to disappoint the senior. Come on. Hurry up and change into your true form. Don't give me this cute and cheap trick. Yes, senior. Don't follow Hutai's example. From now on I'll be your master and I'll make sure you get back the princess and surpass your ancestor Hutai. If you do this same trick of being cute again, I'll take you as a mount. Well, master, disciple Hu Tianya won't act cute anymore. You are still here. Master, disciple won't dare to do it again. Dean, you are rewarded with the Gung Jin White Tiger Art because you accepted the son of fortune of the Tianhu clan as your disciple. Alas, this tiger is really worrying, and I don't know if he will be crooked in the future. However, I am one step closer to my goal of gathering all the sons of fortune. I still need the spirit of heaven, the spirit of earth, the son of fortune to listen to my command and come to me quickly. It got away. Eh, what's going on? What's wrong with this mirror? Ching Chinger is a nine-tailed fox at the 17th level of the Tao realm, and she's one of the ancestors of the fox clan. That's right, it's good to have some decent people, it's not good to have abstract tigers all the time. Let's move her into the Tao chat group first. Welcome Ching Chinger of the Fox Family, 17th level of the Dao Realm, to the big loving family of the Dao Chat Group. Stupid Fox. You are in this group too? Hudel. You are looking for death. Haven't your speaking habits changed over the years? Time flies so fast, another year flew past in the blink of an eye. I've risen two levels and reached the fifth level of the Deity Realm. But because I didn't find any Tao realm experts, it's a bit boring. Moreover, those few disciples did not trigger any system rewards, but Pingfan broke through to the ninth level of the true realm, and I am afraid that he is currently the most talented person in this world. 
If Ping Fan breaks through the Emperor Realm, the system rewards should be extremely generous. Oh? Bao Hong Yin? I didn't expect her to find new information right after she became the head of the Black Moon Tower in the southern region. Sir, Bao Hong Yin is here. Did you find out who's the mastermind of the Black Moon Tower? P.O.C.C. Sir, your subordinate isn't doing a good job. The true controller of the Black Moon Tower is still unknown. Oh? So, why are you here today? I'm here to report information about the ancient land of war demons. The ancient land of war demons? Are those little forces messing around again? Sir, now the three clans, two kingdoms, and other powers in the southern state have decided to organize a competition for the quotas for entry to the ancient land to secure their own interests and avoid unnecessary conflicts. Of course, there are also some places reserved for some powerful practitioners to participate in the competition so as to prevent any complications. It seems that these forces are still a little cautious. Hong Yin, you're getting more efficient. Come in and talk. Yes, sir. Is there anything worth reporting about the Southern Region's forces' movements and secrets these days? There's no valuable information. It's still the same. They put undercover agents to each other. One of the elders in the Qin family is working for the Great Qin Palace. Do you want to warn the Qin family? No, let them deal with it themselves. We will not interfere. Yes, sir. By the way, how is the usage of communication talisman in the northern region? There's a complete coverage. There is no information that can be hidden from master in the northern region. Great, the Heavenly Dao talisman plan was successful in the northern region. Hong Yin, you've done a good job. This is a reward for you to break through the Emperor Realm. Ah, uh, this. Thank you very much, sir. You should refine these pills as soon as possible to break through the Emperor Realm. I have more important things to entrust to you. The subordinate will definitely live up to sir's expectations. Sir, I'll take my leave. Go ahead. I'm so happy, so happy. Ding. Ren China, your disciple, understood the dad Yin and Yang. The cycle of life and death enables him to enter the deity realm, for which you will be rewarded with 500 years of cultivation. Oops, good things come together. Old Ren is still the same. He's always giving me surprises even though he's always been so quiet. We have to give Ren some encouragement to keep up the good work. Greetings, Master. I, Ren Changhe, have finally broken through to the deity realm after receiving Master's teachings. Changhe, I'm very pleased that you've broken through the deity realm and returned to your youth. I am fortunate to have my master's assistance, otherwise, I would have been a dry corpse, let alone breaking through to the deity realm. As a token of my gratitude, I will do my best in the future to repay my teacher's kindness. I'm sure you will do that, and I really have something important for you to do. The nine regions are in turmoil, and in ten years' time, you will be traveling to the southern state of the northern region. Master, what kind of turmoil will there be in the nine regions? You'll know ten years later, and when that time comes, I'll make arrangements for you to be your teacher. Yes, Master. This is the Divine Elemental Pill. It can help you consolidate your cultivation. The Deity Realm is not the end of your journey, so you must cultivate diligently for the next ten years. Don't slack off. A disciple will remember the teachings of the Master. Well, I have other things to do, so I'll leave you alone. Well, Master, the disciples still have some trivial matters to trouble Master. Uh, some trivia about cultivation. Come, look at the blackboard. Amit Ba Buddha. The demonic realm is full of crimes, greed, hatred, ignorance, and endless delusions. Blood, slaughter, and greed are everywhere, polluting the soul. This Buddha is full of compassion and wants to save the demonic realm and turn it into a land of ultimate bliss. If it isn't up to me to change this hell, who will? Even if I have to give up my body, I want to spread the great Buddhist teachings. My Buddhist disciples, you should travel the world to spread the Buddha faith. Amit Ba Buddha, we will respectfully obey your command. Amit Ba Buddha, great, great. Hmm? 
Are there still any more of our followers coming to hear the lecture? Baldy. Here you are again, you are still bluffing. After the brainwashing in my village, you are here again. Ah. You also brainwashed the young girls in my village, and now they are all shaved and have become nuns. Where will I look for a partner? Isn't this the eldest son of the old Lee family in the village next to us? That's right. What's he doing here? Why did he come here to make trouble? Besides that, you destroyed my cousin's village last month and even beat my cousin to death. In the name, Buddha. I'm going to. Now that I've broken through to the true realm, I'm here to avenge your bloodshed, so be a good boy and die. Damn Baldi. Amit Ba Buddha. This is too miserable. There is no residue left. Is this the unbelievable skill of Lord Buddha? How terrifying. Good, good, for this villain to utter such vile words and disturb the purity of my Buddha, it is indeed a sin, a sin. I've helped him with physical transcendence, so now please be quiet, don't. Hey! You damned deceiver of the public. You have no right to kill my elder brother. I'm going to kill you. Another one? Huh, these two boys from the old Lee family have a lot of nerve. Really, they are just queuing up to enter the ancestral grave. I'm already at the second level of the true realm. If you kneel down and beg for mercy, I can still make your death a bit easier. Amit Babuda, what a sin. You goddamn bald bastard. I, the youngest of the Lee family, came here to, er, Amit Ba Buddha, it appears that I have not done enough to convey the concept of my Buddha's great enlightenment to all beings on the planet. I have to work harder. Work harder for the salvation of all the beings in the world. Amit Ba Buddha, thank you for your hard work. Amit Ba Buddha. After lunch, I bask in the sun, and after basking in the sun, I eat dinner. Ding your disciple, the demon Buddha, has spread Buddhism and converted 100,000 followers, you are rewarded a great thousand incarnation technique. Oh? Is this kid that sharp? He already has 100,000 followers? Let's not worry about him for now. Instead, let's get this great thou sand incarnation technique and see how it works. Half a month later, Chu Xian suddenly got a piece of information. The evil king's court has changed leadership. The evil king's court had been taken over by the leader of the force behind them, who had come from the great evil palace in the realm of chaos. Nowadays, the evil court is run by the evil son of the great evil palace. The old evil king has been driven to the realm of chaos. On the surface, the evil king is still the master of the evil king's court, but in fact, he no longer has any power. The little evil king suffered the most. The evil son despised him and tortured him for several days until he was about to die. That was too depressing. Finally, with the sacrifice of one of his confidants, he escaped from the evil king's court and fled into the vast mountains where he disappeared. Run! The familiar evil king's court is finally returned. One month later, the evil king has fallen. The evil king had sneak attacked the evil son, and the difference in their cultivation levels was too great, so the evil king fell. The evil king isn't one of my subordinates, but a useless pawn. If he died, then so be it. No one will avenge the evil king, unless the little evil king encounters a great opportunity and rises up. It's been a long time since I've added a new member to the Tao Communication Group. Why is it a dark shadow? Is it a special Taoist? Who? Hello, little friend. I was looking for a faded person through the great Tao. Little friend, you have the honor of coming into contact with me. I wonder which race you are from and what is your cultivation level. Who are you? I am the Tao seeker. Are you willing to provide me with that information? I have a great Tao communication group, and there are fellow Taoists in the Tao realm there. Would you like to join? Tao Seeker? 
He wants me to contact them? Is it a trap? I'm Yusu, from the Yu tribe, at the 13th level of the Tao. What is the Yu clan? I've never heard of it. It appears to be a minor race. Little friend Yusu, let's enter the Tao group. There's a new member from the Yu clan, Yusu, at the 13th level of the Dad realm. The Yu clan? Weren't they defeated and destroyed during the previous Tao Yuan? There are still Tao realm experts from their clan alive? Why wasn't the Yu clan active in the last Tao Yuan, given that they still have Tao realm experts among them? Could it be that Yusu, our little friend, made it to the Tao realm in the last Tao Yuan? Hong Yuan Chu? The great ancestor of the human race? Xu Yang, Hong Yuan Chu's best friend? All of them are top level powerhouses, and their strengths are all above mine. Especially the three Tao Yuan realm powerhouses. There are legendary existences. Yusu greets the great ancestor of the human race and greets all the seniors. During the previous Tao Yuan, the Yu race was also a powerful race, their possession ability was especially problematic. Many human geniuses were possessed by the members of the Yu race and caused a lot of trouble. Back then, a powerful ancestor of the Yu clan died at the hands of Hong Yuan Chu. Little friend Yusu, don't worry, since the great Tao has given the Yu clan another chance of survival, we won't kill anyone from them. Our grudges are already gone. Thank you, Senior Hong Yuan Chu. Another new member has joined the group, and yet I'm still the one at the bottom. Everyone in the group is a big shot, I'm the only one who's a loser. Thank you, Senior Hong Yuan Chu. Ng Kong greets Sister Yusu. We must have a good relationship. Everyone in the group is a big shot. Maybe in the future, I will have to rely on the support of my group friends. Especially those in the Tao Yuan realm. If you're attacked by someone stronger than you, you can bring out the backers of the group. The border between the southern region and the eastern region. And the vast mountains. Evil son. Father has fallen. Evil son, I'm going to kill you. It's not bad. It's not bad to use this identity to explore the world. Get away from me. What kind of trick did he use? Is my body actually possessed? If I don't do something, I'll soon be imprisoned and become a possessed puppet. Burn the blood, refine the blood, transform the blood, and purify the blood. Blood refinement, flesh refinement, and spirit refinement. Ah. Bind. Let me out. Madman, you're a madman. You'll die too. My physical body has changed, and I have the impression that I can transform into an illusory form. It appears that refining that strange person with my blood refinement technique also granted me some of that strange person's strange abilities. My injuries have gotten worse again. And one third of my blood has evaporated. My wounds are getting worse, and my cultivation foundation had been damaged, and it seems that the hope of breaking through to the Emperor Realm is broken. How can I avenge myself? Looking back, should I go back to the Qin State? It would be good to see her before dying. But will I be able to see her? Is this a fortuitous encounter? Is this an ancient inheritance left behind by some great expert? Surprisingly, there are pills that can repair the foundation. There are even more talent booster pills. What a fantastic opportunity. Senior, this junior will definitely inherit your legacy and will not tarnish your reputation. Evil son, just you wait. I will definitely find you and kill you. 
So what if you're the evil son of the great evil palace? Having received such a great opportunity, it's no longer impossible for me, the little evil king, to annihilate your great evil palace in the future. Senior, I, the little evil king, will never forget the kindness you have given me. No matter what your last wish is, I will spend my whole life fulfilling it for you. What kind of peerless cultivation technique did this senior leave behind? Oh, no, I should call him master. Evil warding immortal scripture. Immortal sutra? A cultivation technique that surpassed legendary divine techniques? If you want to practice this technique, castrate yourself with your sword. Cut off the root of your thoughts, gather your willpower, and cultivate the ultimate technique. If you want to practice this technique, use your sword to castrate yourself. Cut off the root of your thoughts, gather your willpower, and cultivate the ultimate technique. How can I cut off the roots of my thoughts? How can I take revenge if I don't cut off the roots of my thoughts? Without powerful strength, how can I survive in the southern region? How can I see Chu Yun? Darling, from now on, I can only protect you silently. See? Don't worry, darling. Even though I am an incomplete man, I'll still adore you. I'll still go to the depths of hell for you. Darling, even if I cut off my roots, I still can't change my love and longing for you. Uh, ah. Uh. Evil son, I'm going to cut you into pieces. I'm not going to let you go. I'm also going to cut you up like this. Ah. Uh. Darling, I miss you so much. Finally, I can cultivate such an extraordinary technique. If you don't self-castrate, you can still successfully cultivate this technique. If you don't go through the secular world, how can you temper your state of mind? All of the powerful people in the ancient world have tempered themselves. If you sever your roots and sever your desires to cultivate this technique, then you are a coward. Ah, bastard. This old bastard. Such a wicked person. What an asshole. What kind of evil person would write such a book to deceive people? Darling, I've wasted myself. Why didn't you turn the page? Why did you read the first page and then castrated yourself? It's the evil son's fault. Yes. It's because of him that I'm blinded by hatred and that's why I'm acting so foolishly. I'll kill the evil son. If you cut your roots, you are a coward and a moron, but if you didn't, your mind is whole, and you will undoubtedly achieve great things. Could it be that I can't cultivate this technique now that I castrated myself? Did I castrate myself for nothing? Kowtow. Kowtow three times, and the technique will appear. Ah, old bastard, wicked bastard, you still want me to kowtow to you. I learned the technique and how to cultivate it in a short period of time. This level of ability is beyond comprehension. This technique is extremely effective, and when I reach the deity realm, I will be able to restore my fifth limb. I will definitely be able to regain my male body. Why is there an embroidery needle? I always feel that the evil warding immortal scripture is slightly unorthodox. The little evil king was blessed by luck and entered the secret realm of chance you set up. Because of your prank, he castrated himself with his knife and you're rewarded with the blood rebirth technique. I didn't think anyone would be so stupid as to read one page and castrate himself. As it turns out, there really is a fool who reads a page and castrates himself. Little evil king, this brutal pervert, who likes to tear up beautiful women and feed them to the fish, ended up cutting off his own roots with his own hands. This is his retribution. View System Rewards By using the blood rebirth technique, a drop of blood can bring you back to life, and when you're reborn, you'll have 70% of your body's strength and retain all of your body's talents and abilities. At the same time, the blood rebirth technique can condense 9 drops of rebirth blood. 
When the main body dies, the drop of blood closest to the main body is chosen to be reborn. Even if you're killed right after you're reborn, the second and third drops will be reborn one after another. It can be called a secret technique of immortality. The little evil king's self-sacrifice was well worth it. It has given me such a powerful secret technique. In addition to condensing the blood of rebirth for oneself, you can also condense the blood of rebirth for others. Sir, what is this? I feel that this drop of blood has some kind of inexplicable connection with me. This is a drop of rebirth blood. Once your original body dies, you will be reborn from this drop of blood. Master, doesn't that mean that, as long as I have this drop of blood, I won't die? Theoretically, this is the case, however, don't think that you are invincible just because of this and try to attempt foolhardy things. Next, Chu Xian condensed a drop of rebirth blood for Chu Pingfan, Chu Yun, and Xiang Xing with the blood rebirth technique. His disciples were almost immortal. The one who was in the most dangerous situation was the demon Buddha. He was spreading Buddhism in the demon zone, so it was easy for him to be hunted down. It was necessary to ensure that the life of demon Buddha was preserved. If the demon Buddha were to be killed and then resurrected, his enemies would be terrified. The Buddhists, on the other hand, would become even more fanatical. They would believe that by practicing Buddhism, one could be reborn. Was this not appealing enough? Chu Xian took out the myriad heavenly mirror and connected it to Demon Buddha, condensing two drops of rebirth blood for him. One drop was given to Demon Buddha to be placed in a secret location. Once he died, he would rely on this drop of rebirth blood to be reborn and Chu Xian transferred the other drop of blood back and sent it to the small world. One month later, Hu Tianya, your disciple, has advanced to the emperor realm. You've been rewarded for a hundred years of cultivation. As expected, children of fate have to challenge themselves. Only in this way could they quickly increase their cultivation levels. Accept the reward. The sixth level of the deity realm. Rumble. The small world was expanding and undergoing an upgrade. Namo Buddha successfully broke through the deity realm. One more transformation should be enough to allow me to use the origin Tao crystal as a medium to enter the great Tao. Once I can enter the great Tao through the origin Tao crystal, my cultivation speed in the Tao realm would be absolutely unprecedented. I would set a record for being the youngest person to reach the Tao realm. After the transformation of the Origin Dao Crystal, a new ability was born. Members of the Great Dao Communication Group could use the Origin Dao Crystal to transfer items. They could be transferred directly to the other party via their connection to the Origin Dao Crystal. The aura and imprints of the item's original owner would be washed away. The item would be re-imprinted with the recipient's aura by tracing the sender's aura through the Origin Dao Crystal. It could be described as incomparably powerful. There are few treasures that could catch the attention of Dao Yuan realm experts. Unless I can double my earnings, I'm still short on treasures. So the new ability of the Origin Dao Crystal cannot be released for the time being. It wouldn't be too late to release the new ability when I have more to offer and a sufficient understanding of the Dao realm. It had been a while since I used the myriad heavenly mirror to connect to the various domains. I should try my luck and see if I can encounter any more children of fate. Then, I would take them in increasing the chances of triggering the system's rewards. Valley Power related to time This valley is a time mystic realm. Those who can enter the time mystic realm are all people with great luck. I'm almost certain that this person is a child of fate. It turned out to be Xiao Liang and Lu Pia Piao. Lu Pia Piao is still in her divine soul state, but her divine soul is much stronger, and her cultivation has advanced to the fifth level of the heavenly realm. Xiao Liang has even broken through to the fifth level of the emperor realm. That old wrinkled vine with few gray-brown leaves gives off an ancient aura. It is a time-related treasure. The Slow Vine The Slow Vine has the ability to slow down everything that approaches it including attacks. Xiao Liang has actually obtained the slow vine. 
Although the slow vine has yet to recognize him as its master and has yet to be refined, it is only a matter of time before it recognizes him as its master. Xiaoliang really has amazing luck. Xiaoliang, it seemed that this kid is more than just the son of fate of the western region. It is very likely that he is the son of fate of the entire northern zone. Carrying the great fate of the northern zone on his shoulders. It should be his recent transformation. Eh, it's you again, young man. Greetings, senior. This is a precious treasure. Would that senior be tempted? There is absolutely no need to be polite. We're really fated to meet again. Little fellow, your luck is really something. You managed to obtain the Slovine. It is just a fluke. There's no need to be nervous, it's just a Slovine. A mere plant isn't worthy of my attention. Since our meeting is fate, I'll help you get the Slovine to recognize you as its master. This senior is too terrifying. He can control time with a wave of his hand. The slow Vince has already acknowledged me as its master. Thank you, senior. Since we have met again, it means that we are fated. Are you willing to take me as your master? I am willing. Master, please be our witness. From today on, Lu Pia Piao and I are no longer master and disciple. Senior, I recognize that I lack the ability to guide Liang'er. I have no chance of becoming Liang'er's master now that he has acknowledged you as his master. Please bear witness for us. What is this? Looking at Xiao Liang and Lu Pia Piao's strangeness, if these two are not planning to continue being master and disciple, then are they planning to be Dao partners? Xiao Liang has the bearing of a protagonist. All right, I'll be your witness. Thank you, Master. Lu Pia Piao is how many years older than Xiao Liang? He no longer has gold bricks, but a mountain of gold. Did you understand? This little girl is stupid and fails to understand. This is the heaven and earth minor technique. Thank you, Senior. You've taken Xiao Liang on as a disciple. He carries the Northern Zone's luck as a result of his Lux transformation. You have been rewarded with the God Vanquishing Star Radiance and the Limitless Battle Dao. Sure enough, Xiao Liang's luck changed and he became the son of luck in the Northern region. The system rewarded me with a special technique, the Limitless Battle Dao. The God Vanquishing Star Radiance is a deep blue spear, with its tip blooming like a little starlight. Exploration technique, Xiao Liang, the outcast son of the Xiao family on the western continent, was born with a battle spirit coursing through his bones, heart, and soul. Xiao Liang is the most skilled fighter among his disciples, and he will be the strongest once he has mastered the limitless battle Dao. Since you have already started, as a teacher, I will pass some techniques to you. The techniques you are currently practicing are too low level and not suitable for your talent. Thank you, Master. The Limitless Battle Dao is extremely powerful. As long as I cultivate this peerless technique, my combat effectiveness will increase tenfold. Thank you, Master. Get up. Your Master's Disciple. How can you be poor? This spear is so powerful. It's definitely at the level of a divine weapon. Or even above it. Was this the treatment one receives as a disciple of a super expert? Cultivate hard. The nine regions are about to enter a period of great change. Only with strength can we protect ourselves. With crisis comes opportunity. Don't let me down. There will be opportunities for you in the southern region. Take advantage of them. Yes, master. This is the secret treasure of the soul, which can keep your soul immortal. Since you are already in the state of the soul, properly comprehend the heaven and earth minor technique. Recovering your physical body is just a small matter. Thank you, senior. You've got a few senior brothers. You will recognize them when you meet in the future. Don't kill each other. Yes, master. Your disciple, the demon Buddha, has spread the Dharma and transformed millions of Buddhists, and you will be rewarded with the left and right Buddhist attendants. 
The Buddhist attendants resemble puppets, but are not puppets. They can sense the Buddha's thoughts and evolve. Their current level of strength is the deity realm's fifth level. Greetings, Buddha. The border between the southern region and the eastern region, the vast mountains. He disappeared here, the possession failed. Will our family be exposed because of this? This Daoyuan is about to end. We can't wait any longer. Our people must seize the opportunity, starting with the southern state. Grand Master, the southern state is about to undergo a great change, as are the entire nine regions, so here comes the opportunity for us, the Yu clan. If we are to survive, let alone rise, we must maintain a low profile, change our identity, and wait for the right moment. According to our research, the Chu family in Chu County is the best place for us in the entire southern state. We're going to become Chu family members, and we'll be Chu family members for a long time. If we reveal our true identity, we will be exterminated. Is that understood? Yes, we do. We are now the Chu family, and are no longer the Yu clan. We, the Yu clan, have survived for a long time, and most of the nine regions have forgotten about us, so as long as we keep a low profile and show up as human beings, we will definitely wait for the opportunity to rise up. The Chu family is a very special family. It's low profile, not very powerful, and it's safe from powerful forces in Qin. It's the perfect substitute for the Yu clan. Other major powers, such as the Qin Empire and the Dakian Empire, all have their own heritage, making it easy for them to reveal the identity of the Yu clan. The Yu clan had only a hundred members in total, and the Chu family's high status and talented first-degree family members were naturally the target of possession. The Grand Clan Elder was confident that with his power, the Yu clan would be able to obtain the Chu family's direct line without making a fuss. The Chu family will now be one of the main camps of the Yu clan. There's a cold aura approaching the Chu family land. The visitor's aura is strange, and its strength is not weak. It's close to the deity realm. What's a powerful man like that doing in the Chu family again? That cold and gloomy aura is very unique, and that figure is akin to an illusory shadow. It doesn't seem to have a physical body. Is it a ghost? Seal off the Chu family's territory. Why did someone come to my door once more? No one had come to the Chu family's territory to mess with me since the cult had disbanded. It's over. Why was this small Chu family hiding such a terrifying powerhouse? Is there a problem with this human expert's brain? He is clearly powerful, but he keeps a low profile. His absence, or lack thereof, had completely deceived me. He is the same as the human expert who appeared out of nowhere and duped the netherworld race back then. Why is this happening yet again? Did the Grand Elder not say that this trip was almost certainly safe? Our target is just the small Chu family. Why has something gone wrong? Even the Grand Elder is stumped. It's over, our netherworld race clan is going to perish. Heavenly Secrets Origin Probing Technique, the netherworld race has been around for a long time. They were barely able to survive after being defeated in the Great Calamity. The Grand Elder of the netherworld race, a half-step divine realm expert, desired to possess the Chu family members and seize the fate treasure through them while waiting for the opportunity to rise up again. Is this the netherworld race? They look similar to humans. The only difference is that their illusory bodies look like ghosts from the stories and legends of my previous life. Is it fate that I met the netherworld race? Yu Su had been drawn into the great Tao communication group by the Tao Seeking Mirror. The Grand Elder of the netherworld race had now brought over his clansmen to the Chu family. There are no ghosts in the Nine Zones. I can create a ghost race myself. I have to create a cultivation technique that would allow the netherworld race to cultivate and then transform into ghosts. It would be just like turning a demon into a Buddhist. You are calm, thoughtful, and open-minded. You want to turn the netherworld race into a ghost race. You have been rewarded with the ancient netherworld scripture. 
the system's reward has been triggered? The ancient netherworld scripture is the holy scripture of ghosts. If a soul cultivates this technique, it can turn into a ghost. If the netherworld race cultivates this technique, they will quickly transform into a ghost race. If ghosts appeared in the nine zones, many cultivators would be terrified and find them hard to deal with for quite some time. There are only a hundred or so members of the netherworld race in front of you right now. It is not difficult to turn them all into ghosts. Once they succeed in becoming ghosts, I will have an entire ghost race under my command. From now on, not only am I Buddha, but also the freaking ancestor of the ghosts. Almighty human expert, me and my race were just passing by. Don't panic. I have no ill intentions. The netherworld race has no future. No matter how you plot and use all sorts of methods, in the end, you will not be able to create a future in the Great Tao. Almighty human expert, our netherworld race has experts too. If you really want to exterminate our netherworld race, aren't you afraid that our netherworld race experts will slaughter the human race, disregarding all costs? I don't want to exterminate your netherworld race. Also, I know that ancestor of your netherworld race, she also calls me Senior. Senior, if you want to blame me, then just kill me. Let the rest of my clan members go, and let the netherworld race live. I've already said that I don't intend to exterminate your netherworld race. On the contrary, I want to give your netherworld race a chance to survive. The netherworld race wants to seize great fortune and rise to power. However, to do so they must discard the name of the netherworld race and transform into the ghost race. Are you willing? Just changing our name? You will gain great fortune if you convert the netherworld race into a ghost race. The ghost race outperforms the netherworld race. This is your chance to lead your netherworld race to victory. Is this the ghost race? It has some of the characteristics of the netherworld race, but is much stronger and has more abilities. If things are really as described in the information transmission, how strong will the ghost race be? Although the ghost race is not the same as the netherworld race, there are some similarities. If our netherworld race clan is transformed into the ghost race, our netherworld race branch will be extinct. The name of the netherworld race is doomed to disappear. You will have preserved the roots of the netherworld race by turning into ghosts. If you don't turn into ghosts, the netherworld race can't survive this Daoyuan. Senior, why do you want to save the netherworld race? I am a seeker of fate. Your netherworld race ancestor is fated with me. Since you came here, no matter what your purpose is, it's also fate. I'll keep your clan alive. Do you think that the current netherworld race still means anything to me? Senior, we are willing to transform into the ghost race. I will teach you the ghost race's cultivation method. The Small World Thank you, Senior. From then on, the netherworld race began to cultivate in the dark valley. Their spiritual power was constantly being transformed, slowly turning into a form of sinister and terrifying power. This cultivation method was extremely powerful, as were the abilities of the ghost race. They were more powerful than the netherworld race and had a brighter future. Furthermore, if they were successful in transforming into the ghost race, they would become natural ghosts rather than ghosts formed after cultivating from a divine soul. If the netherworld race wants to become strong, they must transform into the ghost race. What's going on? Why has there been a change in my relationship with the netherworld race? The netherworld race had not been wiped out, but their fate had actually grown stronger. It shouldn't be a bad thing. A stronger fate means that the netherworld race has become stronger. Clan disciples, listen to my order. From now on, we will all be converted to the Ghost Clan, we will call ourselves the Ghost Clan, the Yu Clan will cease to exist, and we will all worship Master Chu Xian as the Ghost Ancestor, and those who do not comply will be punished according to the Clan's rules. We'll obey the order of the Great Elder. Wow, the Great Elder has taken the initiative in finishing the transformation. Yes, this ghostly aura is so dominant, I love it. Great Elder, You've just transformed into a ghost. How do you feel? 
Tell us. Yes, Elder, we're all jealous. I feel incredibly refreshed. My whole body has brightened up a lot, and I have also stepped into the deity realm. These things that I have never dared to crave are all thanks to our master. Ding. You created the first ghost of the nine zones and became the ghost race's ancestor. You have been rewarded with the Fengdu secret realm. He, I'm afraid I'm the first person to create a new race in the entire nine regions. Fengdu, the secret realm of ghosts, is a small world where ghosts can train twice as fast and all their abilities can be enhanced and upgraded. The seal of the king of ghosts can be used to appoint the king of ghosts of Fengdu, and no one will dare to disobey the orders of the seal. Now that we have the ghost clan's fiefdom and the ghost king, it's time to go see them. Hey, guys, hope you're well. Ah, uh, Master Chu? No, it's the ghost ancestor. Greeting to the ghost ancestor. I'm sorry I didn't realize Master Ghost Ancestor was on his way. It makes no difference. I'm here to appoint you as the first ghost king of the ghost clan. I present you with this seal. You can command all of the ghosts by holding this seal. I'll give you another fiefdom once all of your clan's members have been transformed. Thanks for your gift. By the way, I see you have a talented girl named you in your clan, so when she's finished transforming, let her come and meet me in my courtyard. I'll follow the ghost ancestor's holy order. Ah, uh, the ghost ancestor wants to see me? Congratulations, you have a bright future. Congratulations, sister you. Thank you all for your kind words. Thank you. Ping Fan, you must remember that there is another mountain to climb, so don't become complacent just because you've had some success. Yes, 13th Uncle, Ping Fan will definitely practice harder and never disappoint 13th Uncle's expectations. I, Ewer, have come to pay respects to my Lord Ghost Ancestor. Good, good, you're polite. Thirteenth Uncle, who is she? Let me introduce her, this is Ewer, she is from the Ghost Clan. The little girl, Ewer, greets the young master. My name is Chu Ping Fan. I'd like to greet Miss Ewer. It's just a girl, where's the ghost? The ghost is like me. Oh. Well, I didn't see any difference between you and me. Oh? He's not scared of me, is he? I'm a tough guy, so show me something that truly frightens me, little girl. M. Ewer, let him see your true strength. My nephew is indeed very powerful. Eh? Really? You are really rude. Is she a ghost? There is indeed a sinister aura around her but she doesn't seem very strong. Is that all? Huh? My figure disappeared with a single roar? Okay, Ping Fan, you are, stop fighting. You are about the same age, so you can practice together to avoid boredom. Yes, Lord Ghost Ancestor. Yes, Thirteenth Uncle. Ping Fan, you are younger than me, so you have to call me sister from now on. Shut up. By the way, you are, I will also teach you the rest of the Netherworld's ancient scriptures. Work hard and don't be frivolous. Yes, Lord Ghost Ancestor. Sir, lunch is ready. I don't have time to eat, put it away for now. Dean, you have created a new race in the Nine Zones, the Ghost Race, by converting the U Clan tribe you accepted. The Yin Dao Principle has been bestowed upon you. Oh? The Yin Dao Principle, doesn't this complement my Dao? His Dao Principles, one steady as a mountain and the other dark as a gentle rain, are an ideal match for a frontal attack and a sneak attack. This can be regarded as one Yin and one Yang, and it would be really wonderful to cultivate these two principles at the same time and complement each other. You've been in seclusion for 15 years, and your strength has increased tremendously. Please keep up the good work. Your Dao Seeking Mirror has been upgraded to the Chaos Dao Mirror. Huh? Have I been home for 15 years? Let's put that aside for now and see how awesome this Dao Seeking Mirror version 2.0 is. The Chaos Dao Mirror is an upgraded version of the Dao Seeking Mirror. 
It has the ability to derive the secrets of heaven and the great Tao, search for Tao Yuan and ancient Tao experts, and obtain the information and appearance of the person being searched for. Yes, yes, this upgraded version has everything I could have hoped for. However, the system recently mentioned ancient Tao experts. Is an ancient Tao expert, an expert who had opened additional Tao paths or had walked those Tao paths for a longer period of time? Let's give it a whirl and see how effective the upgraded Tao Seeking Mirror is at finding experts. Chaos Tao Mirror, open. O. Oh, Demon Race? Tao Yuan Realm Expert? MO2, an ancestor of the demon race and one of the ancient demons. This Tao Yuan Realm Expert has already opened up nearly two Tao paths. The Chaos Tao Mirror is extremely powerful. Despite the fact that this is my first time using it, I've already found a Tao Yuan Realm Expert. It also shows an image of MO2, but he is completely unaware of it. The high level of the Chaos Tao Mirror can be determined from this. As a result of the addition of another Tao Yuan Realm Expert to the Great Tao Communication Group, the time until the next transformation of the Origin Tao Crystal will be shortened. Huh? Who are you? Who's that? How dare he mess with me behind my back? Ahem, fellow Taoist MO2 has joined the Great Tao Communication Group. Come and have a great time with your friends. There are also a few Tao Yuan Realm fellow Taoists here. Everyone, please get to know him. What? What kind of crap is this? To be able to pull a fast move on me without me even noticing it. Who are you? Why did you resort to such unsavory tactics? I'll keep quiet for now and see what kind of sparks this devil can create with them in the group to deter him in the meantime. Your Honor, if you remain silent, I, MO2, will not be easily manipulated. MO2? The overlord of the demon race? This voice? Hong Yuan Chu? This is Taoist Brother Chu's supreme treasure. You don't want to be presumptuous here. Is this your conspiracy, little boy? Oh, these two know each other. Maybe they're enemies. This is going to be fun. What conspiracy? MO2, what nonsense are you talking about? Humph, you are still the same as you were back then, except for making small moves behind my back. You have never dared to confront me head on. If you have the guts, then compete with me. Our brief fight back then appears to have left a psychological scar on you. If we had fought, you, MO2, would not have been my opponent. That's nonsense. Are you sure? You have forgotten how your younger brothers died at my hands. Hong Yuan Chu, don't talk to me about those things. All you know is pretending. If you have the guts, come over here and let's have a real fight. I won't kill you, I swear. Hong, do you have the guts to come or not? Don't make a funny face at me. If you're brave enough, send me your location. MO2 you reckless man, don't try to show off your eloquence here. This group is the most. Coward, you've always been a rat with your head in the sand. You're cursing again. I will curse you, again and again. What you? You sanctimonious little trash. Hey, you've got a temper. When will there be a little shrimp so I don't end up at the bottom of the list? You're a bunch of losers who don't deserve to be compared to MO2. MO2. You are too presumptuous. MO2. If you have guts, tell me where you are. If I'm immortal, I will be the first to find you. Count me in. Those guys in this group are really good at fighting. It's already midnight and it's not over yet. Fellow Taoist Chu, are you there? MO2 is too presumptuous. You are the group leader. Can you kick him out? Oh? Hong Yuan Chu couldn't take it anymore. Group leader? Isn't this group owned by Hong Yuan Chu? Then the one who pulled me into the group without saying a word was this faceless group master? Alas, I don't know why fellow Taoist Chu wants to bring such a reckless man into the group. It's really a big headache. MO2, the group's Tao Yuan expert, is a living treasure. My Tao crystal absorbs more Tao rhyme as he becomes more active in the group. Where can I find another if I expel him? But it's getting late, 
and I can't delay my cultivation tomorrow, so let's clean up the mess now. All of you, in my opinion, are familiar with each other, and all past events have their causes and effects, and now that we can meet here, it is fate as well as Taoism, and there are millions of Taoism laws, and perhaps inadvertent quarrels may also lead to the inspiration of Taoism. What this group leader said is very mysterious. Since he was able to bring me to this group at the beginning, he is also a senior in comparison to me. His strength and state of mind must be higher than mine. Fellow Taoist Chu said that there are thousands of ways of Taoism, how come I can't think of finding inspiration in quarrels? Sure enough, our realm is different, and the things we see are also different. I am really enlightened. Fellow Taoists, have you ever wondered why this group has not existed for tens of thousands of years, and why it opened at this time? This. Understand it yourself. Thank you for your guidance. My realm may not be enough, but my mouth is already invincible. I'm going to bed. Ding. You taught the third 16-year-old Emperor Realm Martial Artist in history without leaving your home, and you were rewarded with a thousand years of cultivation and the Tao scriptures of the beginning. You taught the first 16-year-old Extreme Tao Imperial Realm Cultivator without leaving your house and were rewarded with the Tao of Destruction. Did Ping Fan break through so fast? But it's just as it should be. Ping Fan's hard work these years has not been in vain, and he is already invincible among his peers. Moreover, the extreme Tao practiced by Ping Fan is an exceptionally rare Tao in the world, and the power of the Emperor Realm of the Extreme Tao is also more special than that of other Tao's, which is hegemonic and extraordinary, and has a boundless future in the future. Uncle, I have broken through the Emperor Realm. Ping Fan, congratulations, all these years of training haven't been wasted, and 13th Uncle hasn't loved you for nothing. Hee <laughs> hee, of course Ping Fan will not disappoint you, Uncle. But, Ping Fan, don't be complacent, the Emperor Realm is just the beginning, there's still a long way to go. You've been cultivating for a long time, but you don't have much experience in actual combat. From today onwards, you must enter the secret realm of chance and continue to hone your fighting spirit and awareness, so don't let up. Yes, Uncle Thirteen, Ping Fan will go to try the secret realm right now, okay? That's good. By the way, Ping Fan, you take Ewer with you and you both should practice together. Yes, Uncle Thirteen. Well, it's time to claim the rewards, so let's take a look at these Tao scriptures first. The absolute beginning Tao scripture has been around since the beginning of the Great Tao. It was born from primal chaos and it started from Nirvana. When the absolute beginning Tao scripture is mastered, it can give birth to primal chaos and open the door to the true Great Tao. Even if the Great Tao is destroyed, it can be reborn and returned from Nirvana. Let's go! If I comprehend the absolute beginning Tao scripture, not only can I give guidance to Tao realm cultivators, I can even give guidance to Tao Yuan realm cultivators. But first, I need to receive my thousand year cultivation reward and solidify my cultivation foundation so that when it comes to comprehending the Tao of the beginning, I can get twice the result with half the effort. Come on, let my foundation become more intense. Tao scripture of the beginning, come on. Ding! You broke through just by staying in seclusion. You became the fastest cultivator in history to break through the Tao realm. You have been rewarded with the Time Tao principle and a soul journey through the Great Tao. You broke through just by staying in seclusion. You became the youngest Tao realm cultivator in all of history. You have been rewarded with the Concealment Tao principle and the Myriad Convergence Tao technique. I broke through. I've now incorporated the five Tao principles into my body and activated the Myriad Convergence Tao technique. As Tao Aura surges into my body, my body feels like a whale swallowing. Ordinary Tao Realm warriors struggle to grasp a single Tao principle, but I am completely on the rocket. Being the fastest and youngest Tao Realm cultivator in history is already a thing of the past. I still want to be the youngest Tao Yuan expert in history. What will the system's reward be at that time? I'm excited about it.
but first and foremost, I must improve myself. This time, this reward tour of traveling through the Great Dao of Time may differ from the previous tour of the entire Dao. I will upgrade my Time Dao principle, but I will travel alone. I should also bring the Origin Dao crystal and the Time Ship in case they come in handy. Wow! Is this the Great Dao of Time? So gorgeous! This is simply a vast and never-ending river of light, the end of which would be impossible to see even after hundreds of millions of years. As expected of Great Dao of Time, not only is the scenery magnificent and gorgeous, but the feeling in it is even more mysterious and extraordinary. After just being here for a while, my Time Dao principle is constantly improving. It's too abnormal, but I like it very much. By the way, I'm not sure if some of the Dao Group's pioneers have been here before, so it won't hurt to ask them for more information. I am currently traveling on the river of the Great Dao of Time. Fellow Taoists, would you like to join me? What? The Great Dao of Time. Can fellow Taoists Chu actually travel the Great Dao of Time? Is the group leader that awesome? Then my disrespectful actions back then, hiss. Why am I finding it increasingly difficult to understand the topics discussed in this group? Am I going backwards? Is this Tao realm of mind fake? What's going on today? No one picks up on my first conversation? Ding, you have a new text message. I am currently traveling on the river of the Great Tao of Time. Fellow Taoists, would you like to join me? Fellow Datus Chu, are you on the river of the Great Tao of Time? Yes, fellow Taoist Hong, would you like to join me? Please forgive me, Taoist Brother Chu. I have never comprehended the Tao of Time, so I am unable to enter the Great Tao of Time through the Great Tao. Does the group leader cultivate the Great Tao of Time? I thought no one paid any attention to me, but they were silent just because they were shocked. It turns out that not everyone can enter and exit the Great Tao of Time at will, even the pioneers are not qualified. Friend Chu, are you on the Time Avenue? I walk the Great Tao, and time is only one of them, and I'm sure it's different from the one you're on. I admire Taoist Brother Chu's talent. I, MO2, will not yield to anyone. I can even press Ruoxian, that little bitch, under my body. Brother Chu, I will only submit to you. MO2, you are courting death. You humiliate me the moment you open your mouth. Just wait. You hear me? Come on. I'll definitely take you. Huh? Is there someone there? I walk the Great Dao, and time is only one of them, and I'm sure it's different from the one you're on. A creature appeared on the River of Time. I'll talk to everyone later. What? What? Just now I clearly saw something flashing by. Where did it go? Fellow Taoist, can you come out and meet me? Are you calling me? Um, fellow Taoist, you appeared so abruptly, isn't it a little? Are you talking about me? Oh, it was indeed a bit abrupt, but your sudden appearance here makes me a little uncomfortable. Oh? Well, let's talk about it first, fellow Taoist. It's a little awkward to soak in water. That's fine by me. I see you've been here for a long time, fellow Taoist Long Gun, and I've disturbed your cultivation. I'm hoping you'll forgive me. No problem, I've been on this Tao River for far too long. When the first person came in, I appeared abruptly because I was excited. You're too kind, fellow Taoist Long. Did you just say you've only seen me come to the Tao of Time? No one has ever entered? That's right, no one's ever come in here. You are the first person I'll met on the Great Tao, and the fifth person I met in my lifetime if you count the people I've seen out of the Tao. Oh? So, you can still go outside the Great Tao, Brother Long? So, I can leave, but it's uncomfortable out there, and it's easy to get lost outside of the Tao. In short, it's annoying, and I feel like if I leave for a long time, I'll get called back. I see. I can't imagine that there are all sorts of restrictions on the Great Tao of Time. Then why don't you discuss the Tao with the other fellow Taoists? Is it possible that you're the only one here? That's right, 
I'm the only one here, and I'm one of a kind. I'm not familiar with other creatures on the Great Dao, and I'm not sure if they still exist. Aren't you bored then? That's right. All I do is sleep and cultivate every day. It's boring. You don't have to lament. I have a treasure that can communicate with the outside world and discuss with them so that you can relieve your sorrow and feel the outside world at the same time, okay? Good. That's really good. Brother Chu, hurry up and show me this treasure. Okay, Brother Long, I prefer to assist others. Brother Long will first give me a Dao Aura so that I can connect to the treasure. Brother Chu, feel free to take it. From now on, we'll be best friends. If you need anything, just say so. Thank you, Brother Long. No problem, Brother Chu. Brother Long, I'll give you a Dao Aura Ball. When you meet other beings on the main road in the future, you can use this to bring them into the treasure and communicate with them. Okay, okay. Let me introduce you to Brother Long Gun. He is the Jade Dragon of Time. If time does not die, the Jade Dragon will not die. So if you have any questions about time, ask him. Hello everyone, I am Long Jun Senior Long. Your humble servant MO2 pays his respect. I, Junior Hutai, warmly welcome Senior Long in the communication group. Greetings to Senior Long. If all the immortal beings in the Tao of Time have been dragged into the group by Master Chu, then isn't Master Chu even stronger? Are you satisfied, Master Long? Satisfied, satisfied, so satisfied, right, Brother Chu? I have a little treasure here, not too precious. You can take it for the time being as a token of my appreciation. Then, I won't refuse Brother Long's gift. Yes, you should do so. However, I would like to remind Brother Long that people's hearts are complicated, and it is not necessary to reveal all of your secrets to them. Don't worry, Brother Chu, I'm not the type of person to be duped. That's fine, Brother Long, I'm returning, and as soon as I find a way to keep you from being restrained and get you out of the Tao, I'll contact you. Okay, Brother Chu, we will meet later. See you later, Brother Long. Sienner, make ten times the amount of food today. Sir, that much? Of course, there's an urgent need, so do it quickly and do it well. Yes, sir. Oh? What is this? Brother Long, this is a small gesture of care from Brother Chu, and since there must not be many treasured delicacies on the Great Tao, I ordered someone to make some to improve the food for Brother Long. Then I would like to thank Brother Chu for his kindness. Can we transfer items in the group? It's that amazing? I have activated the transfer function in the group, and we can exchange items in the group now. The transferred items will not reveal the aura of the owner and the recipient, so everyone can use it with confidence. Senior Long, I have something that is born from the essence of heaven and earth. Senior Long, this junior just has a problem. Senior Long, Junior, Grandpa Long. Ng Kong's flattering abilities are truly extraordinary. We'll refer to him as the King of Flatterers from now on. It's night again. After a busy day, it's time to rest. I'll call Bao Hong in tomorrow. It's time to fully control the Black Moon House. Sir, Bao Hong in is here. Let her in. Sir, no word on the true mastermind behind the Black Moon House, which you asked me to investigate. Oh? Is that so? With your current position, can't you find out what's going on at Black Moon House? Yes, sir, it is extremely difficult for me to infiltrate the upper departments of the Black Moon House with my current position. It could be argued that I am unable to determine whether the true mastermind is male or female. Does that mean that only the highest ranking Nine Star Tower Lord can contact or communicate with the mastermind? Maybe, but this subordinate isn't sure. Okay. Then you'll be promoted level by level, gradually infiltrating it. Yes, sir, this subordinate will comply. Thirteenth Uncle Well, Ping Fan, you've come out and broken through to the third level of the Emperor Realm. Congratulations. Thank you, Uncle. Actually, I want to tell you something. Ping Fan, when did you become hesitant? Tell me what it is. Uncle, I want to make a trip to the Eastern Region. Have you thought about it? 
I've thought it through, no matter what, I have to go there. Then proceed to that location. You've worked so hard for so many years to be able to express your rage and frustration about what happened to you and your parents back then. Thank you, 13th uncle. Remember, there's no need to pay attention to the identity or background of the other party, just do the right thing. Yes, 13th uncle. I know what I should do. Me too, great-grandfather. Ewer also wants to go with Ping Fan. What a smart kid. It's not wrong to call me the great-grandfather. I'm the founder of the ghost race after all. Go ahead. Yay, thank you, great-grandfather. Brother Ping Fan, if someone troubles you, don't worry, I will cover you. Humph, I'll let you know who's covering whom. What are you thinking, kid? Why do you look so disdainful? Am I? Tell me quickly, what were you thinking just now? If you don't tell me, I will. Ping Fan, you are, these are some pills refined by your aunt. Take them all with you when you go out for the first time. Be cautious and don't act recklessly. Little Ping Fan, you are, here are some formations and weapons that I refined. You should take them with you, use them wisely, and don't waste them. They gave him medicine pills, weapons, and secret treasures, so what should I give him? There it is. Thanks to Auntie and Brother Xiang Xing for the gift, Ping Fan will definitely come back safely. Good, good. Ping Fan, you are, this is a treasure I took from the world as a child. It will come in handy at critical times. Keep it safe, and you will return safely. Thank you, Aunt Su. Don't bully you are on the road. Don't worry, Aunt Su. Ping Fan, you are, we'll be waiting for you at home, so be careful and don't get carried away. We know, goodbye Aunt Chu, Aunt Su, and Brother Xiang. Alas, to be honest, I'm really sorry to see Ping Fan go on this trip, but it's also the only way for him to grow up. But I still have to see my nephew go away, and to such a dangerous place as the eastern region, damn. chu -er. Master, go and secretly protect Chu Ping Fan, and don't let Ping Fan make even the slightest mistake. Yes, my lord. Alas, cultivate well, the deity realm is not the end. Yes, master. When will Xiao Xing return to the eastern zone of the southern region? The son of fortune cannot stay at home, he must go out and explore. Ding Yu and Wang Luo haven't triggered the system rewards in a while. Is it because they hadn't messed around enough? Thirteenth brother, we're back. You're back just in time. This is for you. Thank you, thirteenth brother. Brother, I'm going to the ancestral home to lead the Chu family's alchemy team. Go ahead. It seems that the Chu family is developing very smoothly. It's been a long time since I've heard Chu Tianming's roar. I'd better not anger old man Chu Tianming, though. He might burst a blood vessel. Your disciple Ding Yu entered the secret realm of the ancient earth spirits by mistake and was crowned the holy child of the earth spirits. His luck transformed. You have been rewarded with the earth creation scripture. Ding Yu triggered a system reward? He mistakenly entered the secret realm of the ancient earth spirit race? I've never heard of the earth spirit clan. Moreover, Ding Yu was crowned as the holy child of the earth spirit? Is this the earth spirit race? Is it a species that was born from a certain type of plant? How did Ding Yu be regarded as the child of the earth spirit? Didn't I just steal a few fruits and trigger some strange phenomena? How did I become the holy son? It's all your fault for bringing me to this place and encouraging me to steal something to eat. It's the master who's greedy. The child of the earth spirits? At least for now, such a title is beneficial and harmless. Although the earth spirit race is small, it is not weak. One is in the deity realm, five in the heavenly realm, and the remaining in the emperor and honorable realms. Elder, does the earth spirit race have a sword Dao inheritance? Yes, yes, my earth spirit race once produced a gifted ancestor of the sword Dao, who left behind the earth spirit sword Dao. Then take me there. Please follow me. 
It's full of spirit herbs and fruits. Before leaving, I should take some of these with me. Oh, after returning, Wang Luo wouldn't have to worry about his supply of spirit herbs to refine pills any longer. The more I think about it, the more I realize that the process of becoming recognized as an earth spirit child is a bit of a farce. I'm a human. How did I become the holy child of the earth spirit? There must be a conspiracy. Holy child, you can sit three feet in front of the ancestor's statue and make a sincere request. You will undoubtedly benefit. Something is wrong. Be careful. Not good. There's indeed a problem. There's a strange phenomenon happening. He has received recognition from my ancestors, and returning to nine zones is just around the corner. If I die, he'll die too. If you threaten me again, I will strangle him directly. I was blind to have recognized such a master. What the hell is this? Don't think you'll be able to kill me in an instant. Even if you kill me, it will perish as well. It's only a test. Why do you want to strangle it? You are the holy child. Do you think I'll actually hurt you? Impossible. I definitely sense danger just now. Don't you know? I am a human. Why would you acknowledge me as a holy child? Don't even think about deceiving me. In fact, the true holy child is the earth vein spirit. As long as he kills me, the earth vein spirit will be free, and it will naturally be crowned the holy child of the earth spirits. Since you share wealth and woe with him, you are naturally the holy child. The holy children of my race have always been human. No matter how I look at it, there is something wrong with this holy child. What about it? Holy Lord. This will not do. It's the holy Lord, and I'm the holy child. Doesn't that imply it's my master? This has always been the rule. No, how can I be of lower status than it? I'm the master. Don't threaten me. Otherwise, if I kill him, you will no longer have a holy lord. Conditions, give me your conditions. Why did it choose such a person? If you have conditions, we can talk about it. You strangled me too hard. 30% is too little. Want 40%? 35%? No more than that. Dean Yu is the fated son, but his heart is too evil. Dean Yu won't die. Let's check out the system reward. The Earth Creation Scripture has the power to manipulate the Earth. Earth Creation Scripture. It can create space on the Great Tao for one's own territory. What a priceless treasure, being able to open up land on the Great Dao means that I can open up my own territory directly on the Great Dao. A new area at the border of the small world appeared in the blink of an eye. When I am able to enter the Great Dao through the Origin Dao crystal in the future, I will be able to use the Earth Creation Scripture to gain a foothold in the Great Dao. Gain a foothold directly on the Great Dao. I can even split my divine soul and allow a portion of it to remain on the Great Tao indefinitely. Then I'll be able to constantly comprehend the Great Tao while nurturing and perfecting my Tao principles. It's as if I've personally traveled through the Great Tao. Myriad Convergence Tao Technique and Chaos Indestructible Physique are what I practice. I absorb Tao Aura at such a rapid rate that I will leave ordinary Tao realm cultivators in the dust. If I can stay on the Great Tao permanently, then my cultivation will increase by leaps and bounds. That fellow Ding Yu is still good. As expected of my first disciple, he has triggered such a precious reward. As expected, a child of fate should be allowed to roam freely outside. I'm looking forward to Wang Luo, Demon Buddha, and Hu Tianya's hard-working rewards. Xiao Liang also needs to work harder. I should search for more Tao realm experts. There are still relatively few members in the Great Tao Communication Group. It will be more lively if there are more people. The Origin Tao Crystal will also obtain more Tao Aura and transform faster. The little evil king, who entered your secret realm of chance by mistake, has broken through to the Emperor Realm. You have been rewarded with a cluster of Dad Aura. Huh? 
I almost forgot about the little evil king. This guy has broken through to the emperor realm. With his cultivation speed, he can now exact his revenge. Furthermore, instead of a cultivation boost, the system rewarded me with a cluster of Dao Aura. A Dao Aura cluster is equivalent to me absorbing Dao Aura for half a month. I'm hoping that the little evil king, who is both physically and mentally strong, can surprise me once more. I haven't found any Dao Realm experts using the Chaos Dao Mirror. It seems I'll have to use it more often. The Eastern Region Hey, this kid is both stupid and strong, so he should be a simple target. People still come to bother me despite my low profile. Did I grow up with an easy-to-bully face? How dare they call Ping Fan stupid? Go to hell. The evil fiend sex followers have gone too far. Are you now targeting ordinary people? Run. Hey, idiot, I saved your life. Shouldn't you say thank you? Forget it, I won't argue with you like a fool. You're the idiot. Are you still not persuaded? I will beat you until your head swells like a pig, believe it or not. I don't care about you. You idiot, you're so weak, aren't you afraid of death? You're even running around, hey, are you ignoring me right now, you idiot? Forget it, you moron, you're just an ordinary person, one whip from me and you'll be split in half and I'll have wasted my time saving you. You are the idiot. Stop. Would you like to inspect her body, or should I strip her naked and let you have fun with her? No, no, don't do it in public. Don't mess around, stop making trouble, get out of her body quickly. She called you a moron. I'd like to punish her a little by having her lend me her body for three days. What method was used to keep my body under control? She appears to be inside of me, this method is completely unusual. Hello, what's your name? I, my name is Yu Bebe, and I'm from the Yu family. The Yu family? Is it the Yu family, one of the three great families in the eastern region? Yes, yes, I am Yu Bebe, the third young miss of the Yu family. Fan Fan, she's the Yu family's young miss. Why don't you sleep with her and you'll be a member of the Yu family? What's going on in your head? She's an oldie. How can I like her? Who are you calling an oldie, idiot? You are about the same age as my Aunt Yun and Aunt Su, but much older than me. What is it if you are not an oldie? You are, let her go. What's the point of possessing the body of an oldie like her? Who told her to call you an idiot? I don't know. I will let her go if you admit you are an idiot. It's been three days, let the old girl go. Shut your mouth. I'm so angry. Fan Fan, are you sure you don't want to sleep with her? She's a little old, but she's quite good looking. Stop it. Miss you. Come with me. Fan Fan, should we save her? She helped us get rid of the flies the last time, and this time we'll save her, so we won't owe her anything. Granny Fan, come and save me. Little girl from the U family, stop screaming and surrender obediently. According to 13th Uncle, all mentally retarded villains died from talking too much. You won't live long if you talk so much. You, you're really stupid. He's an Emperor Realm expert. Little brat, go to hell. Who? Should we kill him? Will it cause any problems if we kill him? I hate trouble. Kill him. We'll always be worried about his retaliation if we don't kill him. It'll be even more difficult then. We can stay out of trouble if we dispose of the body and destroy the evidence. I'll take control of his soul and extract and refine it into soul materials. Something is wrong. I have to run away. You want to run? An Emperor Realm expert died so easily? Do you want it? You, you're a divine soul. I'm a ghost, not a divine soul. Ghost? Are there ghosts in this world? Alright, 
Your crisis is over. You can leave now. We no longer owe each other anything. What's your cultivation level? How old are you? It's none of your business. Why are you going to Central County? I'm familiar with it, so I can help you. I'm going to challenge the G family and grind their faces into the ground. Brother Fan, don't worry. I'll definitely help you. How are you going to help me? I intend to openly challenge my G family peers. I'm going to crush them all and stomp them to the ground. I'm going to degrade the G family's dignity. That's a good idea. Have you heard that the G family was challenged? Of course, it's all over the central county. On the first day, all the G family geniuses under the age of 30 were all crushed. One punch after another, they were beaten until they were left lying unconscious on the arena platform. That's right, the G family's Emperor Realm geniuses made their move later on, and everyone below the third level was defeated. Yubebe from the Yu family is also assisting behind the scenes. She is the fiancé of Ling Baiyun, the Eastern Continent's number one pride. G family will lose a lot of face. Patriarch, Patriarch Yu replied that this matter has nothing to do with the Yu family, and that it was only because his daughter's life has been saved by that youth that she has repaid the latter's kindness. Since it has nothing to do with the Yu family, then the G family has nothing to worry about. Go and ask the G family's younger generation, who are at the sixth level of the Emperor realm, to take action. I still haven't seen my wife. It's been so long since I'm in the eastern region. The G family gave me this shop. As long as I can manage the shop well and display outstanding management talent, the G family will accept me as their son-in-law. As for cultivation talent, the G family does not lack it. The shop's business recovered quickly, but then a love rival appeared. As a result, the shop's business, which had just begun to improve, was immediately thrown back into disarray. I will beat you. What a shame. But there is nothing I can do. I had heard that a young man had arrived to challenge the G family's geniuses. I can only hope that this young man can stall for time and possibly even mess up the G family. I should go see the young man who challenged the G family by myself. G family, huh. Worse than trash. Tian Cheng, you go. Yes, father. It turned out to be G. Tian Cheng, the G family's strongest genius, a hundred year old Emperor Realm expert. He's now at the ninth level of the Emperor Realm and has the best chance of reaching the Heavenly Realm. This has completely angered the G family. Are you going to fight across the cultivation realms? Come on. Hey, idiot, admit defeat if you can't win. G. Tian Cheng is powerful. I'm curious, who sent you to provoke my family? Do you think you're invincible in the Emperor Realm? Are you the strongest genius of the G family? Yes, I am. Very well, I'll trample you under my feet today and tell everyone that the genius of the G family is nothing but trash. Ping Fan knocked on their door, crushed their brightest genius, and trampled on a great family's pride. This will be a great story about the rise of a good for nothing. Ping Fan's cultivation level is a bit lower, but even before he broke through the Emperor Realm, his physical body was comparable to that of a cultivator in the Emperor Realm. He eats Emperor level pills as snacks, and in terms of foundation, there aren't many people in this world who can compare to Chu Ping Fan. It's little Ping Fan? You've got a lot of guts, so give me your name and I'll leave your corpse intact. I'm from the Chu family in the southern state. My name is Chu Pingfan. I'm 16 years old, and I'm at the third level of the Emperor's realm. Today, I'm going to use my strength to show the world that the G family's geniuses are nothing more than trash. 16 years old. Third level of the Emperor's realm. 16 years old at the Emperor's realm? What kind of monster is he? My father's name is Chu Yuan, my mother's name is Ji Chao Wei, and I am the piece of trash that you, the Ji family, used to hate. Today, I want the world to know that the Ji family's so-called geniuses are not even as good as me, a piece of trash. 
Is he the son of the rumored useless husband of the G family's young miss, the son-in-law who wasn't recognized by the G family? Such a peerless monster was thrown away by the G family and regarded as a piece of trash? Is the G family blind? What did you say? Don't mess with me. Kill, behead. How can it be? Are you sure it's him? Yes, indeed it is him. Ping Fan? The geniuses of the G family are nothing more than trash. A breakthrough? What? It's no good. Enough. Old man, you are bullying me. Do you think I'm easy to bully? It's not good. Hence proved, the G family's geniuses are inferior to trash. Both Ji Tian Cheng and the elders of the Ji family were defeated. That's right, and Chu Ping Fan is only at the fourth level of the Emperor's realm. This youth already possesses such formidable strength despite only being in the fourth level of the Emperor realm. Once he breaks through to the ninth level of the Emperor realm, would he not be? Anyone else? I didn't realize that Little Ping Fan's cultivation was so amazing that he could break through and kill the enemies like chopping vegetables. The extreme Tao that Ping Fan cultivated was already extremely powerful, and Ping Fan is the greatest pride of the extreme Tao, and it is not an exaggeration for him to have such a record. Ding Chu Ping Fan, your nephew, demonstrated the power of the extreme dad. The eastern region was jolted by his name. You have received an upgrade to the Destruction Dad Principle as a reward. My Destruction Dao Principle had already been upgraded to the second level of the Dao Realm ahead of time, so I didn't dote on him for nothing. Th Sir, what are you laughing at? Nothing, I'm just happy. Let's keep watching, keep watching. What a conceited young man. You have the right to be arrogant, but this isn't the place for it. If you continue to cause trouble, even if you have G Family blood on your body, I will not show mercy. What does the G family have to do with me? What do you have to do with me? You don't have the right to discipline me at all. Where are my parents? Give me an answer. If my parents have been harmed, I, Chu Ping Fan, will definitely eradicate the G family today. You bastard. Do you understand the gravity of what you're saying? I am your grandfather. How dare you be so rebellious? You still know that I am your grandson. Back then, who was it that said I was a disgrace to the G family? Useless rubbish. Today, I stepped on the so-called heavens blessed of your G family and suddenly became your grandson. Do you have any shame? Ping Fan, don't do anything. Let Dad talk to your grandfather. But, Dad. Patriarch G, Ping Fan is still young. If there's anything he has done wrong, I, his father, will take the punishment in his stead. Humph! Is this the good son you taught, Chu Yuan? He has no respect for his elders and is extremely arrogant. If you want to ask for forgiveness, Father, there's no need to be polite to him. What does the G family think? The G family can't hurt me. If he dares to hurt me, even if the G family had a divine realm expert, they would still be wiped from the face of this world. But Ping Fan, your mother, she. Father, don't worry. Mother will come out very soon. This. This arrogant boy is too presumptuous, but judging from his cultivation, there must be an expert behind him who has taught him, alone Chu Ping Fan is not enough to be feared, if the power behind him is involved, it will definitely lead to trouble. If we want to solve today's situation, we can only find a way to do it from Ji Chao Wei's point of view. What? Chu Yuan, Fanner, Kiao. Mother, what's going on here? Why is Tian Cheng here? Didn't he go to heal his wounds? Fanner, you have grown taller than your mother. You must have suffered a lot these years. Mother, this is not a place to talk. I will take you and Dad out of here first. All right, all right, my Fanner has grown up. You want to leave? You have no respect for me, the patriarch of the G family. 
Xiao Wei, come back. Ah, this old man wants to sneak attack. What's going on? This. Humph. Tianqing. What are you doing? Are you crazy? No, it's that wild child who's to blame for Tianqing's behavior. Wild boy, what did you do to make Tianqing like this? You are, come out, we're leaving. Okay, Ping Fan, I've had enough fun. What the hell is this? No way, how did this girl come out of Ji Tianqing? Are you sure she's a human? If she's not human, what the hell is she? Tianqing, what the hell is going on here? It's, it's, it's that woman. I was in the courtyard at the time, healing my wounds, when the woman who called herself a ghost appeared, used evil magic to take control of my body, and released Xiao Wei. We can't let these scumbags get away, patriarch, otherwise, our G family will never be at peace. Death to all evil spirits. You not only shattered the peace of my G family, but you also used your evil techniques here. I'll personally punish you. You're delusional. Just an old man like you? Sure enough, it's a crooked way to be able to combine the two formations into one. Do you think you can restrain me with this evil formation? You stupid old man, the goal is not to restrain you, it is only to restrain you for a short time. Don't mind him, let's go. You. Remember, if you don't like it, you can come to me for vengeance at any time, but only if you're willing to have the G family destroyed. This Chu Ping fan and that female ghost are simply too terrifying. Yes, you can clearly see the master of the G family's angry expression. A famous family like the G family can't stop even two juniors if this gets out. Sir, won't you look again? I expected Ping Fan to use all of his cards on this trip to the eastern region, but I had no idea the G family would be so useless. There's no need for that, you can see for yourself. Ding. Your ghost descendant, Hoor, has made a shocking move, and the name of the ghost has shocked the world, rewarding you with an upgrade of the Ying Dad principles. Finally a reward, good, good. Sir, a nine-star tower master, who was a heavenly realm cultivator, had secretly arrived in the southern region, but he did not give any orders. Should I control him or not? Huh? Came here secretly? Could it be that the person behind the scenes is aware of the recent changes in the Black Moon Tower? Use the power I gave you to control him first. No matter what the intentions of the person behind the scenes are, we will act first. Yes, sir. Sir, the Nine Star Tower Master is being controlled. That quick? Yes, he said that he came here this time to spy for the person behind the scenes, who was already on his way to the southern region. All right, I see. You should be busy with the communication talisman first. Yes, sir. Sienner, prepare two extra cups of tea. Are there any guests? Yeah, they're already here. Come in and sit down. Didn't you come to the southern region just to see me? What's your name, miss? Hey you. At the ninth level of the emperor realm, suffering from a hidden disease and still controlling the black moon house for several years, it seems that this woman is extraordinary. Your excellency, why did you chip away at my black moon house? Sit down and have a cup of tea first, it's good. And that friend who is on the fifth level of the deity realm, Please appear and join us for a chat. This young man looks so ordinary. How could he see through my concealment technique? He doesn't look like an ordinary person. I don't like hostility. What did you say? Grandpa, don't be rash. The grandfather protects the granddaughter as she controls the Black Moon house from behind the scenes. What an interesting combination. It seems that the story behind this should be very exciting. Hey Yu was born with a divine soul that was incomplete. She was one of the people who had good fortune in the Central Zone. She is a descendant of the Ji family, the Central Zone's human king family. 
she was despised because she was the illegitimate daughter of the current G family head. She had traveled to the northern region in search of a treasure to restore her soul. She then secretly controlled the Black Moon House and led it to rise. I see, she's the one who took over the Black Moon House, so it's obvious that she's a meticulous thinker and a woman of great luck, a descendant of the human king's family, huh? It looks like I've got a better executor for my heavenly Dao plan. We have all appeared at your request. Now, please answer my question. What is your plan for the Black Moon House? As far as I know, the Black Moon House was not built by you. It is true that I did not build it, but after I took over the Black Moon House, it became stronger and more complete than before, so the Black Moon House is mine. Really? Gee, hey you. What did you say? Who are you? Grandfather. You were born with a divine soul, but it's a pity that your divine soul is incomplete, which has caused you to stop at the ninth level of the Emperor Realm, unable to break through. And because of the incompleteness of your soul, your cultivation process is extremely difficult and painful. And if you forcefully break through to the Deity Realm, you may die, right? In this world, only us grandpa and granddaughter know about the incompleteness of the soul. Who is this mysterious young man? This person is too terrifying. It's as if he's seen through everything. What's he even doing? You came to the Northern Zone to take control of the Black Moon House, and your ultimate goal is to find a treasure that can restore your divine soul. By the way, I am curious. How did you discover that something was amiss in the Black Moon House? It's very simple. I naturally know how the Black Moon House operates. I am fully aware of the capabilities of each Tower Lord, so the sudden changes in the Black Moon House were very apparent to me, and I have an intuition that is different from ordinary people. Did your intuition tell you that the Black Moon House is about to change? I don't care about the current Black Moon House. I'm giving it to you. I just want to know your purpose for doing this, you were. Since you're already here, why don't you have a cup of tea first? You were, you, it's okay, grandfather. This tea. Thank you, sir, for this cup of tea. This tea just nourishes your soul. It is easy for me to restore your divine soul. What? A cup of tea can nourish the soul? And he can also restore her soul? Gee, hey, you begs master to help me restore my soul, and I will do my best to repay you. The restoration of the soul is easy, but I have a small request. He he. This expression, it can't be. Ahem, don't get me wrong, it's an official kowtow to the master. I, G -he -u -e, greet master. Yuera's intuit ion has always been accurate, and she has helped us overcome dangers and find treasures several times, so I'm sure she must have realized that her master is not a mere mortal through her intuition. Master. All right, good, get up quickly. Xiam Xing, come out and meet your seventh junior sister. Yes, master. Where did he come from? I have brothers. I greet the seventh sister. I am your fourth senior brother, Xiang Eleven. Greetings to the fourth brother. By the way, I prepared a little greeting gift for my junior sister. Here's a little puppet I made myself. Take it for protection. Thank you, fourth brother. You're welcome, it's nothing. Fourth senior brother gave me a puppet at the level of a heavenly realm. He's only at the emperor's realm and could make such a treasure. Wouldn't he be invincible in a battle with other emperor realm cultivators? Xiamxi's talent is so unbelievable, but as Yu's master, isn't he? Xiam Eleven, take care of your sister from now on, okay? Yes, master. Ding. You have accepted a disciple who is born with an innate divine soul. She is the best candidate to carry out the plan of the heavenly Tao, and you will be rewarded with the heavenly Tao scripture. Even the system thinks that Yuer is the best implementer of the heavenly Tao talisman plan, and it seems that her future is limitless. Yuer, since you are my disciple, as your teacher, I will naturally resolve the issue of your incomplete divine soul. Thank you, Master.
Dao fruit for the soul? Dao fruit, the legendary soul nourishing fruit. Looks like I've done the right thing. Go. This. Is this the effect of the soul nourishing Dao fruit? I feel like a strong vitality is pouring into my body. This feeling is simply amazing. With this fruit, I'm one step closer to my revenge. G family wait for me. How could this happen? You were, you were, what happened to her? You were, it's too much of a rush. She is desperately trying to absorb the Dao rhyme of Dao fruit, but her soul and body are weak and can't be replenished because her soul has been incomplete for too long. So what should I do? Sir, I... Don't worry, I can bring my disciple back to life, even if her body and soul are destroyed. Master, you are. With the master here, you don't need to panic. Master, thank you, master, for saving me. Thank you, senior, for saving you are's life. There's no need to be too polite. You are is my disciple, it's my duty as her master. You are. Please don't rush for a quick breakthrough from now on, you understand? Yes, this disciple will remember. All right, then you can go to the small world to cultivate hard. Yes, master. By now, Xiang Xing should have come out of this secret place. Mr. Zhang, you can also have a cup of tea. All right, all right, thank you, Sir Chu. This tea is so powerful. I've been stuck at the fifth level of the divine realm, but now there are signs of breaking through to the sixth level. Just a single cup of tea has such a miraculous effect, then the cultivation level of Sir Chu. Mr. Zhang, how is the tea? Thank you, Sir Chu, for the tea. I hope Sir Chu won't be offended by my rudeness. You're being polite. Right now, the Black Moon House is short of a leader, so I'd like to invite Mr. Zhang, Sir... This old man will head back to the Black Moon House and guard it for Sir. This old man is going. It seems that Mr. Zhang's temperament is not as impatient as before. Recently, Yue has been progressing very fast. Although her soul has not been fully completed, she is already on par with Xiang Xing and the others. She is worthy of being a descendant of the King of Humans. Oh? Another ancient ruin has appeared. It appears that the laws of heaven and earth are about to be restored in the southern state, and a war between the major forces is about to break out, but this time, with me, Chu Xian, in the southern state, I'll have the final say. Let's check on the condition of the disciples first. After all, I can't go out to join the battle. China, you have to train harder. Don't disappoint my expectations as your master. Buddha, don't do all that useless stuff. Just hurry up and cultivate. Chi Ning, how are you doing recently? Did you eat well? You. Ding. Your disciple, Wang Luo, received the inheritance of an ancient pill king. His heavenly void fire evolved and his fate was transformed. You have been rewarded with the fate Dao principle. Wang Luo, this kid is really a son of luck. This kind of heaven-defying reward as the fate Dao principle is triggered for me for his achievements. I now have six Dao principles in my body. It's simply a sin. Let's take a quick look at my dear disciple. Give it to me. Rise. Divine pill. Good. Wang Luo. I really wasn't wrong about you. With a cultivation level at the Emperor Realm, you have actually produced a divine pill. You really are a heavenly prodigy. This junior was able to accomplish such a feat thanks to the guidance of senior. No need to be modest, Wang Luo. Now you are one of the most powerful alchemists in the Nine Zones. I'm considered Ed one of the most powerful alchemists. To be honest, Wang Luo, your alchemy talent is superior to mine, so it's understandable that you refuse to acknowledge me as your master. Senior, don't get me wrong, I already have a master, no matter how talented I am, I will not betray my master. Do you already have a master? Yes, my master is perfect in everything, including alchemy, where he has attained an unrivaled level. Oh, this ancient alchemy king is still attempting to dupe my disciple. 
How dare you, a phantom image left over from the Dao Realm's fall, make that error in front of my system's son? Forget it, my legacy has been passed down anyway, and I've fulfilled my wish for this life. If you go to the central region in the future, give this letter to the master of the Heavenly Star Palace. If the Heavenly Star Palace is no longer there, then forget it. Senior, don't worry. I, Wang Luo, will definitely fulfill your request. Great, great. It seems that Wang Luo has to do a side mission. Let us not look at it for the time being, but rather comprehend the Tao of Luck that was just awarded. Tao of Luck, I'm coming. The Great Tao of Luck, open. Is this the Tao of Luck? It's like being in the clouds and stepping on clouds. Oh, the Chi Luck on my body resonates with the Chi Luck here. They automatically started to absorb the Chi Luck. Are the treasures automatically upgraded? But the system hasn't been provoked. This. Forget it, it doesn't matter, it has been strengthened anyway, it doesn't matter if there's no system alert. Huh? These cloud-like things under my foot are transparent. I can see something underneath. Why does the thing below look so familiar? The more you look at it, the more it looks like. Looks like. The Nine Regions. That's right, it's the Nine Regions. This great Tao of Luck is simply incredible, no wonder it appears to be in the air. This Tao seeks to rule over the entire Nine Regions, and the fortune of the entire Nine Regions rests at its feet. Without this Tao, the Nine Regions' luck will vanish, and without luck, all things will perish. If I master this Tao, I'll be truly invincible. Whiny. Huh? Why is there a beam of light? This light is coming from the northern zone of the southern region, as if it were coming from the war demon ancient land in the southern region. And, it's not one beam of light, it's five beams. These five light beams correspond to the five treasures of luck in the northern zone. Sir, it's time for dinner. Oh? I've only been on the great Tao path for a short time, and it's already dark in this world? Then let's take a break and then go over the other Tao principles I've learned later. If I can successfully combine them, I will be able to create my own unique Tao. I'm a little excited to think about it. If I succeed, I'll be famous for years to come. Master, Yuera is here to see you. Yuera wants to meet with me. Is it possible that there is an issue with her soul's restoration? Yuera, what's wrong? Is there something wrong with your soul again? No, Master, I've good news for you. Good news? Then, your soul must have been completed. Yes, Master, my soul is now complete, and I have a vague feeling that I'm about to break through. That's great, your Master was worried you were in trouble again. Congratulations. Thank you, Master. Now that you've recovered, your Master will entrust you with carrying out the Heavenly Tao Talisman plan. The Heavenly Tao Talisman Plan? Yes, this is Heavenly Tao Talisman, and it contains the contents of the Heavenly Tao Talisman Plan, so you should first understand it. This. This Heavenly Tao Talisman Scheme is simply too grand. How powerful is Master to devise and carry out such a scheme? Return to the Black Moon House to carry out the Heavenly Tao Talisman Plan, which is also intended to address the upcoming changes in the Nine Zones. Yes, don't worry, Master. I will carry out the plan well. I believe in your ability as your Master, so go, and if you don't understand anything or run into any difficulties, use the talisman to contact your Master. Yes, Master. One year later. Over the past year, even though I haven't completed the fusion of the Tao Principles, but through the continuous fusion and splitting of the Tao Principles, I have already touched the threshold of the second level of the Tao Realm, but I'm still far from breaking through. It's no surprise that, despite his comprehension being half a step into the fourth level of the Tao Realm, Ing Kong is still a long way from breaking through, even with Brother Long's guidance. Meow. Heavenly Spirit Cat, what's the matter? Are you hungry? Meow, meow, meow. You're going to break through, aren't you? Meow, meow, meow. Okay, okay, take these pills. 
Meow, meow, meow. Clattering, clattering, clattering. Spirit devouring flower? What's wrong with you? Clattering, clattering, clattering. Do you want to go to the Fengdu secret realm to cultivate? All right, I know you like the gloomy ghost energy there. Go to Fengdu to cultivate. Clattering. But one thing, don't devour the ghost race. They are all my people. Clattering, clattering, clattering. Master, the major forces of the Northern Zone have decided to hold a quota competition in the Southern region in a month's time. Many famous itinerant cultivators have already started making their way to the Southern region. Oh? The competition for the ancient war demon land quotas appears to have begun ahead of schedule. The restoration of the heaven and earth laws in the Southern region has accelerated again, and the restoration speed will continue to accelerate. It's almost time for everyone involved in the War Demon Ancient Land battle to make their debut. In the quota competition, although casual cultivators in the Emperor Realm can participate, the big forces in the Northern region have set checkpoints, and only those who break through the checkpoints are eligible to participate. Ren Chinghe is also planning to go to the Northern Zone. I don't know how well my disciples will perform, and I hope that they'll be able to trigger the system's rewards in the quarter competition. The battleground was set up in the grasslands of the southern region, far from human settlements and in the middle of a barren area. The southern region's three clans and three kingdoms built the arena for the battle, and the northern zone's superpowers stood behind them. The road to the southern region has been opened, and the first hurdle that normal cultivators will face is to pass through the road to the southern region. Southern region, if you can't even come to the southern region, what qualifications do you have to participate in the quota competition? All the major powers have placed strong people on the road to the southern region to stop the itinerant cultivators. Since there is a checkpoint, there are also rules. No one above the emperor's realm can make a move. As an itinerant cultivator, you should have some self-awareness. Not everyone can participate. Young man, you should leave. I won't make things difficult for you. Boy, are you not convinced? You're just an itinerant cultivator. You should know yourself better. Don't you know that 12 Emperor Realm itinerant cultivators have already fallen here? How old are you and how strong are you? Listen to me. I broke through the Emperor's Realm in 500 years, and it's been 3,000 years since then. I reached the ninth level of the Emperor's Realm, and I was once the proudest person of my generation. Huh, it took you 500 years to break through the Emperor Realm, and it took 3,000 years to reach the ninth level of the Emperor Realm. You are nothing but a waste. You are dead. Anyone else coming? Go. You managed to receive three strikes from me. You can be considered a real man. Good, it's a rare sight to see a strong man like you amongst the itinerant cultivators. If you can beat me, you'll be considered to have passed this hurdle. It's Xiao Ping from the Xiao family, one of the top geniuses of the Xiao family, the other party is probably going to stop here. More than that, Xiao Ping is cruel, if he loses, he'll die. Not necessarily, there must be a strong master backing him up. So what if he has an expert backing him up? Xiao Ping killing him won't break the rules. He has the support of the Xiao family. Would a mere itinerant cultivator expert dare to go against the Xiao family? Xiao Ping of the Xiao family? He's just a cocky, arrogant loser. Are you courting death? You, Xiao Ping, are narrow-minded. Didn't you come out here to kill me? Even if I beat you, you won't let me pass smoothly. You can't hide your thoughts from me. Go to hell. The slow vine's power of time. I want to hit Xiao Ping as hard as I can, destroy his state of mind, and crush his pride. Xiao Ping's strength is a bit weak. Not just weak, but very weak. I wonder if his huge reputation was given to him by the Xiao family? It's hard to say. I heard that the Xiao family is getting weaker and weaker from generation to generation. For the sake of their reputation, it's possible that they boasted about having a supreme talent. What are you all standing there for? Let's attack together. 
Are we really going to let him get through? Trash, killing you would make my spear dirty. The quota is for the five continents luck treasure, which is related to the luck of the ancient northern region, and it's also the focus of competition among the major powers. No matter who or which force gets the treasures, they'll have a strong rise. If you gather all the treasures of luck from the five continents, it is highly possible to rise up and ascend to the throne of the northern region king. The most important step of the Heavenly Way plan is that the treasures of luck from the five continents must belong to a person under me, and the first king in the northern region must also be my disciple. It is time to inform Qi Ning and allow him to make preparations. The overall situation in the southern region is about to change. Your disciple, Xiao Liang, single-handedly fought a hundred emperor realm experts with his spear. His battle intent is boiling, and he is transformed into a battle god. You have been rewarded with the Battle Dao Principle. He is deserving of being born with battle bones, heart, and spirit, and it is absurd for one person to fight hundred emperors alone. This combat power is already stronger than Ding Yu, right? Xiao Liang is trying to pass the checkpoint. Haha, <laughs> none of the Emperor Realm experts of the Western region can put up a fight. The Xiao family members are all trash. Young man, you're too arrogant. Shameless old trash. This kid is too monstrous. He has fought against a hundred Emperor Realm experts by himself and has consumed a lot of spiritual power, but he's exhausted himself and suffered a lot of injuries. And under such circumstances, this kid was actually able to block my attack. Arrogant brat, I can't let you live. What's the point of bullying a junior? There's an expert here. Save. A Heaven Realm expert guarded each passageway. The person who made that attack is stronger than me. And there's no trace of the other party. It is too terrifying. My own life is more important. In any case, the one who died was not a member of my own sect, much less my own junior. If he died, then so be it. I'm looking forward to Xiao Liang's performance in the quota competition and the battle for the Fate Supreme Treasure in the ancient war demon land. Receive the Battle Dao Principle. The news of Xiao Liang single-handedly fighting a hundred Emperor Realm experts and successfully passing through the passageway spread like wildfire throughout the Northern Zone. Master, the headline news publication of the Northern Zone you mentioned last time is almost ready for promotion. At least 50% of the cultivators in the Northern Zone possess a Heavenly Dao Talisman. And my plan for the next step is to charge for the Heavenly Dao Talismans, which is when cultivators develop a dependency on the news talismans and become addicted to reading the news every day. The Black Moon House will introduce monthly subscriptions, annual subscriptions, and so on. Only by paying the fees on time can they continue to receive the news publication. No wonder she is called Hey You. Her name really suits her methods. She has countless methods and operates using the mindset of a capitalist from my previous life. I'm going to follow up on your plan and make some suggestions for a complete system. For example, for certain hot news items, it will only display the headline and a brief excerpt, and if one wants to see the whole news article, they would have to pay an extra fee to purchase it. Of course, in order to make things easier for cultivators to pay, one doesn't have to go to the Black Moon House branch to pay the fee every time. One can sign up for a VIP package and pay an extra fee every month to see the full contents of the hot news items. Your clan can also take on the advertising business and broadcast messages for people. Whoever wants to be famous can go to the Black Moon House. You can charge according to the number of people they want the message broadcast to. The more people they want to broadcast to, the higher the fees. I've always thought that my business methods are cutthroat and that I was black-hearted enough to put profits first. Oh, oh, unexpectedly, compared to my master, I'm a completely good person. Master, do you think I should lower the pay of the members of the Black Moon House? Increase their working time and workload? Maybe I should tie their pay to the effectiveness of the branch's operations. 
For example, how many tasks and missions must they complete before receiving benefits and rewards? They will be punished if they do not complete the task or mission. And if a certain loss is caused, we can even deprive part of their cultivation as compensation for the Black Moon House, good heavens. Even capitalists will cry when they hear this. This is so damn cruel. I won't give her any more tips when it comes to the business world anymore, otherwise she's going to become a black-hearted female devil. Hey you, don't be black-hearted. If you treat your own people like this, will you still have feelings of loyalty in your heart? Everything should be done in moderation. You cannot be too excessive towards your own people. In one's life, you cannot lack the tenets of loyalty, compassion, and sympathy. This is part of the great Tao. Master's teachings are correct. Hey, you has gone astray. Learning from mistakes is good. Thank you for your guidance, Master. Hey, you knows what to do now. There must be a limit to everything. You should grasp it well on your own. Master, I understand. Fortunately, I've corrected her in time. Black Moon House The Black Moon House is too black-hearted. They charge a million low-grade spirit crystals to send messages to a million people. It is equivalent to one message per spirit stone. It is ridiculously expensive. I'll definitely be able to do it. I only need to fight 10 Emperor Realm experts alone, and I'll be able to make a name for myself. The pride of the XX sect broke through the southern region checkpoint alone and fought against 10 Emperor Realm cultivators alone. His strength is astonishing. He deserves to be the top tiered pride of the XX sect. I fought 12 Emperor Realm experts by myself. Why is there no news about me? Young man, don't try to delude yourself. Except for a one person fight against the 100 emperors, other information is of no great value. If you want to let others know, you will naturally have to pay a price. Our Black Moon Tower has always been known for reliable and truthful information. Now that we are launching this business, it is also for the consideration of the other geniuses. Don't think the price is expensive. You must know that the Mother Talisman is designed to convey a message, but it needs to consume a lot of spiritual crystals. Moreover, once you become famous, you'll also reap the sweet rewards. For example, what if your elders think that you're a promising talent and nurture you more? You'll definitely get something in return for your efforts, is it possible? Furthermore, what the Tower Lord said is correct. Being famous and displaying your talent and strength will undoubtedly increase your value, won't it? Send one, no, two million messages. Okay, no problem. Dear guest, take a look. Would you like the evaluation service as well? You know the reputation of our Black Moon Tower, and the genius who is reviewed by us can be valued even more. Look, do you want to activate this VIP package service so that you can get the most accurate and insider information as soon as we find it, including the confidential information of major forces and other heavens blessed persons? Bye, I'll buy them all. I feel like I've been tricked. Also, it seems I spent all my crystals. I'm no longer able to afford cultivation pills. Do you understand now? Sell it to people just like I showed you. Got it, Tower Lord. Xiao Liang fought a hundred emperors alone. He's too strong. I can do it too. I, Ding Yu, have no woman in my heart and am a genius who can kill gods with his sword. How can I lose to others? Ding Yu. I finally found you, Ding Yu. Are you that Han Ingming from the Floating Flower Pavilion? Can you do me a favor? I'd like to try once more to see how close I am to breaking through to the third level of Sword Dao. Again? I'm not the same person who could be thrown away. I'll show you the power of the Emperor's Realm Cultivators. Okay. What do you want me to do? Miss Han, you're so kind. I, Ding Yu, recognize you as a friend. Come on, try hanging on to me again. No problem. I'm going to make this guy scream for mercy. I'll make you scream and beg for mercy. 
Ding Yu's body is too powerful. I'm using the Emperor's realm strength. You can't pull out a sword and kill a god unless you have a woman in your heart. I understand. I'm only a half step away from completing the third stage of the Supreme Way of the Sword. After all, I, Ding Yu, am the one who wants to kill the gods. Master, I am on the verge of being able to draw my sword and slay a god without a woman in my heart. You. Thank you so much for your assistance, Miss Han. I've made another significant advancement in swordsmanship, and I'm also about to break through to fight against the hundred emperors alone. Ding you, I, ah. Uh, you bastard. Don't go. Look, there's another brat kid here. At first glance, he looks like an amateur cultivator. Even random cats and dogs are trying to break in these days. True, the truly capable amateur cultivators all have the assistance of a high-level expert. Yes, just like the one who fought a hundred emperor realm experts alone a few days ago, he had a heavenly realm expert behind him, so breaking into our Zhongzhou passage was just a matter of time. A brat kid like this, let alone someone breaking in, could be terrified if we say anything out loud. Humph, ridiculous. This guy is so amazing. Although the front blockers are all average cultivators, they are all at least 8th or 9th level Emperor Realm cultivators. Looks like he is another tough one. Is this the best you can do? Then I'll have the Black Moon House spread the word about this. Don't run, you bunch of cowards. I'll beat up a hundred of you. This kid is too arrogant. We must show him some moves. Does he think we from Jonjo or nothing? Arrogant boy, I want to see what you are capable of. It's Fairy Ling Yan of the Floating Flower Pavilion. They say that she's invincible under the ninth level of the Emperor Realm. This time, that kid is dead. Woman from the Floating Flower Pavilion? Leave. On account of Miss Han helping me, I won't beat up members of your Floating Flower Pavilion. How dare you? Take this palm attack. So troublesome. Just one strike. What kind of monstrous existence is this? No matter what kind of monster he is. If he dares to insult Zhongzhou, we can't let him go. Come on. Today. I, Ding Yu, will be your nightmare. Ding. Your disciple, Ding Yu, single-handedly fought against a hundred Emperor Realm experts. His torrent of ten thousand swords shook the northern zone. You have been rewarded with the Fish and Dao principle. Oh, that's amazing. Ding Yu also went to break through the checkpoint and fought against hundred Emperor Realm cultivators alone and didn't fall behind Xiao Liang. He's already mastered the torrent of ten thousand swords, a dominating sword art. Xiao Liang appears unable to suppress Ding Yu. Okay, as one would expect from his senior brother. Should I let Xiam Xing go for it too? With Xiam Xing's current strength, there is no problem in fighting hundred Emperor Realm experts alone with the help of his puppets. However, such a deliberate request might not trigger the system's rewards. I don't know if Wang Luo will make a breakthrough. Wang Luo's combat power is relatively weak. After all, his talent is in alchemy. Ping Fan is a powerful warrior, but his cultivation level is low, so I'm afraid he won't be able to break through the Hundred Emperor's Barrier. Is there someone whose strength is not weaker than mine? I cultivated the Limitless Battle Dao. There's no one in my realm who can match me. Could it be one of my brothers? This looks like Senior Brother Ding Yu. I feel that I have to make a breakthrough, although in terms of combat power, I am indeed not as good as my senior brother Ding Yu. However, it is far beyond the same realm cultivators, and the power of the Void Skyfire is enormous. I also refined special pills that have been fused with array formations and restrictions. Relying on these methods, it is not difficult to break through the checkpoint. It's time to go back, 
and it's time to release the array formation pills and restriction pills that have been created. I want the entire Wine Clan and Northern Region to know that I, Wine Luo, am a true Tao of alchemy genius, a peerless genius who has opened up a new Tao of alchemy. Alchemy is not just about refining medicinal pills. You know nothing about alchemy. Look at my formation and restriction pills. How can pills be used like this? How do you refine it? Your disciple, Wang Luo, shocked the northern zone with his Tao of Alchemy. You have been rewarded with the Fusion Tao Principle. These few disciples of my own are powerful enough, and my painstaking efforts to cultivate them were not in vain. Receiving the Fusion Tao Principle I am one step closer from creating a miniature version of the Great Tao. After comprehending the principles of fusion, you can integrate all the principles into a miniature version of the Great Tao. Fusing and splitting the Tao will become easier. Among my disciples, Xiaoliang, Dingyu, and Wang Luo had passed the checkpoint, and no more disciples broke through. Chu Pingfan's cultivation base is, after all, lower. If he also had a cultivation base of the ninth level of Emperor Realm, he could break through the checkpoint and shake the northern zone. With the speeding up of the restoration of the laws of heaven and earth, all parties have begun to play the game. The war demon ancient land involves the treasures of good luck of the five continents in the northern zone. Anyone who gets the news will definitely be tempted, and there must be other forces from outside the region involved. Breaking through the checkpoint to enter the southern region is the first hurdle that casual cultivators face. Only by winning a victory in the quota allocation battle can they obtain the quota to enter the ancient land of war demons. Xiaoliang, Dingyu, and Wang Luo won't participate in the elimination round. They can enter the war demon land whenever they want. Who would dare to stop them? This round will probably take several years before the geniuses of the various major factions would compete for the number of spots in the final round. Greetings, Master. Get up and let me introduce you to Xiang Eleven and Hey You. Greetings, brother. Greetings to my sister and brother. This is a large collection of treasures that I discovered in the Earth Spirit Clan secret realm. These few bottles of my pills will serve as a welcome gift. Thank you, brothers. We're family. You're welcome. The two senior brothers are not paying attention to me. Could it be that I am not pretty enough? But that's right. If he is easily attracted by beauty and fawns over me, then he isn't worthy to be my master's disciple and not worthy to be my senior brother. Master, there's a man who's very powerful. I feel like he's no weaker than me. That is your junior brother, Xiao Liang. What? It was our junior brother? Apart from you all, I have also taken in a few disciples outside. There are two registered disciples and one servant. You will meet them later. Has the master ever left the courtyard? Since he has been my teacher, I've never seen him leave the courtyard. Master is too powerful and mysterious. I have to practice hard, and I mustn't be caught up by my juniors. Since all of you are here, as your master, I will preach Tao to you. How much you can comprehend will depend on you. This is my first time preaching Tao since entering the Tao realm. In contrast to the past, what I'll preach about now is the Tao itself, which should provide you with direct insight into the true meaning of cultivation. Of course, Ding Yu and the others' cultivation levels are still low, so they are unable to comprehend the depths of what I'm preaching. But whatever they comprehend will be enough for them to reach the heavenly realm smoothly. I should take some time to gather my disciples and preach the Tao again, but this matter will have to wait until after the ancient war demon land. Xiao Liang has already arrived in the southern region. Let him come and pay his respects and get acquainted with Ding Yu and the others. No matter what, the precious fate treasure of the northern zone can't fall into the hands of others. Moreover, Qin Ying must have left a backstage plan for the fate treasure. Chu Yi, go and bring Xiao Liang here. There is also Du Yuan, who has just broken through to the heavenly realm, so it's time to meet him as well. Now that he has become my disciple, and his aptitude is not too bad, I should help him cultivate and make him a divine realm expert at the very least.
Master has asked me to bring you guys over. Who is your master? Your master. The honorable senior is really powerful. After a little bit of cultivation, I've become a heavenly realm expert, and reaching the divine realm is not impossible either. Who are you? What kind of expert is this? I have no power to resist at all. Divine Realm He is definitely a legendary Divine Realm expert. Master wants to see you. Honorable Senior? Master, I have brought them here. Shaolian pays his respects to Master. Do Yuan pays his respects to Master? Rise and sit down. Your brothers and sisters are still in the midst of enlightenment. Since you are here, I will preach the Tao to you as well. Thank you, Master. You guys sit and listen together. How much you can comprehend will depend entirely on you. Thank you, Senior. Thank you, Master. You guys should get to know each other a bit. Junior brother, come, let's spar. Okay. Little Dew is awake. Go ahead and break through. You won't disturb them. IDS, Master. I've broken through simply by listening to Honorable Senior preach the Tao, as one would expect from a super awesome big shot. She unexpectedly regained her physical body for a while, but it was a physical body condensed from the power of heaven and earth. Thirteenth brother, I should go back to the Chu family's ancestral residence to teach some of the Chu family's juniors how to cultivate. Go ahead. That is senior brother Buddha. He is quite special. His cultivation is already in the deity realm, but I don't know exactly which level. Going north, there is a gloomy valley, which is the valley of the ghost king, and the ghost king of Fengdu is also in the deity realm. Are all of the master's servants in the deity realm? Among all the servants, I am the most useless. If it was not for the word fate, my lord would never have accepted me. I must practice hard and strive to break through the deity realm as soon as possible. Who brought us here? He is a little more special. He was created by the master. We don't know the specific details. His name is Chu Yi, and he is at the ninth level of the deity realm. Master created it? How powerful is master to have created such an incomparably powerful existence? You will know more in the future. Come on, let's go to the trial secret realm to fight. The twenty-year period is approaching. What rewards will there be? Guiran joins the group chat. Hello everyone, I am Guiran, a great Dao black turtle who met Long Jun and was drawn into the group. I'll give everyone a little greeting gift. Click to receive, click to receive. Although the Dao aura obtained by the Origin Dao crystal is getting more and more, there's still some time before it'll undergo its next transformation. I am still at the first level of the Dao realm. I haven't accumulated enough foundation yet, and the Tao principles have yet to complete its transformation, but I am close to the second level of the Tao realm. I am waiting for an opportunity to use the heavenly Tao talisman to replace a portion of the original laws of heaven and earth. Then, I will slowly erode the laws of heaven and earth in the southern region and replace them with my own laws of heaven and earth and control everything in the southern region. Your ghost granddaughter Ewer has brought a hundred ghosts to pass the checkpoint. She has shocked countless experts and shocked the entire northern zone. You have been rewarded with the transformation Tao principle. Ewer brought a hundred ghosts to pass the checkpoint and have shocked the entire northern zone? I don't love her for nothing. Let's take a look at the eastern region's checkpoint. Why are you stopping me? A heavenly realm powerhouse in the eastern region checkpoint. Ling Jin, hand over your life. As I said before, I won't let you off even if I become a ghost. Help. Presumptuous. Brother, kill her quickly, kill her quickly. Ling Baiyun, you want to protect him? You can protect him for a while, but you can't protect him for the rest of his life. Why did you become a so-called ghost? I'm curious about ghosts. Why don't you come with me? Yes, Ling Baiyun. I am a powerful spirit who has simply come to seize his life. I strongly advise you not to meddle in my business. My ghost clan is not someone to mess with. I don't know if it's easy to trifle with them or not, 
but you have shocked the entire northern zone, and soon there will be strong people coming. I think they are all very interested in ghosts. The man who confronts the powerful expert in the heavenly realm is from the Yu family, right? Are your ghost clan related to Chu Ping Fan? I'll hold him back while you kill him. Sun Luo Ghost Domain Where to go? The female ghost in red was persecuted by Ling Jin, so she exploded her body and ran away. She happened to meet Yuer, who turned her into a fierce ghost and made her practice ghost clan skills. Tonight, Yuer had brought the ghost race back to the southern region and helped the red-clothed female ghost to take revenge. Thus, the matter of a hundred ghosts challenging the checkpoint happened. However, according to the current situation, someone powerful will soon arrive, and I'm afraid it's going to be bad for Ewer and the other ghosts. Go and bring Ewer back. Yes. Now that the ghost clan has appeared, it's time to show off their strength. Not good, the ghost race has fallen into a disadvantage. I can sense the aura of a heavenly realm expert approaching, I can't hold it anymore, I have to ask for help. What? We are the ghost race. Anyone who dies unjustly and whose divine soul is not destroyed can join our ghost race and transform into a ghost to take revenge. Transform into a ghost? As long as the soul is not destroyed, there is a chance of revenge. Itinerant cultivators, I want to join. The situation has been stabilized, so nothing should happen. But despite the huge commotion, no Divine Realm Expert appeared. Could it be that the Northern Zone does not have a Divine Realm Expert? Or is it because the ghost race led by Ewer was all formed from the souls of human cultivators, so they held back? This time, the ghost race has added more than a hundred members to their ranks, with a few talented ones as well. Bring all of them back to the Fengdu Secret Realm, teach them ghost race techniques, and strengthen them. Grandfather, I'm back. Ewer did a good job, adding new members to the ghost race. It was not in vain doting on Ewer. Let's make her the holy maiden of the ghost race. In terms of talent and potential, Ewer is much more capable than the Fengdu Ghost King. How could Ewer bear to leave Pingfan and come back alone? Grandfather, there's an old lady who pesters Fan Fan every day. Do you think I should turn her into a ghost? Fan Fan already said that he doesn't like the old lady, yet she still keeps coming over. She's too annoying. Moreover, I heard that she's engaged to be married, but for Fan Fan, she actually wants to break the marriage engagement. That fiancé of hers isn't simple either. He's very powerful. Before Fan Fan arrived at the Eastern Region, he was known as the number one genius of the Eastern Region. This feeling, the relationship between the three of them isn't quite right. Grandfather, is there any way for my ghostly possession to not affect you, baby, adversely? A ghost at the ninth level of the Emperor Realm, a person who isn't even an Emperor Realm cultivator, even if she suppresses her ghostly aura, it would still have a big impact on you, Bebe. You came back just for this matter? Not really. I wanted an elder to come with me to the eastern region to strengthen the ghost race, but I don't want to be ordered around by him. I understand, those heavenly realm ghost experts are all her elders, and if they follow her to the eastern region, Ewer would have to listen to their orders and has no autonomy. All right, I'll do as you wish. From today onward, Ewer is the holy maiden of the ghost race. Her status is not inferior to the ghost king, and she is not under the ghost king's jurisdiction. She carries the fate of the ghost race. This is the Holy Maiden's Bell. It can suppress, absorb, and control souls. None of the ghosts will dare to disobey her with it. Thank you, Grandfather. Greetings, Holy Maiden. Rise, you are welcome. You'll follow Ewer for now. Listen to her orders. Do you understand? Yes, Ghost Ancestor. Go back to the small world. Grandfather, is there any way to prevent you, Bebe, from being adversely affected? Why do you have to possess her? Isn't she obsessed with Fan Fan? She's also very beautiful. I enjoy controlling her body and playing with Fan Fan. It's very interesting. Also, that fiancé of hers is a little annoying. 
If I possess her to do the deed with Fan Fan, I can help her get rid of the marriage engagement and then later defeat that fiancé of hers. Then it would be great if she can follow Fan Fan in the future and be his old maid. I don't know what Chu Ping Fan is thinking, but why has he been resisting? I have been living in the house for so many years and I never leave the house. I can't keep up with the times. I'm getting old. Today's young people really know how to play. I have been living in the house for so many years and I never leave the house. I can't keep up with the times. I'm getting old. Today's young people really know how to play. She's too weak. She should at least be in the Emperor Realm. This pill can help her break through to the Emperor Realm quickly. I'll also teach you a minor technique. You can teach it to her. In the future, when you possess her body, there won't be any adverse effects in addition. I'll also pass on to you the more profound secret technique from the ancient netherworld scripture to enhance your ghost power. Thank you, Grandfather. Grandfather, I'm going back to the eastern region. Go ahead. Yu Beibei's fiancé is Ling Baiyun, who hailed from the Ling family of the eastern region. He is known as the number one genius of the eastern region. He is the son of the fate of the eastern region. Why? I should give it a try and transfer the fate of the eastern region to Chu Pingfan and make him become the son of the fate of the eastern region. As such, only the central region's son of fate will be left in the five northern zone regions, not under my control. The conflict between Ping Fan and Ling Baiyun has become inevitable. Comparing the two, Ling Baiyun is the son of luck in the eastern continent, so he has a natural advantage, while Ping Fan has the extreme Dao, and the Qi of the extreme Dao is so brutal that it is enough to counter Ling Baiyun. But in terms of realm, Ping Fan has just broken through the sixth level of the Emperor Realm, so he is naturally weaker than Ling Baiyun. Although he has various trump cards to protect himself, if he wants to completely crush him, there is still one key point missing, and that is Ewer. In that case, Rui, Rui, as I wish, I will transfer the fate of the Eastern Continent to Ping Fan. Although I don't have complete control over the state's fate, a gentle stir is enough for Ling Baiyun to drink a pot, he. He he he. Meow? You can't go to the Chu family. Why are you still so afraid, little fox? What exactly are we now? The man you're afraid of has only recently passed through the Emperor's realm. That's right. Does he and I look like we're just a bunch of losers? Xian Yuan Fong by Shao Kong. Let me say it again. I am no longer a little fox, the Chu family. Okay, okay, little fox. Please don't worry about our affairs anymore. Just wait for the good news here. See you soon, little fox. Well, it's hard to persuade a damn ghost. Meow? Right here, let's meet this mysterious man. By the way, third brother, have the three warriors that the Chu family sent to protect the eldest brother completely fallen? Shao Kong, you were severely wounded at that time and retreated to Baixing Mountain. You did not see the tragedy of their sacrifice. And not only the Chu family had fallen, but also the He and Zhao families as well. What about Big Brother? Don't worry, Big Brother is a great man. He won't make a mistake. Just wait for his return. Yes. In fact, I had to come to the Chu family today to see if this mysterious person was a member of the Chu family. After all, Great Qian has been seriously infiltrated by the enemy these days. If the mysterious man is not a member of the Chu family, execute him on the spot. Meow. Third brother, look, there is a white cat on the wall of the courtyard over there. It is very cute. How about catching it and giving it to the little fox? Don't give the little fox as a gift. Sixth sister should like it more. Just catch it and give it to her. That's fine. Huh? Where's the cat? It was right in front of us, wasn't it? Why has it suddenly disappeared? Strange. Third brother, don't move. It's on your shoulder. What? I'm so strong. Why can't I even detect the movement of a cat? What on earth is this cat? Does it move so fast? Or were we just careless and unprepared for this thing? 
Third brother, Shao Kong. Strike first to gain the upper hand. Do it. Meow. Oh. What? What? This time, the cat had some fun. Sienner, please put these pots containing fairy plants back into the small world. It's been three hours. Hasn't the heavenly spirit cat played enough yet? Ack. Meow meow, that's awesome. Brother, third brother, I think I saw my grandpa. Me too, I saw my own grave. Meow, 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 how does it feel? Youngsters, what is this cat lord saying? How do I know? Ask the little fox for help. The little fox? I'm afraid even the fox fairy's ancestors can't help us. Meow, meow. Lord Cat, what's this? Meow, meow, meow. Got it, got it. Lord Cat wants us to brush and fan it. Oh, that's right, third brother. Hurry up and use your hands more quickly. Yes. Lord Cat, what do you think? Is my fan strength okay? Lord Cat, do you think I combed you well? I didn't hurt you, did I? I? Meow, 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 not bad. Use the treats again. All right, all right. Yes, yes, yes. Who the hell is this cat lord? Even the fan it uses to fan itself is a treasure. Meow? Shao Kong, be serious. You're so rough, you can't treat Lord Cat's precious body like that. Yes, 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 third brother is right. I'll make more efforts so that Lord Cat. Poor fellas. The cat hasn't let them go after three days, so much for being a cat slave in a previous life. What? It's been three days, Ying Xiao Kong and Xian Yuan Fong haven't come back yet. Damn it. They're not even responding to my message. Yes, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, the Great Qian Dynasty is attacking, and they're closing in on our borders. What? Continue to use the communication talisman to contact Bai and Xian and tell them to return quickly. Don't send anyone to look for them in the Chu clan, otherwise, they'll be severely punished. Point zero, yes, Your Majesty. The Great Qin Dynasty is in danger. Sienner, go out and ask the Heavenly Spirit Cat to let them go. Don't be too playful. Yes, sir. Um? Is the ancient war demon land finally going to open? Have you arrived in the southern region, Olrin? The disciple have arrived in the northern zone and are heading towards the southern region. Very good. After arriving in the southern region, you go to the Black Moon Tower. I have arranged for someone to receive you. Don't expose your whereabout yet. Yes, the disciple receives the order. It is expected that Qi Ning will arrive in the southern region soon. In his last life, he suffered a bitter defeat, but in this life, under my protection, he will be able to get his revenge. Master, do you also feel the strange movement in the southern region? Yes, Master. The ancient land of war demons is about to open. This is an opportunity and also the beginning of a great change in the nine regions. Inside the ancient land of war demons, there are treasures of luck from the five continents in the northern zone. Whoever owns the treasure will have a chance to become the first human king of the northern zone. The human king of the northern zone? If I can get the position of the human king, the G family will be nothing compared to me. Wow, is the ancient land that amazing? Now we have some fun. This is a continuation of a plan from ancient times. It originated from a divine realm expert who wanted to lure the demon race into invading the southern region. At the crucial moment, he would come out to turn the tide and thereby earn the human king's position. Qin Ying, the emperor of the Qin dynasty at that time, realized this conspiracy and joined forces with the major forces in the northern zone to set up a plan and disintegrated the conspiracy of his. As a result, it has continued to this day. 
and you are all going to participate in this upcoming battle to refine yourselves and to make sure that the great treasures of luck don't fall into the hands of others. The human king's throne isn't all that important. Furthermore, with the impending great change of the nine zones, the throne of the human king is unsuitable for anyone. Master, I don't care about being a human king. I ding you, only have a sword in my heart. As long as my sword is strong enough, even a human king cannot stop me. This guy's obsession and dedication to swords are absolutely top-notch. Master, I, Wang Luo, am not a person who can be a human king. Master, unlike my two senior brothers, I just let everything happen as it is estimated. It's good that you all have your own ideas. Hey you, I know what you are thinking, but don't let anything limit you. Yes, I am a complete moron. How could I be perplexed by something like a human king? What is the significance of the position of human king in comparison to being in charge of the heavenly Tao talisman? Thank you, master, for this enlightenment. Good. By the way, the original great Qin emperor, Qin Ying, has been reincarnated and is about to return to the southern region. Is the master a deity? Do you even know that the great Qin Emperor was reincarnated and returned? He is now my in-name disciple. I once promised him that no one above the Emperor realm would interfere in the fight for the treasures of luck. Master, do you want us to help Junior Brother Qin Ying? He has his own plan. Whether you help or not is up to you. Besides, Qin Ying is very strong, not weaker than you. After hearing what the master said, I really want to meet this junior brother I have never met before. You are all my proud disciples, and you are all top-notch beings in the emperor's realm. Just make sure that the treasure of luck doesn't fall into the hands of outsiders. When the time comes, each of you will go on your own and show those so-called prides and celebrities of the northern zone what you're made of. Yes, master. Sister Yun, what are they doing? They are talking about the war demon ancient land. Really? No wonder Ding Yu and the others are so happy that they can finally go out and show off their talents, go out to play. Eh? Where is Sister Yuner? Brother 13, I also want to go to the war demon ancient land to have a look. 13th brother, please allow me to go. Yuner, you are free to go, but you must bring the heavenly spirit cat with you to protect yourself. All right. Thirteenth brother. I'm going to find the cat right now. Little white, little white, come out to play. Where did it run off today? Meow, meow, it's comfortable, Lord Cat, when will you let us go? Let's serve it first, don't provoke it for now, otherwise it will be pissed off again. Meow? Someone is calling me again. It's Miss Yuner, I need to hurry over there. I'm not going to play with these two guys anymore. It's not fun. Is Lord Cat really gone? The sacred treasure fan is also taken away? What's with the treasure fan? It's a good thing it didn't take our lives away. Ugh. What are you waiting for? The communication talismans are full of Little Fox's distress messages. Let's hurry back and help. Oh. Right, right, let's hurry up and go. Little White, stop making trouble and come out quickly. Meow. Oh, so you were here. Come here quickly. I have been looking for you for a long time. Meow. I can't go out without you. Thirteenth brother won't let me go out to play. I'm gonna take you to the war demon land in a while, and we're gonna go for a little ride there. Meow, meow. Come on, let's get going. Sienna, aren't you going? I'm not going. I'll stay here to accompany you, sir. All right, as you wish. Ding. You've been in the house for 20 years, and your heart is as stable as a mountain. You have been rewarded with a lump of chaotic energy. The reward finally came. Let's take a look at my 20-year award now. Chaotic energy originated from primal chaos. It can evolve Tao principles, fuse Tao principles, and them as well. Chaotic energy originated from primal chaos. It can evolve Tao principles, fuse Tao principles, and them as well. 
Not only did it speed up the cultivation of my indestructible chaos body, it also made my indestructible chaos body even more powerful. In addition, it allows me to fuse, refine, and even create new DAO principles more quickly. System, I love you. Sir, dinner is ready. He is ignoring me again. What is Master even doing inside the house? He doesn't even eat. I have a feeling that if I refine this primal chaotic energy, I'll be able to break through the second level of the Tao realm. Furthermore, my indestructible chaos body will be even more advanced, and most importantly, in the future, I will be able to fuse and separate my Tao principles as I please. So how far am I from invincibility? He he he, it's done. What's the matter with you this time, sir? You're tired of sitting at home? It's done. The energy of chaos is completely absorbed, the second level of the Tao realm has been completed, and the integration and dismantling of the Tao principles has been fully realized. The borders of the Great Qin Dynasty were invaded by an unknown powerful person from the Great Qin Palace, and it was in danger. Unknown strong person? Qin Ying. Where is he? You still haven't found out who's on the other side. No, your majesty. Who are you? State your name. Humph. Are you the female emperor of Qin? Let Qin Ying get out and see me. You are not worthy of that. Presumptuous. How fast? Oh, you blocked it? This guy is really strong. The blow just now made me activate the three-tailed guard, but I felt that he didn't even use his full strength. Not bad, not bad, a little trick. Humph. You are a small character, but you still want to meet the emperor? Then what if I have to see him? With this posture, could he be? Chen Ying. I, Chao Tianyi, am here. If you are a man, get out of here. Chao Tianyi. Nine Tails Guardian Fox. Get out. Jeez, you recognized me. Too late. Your Majesty, where are you? Your Majesty. Your Majesty. Since then, the Great Qin Empire has been a bunch of softies. Chao Tiani. What did you say? Too impudent. Kill him. A bunch of ants. Emperor Qin, where the hell are you? I. Am. Here. Bastard Chow. Your opponent will be me. Xian Yuan Fong. Did he succeed? Chow Tiani. Humph. This time, you can't run away. What's going on? I can't move. The one who used the sword lost. He he. Garbage will always be garbage. It's not funny to argue. If you have the ability, kill me. Okay, I'll fulfill your wish. Brother, little fox, I may have to take the first step. Third brother. I'm coming too. Shao Kong. This voice seems a bit familiar. Bastard Chao, don't be so arrogant. Mr. Bai is coming to meet you. Humph, Chao Chani, you are nothing more than rubbish. What? Is it a fake person? I thought you might surprise me, 
but it appears that the word rubbish is just a compliment to you. Third brother, let's fight. Xiao Kong, you on phone, we're here. Oh? Pang Xinghai from the Star Ocean Sect and Peng Chiguang from Qishan Alliance. Xiao Kong. You on phone, sorry, we're late. Peng Xinghai, Peng Chiguang. You aren't late at all. We haven't seen each other for so many years, but you haven't changed. Let's not reminisce about the old days, there's still chow to deal with. Have the rotten fish and shrimps finally gathered together? It saved me the trouble of searching for you one by one, and I will completely wipe you out today. Bastard Chow. Stop talking nonsense. Today is the day you die. Okay, let's dance. This Chow Chani is very strong. He is indeed very strong, even with one against four, he still has the upper hand. Well, I can't beat him, but he can't do anything to me. I can't beat him either, but I have a puppet. My two junior brothers are too modest. They have either forbidden pills, magical formations, or puppets at the level of heavenly soldiers. They are more than enough to deal with Chao Tiani. The senior brothers are all very strong, but with the help of the heavenly Tao technique taught by my master, I am able to suppress Chao Tiani with all my strength. I'd rather watch the excitement of such an intense battle. Meow, 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 Miss Yuner, I am here. Brother, wait for me. What? You buy long, this road is blocked. Who are you and why are you blocking me? Since your Yu family has made a choice, my Ling family will naturally respond. If that's the case, I'll show you what the pride of the eastern region can do. Huh? Why is someone fighting again? By the way, there have been recent rumors that Yu Bebe, the daughter of the Yu family, fell in love with someone else, and that the Yu family intends to break the marriage agreement, so, was it because of that abandoned child of the Ji family? Yes, I've heard about it too. Haha, <laughs> the southern region is so lively. Western Zone's northern region's heavenly saint sect, M.O. Hong Lu. Humph! What? Am I not welcome here? I was curious as to who it was. It turns out to be a heretic from the heavenly saint sect. You're courting death. It is common knowledge that heavenly saint sect members are a cross between the human and heavenly demon races. If you're not a bastard, then what are you? Die. The Divine Rome Demon Elder have appeared, Western Zone's Northern Region's Heavenly Saint Sect, a human faction with the bloodline of the Heavenly Demons. M.O. Hong Lu, if he was a pure-blooded Heavenly Demon, no matter what, he wouldn't be able to participate in the fight for the Fate Treasures, so he reincarnated to the Northern Region of the Western Zone and became the Holy Son of the Heavenly Saint Sect. So powerful. They're not normal people, and their strength can't be considered normal. The evil son is also a reincarnation of a divine realm expert, but he is different from Chao Tiani and the others. He is a reincarnation of a divine realm expert's divine soul. He had cut off and reincarnated. He wanted to reincarnate and obtain a supreme treasure to become stronger. Then, he would fuse his reincarnated body with his original body and break through to a higher realm. What a daring plan. They are... Oh, the divine realm experts that usually hide themselves are all showing themselves. It wouldn't be normal if there weren't any divine realm experts involved. After all, these are fate treasures that involve one zone and five regions. Judging from the current situation, Qin Ying's side is at a disadvantage. However, the other forces in the northern zone should be more biased toward Qin Ying. After all, they are dissatisfied with Chao Tiani for inviting the demon race to invade and scheming for the position of the human king. Do you think our junior brother Qin Ying is their opponent? That's hard to say. As far as I know, even at his peak, Qin Ying had not attained the divine realm. Even if the master accepted him as an in-name disciple, I'm afraid he won't be as powerful as the others. Should we lend a hand? It depends. Anyway, the fate treasure can only be ours. We can't let those fate treasures fall into the hands of others because Master must have a purpose for them. Are there any Divine Realm experts? Isn't Senior Zhang there? Whether there are Divine Realm experts or not, 
It doesn't affect us. Don't forget what Master said. Those above the Emperor Realm are not allowed to participate. With my soul puppet, who can compete with me? I will return here in three days. If Qin Ying is not here, then there is no need for the great Qin Dynasty to exist anymore. Big Brother, could something have really happened to him? Qin Ying didn't really have an accident, did he? Without him as our backbone, how can we fight up against Chao Tianyi? The great Qin Emperor won't let us down. If something really happens, my old friends will join forces with us. No matter what, we can't let that scoundrel Chao Tianyi obtain the fate treasures, especially the southern region's fate treasure. The Qishan Alliance will make a move. Who was the traitor back then? There were so many people who participated in the plan back then. Most of them are already dead. Apart from us, the others who came into contact with the core secrets of the plan have all died. Those who did not perish are the traitors who leaked the information back then. If the traitors didn't leak the news, how could we have ended up like this? The Swordmaster has already returned. Why don't we ask him to personally kill Chao Tianyi? That old ghost from the Great Qian Palace has also returned. There are also a few others in the same realm, so I can't take action. Greetings to the Sword Master. I hope Qin Ying is safe. Three days later. Haha, <laughs> I'll return in three days, and if Qin Ying doesn't appear, we'll have to discuss whether or not you guys meet the requirements to enter the ancient war demon land. Without our backbone, we are simply vulnerable. Master, where are you? Why haven't you returned? Who are you? Little Fox, you've grown up. Emperor, Emperor Qing? Lord, Master, is that you? Emperor, is that you? You. Yes, it's me. Emperor, you must avenge me. Where is the strong and broad imperial chest? Why is it so soft and elastic? It's over. What happened to my mighty emperor? Emperor, master, why did you fake toys with people? Then should I call you supreme sister from now on? No. You are now considered a descendant of me, Qin Ying. How can you call me sister? Keep calling me master. All right, master. It's so big. They can't even be compared to mine. Don't mess with me. Supreme Emperor, Master, Brother Xian Yuanfeng, and others cannot stop the scoundrel Chao. Why don't you show up? It's all because of that bastard Chao. The news of my return mustn't be leaked or told to anyone. If possible, I will act in secret. Uh-huh, Master, I understand. No one will be told. As to be expected from my Emperor. Even as a woman, his chest is bigger than mine. For the current situation in the southern region and the northern zone, there is a man named Chu Xian in the Chu family. Master, has Chu Zun died? Huh? Why do you ask? He is very powerful. I suspect that Chu Zun is also involved. Chu, he, and Zhao sacrificed their lives and souls back then to block a strike from Chao Tianyi for me. They are completely dead. It cannot be him. I'll go see him. I hope that it isn't one of Chao Tianyi's schemes. Xian Yuanfeng and Bai Xiao Kong went there, but the result was unknown. They refused to talk about it. Maybe they suffered a little? Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. Qin Ying's brothers are not bad, but Chao Tianyi is reincarnated as a divine realm powerhouse after all. I don't want to see Qin Ying yet. In case he asks me for a way to become a man again, how can I fool him? Chu Yi, go and send them away, yes, my lord. This place concerns the lord. Don't disturb him. My lord is, could it be? Exactly. Since the lord has made you a promise, he will keep it. Aside from that, I'd like to remind you that the lord has other disciples in the south. I didn't notice the appearance of that person just now, which shows that his strength is superior to mine. The entire Chu family was in sight, and no thing strange could be seen. Where was that person? 
the Luo family's top elders are aware of who Qinning is. He is a reincarnation, but he still possesses Luo family blood and is directly descended from the Luo family. Luo family ancestor Luo Ming. Once she rises, she'll definitely be able to ensure that the Luo family continues to be glorious or even go one step further. Nothing can happen to her, and Qi Ning also has a mysterious master. He is only at the fifth level of the divine realm. No matter what he wants to do, Namo Buddha can suppress him. We need to concentrate even more on the Heavenly Tao strategy because the ancient land of war demons is about to open. A new Heavenly Tao talisman must be created as the number of Tao principles grows and new regulations are conceived. A year later. The days were really hard. Chao Tiani came every now and then, the evil son and Mo Honglu also attacked twice. I was pressed down and beaten every time and my brother didn't appear, which made me feel more and more frustrated. Big brother might really have had an accident. What a nice couple, maybe that's what love is. Luo Xingbai, the second human king of the Eastern Zone. He has reached the 15th level of the Tao realm. He received the inheritance of the Kuan He and ascended to the throne of the. It turned out to be the Luo family's human king. Qin Ying's ancestor. The divine realm ancestor of the Luo family, who is still shrouded in the air outside the Chu family's domain, is also a descendant of Luo Xingbai. What a fate. Furthermore, Luo Xingbai is a disciple of Kuan He. If Luo Xingbai is the second human king of the Eastern Zone, was Kuan He the first? Let's see what the information about this beauty is. As expected of a human king, Luo Xingbai had a total of four Tao partners. The one in the pavilion should be the main wife, and also the one with the strongest cultivation. One of the Tao companions has attained the first level of the Tao realm, while the other two have already attained the pinnacle of the divine realm and are on the verge of entering the Tao realm. Their bodies also contain a very faint hint of Tao aura. Let's directly pull Luo Xingbai into the Great Tao Communication Group. Xingbai, what's wrong? I need to be alone for a while. Luo Xingbai joined the group chat. Please welcome our newest group member, Luo Xingbai, who has reached the 15th level of the Taoist realm. Luo Xingbai? The Eastern Zone's human king, Luo Xingbai? That's me. I'm Kuan He, you can be considered my disciple. Being able to enter the Great Tao Communication Group is your great fortune. Master Kuan He? That's me. Disciple Luo Xingbai pays his respects to Master. There's no need for formalities. Welcome to the group. He's actually fellow Taoist Kuan He's disciple? It's fate. It is his great fortune that he was able to meet fellow Taoist Chu. There's a newcomer. Call me Senior Huang Long and I'll give you a welcome gift. And me, Senior Gui Ran. Greetings, Senior Huang Long. If they are people respected by my master, then they are definitely experts worthy of my respect. Even after entering the Tao realm, I hadn't anticipated coming across such a fantastic opportunity. One is a time-related supreme treasure, and the other is a defensive supreme treasure. Luo Xingbai is indeed a human king. He is too clever. He has just obtained a treasure, and he immediately began to flatter them. Kid Luo, quickly greet your grandpa Mo too. Old demon, go away. The people in the great Tao communication group are all too powerful. All of them are Tao realm experts. Among them, a few of them are even Dao Yuan realm experts, they are legendary existences. And the group leader is even more mysterious. As the group leader, I'm a mysterious expert. It's not suitable for me to participate in the group, I can't mess around with the juniors or trick them, maybe I should create a smuff account. What kind of smuff account should I open? Of course it can't be too strong or too weak, at the very least, it can't be weaker than Ing Kong. Someone had to prop up the bottom ranks, after all. To cultivate, one must locate these Tao realm experts' hiding places. They are not active in the Nine Zones for whatever reason. This kind of persona was too difficult. How could someone who managed to cultivate to the Tao realm be a complete newbie? 
Sir, the kids of the Chu family don't even know what it's like outside Chu County. They've been locked up by the Chu family and haven't seen the world yet. That's right, I can create a smuff account with a super awesome background. However, he was locked up by an elder somewhere and has never seen the world. I've got it. Sir, what have you got? It's fine. Go play somewhere else. Don't pay attention to those little guys from the Chu family. The cultivation level is set to the sixth level of the Tao realm, which is a little stronger than Aang Kong's. What should his name be? He would be called Handsome Heaven Breaker. But Luo Xingbai has just joined the group today, and this smuff account's background is too magnificent, so I need to find another opportunity to add it into the group. The Luo family's divine realm ancestor, Luo Xingbai's descendants, maybe I can trick him into running errands for me. Where did that person come from? I can just pay him a visit. How terrifying. How could there be such a terrifying expert in this world? Even a peak divine realm expert would not be able to do something like this. In a moment's notice, he took me over. Don't be nervous. Which generation of Luo Xingbai's are you from? Luo Xingbai? From the tone of his voice, Luo Xingbai seems to be a junior to this expert. Senior, I am Luo Xingbai's fourth great-grandson, Luo Ming. Oh, so you are Luo Xingbai's great-grandson. Your cultivation is a little lacking. Luo Xingbai. In his eyes, my great-grandfather is just a little guy. He is definitely a super terrifying expert, and he knows my great-grandfather. This junior's talent is lacking, I'm ashamed. I can see that you're way worse than your great-grandfather. This senior's words are too straightforward. I remember that little guy Luo Xingbai back then. He was smart, sweet-tongued, and very efficient in handling matters. As his descendant, it is a pity that you haven't inherited many good traits. Maybe this will be my opportunity? Just a little guidance from this senior will be enough for me to break through to the seventh level of the deity realm, right? Where are Luo Xinbai's descendants? Where have they gone? They have broken through to the deity realm or higher. Senior, my ancestors and father are all above the seventh level of the deity realm. They entered the ancient zone a long time ago, and the younger generation has not seen them for a long time. Are you the only deity realm guy left in the Luo family to take care of things? That's not true. One of my uncles has also returned, and his cultivation is stronger than that of mine. He is at the eighth level of the deity realm. As expected of a human king's family, their strength and foundation are beyond imagination. Luo Xinbai, this little guy is living a very comfortable life, and he has three more children. Isn't that my great-grandfather and great-grandmother? This senior didn't lie to me. He really does know my great-grandpa. Do you want me to send a message to Luo Xinbai? I wouldn't dare to trouble you, senior. I'll give you some advice for the sake of the little guy Luo Xinbai. The nine regions are about to undergo major changes, and you must plan ahead of time. Senior, can you tell me a bit more? This is a secret of the heavens. Knowing it will not benefit you, Qin Ying has a fate with me and is my named disciple. Not only is he a bloodline of your Luo family, but he is also related to the little guy Luo Xingbai. He can lead the Luo family through great changes. You need to know that when great changes come, it is normal for the deity realm cultivators to fall. Only those with great luck can survive the great disaster. Qin Ying is extraordinary. Thank you for your guidance, senior. However, if you have any instructions for us, the Luo family will definitely complete it even if we have to go through the flames of hell. That's good. Take this. If anyone contacts you, you can try your best to help that person. Thank you, Senior. This pill is to help your cultivation. Thank you very much, Senior. Practice hard and go ahead. Yes, Senior. The Luo clan are bound to take off again. Following this incident, it has been decided that Qin Ying will be the next Luo family head. He won't get married anyway. Besides, I can use Qin Ying to get in touch with this senior. 
Black Moon Tower can use them to expand to the Eastern Zone after the incident in the War Demon Ancient Land. The Luo family's strength in the Eastern Zone is sufficient to allow Black Moon Tower to launch a series of plans. This will lay the groundwork for the implementation of the Heavenly Dao Talisman Plan in the Eastern Zone, and once the rules of Heaven and Earth in the Northern Region have been consumed, they will be replaced with the rules of Heavenly Dao, allowing the Eastern Zone to be consumed without difficulty. The Demon Zone has Demon Buddha, so it could be carried out there, and the Monster Zone had the Tiger Tai, so that won't be a big problem either. The key point is the Southern Region. As long as the plan can be implemented smoothly and quietly, then all future implementations will go smoothly. That battlefield is about to return from the spatial cracks. The ancient land of war demons is about to open. I don't know whose hands the treasure of luck will fall into. Beauty, how about coming to my great evil palace and enjoying yourself? Don't go, Beauty, which faction are you from? To receive the favor of my great evil palace is an honor for the faction behind you. There are so many people who aren't afraid of death. You are the evil son, right? Get out of here. Go to hell. He's the evil son. Who dares to fight him? It's not Chao Chani or Mo Hong Lu who has the strength to do so. I recognize him. He's the spear expert who challenged the hundred emperor realm experts alone. He doesn't look like that person. Nonsense, he changed his appearance when he challenged the checkpoint. This should be his true appearance. It's Xiao Liang from the Xiao family. Was Xiao Liang this powerful? How did the Xiao family end up parting with such a prodigy? Evil son, you're pretty average. Ha, huh, what's this about a prodigy who fought a hundred Emperor Realm experts alone? You're pretty average too. Let's decide the victor inside the ancient land. The evil son dares to harass Chu Yun, he's courting death. After so many years, through hard training in the secret realm of chance, the little evil king's strength has improved rapidly, and he has broken through to the ninth level of the Emperor Realm. He can't break through to the Honorable Realm for the time being. It's time to come out. He's Chu Yun's lackey, and Evil Sun is his enemy. Will the little evil king spare Evil Sun? There will be something funny to watch. Has the fake treasures of the ancient war demon land appeared? That's right, it's definitely the fake treasures. It is impossible for ordinary emperor weapons to emit this kind of light. Moreover, the fake treasures must have undergone a transformation after so many years of cultivation. They might even give birth to lower-level fate treasures. Even without the support of the position of human king, it seems that I can still break free from the shackles of my cultivation by relying on these fate treasures. Furthermore, I have once touched the boundary of that mysterious realm that is unheard of in the first place. Many years ago, I obtained by chance an incomplete scroll in the desolate ancient zone. From it, I learned that there was an even more mysterious and powerful realm above the deity realm. However, my cultivation had not yet reached the peak of the deity realm, so I could only learn from the incomplete scroll that if I possessed great fate, I would have the opportunity to reach that mysterious higher realm. For that reason, I quietly left the desolate ancient zone and returned to the northern zone. I secretly enticed the demon race to invade the northern zone, intending to rescue the northern zone's human race in times of great calamity and become the northern zone's first human king. By removing the threat posed by the demon race, I will be able to ascend to the throne of the northern region, benefit from the good fortune of the human race, and strive to reach that enigmatic higher realm. At that time, everything went smoothly. All of the deity realm experts of the nine zones were exploring the desolate ancient zone. I was invincible in the northern zone. Moreover, I had destroyed the great array connecting the zones, preventing human experts from the other zones from quickly reinforcing the northern zone. I thought everything was perfect, but then that guy showed up. The one who ruined my plan, Qin Ying. If Qin Ying is still alive, I'll crush his bones with my bare hands and scatter his ashes. Seeing Chao's vicious look, I know he's not holding his killing intent. Competing for the title of human king will not benefit me as a half-human, half-demon, but I'm determined to get the fate treasures. 
then it's time to clean up all the trash that's blocking my way. Third Brother The Supreme Fake Treasures will appear soon, and Big Brother. Shao Kong, don't say any more, no matter what, even if we die, we will never allow Chao Chani and the others to get what they want. Right. Then we will fight to death. Humph. What a joke. Since Qin Ying is dead, you'll bear the blame for blocking my way in the previous life. Mo Hong Lu, it's time for you to help. Since Qin Ying is dead, it's time to clean up his people. We'll men decide the victor between us after that. Heh, all right. Evil son, are you sure Chao Tiani and the others won't join forces to target you later? There's no need to try to rope me in. My great evil palace is also Qin Ying's enemy. Since you are from the great evil palace, you are an enemy of our Jiang family. Evil son, we will be your opponent. The Jiang family's twin experts. Have you chosen your side? Our Jiang family will only target the great evil palace. Humph. I hope so. And now. It's time to clean up the trash. It's just a fool's dream. M. Well, let's try and see. Xian Yuan Fong, can you use a little force? Bastard Chow, stop being so arrogant. Brother Yu, are you okay? It's okay. I can't die. You buy long. You're nothing more than rubbish. Where did the special skills go? Mo Han Lu, don't make any mistakes. Sixth Sister, even if Brother Qin dies. I, Hua Qianzi, will do my best to complete his plan. It's a fierce battle. Sir, I want to go and mess with the Su family. Oh, you can't hold it in any longer? Can you send a bald man to protect me, sir? That way, if I irritate the Su family or other forces in the area, I won't be afraid. All right, let the left Buddha accompany you. His cultivation of the eighth level of the divine realm is enough to deal with the Su family. Thanks, sir. Looks like it's time to go down and have some fun. A big event like this would be boring without me, Dan Sangzi. Is this the aura of Dan Sangzi? Huh. Yuan Fong, I, old Dan, am here to help. Good job, brother. What's going on at Yuan Feng's place? You. M. Xian Yuan Fong, I'm sorry, I only have one eldest brother, his name is Chao Chani. It turns out that you're a traitor. Dan Sangzi has always been my man. Ha ha ha. Their relationship is so messy. Ding Yu. Oh. Miss Han, can I help you? Can you help me stop Chao Chani? No problem, you helped me twice, we are friends now. Moreover, I've long been displeased with Chao Chani. But if you take action, you'll offend. Don't worry, I, Ding Yu, am not afraid of offending anyone. What's more, he's just an old loser. Two against one and a surprise attack, how shameful are you both? Damn boy. Say that again if you dare. The dog started barking without the master even saying a word, so why don't you do something about it? You. Hold on. Little brother, I really admire your arrogance, and I think you've done a great job of helping this trash, so if you're interested in coming to my side, I'd love to welcome you. Old trash, you're full of nonsense. I'll get rid of both you and your dog. If I don't beat you to death, I won't be ding you. You're courting death. Brother, don't worry, it's just a diversion. This is a diversion? Yes, he's clearly here to provoke us into attacking him with all our might so that the others can save the critically injured Xian Yuan Fong. Humph. In that case, let's kill Xian Yuan Fong first. And then kill that little bastard. All right, big brother. Xian Yuan Fong, you never expected you died like this before meeting Qin Ying. Traitor, you deserve to die. Don't worry about me. 
Go ahead and die in peace. How will come? This, just. You. Your. You are. Big. Brother. Ugh. Cheening? Is this cheening? Is this really cheening? My junior brother? But, this seems to be a junior sister. Bastard Chow. Dare to laugh again. What a sight. The great Qin Emperor, Qin Ying, has become like this? Bastard Chow. Shut up. Brother Qin. Bastard Chow, I'll kill you. Well, you have a nice voice, Sister Qin. Bastard Chow. Is there any more nonsense you have got left? Yes, but I see that you've developed quite a bit in this life. I'm in this state because of this bastard. If I don't kill him, I swear I won't be a human being. Despite the fact that this Qin Ying has transformed into a woman, I discovered in our recent fight that her strength is even greater than in her previous life. Brother Qin. My brother Qin. Qinzi? This Hua Qinzi has so much explosive power. Brother Qin, I thought you were gone. Do you know how heartbroken was I? We agreed that we will grow old together, so you can't. Huh? This doesn't feel right. How can my brother Ching's pectoral muscles be bigger than mine? Chinzi, I. No way, the Emperor of Great Qin has turned into a woman? It's true, take a closer look at her body and appearance. What kind of secret technique is this? Can it change gender? However, she is really pretty, he. Is the great Qin Emperor a woman? Junior brother becoming a junior sister? What on earth is going on? Old Lu, look, look. She's really pretty, he. She's like a fairy descending to earth. Incredibly beautiful. Who? Damn. Those bastards really deserve a beating. Big brother? Are you really the big brother? Lao Pang. Lao Ping. Bai Long. Xiao Kong. She's really Brother Qin. Who? She really is the big brother. Big brother. Yes, it's me. I'm back. You've suffered because of me. Brother. Wow, I want a hug too. Who doesn't want it? I want it too. Brother, this. It's all because of Chao Chani, that bastard. If I don't kill him, I'll never be a man. Chao Chani. Go to hell. That dog Chao, where's he? The surprise we received today was a bit huge. We have to adapt to it, otherwise, it will be easy to get distracted when confronting the female Qin Ying. Indeed, we should gradually adapt. Qin Ying's current impact on us is too high. Thinking about it, that man who was so powerful and no one was able to defeat him has now become a delicate and beautiful woman. It's really hard to think about it all. Exciting. Abnormally exciting. He he he. Pervert. Have you heard of it? The former emperor of Qin, Qin Ying, is back. Of course I've heard about it. Even the guy who buys cakes in front of my house knows about it. Really? Then have you heard that Qi Ning has turned into a woman? Is that possible? The emperor of Qi turned into a woman? How can I lie to you? Just because he became a woman, even the major forces didn't know how to fight and take sides. What does it matter if she's a man or a woman? You don't understand this, right? Qi Ning becomes a woman and they are afraid that her strength will decline because of that. But I've heard that his strength has increased, not decreased, and that he's killed the traitor Dan Sangzi with a single blow. That's why the major forces got completely confused and don't know who to bet on. In my opinion, they are all on the fence and will fall wherever the wind blows. In critical moments, a man can't rely on anyone except his close friends and sect masters. You don't understand this, right? Qin Ying becomes a woman and they are afraid that her strength will decline because of that. 
but I've heard that his strength has increased, not decreased, and that he's killed the traitor Dan Sangzi with a single blow. That's why the major forces get completely confused and don't know what to bet on. In my opinion, they are all on the fence and will fall wherever the wind blows. In critical moments, a man can't rely on anyone except his close friends and sect masters. Yes, that's the truth. Alas, I thought Qin Ying's return would cause a sensation, but I didn't expect it to be so sensational. Qin Ying is probably having a hard time, but she won't be too worried about Chao Chani because I'm on her side. The biggest problem she has now is how to become a man again. Brother Qin, how did you end up like this, Wu Wu? What do you want me to do? Wu Wu. Don't do this, I should still be able to become a man again. Really? Gonzi, please stop worrying about this issue. The top priority is to unite the forces which have grudges against Chao Tiani and expand our power in the battle for the treasure of luck. If I let you unify, the major events in Brother Chin's life won't be important? Is my happiness for the rest of my life not important? No, Sixth Sister, please listen to me first and don't beat me. No. I won't listen, I won't listen to you, asshole. Alas. What a sin. After so many days of cultivation, I'm now at the seventh level of the Emperor Realm. It's time to settle the grudge between me and Ling Baiyun. Southern Region. You might not be able to defeat him now, Ping Fan. After all, he is the Eastern Region's fated son, and his strength is far beyond that of an ordinary Heaven's Blessed. What's wrong with that? I still have you. Oh? Are you shy? No way. Let's hurry up and find Ling Baiyun. Elder Su, which side should we choose? It's too risky to take sides now. The return Qi Ning is indeed very strong, but behind Chao Tiani, there must be a Qian Empire extremely powerful deity realm expert backing him up. However, in terms of reasoning and principle, Qi Ying's side still has the upper hand. After saying so much, what are we going to do? All right, don't argue. Stay neutral for now. Elder Su, if we remain neutral, it means that we won't get any benefits from this battle for the fate treasures. That's right. If we don't get anything this time, we'll be too far behind the others. Elder Su, think twice before acting. So, what do you say? It seems that the ancient war demon land will be fully revealed soon. Humph. I don't care about the ancient war demon land. I only have eyes for the Su family. Sister Sienner, aren't you a member of the Su family? Why are you still targeting the Su family? Go and ask Wang Luo why he's targeting the Wang family instead. Oh, I see. When I'm strong enough, I'll definitely return to Xiang's family and get them. By the way... I discovered that I was expelled by the Wang family, senior brother Ding Yu was expelled by Nine Swords Mountain, and sister Su was forced to flee her marriage. From this point of view, it seems that all the disciples accepted by the master have one thing in common. Eh? When you put it that way, it is indeed true. Could it be that the old master has some kind of special hobby? He enjoys nurturing expelled disciples and assisting them in rising up and becoming strong, only to return and crush their enemies' dignity and slap their faces. That's a pretty far-fetched explanation, isn't it? It's because of great luck. Eh? Great luck? It's true that we have a lot in common. We've been expelled. We've been rejected. But above all, we've all been gifted with special talents, with special luck and we're gradually evolving into the sons of fortune of each region. Moreover, Master has mentioned more than once that the Nine Zones are about to undergo a great change, and we sons of fortune must have appeared in order to deal with these great changes in the Nine Zones. In other words, we're the main players in this great change? And Master is our guide? Yes, Master should also be. Come out. Meet me. It's Chao Tiani. He's back. Chining is here. Humph. Well done. Bastard Chao. How dare you come here and make trouble? 
Back then, for your own selfish desires, you betrayed the human race, you lured the demon race into invading the southern region and massacring the innocent human race. Such heinous crimes will not be tolerated in heaven and earth. Today, let me complete the mission of my previous life, to kill the evil and comfort the souls of the dead. Humph! Cheening, don't talk in such a grandiose way. You and I have been fighting for so many years, isn't it all to break through our cultivation and reach a higher realm? What will happen if we keep fighting? It's still a losing battle, isn't it? Bastard Chow! What are you trying to say? If you speak nonsense, I'll kill you. What I'm trying to say is, let's join forces. What? Cooperation? What is Chow Tiani thinking about? Why am I unable to see through it? Cooperation? Chow Tiani wants to cooperate with Qin Ying? Did Chow Tiani take the wrong medicine today? What is this, some kind of fantasy plot? Such breaking news will definitely be the hottest headline in the Black Moon Tower tomorrow. I'll quickly use my spiritual power to record a video to commemorate the occasion. Chow Tiani, you are so crazy. How can my senior brother cooperate with such a treacherous person like you? Get down here and die. Chow Tiani, don't be pretentious here. You and I will not rest until we're dead. It has to be said that Qin Ying's angry expression, coupled with his cute body, really has a unique charm. It's hard not to agree. Qin Ying, don't be so arbitrary. Why don't you and I put our old grudges aside and collaborate? Why don't you and I become a couple and compete for supremacy together now that you're a woman? Wouldn't that be lovely? What the hell did he say? This is too much, right? You've lost your mind? Brother, he. Young people nowadays are quite angry. Damn. He is a powerful person in the divine realm from the great Qian Palace. You intend to use divine realm power before entering the ancient land of war demons? It seems that Chao Tiani is going to completely break him up this time. Brother Qin, we you Chao Tiani. Qin Ying, since you don't want to go to the great Tao with me, disappear completely from this world. Yes, 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 he is a powerful person in the divine realm from the great Qian Palace. It's over, it's over, I'm afraid something big is going to happen this time. What are you looking at? Find a place to hide first. If the Divine Realm Expert takes action, those of us who are watching the excitement will either die or be disabled. Are all the people in the Great Qian Palace so shameless? The Divine Realm Cultivators cannot intervene in the battle for the treasure of luck in the ancient land of war demons. Are you trying to break the rules? Huh? What can you do if I break the rules? He is from the Great Qian Palace and is at the third level of the Deity Realm, and the other powerful person is at the first level of the Deity Realm. It's a problem. With just these little rookies, do you still want to start a war in the southern region? However, judging from the current situation, Chao Tiani's side is still slightly stronger. Two of them are in the third level of the Deity Realm, and one is in the first level of the Deity Realm. As for Qin Ying, only the old sword master of Nine Swords Mountain is at the third level of the Emperor's Realm, while the master of the Floating Flower Pavilion and the Yu family's patriarch is at the first level of the Emperor Realm. I just don't know what else Qin Ying's plan includes besides me. Humph! You human race traders are so treacherous. Qin Ying, there's no need to be so mean. What can you do to me now? Ignorance. The demon race elder is probably the one who is surnamed M.O. Ha! That was in my previous life. In this life, I am the holy son of the heavenly saint sect. The one over there was probably the southern region's evil lord back then. Yes and no. Qin Ying, actually, I admired you very much back then. However, a grudge is a grudge. You were chased out from the northern zone by me back then, but now, after all these years, you've reached the Divine Realm, right? But now that you've appeared at the Emperor Realm to compete for the treasure, you must have used some kind of secret technique. 
Chin Ng is really no ordinary person. People think that I'm a reincarnation, but in fact, I was reincarnated with a split soul, and this is just an Emperor Realm clone of my original body. Chin Ng, you've said so much, don't you just want to mock and condemn us from the standpoint of justice, but... Does it change the fact that today is the day you die? Even if you can gather some so-called righteous people, you can't stop me. It's like a mantis against a chariot. It's just a death wish. In that case, Grandfather, show yourself. I'm here. The master is here. Chao Tiani. You initially lured the demons into the country with the intent of causing harm to the human race. I, Luo Ming of the Luo family of the Eastern Zone, have come here to punish the evil and eliminate the evildoers. If any do not come to their senses and continue to follow Chao Chani, they will be considered traitors to the human race and will be killed. Chi Ning, is this your trump card? A mere fifth level of the divine realm, you want me to submit, I, Chao Chani? You ruined my plans in my previous life, and you still want to stop me in this life? This world is a world where strength speaks for itself, and I, Chao Tiani, am not lacking in strength. What can the human king's family do to me? The eighth level of the divine realm. Chao Tiani's divine body from back then. What secret technique did he rely on to maintain his original divine body's existence? Is this your real trump card? I'm here as well. Even M.O. Hong Lu. I, Chao Tiani, am determined to get the fake treasures. Chao Tiani, if you don't come to your senses, I, the Luo family, will issue the human king's order to join forces with the human king's families to eliminate you. Humph. The human king's order? I, Chao Tiani, am now the god of the southern region. Who dares to stand in my way? The longevity of the human king's families isn't only due to the blessings and inheritances of the human kings, it is also due to the tacit understanding between the human king's families. Even if a major force targeted a human king's family, they would not dare to dream of destroying it. Unless the human king's family has lost its righteousness and has become so infamous for its many wrongdoings, it will be possible to avoid being surrounded and killed by the great forces of the human race. Although the human king's families may produce deviant offspring who commit unscrupulous acts from time to time, they never allow it to affect the family. Every time they discover that, they hunt down and kill those evildoers. There is no one with bad character in the Luo family. Moreover, Chao Tiani once led the demons to invade, betrayed the human race, and took action against the Luo family of the human king, so they were completely warranted in issuing the human king's order. The Human King's Order? I have obtained Ed the most valuable treasure of Chi Luck, and Chi Luck has been added to my body. What harm can it cause me? How much influence can the Order of the Human King have on a Deity Realm expert? Indeed, the Human King's Order is usually only used to summon strong men to deal with demons or to fight against rebellion. Moreover, the deterrent effect against a deity realm expert is indeed relatively weak, especially when all the human kings have disappeared and the human race has been without a king for a long time. Brother Chow doesn't dare to take action against the Luo family, but I, M.O. Hong Lu, have no scruples. Even the human king's family can't intimidate Chow Tiani. How can we fight with him? I'm afraid we can't stand up to him even if we join forces. The gap is too big. It's time for Renchanga to appear. Since I promised Qin to win, I must fulfill my promise. Moreover, I'm the one with the greatest advantage when it comes to Emperor Realm cultivators. It is critical for the Heavenly Dao plan to be implemented quickly and for the rules of heaven and earth in the entire northern region to be quickly consumed, so luck treasures are extremely valuable. Once the rules of heaven and earth in the northern region are replaced, even if more powerful Dao realm experts attack, they can be suppressed by relying on the power of heavenly Dao rules in the entire northern region. In order to safely cultivate in the courtyard, it is necessary to extend my range of control and influence. Let Ren Chang have pass on my order. No one above the emperor realm can participate in the fight. 
In order to get Chao Tiani and the other deity realm experts to listen, I have to do something. On behalf of the eternal, immortal, handsome, unparalleled, mighty, virtuous, supreme and holy number one Tao master in the myriad realms, anyone above the emperor realm is forbidden to participate or interfere in the battle for the treasures of luck. Anyone who disobeys this order will be killed without mercy. Anyone who dares to disobey the master's orders will die. So what if the other party had 8th level divine realm bodies? Those were just bodies that existed due to a certain state. What is the holy number one Tao master? There are too many titles, right? What bullshit supreme and holy number one Tao master? If you want to interfere, just say so. There's no need to pretend to be so high and mighty. Old man, you are courting death. I thought that the first one to jump out would be Chao Tiani or Imo Hong Lu. Since the guy from Heavenly Saint Sect jumps out, I'll take action on him. No. As expected of a master, the slightest transgression of his name will result in disaster. Arrogant fool, how dare you offend the eternal, immortal, handsome, unparalleled, mighty, virtuous, supreme, and holy number one Tao master in the myriad realms. You summoned the wrath of the heavens. Who else dares to disobey? In the battle for the treasure of luck, those above the emperor realm are not allowed to participate or interfere, and those who violate it will die. Your two old bodies must not participate or interfere, otherwise they will be destroyed. It's too frightening. Is this the ultimate existence beyond the deity realm? Fortunately, he doesn't take sides, otherwise, how can we fight? Chaining has a backup plan, and we also have one. It's time to join forces. The enemy of my enemy is my friend, and we can work together. Above the Emperor Realm, no one is allowed to participate or interfere. Who has any objections? We have no objection. In this case, all the Deity Realm experts have to leave. Especially you two. If you dare to play tricks and borrow the power of your Deity Realm bodies, I will kill you. Those who haven't shown themselves don't need to show themselves either. If you dare to interfere secretly, be prepared to be killed without mercy. The pinnacle of the deity realm. Even above the deity realm? Those above the emperor realm must not step within a thousand miles of the Azura ancient land. Otherwise, they will be killed without mercy. Is this master's servant? It's too powerful. Don't let your senior down. I won't let the master down. Don't you think you can win the battle for the throne? Cousin, cousin, I'm here to lend you a hand. Why is he here? However, Zhu Yuan Bai is extremely powerful and can be of great assistance. Feng Xiaoqing greets everyone and greets Miss Luo. The northern region of the southern zone's human king's Feng family? That's right. Please forgive me for coming uninvited, Miss Luo. Are you going to help Qin Ying? No, no, Feng won't interfere in the grudges between the two of you. Got it. He's here to reap the benefits. Another member of the Human King's family? The reputation of the Human King's family is no longer very useful. The battle for treasures is always won or lost by one's own strength. My strength is average, but I also want to experience the strength of a human king's descendant. Feng's strength is average, and I'm embarrassed to be referred to as a descendant of a human king. This brother wields enormous power. Feng is embarrassed to admit that he isn't as good as you. So you're saying that the reputation of the Feng family's human king is not really what it is called? If you guys don't have the strength to back it up, then you should stop calling yourselves a human king's family. I think that this brother is tired of living. Fine, I'll fulfill your wish. Ha! Why bother? I don't like killing people. A powerful enemy. His strength is no weaker than mine. He is worthy of being the pride of the human king's family. Very strong. His flames are no weaker than my heavenly void flames. He is indeed very strong. 
However, when it comes to playing with fire, I won't lose to him. I'll be right here, waiting for the opening of the ancient war demon land. Scoundrel Chow, do you dare to fight me? Aren't you going to take revenge for having your plan foiled? I'm waiting for you. Good, good, I'd like to experience the power of the great Qin Emperor. Her physical body is so terrifying, not inferior to my god-slaying golden physique, but it's even more domineering. This doesn't seem to be one of the Luo family's secret techniques. What kind of technique is this? Was it something he cultivated in his previous life? No, in his previous life, his physique was special and he possessed the overlord physique. In this life, after being reincarnated as a woman, he should no longer be able to exude such a domineering aura. What a domineering aura. What kind of body tempering technique does Junior Brother Qin cultivate? This kind of body tempering technique suits Junior Sister Qin very well. It should be Junior Brother Qin. Senior Brother, he is now a woman. Of course, he is our Junior Sister. Junior Brother, you are wrong. We cultivators of the Supreme Way don't have women in our hearts. Since Junior Brother Qin was a man in his previous life, even if he has become a woman, he should still be treated as a man. If you treat him as a woman, this shows that you still have a desire for a woman in your heart. Senior Brother is right. It should be Junior Brother Qin. My comprehension of the Supreme Way is still insufficient. If no one will fight, I'll join hands with Brother Chow. Humph! If you're not capable enough, you brothers should come at me together. If you don't work together, you're worthless. Ha ha. Evil son, you deserve to die. You didn't expect me to be alive, did you, evil son? I've returned to exact my vengeance on you. It's you. Yes, it's me. Evil son, come here. What's this technique? How did he raise his strength so rapidly? Not only is the technique strange, the afterimage is even more difficult to tell the difference between real and fake. Damn. I'm a reincarnation of a deity realm expert. How can he suppress me? Why are there such large differences between people? See, this is not fair. After disappearing for a while, the little evil king actually became so powerful. But why do I have the impression that he is odd? Something appears to be wrong with him. In particular, that colorful robe he is wearing. His appearance is neither male nor female. It's too unusual. Could it be that he cultivated some strange technique that caused this? Damn it! She destroyed the golden fist. My cousin is so pretty. You can't say that about Big Brother. What nonsense. What? Chao Tiani, after all, was once a powerful deity, so his strength is naturally extraordinary. Are we going to help Big Brother? Help? I'd rather not let you down, but a fight of that level is beyond our capabilities. Let's look at the battle between the other two. Damn it! This needle is as fast as a ghost, and the attack is as bizarre as it looks. Polo. This person can be roped in. The enemy of our enemy is our friend. At the very least, he can help us deal with the great evil palace. It is indeed a rare combat power, but isn't it a little too crazy? But, does our big brother really need no help? Stop. It appears that for the time being, determining the winner between these two groups will be difficult. Then, if we help Big Brother secretly, he'll win, won't he? Look at that guy over there. Who is he? M.O. Hong Lu, a deity realm demon elder. His strength is unfathomable. He's been watching the battle between Big Brother and Chao Tiani. 
there are two possibilities. One is that he's observing the situation, looking for an alliance with the one who has a greater chance of winning. The second is that he's in league with Chao Tiani, looking for an opportunity. Either way, it's not good for us. So what we can do now is to protect Big Brother's back. As for the duel, let Big Brother settle it by himself. He, a descendant of the human king? As expected, someone from the outer zones was also present, in addition to M.O. Hong Lu. It's also another member of the human king's family. The Black Moon House's influence has not yet reached the southern zone. However, because Xiang Xing is from the southern zone's eastern region, he should have some knowledge of the Fong family. That's it. I shouldn't worry about these little details. Here's the Heavenly Dao Talisman. Increasing the number of principles of the Heavenly Dao Talisman is the key to winning the entire layout. Scoundrel Chow, I'll let you go today. In the future, I'll cut your head with my own hands. Humph. Let's see. It's not certain who will get rid of the other. It's just that you and I need to conserve our energy before the ancient war demon land opens. Humph. Little evil king. I'm already familiar with your moves. Despite the fact that I still don't know how to break it. However, you have no chance of winning. Damn. Damn it. Withdraw. Don't think that your plans will succeed. I will always keep an eye on you. Your Excellency. Please stay. I've taken the liberty to come here. May I have a word with you? Huh. Did he leave? How did it go? Did he say yes? With his current strength, he can't kill the evil son, so he should have no reason to refuse. Don't worry. We just need to protect our big brother. Damn it. Stop showing off. It seems that the opening of the war demon ancient land is getting closer and closer. Strike first to gain the upper hand. Let's seize a favorable position. Don't make rash decisions. We are not the only ones who are concerned about the treasures of antiquity. More forces must have arrived at this point. You family. Come out and fight. Humph. You are worthy of being called the Eastern Region's greatest pride, Ling Baiyun. You're really domineering. Stop talking nonsense. With your cultivation level, you are not qualified to compete with me. What if it's me? There's someone else. Who is he? Ling Baiyun, your opponent is me. Are you the abandoned son of the Ji family? The 16-year-old Emperor Realm Cultivator. Oh. Very good. Then let's fight. Why did Ping Fan come? Does he have a grudge with the Ling family? Don't worry, you are with him. Nothing will happen. How did he become enemies with Ling Baiyun? Yu Beibei, a member of the Yu family, is a bit different from Ping Fan. Um, how should I put it? It should be Yu Beibei and Yuer and Ping Fan. Between the three of them, anyway, it's not an ordinary relationship. And Yu Beibei used to be Ling Baiyun's fiancé, so what? How old is he? Does Ping Fan like that girl? Uh, I don't know if he likes her or not. Their relationship is a little messy. It's something even I don't understand. The nephew's filter is completely shattered. Is this still the little kid I know? Such a young Emperor Realm Cultivator. What's even more terrifying is his cultivation technique. Is that the legendary Extreme Dao? It should be. Why is there someone who can cultivate the Extreme Dao in the current nine zones? Moreover, it's such a young Emperor Realm Cultivator. I don't know. There was an Extreme Dao Cultivator in the Chaos Zone. What happened after that? He disappeared after killing a Deity Realm Expert. There are a lot of rumors, but I haven't heard any news about the Extreme Dao since then. It supposedly disappeared from the Nine Zones. 
Is that person really dead? It's hard to say. You're not sure either? Rumor has it that after entering the demon zone, there was no trace of him. At that time, I had just entered the heavenly realm. How could I know of those secrets back then? Who are you talking about? We are now allies, so shouldn't we be sharing information? It's about the last extreme Dao lunatic. Now that you've said it, why don't you speak more clearly? Ahem. Well, I'll tell you, it should be something that happened 500,000 years ago. 500,000 years ago? How long is the lifespan of a deity realm cultivator? There is no exact limit, as long as you know it must be far longer than 500,000 years. 500,000 years ago, that was the end of that incident. It probably happened a million years ago, or even earlier, so very few people know about it now. Since you remember clear, why don't you tell him instead? Who tells doesn't matter. Hurry up and say it already. What exactly happened? King Slayer. Slayer. That King Slayer incident shocked the nine zones at that time. An extreme Dao lunatic killed a human king, a monster king, and a demon king. Three kings. The three kings of the nine zones, three most powerful clans. Doesn't this mean he's defended every strong man in the nine zones? Someone who dares to do such a thing. How strong and confident must he be? It's not a big deal to offend all the powerful men in the nine zones. The true ramifications of this incident are that the absence of the three kings has resulted in the current state of the nine zones. This is simply something that only a lunatic would do. Yes. People at the time agreed, so they banded together to assassinate this lunatic. Extreme Dao was also considered a heresy and an evil art, and it was forbidden to practice. But now, an extreme Dao cultivator has reappeared. Then, he's practicing a forbidden art. Humph! Do you think anyone still cares about the ban that was imposed millions of years ago? Just like the three kings millions of years ago, who remembers them? So, we're united to gain the position of the human king. Now let's see if this extreme Dao cultivator will become the new lunatic. Damn it! Why do I feel like my power is not fully unleashed? It seems to be related to the woman behind him. It's the power of the ghost clan. They're helping him in secret. How else would he be able to fight me with such a difference in the realm? Damn it! Hmm, he can't suppress an enemy whose cultivation level is lower than him. It is equivalent to a defeat. Fulfill what I wish. Fulfill my will do as I wish. Take your time. Fate gradually shifts, one disappears and the other grows. Chu Pingfan will become the son of fortune in the eastern region sooner or later. Had I'm so sleepy. Let's stop here today. Let's go to bed. It seems that today's winner will be difficult to determine. I, too, am exhausted. I'm going to let you go today. Hey! Bastard! Cut the crap! Next time I'll make sure you don't leave alive. Junior! Please stay! We seem to have a common goal. Don't speak respectfully. No alliance. Hey! Don't you want to listen to the offer? It's a great deal. It's over. What do you think? It is indeed an extreme Dao cultivator, no doubt about it. But it's hard to say that he's not here to stop us from seizing the throne of the human king. But to be on the safe side, I think it's safer to focus on fighting for the treasures of luck first. Do you feel that? Yes, it started two days ago, and it has become more and more obvious today. Why is Ling Baiyun's fate weakening? I wonder if it has anything to do with the opening of the ancient war demon land. It's unlikely. If it's due to the ancient war demon land, it shouldn't only affect him. Then there's only one possibility. The extreme Dao? Yes. Ling Baiyun has never done anything but fight with Chu Pingfan. And the weakening of his fate also began in these last few days. 
In other words, the extreme Tao can steal the fate of others? At present, it seems that this is an extremely high possibility. Fighting against such an opponent, regardless of what the outcomes is, it would still be a loss. That explains the reason why that lunatic slaughtered the kings back then. There is no more direct way to seize fate than by killing the king. Alas! The ancient war demon land is about to open. And yet such a troublesome person isn't our ally. The ancient war demon land is opening again. The ancient war demon land is opening again. I'm in a good mood. I'll let you go for now. Bah. Two people against one and you have the nerve to say, you will let me go. Are you afraid of losing and being humiliated? Farewell. Your head will remain on your body for a few more days. He. One step closer to the completion of the plan. With the Heavenly Tao Talisman, I will control the entire southern state. When the Heavenly Tao Talisman has completely replaced the laws of heaven and earth in the southern state, no matter what realm one cultivation level is, they must all submit to my Tao laws. He, he. Why not try the effect of this talisman now? Let me think. Difficulty reduced by 1.5%, speed increased by 0.3%. This way, the genius cultivators would mature faster and has more vitality. It would be easier for cultivators to break through and improve their cultivation faster. More importantly, the flow of fate would be more at my disposal. Ha ha ha. It's spiritual energy. The spiritual energy is improving. Sure enough, it was not in vain. Only those who love to work hard will win. I thought this was the end of my life. I never thought I'd have such a great chance. It's spiritual energy. I feel it too. Indeed. Is it related to the restoration of the rules of the southern region? Strange. The nine zones should be connected. Recently, there have been frequent rays of light here, and the earthquakes have been felt constantly. I'm afraid it's due to the reappearance of the war demon ancient land. Perhaps this is because of the incomplete rules of heaven and earth in the southern region, so that fate changes only appear here. He, he Let me see what new discoveries there are. Oh? What is this, so red? Lake of blood. Although it is not strange, it is very strange. It's not surprising that there is a lake of blood in this place of murder. But after a thousand years, it has not dried up. This is very strange. This place is not fun to go to. But I did think of something very suitable, hee hee. Let's look at other things first. Corpse of a demon? The evil spirit of this blood lake can make the corpse move on its own. How terrifying. But it is a corpse after all. Even if it inherits the cultivation level of its original body during life, it will only reach the emperor realm at most. Four, five, six, there are a total of seven blood lakes, both large and small. I'm afraid the big variables in the battle for fate's treasures will occur in these seven locations. Oh, this is it. Well, I wish you all good luck. The rays of light have appeared again. Chu family, all of you. Follow my orders. Light rays appear frequently. It indicates that the most valuable treasure is about to appear. All Chu family members must work hard and seize the opportunity. Increase your cultivation as soon as possible. We'll obey the master's order. We'll obey the master's order. The southern region is about to change. I wonder what happened to Qin Ying. At this moment, I have to remain in the state of Qin. Damn it. This imperial power allows for a lot of freedom, but is also a cage. He, he The sun is shining. What nice weather. It's better to choose a day than to wait for it. Why not? Let's start now.
Here's my chance. I'm going to find out what happened in the ancient war demon land today. Law's replacement. Origin Dao Crystal. Come. Phew. The sun has emerged. It's finally starting to calm down. The most important step appears to have been completed. All I have to do now is wait for the heavenly Dao laws to be activated. I wonder what kind of reward the system will offer this time. It's gonna appear soon. Are you ready? Humph. Worry about yourself. Here is it. The ancient war demon land. Phew. Is it that exaggerated? 108 heavenly Dao laws. The replacement is almost finished. It's surprisingly smooth. It turns out that the master of the heavenly Tao is extremely powerful. But I can't do it right now. After all, I've only changed a portion of the laws of heaven and earth in the southern region. Only after all of the laws of heaven and earth in the southern state have been consumed and transformed into heavenly Tao laws will I be able to change everything in the southern state with a single thought. Receive. Ding. You have not left seclusion, but have substituted heavenly Tao laws for some of the southern region's heaven and earth laws. You have received the heaven-splitting brush as a reward. Heaven-splitting brush? Heaven-splitting and earth creation. Is it a treasure that is used in conjunction with the scripture of earth's creation? System. Let me check the rewards. The heaven-splitting brush draws out the heavens with a brush. It can draw the laws and all living things. It can open the heavens from nothingness and from primal chaos. Paired with the earth creation scripture, it can create a world and the living things within it. It's exactly what I expected. The brush creates the heavens, the book creates the earth, which means opening up a world and creating all living things. This is a treasure of creation. My plan can be implemented more perfectly. However, in order to support the creation of the world, I must be at least in the Tao Yuan realm, right? It has the potential to create the heavens from nothingness and primal chaos. Chaos. Where is it? Beyond the Great Tao, is there primal chaos? Is chaos part of the Great Tao? Is there chaos inside the Great Tao? I'm afraid even a Dao Yuan realm expert like Hong Yuan Chu might not know this. Did Huang Long and Gui Ran, who are creatures of the Great Dao, know about what is inside and beyond the Great Dao? To explore the Great Dao, one must reach the Dao Yuan realm. However, the speed of replacement is a bit slow and must be accelerated. The Ancient Land of War Demons The fate of the ancient southern region would serve as a catalyst. This will allow me to expedite the replacement process. At present, other than my disciples, only Chao Tiani, Mo Hong Lu, and Feng Xiaoqing are the most powerful participants in the competition for the greatest treasures of fate. The evil son is targeted by the little evil king, and his chances of obtaining the treasures are slim. Chao Tiani and Qianning each have their own trump cards, so it is hard to say who would win at the moment. And Ding Yu is the son of fate in the southern region and has an advantage. The same is true for Wang Luo and Xiao Liang. Chu Pingfan now controls half of the eastern region's fate and has an advantage. Yuer is from the Ghost Clan so she also has certain advantages. The chance of the five treasures falling into my hands is as high as 99%. The treasures of fate must be mine. How have the laws of heaven and earth ever been like this, as if they had emotions and intelligence? Could it be because the laws have just been reawakened? Humph. Chin Ng, let's see who will win on the battlefield. As you wish. Brothers, let's go. Evil son, with me present, you can forget about getting any treasures. 
Let's head in as well. Humph. Damn it. I should not have kept you alive in the first place. Come on. Let's fight again. I have no intention of resting. Should we move together or separately? If you move separately, our chances will be greater. With our strength, we're almost unmatched in the Emperor Realm. Even Wang Luo, who is slightly weaker, can handle Chao Chani and Mo Hong Lu. Xiang Xing is actually the most powerful. His Heavenly Realm soul puppet can crush any Emperor Realm cultivators. Chu Yuan is the weakest, but even so, she is still stronger than most Emperor Realm experts. Moreover, Chu Yun is holding the Heavenly Spirit Cat, which has reached the Deity Realm and currently is the most powerful creature present in the ancient War Demon Land. Chu Pingfan and Yuer are inseparable, so they aren't afraid of any Emperor Realm expert. Chu Pingfan also has a trump card to protect himself. Then let's split up. Wait a minute. Be careful with that Fong family member. He is not simple. It's fine as long as he's not a foe. What does it matter if he is? Whether he is a descendant of a human king or not, just kill him. Let's not waste more time. Let's go. Chu Yun. Sienner. Do you want to follow me or go alone? I'll be fine alone. I'll just take a look around. Okay, see you later. An Emperor Level Fate Treasure This Emperor Level Fate Treasure could help the Chu family's foundation. Put the treasure down. Since the treasure has chosen me, then it's mine. You guys can go find another treasure. You're courting death. I really don't want to kill you guys. Don't seek your own death. Stop talking nonsense. Seeing your brother, kill her. Xiao Bai, stop playing. People hiding behind the tree, come out too. He, he, we happen to be passing by. We don't mean to disturb you. Miss Chu Yun, goodbye. Boss, are you leaving now? The Emperor level weapon in her hand, shut up. Didn't you see what that cat could do? We're all in this together. It's too terrifying. Let's withdraw. Fortune. Not bad. Some obtain inheritance. That's also pretty good. Oops. That's, after all, this is the ancient land of war demons, so there are still risks. This group of people? Ah. Oh. Are they attacking each other recklessly? Have they lost their minds? The Blood Lake. So that's it. They must have devoured the chi and the blood essence of the Blood Lake and suffered backlash as a result. He, Not a bad idea. But the performance is still not well thought out. I'd better take this Blood Lake essence. Spirit Devouring Flower. Go for it. After devouring the Blood Lake, you'll have no problem breaking through to the Deity Realm. Take it easy. After all, the battle for the Fate Treasures cannot be won in a matter of days. Kill him. Kill. What? I can't believe he's still unscathed. Even Emperor-level weapons and artifacts couldn't harm him, could they? That is impossible. Uh. Humph. Mind your own business. Don't waste time. It's better to be careful here. Humph. Even the Emperor level weapons and artifacts can't damage my armor. What can these weak people do to me? Just take care of yourself. Don't drag everyone down. With me here, you'll never get the fate treasure. Stop wasting your time. 
Everyone's ability is all that matters when it comes to obtaining the fake treasure. It's impossible for a fake treasure to fall into the hands of a criminal like you. Wouldn't it mean that all the world would be ruined? What? What is this weird thing? Farewell. Damn it. You lonely soul, obey my orders. Forget about it all. Cut off the remnants of your previous life, let go of your obsessions, and reincarnate as a ghost. How can this work? What kind of trick is that? This is a remnant soul, lingering in the world because of a grudge from his previous life. As long as its obsession is suppressed, it will be harmless. The remnant soul will be reborn as a ghost once the obsession is resolved. There will be no harmful obsessions if there is no memory of the past. There are many such souls in the ancient land of the war demons, and with the fierce energy in this place, they will become violent. I'm not sure what kind of evil it is, so the best thing to do is leave. He's scared. It seems that Bai Ling Yun's identity as the son of fate in the eastern region has come to an end. Rui Rui, follow my will, quickly manifest. Transfer of fate, two times faster. Humph. I'm sorry, gentlemen. Our Su family will take the emperor level fate treasure. If it weren't for Su Sienner, that scum of the family. The treasure wouldn't be, oh. Forget it. My Su family now possesses the emperor level fate treasure once more, hee <laughs> hee. Our Su family's fate appears to be far from over. Who's there? How dare you go against my Su family? Su Sienner, it's you. What are you trying to do? Trying to cause destruction. Su Xuanha, I didn't expect that. However, you are not qualified to talk to me. Let my whip speak to you. So strange. Is this Su Sienner's strength? Her strength is now no less than that of Chao Tiani. There is no way I can match her. Slow down. Wait. Wait. No matter what you say, Sienner, I am still your brother. Brother? Since when have you treated me as your sister? If there was a single member in the Sioux family who could tolerate me, I wouldn't have run away from home. My good sister, you are familiar with our family's elders. I've always loved my sister, but I was scared to show it. In fact, I've always told the clan elders that Sienner has extraordinary qualities and will undoubtedly achieve great things in the future. Sister, that's an emperor-level fate treasure. You're still a member of the Sioux family. You wouldn't disregard the safety of the Sioux family, would you? And with your current strength, if you return to the Sioux family, there is no way the elders would not treat you well. Bah! The moment I stepped out of the Sioux family's door, I was no longer a member of the Sioux family. Also, I didn't find you for the Emperor Level Fate Treasure. I don't care what happens to the Emperor Level Fate Treasure. You can have it if you want. I don't care. I'm just here to vent my anger on my enemies. Do you get it? You, you, you. If you're not concerned about your blood family, you can go ahead and beat me to death today. All right. Ah. Ice cold force. If this continues, I'll freeze to death if not beaten to death. Ah. Ah. It burns. Ice fire dual whip. Ah. Mom. Help. Huff huff. It's just a pain in the flesh. As long as the emperor level fake treasure is still there. Goodbye. What? Su Sienner, you didn't keep your word. Did I promise to give it to you? Furthermore, can the Su family speak of credibility with me? 
Your maidservant, Sue Sienner, whipped a heaven's blessed and created the ice and fire dual whip technique. You have been rewarded with the ice and fire Dao principles. Sue Sienner, my maid, she triggered a system reward for her contribution. She whipped a heaven's blessed and created the ice and fire dual whip technique. She is quite capable. The heaven's blessed that was whipped, as expected, is Sue Shwana from the Sue family, right? System, receive the reward. Ice and Fire Dao Principles, Fuse. Very good. This adds two more Dao Principles. It is becoming more and more perfect. Good luck, everyone in Ancient War Demon Land. You are. Your ability is incredible. This place was created just for you. He, he I saw many masters die unexpectedly along the way. How miserable. Yeah. We have to be careful, too. Where's that bastard Chow Chani? He obviously came this way. Bastard. Huh. Chi Ning, you should have stopped me from coming here. I know you still you have your own trump cards, but do you think that your trump cards can be compared to mine? If you have any trump cards, just use them now. Here we go. Mo Hong Lu, it was you who colluded with the demon race and reached an ulterior agreement. Now the situation is clear, you and Chao Chani are in the same group. That was all in the past. Does it matter? Back then, there was indeed a deity realm expert who died. We killed him. Killed a deity realm expert. You are enemies of the human race. Why does it have to be a human? If he wasn't a human, would you want to say that you are the great heroes who fight the demons? There are not only two races in this world, humans and demons. Could it be? Earth spirit? Chining, I, Chao Chani, actually admire you. However, your cultivation and your horizons are limited. I, Chao Chani, am a strong person in the deity realm. You plotted against me once and secretly planned and planned to block my way. It was considered a success, but how did you know that I, Chao Chani, had no plan? The fake treasures will ultimately be mine. What if I don't get the position of the human king? My old body will fuse with my current body, and I'll break through again. Your reliance on the human king's family means nothing to me. I, Chi Ning, have many enemies, and many talented people have died in my hands. However, the one I despise the most, the one I look down on the most, is you, Chao Chani. So what if you're a deity realm expert? You sacrificed the lives of fellow humans in an attempt to break through the bottleneck. No matter how strong you are or how high your cultivation level is, in my eyes, you are nothing but trash. Haha, ha, the great Qin Emperor is indeed arrogant. No wonder you dared to plot against me. The deity's blood will guide me. The divine blood will guide me. Fate treasures will be mine. Brother, it's divine blood. What are your plans? You must pass through me first. Ha ha ha. Come. What? Humph. Dao Weapon Imprint. You left a wisp of your Dao Weapon's aura on the fake treasures. Humph. It seems you're not too stupid. You know that a treasure with a smidgen of a Dao Weapon's aura will eventually recognize its owner. So put an end to the fighting. Stop talking nonsense. Recognition is a matter of refinement. It has nothing to do with the aura imprint. Do you think I'm a three-year-old child? Humph. You're too stubborn. Let's see who's stronger. Damn it. Galaxy. It is deserving of the title of Nine Swords Mountain's ultimate technique. It's extremely powerful. However, it consumes a lot of energy. How are you going to deal with my next move? 
Humph. Unfortunately, as you said, this technique has rendered me powerless for the moment. But, unlike you, I'm not helpless. I. Cough. What a small trick. That's the end of it. Your time of death has come. What? We're also here. It's not the time to die. Sorry. I underestimated the enemy. Looks like it's time to get serious. Come on. Ah. Humph. It's just useless resistance. I believe you also know how big the gap in our cultivation is. Bastard Chow, let's decide the victor today. What's it? Is it a treasure? That's right. That's a treasure. So we should take action? No. This place is brimming with first-class experts. We must wait. We wait for them to consume each other. Damn. Their battle is completely out of my hands. I'll see what I can do to help the other side. Suitable moment. I just need a chance now. Brother, when will it be finished? There's no rush. Even if we go out now, do you think we have a chance of winning? How about? What? Humph. Let's clean up the battlefield first. Don't worry. It's your turn next. Warm-up is over. Let's get down to business. Humph. Well, that's one of the rare times we agree on something. Humph. I can't believe I actually got hurt. That's commendable. No matter what, I'm still a reincarnated deity realm expert. All of you are no match for me. And the enemy your big brother is facing now is the same. Ah. Stop. Right now. One sword technique. What? You on phone. Not bad. If I hadn't dodged in time, I'd have been on my way to hell. It's a pity you couldn't achieve what you wanted after all. But once you use this move, it will be difficult for you to make another. And I still have endless power. You on phone. You on phone. Are you all right? You on phone. Ha ha ha. This substitution secret technique was originally meant to block your fatal attack. I didn't expect to use it this early. Fine. The sooner our life or death battle. The sooner we're done with this. This time, I'll make sure. To take blood for blood. Come on. I'll kill you and the treasure will be mine sooner or later. I won't be distracted to get it. From now on, I will do my best. Hee hee. Thank you for your advice. Huh. Don't even think about it. Divine Soul Strike. Cousin. You concentrate on dealing with him. I will take care of the treasure. Get back quickly. The soul attack is not something you can resist. Get back? Isn't it still too late? Divine soul strike. What? How can you block the divine soul? Immovable mountain? I didn't expect it. 
The immovable mountain technique is so powerful. It's our turn. Hurry. Now. Done. How dare you? Senior. You have been trying to grab it for a long time. You still haven't touched the treasure. It seems that the treasure is still destined for us. Don't force yourself. Lao M.O. Someone is robbing the fish. Where did you come from? Damn. Chao Tiani. Don't forget your opponent is me. What do you mean? You're going to let them take the treasure? Humph. As long as you don't get it, I don't care. Damn. Every one of them is against me. Then come on. Hey. I'm not afraid of you. Huh? When? Heavenly Dao Laws. What? My power. These people. What kind of terrifying techniques is those? What is this technique? It can actually make me lose my strength in an instant. It wouldn't hurt to tell you. This is Heavenly Dao Laws. I'll deal with her. You deal with the one with the sword. Finally, no more meddling. It's time to try out my newly acquired treasure. You're still a baby. Do you know who you're talking to? Old thief. Have you forgotten your situation? Damn it. That bastard is still alive. I'm still unable to take action. What's the use of me getting this treasure? Hand over the treasure quickly. Xiao Liang. Take the treasure. He he. Everyone wants this treasure, and I, Feng Xiaoqing, also want a share of it. Where did you come from? Humph. If I'm not mistaken, you have just joined this battle. The competition for the fake treasure depends on everyone's ability. There's no such thing as first come, first served. It seems that I'll have to take action. Exactly. This thing. Its strength is comparable to the peak of the heavenly realm? As expected of a descendant of a human king's family. You have such a treasure. Humph. Isn't it too late to be scared now? Humph. If I was scared, I wouldn't have come to this place. What the hell? Xiao Liang. Hey you. Ding you. Retreat. Here comes another one. I'll kill you all. What? My secret treasure. Now the treasure is in my hands. He he. And I have a ghost army. Damn. A cook duck. Does anyone else have any objections to the outcome of the competition for the treasure? Huh. Oh. Divine blood. Restriction pill. Refining furnace. What? Do you want to keep all the treasures for yourself? Did we steal it from you? It belongs to us. Damn. Since that's the case, let's burn together. What? Tainted blood. Hey you, what the hell is this? It seems to be growing. Humph. Not bad. You know about the tainted blood. I have only read about it in ancient books. Legend has it that it was formed from the blood essence of countless fallen deity realm experts who were unwilling to die, which carries resentment and anger towards fate. That's why the resentment is so great. Once corruption begins, there's no way to stop it. Bastard. Then we can't stop that? Yes. That's why he said he'd burn everything. Let's get out of here. The erosion is growing. He he. What about it? There is no winner in this game. Let's call it a draw. Senior Chow. It's too early to make a final conclusion now. Sienner. When did you come? I've always been there. This is not the point. What I want to say is that tainted blood can be solved directly. 
Could it be that master? Has an idea? There's no need to bother, sir. Look up to the sky. Humph. I don't know what this weird thing is. But I've never heard of anything that can cure tainted blood. Humph. It's called the spirit devouring flower. It feeds exclusively on the filthy and violent things in the world. It has a big appetite. You haven't heard of it just because you are ignorant. This. It just ate them like that? Is there really such a purifying ability? That's so weird. Impossible. Absolutely impossible. This is the forbidden blood refined in the desolate ancient zone. If I get this flower, I'll be immune to all poisons in the future. Little plant. Come with me. Follow your master quickly. Hey. Humph. This is no longer a power we can comprehend. The treasure is yours. Farewell. Scoundrel Chow. Don't even think about escaping. Brother. They ran away. Let's chase them. No need. We've achieved our goal by preventing Scoundrel Chow and his men from getting their hands on the treasure. You've all worked hard. Let's go home and recuperate. They're all gone. What should we do now? Let's find the rest of the treasures. Then return back and report to Master. Let's go. Few days later, wow. You're back so soon. Master, all the treasures from the five regions are here. Pod. Great. This way I can improve the fate of the Northern Zone. Prepare to break through. Yes. Master. Thirteenth Uncle, I. If you want to go to the Eastern Region, go. Ah, uh, Thirteenth Uncle, it turns out you know all about it. There's nothing left for you in the Chu family. Thirteenth Uncle, I will come back to see you often. Should I call you Big Brother? I don't deserve it. My qualifications are poor. I'm just a registered disciple of the Master. Then, Senior Brother, there is no need to be humble. I am also a registered disciple. Dare I ask my Senior Brother for his surname? My last name is Rin and my first name is Changha. Rin Changha, the Celestial Master Rin Changha? Yes. That's me. How can you be so humble? Alas. Before I met my master, I boasted of my extraordinary talents. I was young and energetic. I went to the demon zone alone, but if I hadn't met my master, I would have fallen long ago. Senior brother, has there been any news about master recently? Master never shows up. We should just wait for master's instructions. One month later. Huh? It's dawn? Great. All the treasures have been fused with the heavenly talisman. Ding. Your disciple, Demon Buddha, is spreading Buddhist Dharma and transforming demons into Buddhists. The number of Buddhists has surpassed 10 million. You have been rewarded with the Myriad Races Atlas. What? 10 million? 10,000 Heavenly Mirror. Connect with the Demon Buddha. Brother Chu. Brother Yuan Chu. Daoist Brother Chu, what do you think of the great Dao Yuan calamity? What the hell? How could I know? I'll just sit back and watch the great calamity pass by. That's right, the great Dao Yuan calamity cannot affect us, so there is no need to pay too much attention. Hmm, this time during the Dao Yuan catastrophe, my demon clan will definitely rise. It's not your turn to rise, demon. What the hell do you know? That's not accepted stop messages. Damn. That's annoying. Why are you asking me? Should I create a smuff account? I can't inquire about anything with my current account. Damn it. Don't you understand what I said? You have blocked the chat group and have been rewarded with the Myriad Races Atlas. 
The Myriad Races Atlas records all the races which has existed in the history of the Nine Zones, including the extinct races, their details, their influence, and so on. Myriad Races Atlas? System. Enter. Forget it. The competition for the fate treasures has just ended, and there is nothing important for the time being, so why not use it to relieve my boredom? Nine Daewans represent one Great Dao Era, and each Great Dao Era exists for an unfixed period of time. Every nine Great Dao Yuan calamities will usher in a Great Dao Calamity. Once the Great Dao Calamity ends, the next Great Dao Era. What if there are nine Great Dao Eras? Every nine Great Dao Yuan calamities will usher in a Great Dao Calamity. This represents the end of this Great Dao Era and the impending entry into the next Great Dao Era. Does it mean that the Great Dao will restart and regenerate all living things after the Great Dao Era? Hold on. I see. The Chaos Indestructible Body and the Chaos Bell refer to the Great Dao Calamity. In that case, I only need to work hard to increase my strength and don't need to worry about the so-called Great Dao Calamity, right? The Celestial Race Celestial Race the celestial race rose up during the third great Dao era. After going through many ups and downs, they became known for their strength and were revered by all living beings. At the end of the eighth great Dao era, they disappeared from the nine zones. The celestial race. The myriad races atlas starts from the end of the last great Dao era. So, it's the ninth great Dao era now? What great calamity will descend at the end of the ninth great Dao eras? Although it is almost the end of the Great Dao era, there is still a long time before the Great Dao Yuan Calamity would arrive. Therefore, I still have enough time to become stronger to be able to overcome these calamities. The Origin Dao Crystal must be upgraded as soon as possible. It is the source of the Great Dao. It seems that Hong Yuan Chu and the others don't know about the Great Dao Calamity. According to my speculation, the two Dao Yuan realm experts that Hong Yuan Chu has invited were also considered juniors. The immortal race rose up during the Third Great Dao Era. Despite experiencing challenges, they remained exalted and mighty. They were revered and yearned for by all living creatures. At the end of the Eighth Great Dao Era, they disappeared from the Nine Zones. The demon race rose up during the Third Great Dao Era. They went through many battles, but were never destroyed. They were feared by all living creatures. The pure-blooded demon race disappeared from the Nine Zones at the end of the Eighth Great Dao Era. There are still some non-pure-blooded demons who are active in the Ninth Great Dao Era. They all disappeared from the Nine Zones at the end of the Eighth Great Dao Era. They all disappeared from the Nine Zones rather than being completely destroyed. Does this mean that the three races exist somewhere outside the Nine Zones? The monster race was active during the Third Great Dao Era. There were many types of monster tribes. There were also overlord tribes among them such as dragons, phoenixes, and chilin. These overlord tribes disappeared in the Nine Zones at the end of the Eighth Great Dao Era. Disappeared again at the same time and same place. There are still many races? What? This is. What? It turned out to be. Human race. The human race appeared in the middle of the Third Great Dao Era. They were at the bottom of the hierarchy and were oppressed by all races, but they pulled through and were never destroyed. They began to rise at the end of the Eighth Dao Yuan, were active in the early days of the Ninth Great Dao Era, became the dominant force in the Nine Zones at the end of the Ninth Dao Yuan, and later monopolized the Five Zones. That's where the record ends, unlike other races, which are recorded from their rise to their fall. That shows that the future of the human race is still unpredictable. However, I still have to prepare early to deal with the upcoming Dao Tribulation. Let me look at the other races. The Yu clan, which became powerful in the 5th Dao Yuan, uses humans as puppets and likes to possess humans and control their bodies. At the end of the 7th Dao Yuan, they were defeated by the human race, their fate declined, and they hid themselves in the Nine Zones. They are currently on the way of extinction, turning into a ghost race. Oh? The Myriad Races Atlas actually recorded the changes of the Yu clan in it. 
However, what the records say is that the Yu clan is heading towards extinction, but has not yet completely perished. It seems that it's time to bring in Yusu, the Dao realm ancestor of the Yu clan, MO2. Watch your mouth. I won't. What can you do? Just wait for me. If you have the ability, just come. Lu, this group is really lively. It's time to get a smuff account to go in and inquire about the Great Tribulation. After all, using my account to ask questions will damage my invincible character. Hong Yuan Chu, don't hide behind the juniors. Come out and have a chat. I don't talk to vulgar people. Hello everyone, I would like to introduce a new friend to you, Shui Padian. Oh? Here comes another newcomer? I hope it's a rookie so that I can get out of last place. Shui Padian. How handsome can he be? More handsome than me? It seems that the newcomer is a bit of an expert to have Chu Xian himself introduce him. Hello everyone, let me introduce myself first. My name is Shui Padian. I am 3,000 years old and at the 6th level of the Tao realm. My qualifications are average in my family. 3,000 years old. Tao realm? This is the average level of the family? Great Tao communication group 3,000 years old. Tao realm? Are you kidding me? Fellow Taoist Shui, we don't dare to talk nonsense in this group. Old Shui Padian, you brat. You're saying that you are only 3,000 years old? Don't brag. Do you think I, MO2, a three-year-old child? Hee hee, these guys are all shocked. But there is no other way. Without fooling you, how can I find out the secrets of the Nine Zones Tao Tribulation? As I recall, the Myriad Races Atlas says that the gods, demons, and immortals eventually disappeared into the Nine Realms, but it doesn't say that they were completely destroyed. Then I will just use this point to fool them. Old Shui Padian, you brat. You're saying that you are only 3,000 years old? Don't brag. Do you think I, MO2, a three-year-old child? That's right, Shui, tell me the truth. What I said is true. Besides, there are many powerful people in this great Tao communication group who are in the Tao realm. Haven't you seen any 3,000-year-old Tao realm expert? How did this newcomer figure out that there are Tao realm experts in the group? We haven't revealed that anyone here reached the Tao realm, and besides, our strength and cultivation will not be displayed in the group, right? Did this person use some kind of secret technique? But, I have never heard of such a secret technique of peeping that defines Tao realm experts. Is this new guy telling the truth? That's... No way, is he really 3,000 years old? Then I just called him old Shui, isn't this? That's right, Shui, tell me the truth. What I said is true. Besides, there are many powerful people in this great Tao communication group who are in the Tao realm. Haven't you seen any 3,000-year-old Tao realm expert? It is normal to reach the Tao realm at the age of 3,000 years. My father and others both reached the Tao realm at the age of 30. My qualifications are really average. He he he, let me give you some more exciting news. Great Tao communication group, what I said is true. Besides, there are many powerful people in this great Tao communication group who are in the Tao realm. Haven't you seen any 3,000-year-old Tao realm expert? It is normal to reach the Tao realm at the age of 3,000 years. My father and others both reached the Tao realm at the age of 30. My qualifications are really average. Are you so surprised? Did you all break through to the Tao realm after a long life? Are you mocking us? I have ignored the family that Shui Padian mentioned before. If there is such a terrifying family, why have I never heard of it in the Nine Zones? Could it be this little guy is? Why are you all so surprised? Could it be that you all were thousand years old when you broke through to the Tao realm? My young friend Shui Padian, there is no family like yours in the Nine Zones. It's not good to lie to the group. I'm really only 3,000 years old. My father and the others all reached the Dad realm in a thousand years. My qualifications are really average. 
Why are you all so surprised? Could it be that you all were thousand years old when you broke through to the Tao realm? My young friend Shui Padian, there is no family like yours in the Nine Zones. It's not good to lie to the group. Well, I have never heard of such an extraordinary family in the Nine Zones. Everyone has advised you so, young friend Shui Padian, just tell us the truth. We won't make fun of you, so why lie? I didn't say I'm from the Nine Zones either. What? What? You're not from the Nine Zones? Ah. It's over now. He's called handsome, right? He's obviously awesome. Is there another world beyond the Nine Zones? You didn't know? Oh, that's right. You shouldn't know. Tell me quickly, what are the Nine Zones like? I'm very interested in the Nine Zones. If it wasn't for the old man at home who said I wasn't allowed to go out until I broke through the Daoyuan realm, I would have gone to the Nine Zones to play long ago. I like it when I fool others. He's not only awesome, his whole family is awesome. Is there another world beyond the Nine Zones? You didn't know? Your entire family has reached the Daoyuan realm? That's right. Apart from me, everyone has reached the Daoyuan realm. I'm the youngest and have average qualifications. Is there really another world beyond the Nine Zones? There might really be a world beyond the Nine Zones. A long time ago, I met a person on the Great Dao who had an extraordinary temperament. He said that he did not come from the Nine Zones and that he would not enter the Nine Zones. Since Huang Long said there are people outside the Nine Zones, then what Shui Padian said is the truth, and his family is simply terrifyingly powerful. It seems that my guess is indeed correct. Although certain races have disappeared from the Nine Zones, it doesn't mean they are completely destroyed. They just continue to exist in another world. But why don't these races enter the Nine Zones? Young friend Shui Padian, why can't you enter the Nine Zones? Um, I don't know why, but the elders in my family won't let me into the Nine Zones. I also learned of the existence of the Nine Zones from family records. He he he, I give myself full marks for my deception and evasion abilities. So that's how it is, does young friend Shui Padian know the way from the Nine Zones to the space where you are? I don't know, but I can find an opportunity to ask my elders for you. Then I'm grateful to you, young friend Shui Padian. You're welcome, but where do you Dao Realm experts cultivate in the Nine Zones? I almost forgot to get down to business, I haven't even asked anything yet. We originally exist in the core area of the desolate ancient primordial land. Three, of course, there are also top-level Dao creatures like Huang Long who cultivate in the Great Dao. The desolate ancient primordial land? Yes, the desolate ancient primordial land is a space shrouded by a mysterious energy barrier. Only Dao realm experts are allowed to enter because that is the place closest to the Great Dao in the Nine Zones, and non-Dao realm experts aren't qualified to perceive the Great Dao. Moreover, the Great Dao will automatically attract strong Dao realm experts to enter the ancient primordial land, so strong Dao realm experts will also follow their intuition to enter the ancient primordial land. As for the desolate ancient primordial land, it is the largest zone among the nine zones, and it is also full of many secrets of heaven and earth. Even Dao Yuan realm experts don't dare to say that they have a complete understanding of the desolate ancient zone. I only know that in the desolate ancient primordial land, you can comprehend the great Dao from a close distance and refine Eper body and soul. Moreover, there are more advanced treasures in the desolate ancient primordial land, which are rarer and more powerful than any other treasures in the Nine Zones. Then, can you still go out of the desolate ancient primordial land and return back to the Nine Zones? Yes, but no one will go out easily, because when Dao realm experts enter the Nine Zones, they would be contaminated by the turbid spiritual energy of the Nine Zones. After being contaminated, they may be repelled by the Great Dao at least, and they would need to spend a large amount of time and Dao aura to wash away the turbid spiritual energy contamination. In the worst case scenario, they won't be able to enter the desolate ancient primordial land again, and will be completely expelled from it. I see, no wonder there are no Dao realm experts in the Nine Zones. 
The Great Tao attracts Tao realm experts to the desolate ancient primordial land and restricts them from coming out so as to prevent the Tao realm war from causing irreversible damage to the Nine Zones. This is both a form of protection and control to maintain the balance of the Nine Zones. And the reason why I wasn't affected by the Great Tao probably has something to do with the system. Then, I can develop slowly without any worry and carry out my grand plan. He he he. However, in special periods, Tao realm experts can enter the nine zones without being contaminated by turbid spiritual energy. Oh? Really? What does this special period mean? The special period refers to when the Tao Yuan Great Calamity has developed to a certain extent. The Great Calamity of Tao Yuan has begun, and the will of the Great Tao has been poured into the nine zones. Fated ones will rise up by taking advantage of their fate and break through the shackles of their cultivation. Whoever can compete for the great fate will be favored by the Tao and will surely become a peerless strongman. Moreover, in the later stages of the Tao Yuan Great Calamity, the rays of fate and the supreme treasure of the Tao will appear to lure the powerful in the Tao realm into the calamity. Usually those who enter the calamity are those who are below the 16th level of the Tao realm. Those who are above the 16th level of the Tao realm and enter the calamity will be rejected by the Tao and will end up either dead or injured. It turns out that the great calamity of Tao Yuan is like this. From what I know, the great Tao Yuan calamity isn't a great danger and the threat of the great Tao calamity is much bigger. It is the great Tao that controls the behavior of the people and once the nine zones are saturated, it begins to destroy things to achieve a certain balance while avoid ing the existence of those who exceed the Tao realm. However, in this process, the great Tao will produce a higher level of great fate and those who obtain such good fate will undergo a huge transformation. However, these are not important to me. The most important thing at the moment is the great Tao calamity. Unfortunately, the realm of Hong Yuan Chu is still too low to get information about the Great Tao Calamity from him. I'll open a private chat and ask Master Long, but I don't think there is much hope. Chu Xian invites you to a private chat. Oh? Can we also chat privately? Brother Chu, what's the matter? Brother Long, let me get this straight. Have you ever known or experienced the Great Tao Calamity? Great Tao Calamity? Brother Chu, I've never heard of or experienced the Great Tao Calamity, so what is this Great Tao Calamity? As expected, Long Jun was born in the Ninth Great Tao Era and doesn't know about the existence of the Great Tao Calamity. It's a long story and I haven't figured it out yet, I only know that the Great Tao Calamity will appear after the Great Tao Yuan Calamity. Ah, uh, even Brother Chu hasn't figured it out yet? Brother Chu, this Great Calamity won't affect me, right? I don't have a definite answer now, but Lord Long, as a Tao creature, you should pay more attention to the changes in the Tao. There must be abnormalities before the Tao calamity occurs. If you notice anything unusual, please notify me as soon as possible. Okay, okay, thank you Brother Chu for informing me. Brother Long, that's it for now. I have other things to do. I'll let you know when I find out the details of the Great Calamity. Thank you, Brother Chu. Sir, it's dinner time. You can put it outside for now. I'll come out to eat later. Although the Tao Yuan calamity is of little significance to me, it has greatly improved my disciples. If we can obtain the great fortune of the great Tao, a hundred years in the heavenly realm is just around the corner. For the sake of my disciples, I'd better use the heavenly mirror to deduce when the great calamity of the Tao will occur. This, this is a lake made of the blood of countless fallen cultivators. Compared with this blood lake, the blood lake in the war demon ancient land is nothing worth mentioning. And to be precise, this is not a lake of blood, this is simply a sea of blood. I don't know what kind of intense battle occurred here in the first place to leave such a horrific sea of blood. What's this? The resentment of the ninth Dao Yuan. They originated from the Ninth Great Dao Yuan Calamity and are born from the Blood Sea. They could be resurrected on the battlefield, those who possess blood lust won't die. 
They are the bearers of the calamity, the Blood Fiend Clan. Blood Fiend Clan? Looks like it's gonna be a little troublesome this time. The Blood Fiend Clan is a race that will never die as long as there is blood. They are commonly found in ancient battlefields. And the ancient battlefields are spread throughout the entire nine zones. That means there's no place within the nine zones that won't be affected by the Great Daoyuan Calamity. It seems that this Great Daoyuan Calamity is bound to break my peaceful life in this small courtyard. The Great Daoyuan Calamity will officially begin in 10 years. In 10 years? That's too fast. There's no way I can break through to the Daoyuan realm in 10 years. It seems that I underestimated the power of the Great Daoyuan Calamity. But 10 years are enough for me to use the Heavenly Dao plan to devour the heaven and earth laws of the Northern Zone. To greatly minimize the effect of the Great Daoyuan Calamity on the Southern Region. It seems that I have to raise my cultivation level, even if I can't break through to the Daoyuan realm, I still have to raise my cultivation to a level that's enough to crush the great Daoyuan calamity. It seems that I have to raise my cultivation level, even if I can't break through to the Daoyuan realm, I still have to raise my cultivation to a level that's enough to crush the great Daoyuan calamity. The heavenly Dao talisman plan still needs to rely on the power of the Luo family. Greetings, Master. That's enough. There's no need to be too polite. I wanted to meet you as your master because I have an important task to entrust you with. Master, I'll do whatever you ask. As your disciple, I'll do anything. Okay, listen, the nine zones are about to be hit by the great Daoyuan calamity. The two of you must speed up your cultivation and ensure that you fight for fate in this great Daoyuan calamity. Those who obtain fate will be able to cultivate at a rapid pace and reaching the heavenly realm in a hundred years would not be a problem. The Great Daoyuan Calamity? Reaching the heavenly realm in a hundred years? Really? China, the Inyang divine seal you cultivate can comprehend the Dao of Inyang, so you can make great achievements in this great calamity. If you obtain great fortune and fate, you can break through to the Dao realm directly during this calamity. Yes, Master, how do we fight for fate? It's nothing more than killing the enemy, defeating the Chosen Ones, or defeating the bearers of the Calamity, the Blood Fiend race, and so on. You will sense it innately when the time comes. Yes, Master. You can join forces with some Deity Realm experts to prepare to deal with the Blood Fiends. Pay more attention to the desolate ancient zone. China, you can leave now. Chin Ying stays behind. I'll assign you another mission. As Master wishes, this disciple will leave now. Chin Ying, I have some relationship with the Luo family. You should return to the eastern region first and take control of the Luo family so that you can assist your senior sister. Yes. Hey Yu pays respects to Master. It's good that you're here. I was just looking for you. Greetings, senior sister. Junior sister, there is no need to be too polite. Let's reminisce about the past later. Both of you should leave a drop of your blood essence with me so that I can condense a drop of rebirth blood for you too. So that even if something unexpected happens in the future, you can still be reborn. Thank you so much. Master. Master, how strong are you really? If you can even resurrect us, then we disciples will be able to do whatever we want in the future. Don't be arrogant or let your guard down just because you have an extra life. Master is right. We'll remember that. Hey you, tell the Black Moon House to pay more attention to the movements in the Nine Zones and notify me immediately if there is any change. And hurry up with the Heavenly Dao Talisman plan to prepare for the coming Great Dao Yuan Calamity. The Great Dao Yuan Calamity? Yes, the Great Dao Yuan Calamity represents the end of an era, with various races rising or being annihilated. But at the same time, various kinds of fate treasures will appear, and if you win the fate treasures, you can transform your body and rise to the top. Master, when you just talked about the annihilation of an entire race, you meant. Don't panic, your master has his own plans. All you need to do is fight for the fate treasure, you don't have to worry about anything else. Yes, Master, we will definitely strive for the fate treasures in the Great Daoyuan Calamity and live up to Master's expectations. 
Your master has also prepared some Dao artifacts for you to assist you in your cultivation. Dao artifacts? These are more advanced than divine artifacts. Thank you, master. I still have the demonic realms Buddha clan and ghost clan as my two trump cards. The Buddha clan's abilities can restrain the blood fiend clan, purifying their evil bloodline so they won't be able to revive. Subsequently, the Ghost Clan can empower our forces during fights and transform the souls of fallen warriors into part of the Ghost Clan, sustaining our strength through battles. Seems like the two races I unintentionally created will be able to demonstrate their power during this Dao Yuan's tribulation. Now that I think about it, could this be the system's hidden manipulation? Forget it. There's no point thinking about it. I can't interfere at my current level anyway. Let's just sleep and recharge. I have to settle the Ghost Clan's matters first thing tomorrow. Sir, the Ghost Clan's Ghost King has heeded your summon and came to visit. Good morning, Ghost King. I called you here to find out if you can contact the Spirit Clan. I greet you, Ghost Ancestor. I will think of a way to contact them. Good. Get it done quickly. Since the Dao Yuan's tribulation is approaching, it's the perfect time for the Ghost Clan to rise. We will make the spirit clan disappear, then the ghost clan shall inherit their fortune and rise powerfully. Indeed, we did not follow the wrong man. Ghost Ancestor is like a deity in this world. Ghost Ancestor can rest assured, I will do my utmost and complete this task. Okay, go and get it done. Yes, Ghost Ancestor. Namo Buddha, I already imparted you with the latest Buddhist doctrine. You can now go to the demonic realm and assist demonic Buddha, convert all demons into Buddha. Yes, our Buddha. Namo Buddha has already reached enlightenment. I wonder what kind of conflicts will spark between him and the demonic Buddha. I am actually looking forward to it. Thirteenth uncle, I am thinking about going out to temper myself with you. -er. Seems like our little ping fan has grown up and knows how to make his own requests now. There's me as well, Grandpa Ghost Ancestor. Oh? You two mischievous little demons are always together. I am worried Ping Fan might get bullied outside. I just want to protect him. Okay, okay. Both of you can go. Make sure you have fun. Grandpa Ancestor, what did you say? Ping Fan, do remember that your extreme Tao can gain a lot from the tribulation. Just go with the flow. All right, Uncle Thirteenth. Goodbye. Shao Li, summon the top ten lords, tell them to gather at the Eastern Territory border. Yes, chief. By the way, select another two heavenly realm lords and have them gather at the Eastern Territory border as well. But, no buts, execute the order. For now, we must fully support Qin Ying and the Luo family and establish the Black Moon Pavilion in the Eastern Territory. As you ordered, chief landlord. Black Moan Pavilion's experts has already gathered at the Eastern Territory border, waiting for Lady Qin Ying's command. The Black Moan Pavilion is indeed swift and decisive. I won't have to worry about the Eastern Territory for now. If only I can leave the house, I wonder when I will become invincible. Oh. The laws of the Southern region will soon be fully eroded by my Heavenly Dao plan. Seems like it will be replaced completely within a year. I wonder what kind of mysterious rewards the system will give me. I am really looking forward to it. Don't be like this. I know what's in your hearts. In the previous life, you followed me, Qin Ying, without any regrets. Even when you were in danger of dying, you didn't retreat. In this life, you have shared both honor and disgrace with me, and we have once again joined hands to fight Chao Chani. I, Qin Ying, will never forget the friendship of two lifetimes, and will never let my fellow comrades down. But this time, I'm only going to the Eastern Zone. It's not like I won't come back, so why are you all crying here like this? Hey, what's the matter? Say something. We just don't want our brother Ching to go, sob, sob, sob. Brother, we finally got together again. Why do you have to rush back to the Eastern Zone? That's right, big brother. Big brother, don't go. Isn't it good here? 
Brother, we really don't want to be separated from you anymore. I'll be honest with you, the Nine Zones are about to face a great calamity. We must be fully prepared. A great calamity? Yes, the great Dao Yuan calamity, this Dao Yuan is about to end, and the great Dao Yuan calamity is about to rise. We must be fully prepared. If the human race wants to maintain their position as the overlord of the Nine Zones, we must succeed in the fight for fate in the calamity. My return to the Eastern Zone was arranged by my master to prepare for this great calamity. Originally, my master wouldn't let me reveal this information to you for fear that our brotherhood would hinder our future development. However, since we are brothers, I must explain to you what is at stake. If we don't prepare well for this catastrophe, not only you brothers or me, but also the entire human race of the Nine Zones will be annihilated and may even disappear completely from the world. This So, do you want to remain together for a short term, or do you want to have a good time in the future? Brother, we understand. We'll go back to the sect and cultivate hard, and when the great calamity comes, we'll never disgrace our big brother. Brother, we'll wait for you to get together again. Yes, brother, please feel free to go back to the eastern zone. That's Qin Ying's good brothers. When I return again, it will be the day of the great calamity. The grudge between us and Scoundrel Chow will definitely be settled during this great calamity. Yes, big brother. Qin Kiyun, I'll leave the great Qin dynasty to you. With the unification of the southern region and my brother's support here, nothing will go wrong. Yes, master. Don't worry. Brothers and sisters, let's say goodbye today and meet again someday. Brother, let's meet again someday. The southern region entered a state of relative peace, and all forces have already learned of the existence of the Daoyuan calamity through various channels, and are working hard to improve themselves in order to cope with the upcoming Daoyuan calamity. Except for a few people, of course. The spirit devouring flower is already at the deity realm after feeding on the blood lake for a few days. The blood lake at the ancient war demon land is almost depleted. The evil blood clan nurtured by it is being devoured at the same time. According to what I observed from the heavenly laws, the southern region has more than one ancient battlefield. The others should also have a blood lake. There's still a chance for the blood fiend clan to appear. The Atlas has records of the Blood Fiend clan, which means they already appeared before. Since they haven't appeared, they must be accumulating their strength until they are confident they can dominate. If that's the case, then we still have time. We still have time to be prepared. The time for the Heavenly Dao Talisman to fully replace the Heavenly Laws in the Southern Region should be about three days at most. It shouldn't be too late. Uncle Chu Xian, are you in? This timing, who is it? Who is being noisy outside? Uncle Chu Xian, it's Kiyun. I came specially to visit Uncle Chu Xian. Qin Kiyun? What's she doing here? She must be here to ask for help. Oh. So it's Kiyun. Come on in. How rare. What kind of wind managed to blow the great Qin Empress to my humble abode? Uncle Chu Xian. You jest. Kiyun has been thinking about Uncle Chu Xian day and night. If I wasn't busy with all those trifling matters, I would have preferred to stay beside Uncle every day. Oh, trifling matters. Then the reason you are here today must be because of these trifling matters. Ha <laughs> ha. I really can't hide anything from Uncle. Uncle. Qin country is having both internal and external troubles, but my strength is too weak to help. What can I do? Fine. Stop talking. Come here. Okay. Get up. Ma, many thanks, uncle. Right. I need you to do something for me. An ancient battlefield will soon appear in the southern region. Prepare some candidates for it. Soon? 
Other than the ancient war demon land, are there other ancient battlefields in the southern region? That's right. I'll get someone to give you the entry token when the time comes. M. Wow. The Qin Empire will now be fully developed. Thank you, uncle. No need. Go back now. Wait for my news. Yes. Kiyun will now return. Phew. I, too, must hurry. Heavenly Dao Talisman, rise. Three days later. Finally. The moment has finally come. I've truly become the legitimate ruler of the laws of the southern region. The first day. The third day. The fifth day. The seventh day. After the seventh day. Whoa. The sun is rising. Phew. It's finally done. After a whole week. The southern region experienced a week of weather changes as a result of the law change. However, no one was injured. All fate changes in the southern region will now be under my control. I'm curious how Qin Kiyun's preparations are going. You are all cultivators that I personally chose. Your next mission will affect our great Qin Empire fate for the next few decades or even centuries to come. Oh, even though the battle for the treasure is over, why are there still people around? They look like the people from the evil court. Are they still here to welcome the evil seeds? Cultivation appears to be at the deity realm's second stage, which is not low. How about using him to nourish Heaven's Tao? Once you become nourishment for the Heaven's Tao, the Heaven's Tao will slowly squeeze you dry, leading towards death of both body and Tao. You are not guiltless because you are an evil cultivator, so facing such an end is only right. However, this person has no enmity with me. If I harm him without reason, it's a bit. Forget it. Ding. You've become the father of the southern region Heavenly Dao without ever leaving your house, dominating the entire southern region. One cultivation realm advancement is rewarded. He. So slow. But being late is better than never. Cultivation level up. Dao realm third. Damn it. Another failure. Although the last few days were smooth sailing and I advanced to the Emperor Realm, my cultivation level has now become stagnant. It seems to be impossible without the resources of a wealthy and powerful family. But I'm just a commoner. Huh? Aya. Is the great Qin Empress recruiting for her army? Based on aptitude. Background and status does not matter. This is an opportunity for me. Let's go to Qin country right away. Soldiers, today is the day we move out. I have witnessed all the hard work you guys put in. The glory of Qin country belongs to you. From the journey to the secret realm, may you return victorious. This is unexpected. The southern region has so many high-level warriors. Did cultivation get easier? He. <laughs> As soon as I arrived, there was a major mission. I'm so lucky. Doesn't matter. It's a good thing for me. Recently, there has been an increase in the news regarding the explosive increase in cultivation for the southern region warriors. This is normal. Previously, the laws in the southern region were incomplete. After the battle of the ancient war demon land, the laws returned, and cultivation got easier. How can you be so calm, master? Isn't an increase in the number of powerful people a threat to us? Black Moan House doesn't rely on power to gain a foothold in the underworld. But, but still, we still need to take some action. You are correct. It's time to get started. We should make the most of this favorable situation. Let's publish some secret manuals. Publish secret manuals? One week later, I want this, this, and that. All right. These two are 35 yuan. 
The total is 35 yuan. Thank you, shopkeeper. It's so crowded. Master, you are a genius. Humph. Our purpose of opening the Black Moon House is to make money. And making money depends on assessing the situation. It's not about fighting. I'm impressed. I will follow the teachings of my master. But master, these books are all written in a hurry by unsuccessful scholars. What if those who buy the books discover that the techniques described are ineffective? Humph. Let's hope those people are enthusiastic enough to finish all these books first. How can anyone be successful if they're not enthusiastic? Damn it. Cough, cough. Bastard. Are you not done yet? Humph. I told you. I won't let you go. What exactly are you doing here? You don't even care about the battle for the fake treasure. Humph. Even without the fake treasure, I can still be stronger than you. So what's the point of possessing the fake treasure? You. It's not good to stay here for long. I have to get out of here. I'm sure the person who rescued me is still alive. Humph. How persistent. Ah. Ha ha ha. My legs. Humph. Do you think you can escape from me? He. You should take a closer look. Where do you think this is? The outskirts of the ancient land? Do you have anything else up your sleeve? Kill him. Aya. He. How about it, senior phone? Do you concede? How is this possible? My cultivation was two stages above you last month. I didn't slack off as well. Damn it. Did you use some kind of trick? There's nothing strange here, senior phone. It was because I was in the southern region. Southern region? So what? Is that a big deal? Have you heard the news, senior phone? The laws of the southern region have now been completed following the battle for treasure. The flow of good fortune has accelerated. Everyone's cultivation rate has far outpaced that of other regions. There's such a thing? So fast. The cultivation rate in the southern region is approximately three times that of the other regions. That is far too amazing. Are there any other methods? If not, let's just use that deity realm warrior from the evil clan as nourishment. Hang on. He belongs to the evil clan. He ain't innocent. There's no need to be soft-hearted. But, since he did not offend me, what reason do I have to harm him? So annoying. Little Evil King Little Evil King's destiny changed as a result of the secret realm I created. He could be considered one of my people. He he. There is now a reason. Ha ha ha. This must be retribution. Heaven's punishment. Nonsense. I am a deity realm expert who is part of the heavenly Tao. Why would heaven's punishment descend on me? Oh? After spending so much time in the ancient lands, it seems like the laws in the southern region have changed. What's going on? What's with the lightning? There's nothing I can do. Good luck. WTF. What's happening? Let's go take a look. What's the situation? Deity Realm. What kind of power is this? To turn a Deity Realm expert into charcoal. He couldn't even retaliate. Okay. After absorbing the power and comprehension of that Deity Realm expert and spreading them throughout the southern region, the speed of cultivation there can be greatly increased. Ding, ding, ding. Someone joined the group chat. Soaring Flood Dragon King Dragon Race Dao Yuan Realm. A Dao Yuan Realm expert of the Dragon Race? That's rare. Interesting. This world appears to have a lot of interesting things to discover. 
One year later, Southern Region Mystic Realm, Soldiers. This Mystic Realm is already ours. Great Chain, Great Chain, we'll do anything for our Great Chain State. If this continues, our Great Chain State will surely unify the nine regions. Ha ha ha. I'm finally in the Emperor Realm. I, Chu Tianming, am indeed a genius. Please. Brother, ah, uh, no. I mean Grandpa. It's just the Emperor Realm. Alas. It's a shame my favorite third son missed it. If only you were still alive, alas. Well. Let's go and see my wonderful grandson. I was so angry the last time he refused to come home that I lost half my life. But how could I not be concerned about the next generation? What? Do you still have any respect for your grandfather? You still have this attitude. Then you can stay in this yard for the rest of your life. No one should try to persuade me. It won't work. I'm going back home. Thirteenth brother. What's wrong with you? Just promise grandpa? Yoon. When grandpa and I see each other, it's as if thunder and lightning have set the earth on fire. I don't want to return because I'm afraid he'll get even angrier. Looks like this. Thirteenth brother, take care. I'll go see grandpa. Grandpa. Slow down. Wait for me. Phew. Finally, they are all gone. Come out, you guys. You've all reached the peak of the honorable realm, and the next step is to break through to the heaven realm. Breaking through to the heaven realm will be difficult, and as the disaster approaches, the laws will change. So head out first. Yes, master. Ha ha. These kids were thrown away back then, now they're all masters in their own right. It's time for them to venture out into the world. Only then would the system reward be activated for me. Mom, someone's flying? Yes, yes, yes. When Xiao Bao grows up, he will be able to fly as well. It's real, Mom. What Master mentioned before. Master, were you looking for me? Did you have a good understanding of your mother? My mother left when I was young, and I never heard anything about her. There are rumors. Don't pay attention to that gossip. But, after testing, I discovered that you do indeed have a natural fire bone. This is unquestionably related to your parents. Your father is from a prestigious family, so it's not him, it should be related to your mother. There must be some hidden secrets regarding your mother's identity. This time when you head back home, try to find out. A firebone is out of the ordinary. There must be some involvement. Keep this drop of rebirth blood essence somewhere safe in case of an emergency. Mother, she isn't just some commoner, is she? I'll prove her innocence this time. Ding dong. In the demon region heaven's chosen competition, your disciple Wu Tianya defeated a son of fortune, transforming his fate and increasing his strength. Awarded the four spirit star chariot. Ah, uh, what's going on? Wu Tianya. Almost forgot about him. Not bad. I was so surprised that my face mask fell off. Heavenly Mirror of 10,000 Daos. Show me the current location of Hu Tianya. How about it? Is anyone else from the Flood Dragon tribe interested in fighting me? Damn it. How can this be? Ha ha ha. Tianya. As expected from a son of the Heavenly Tiger tribe. The river flows east for 30 years, and the river flows west for 30 years. Change is the only constant. Do not bully a young tiger. Hey, hey. This kid is so vengeful. He hasn't forgotten about the Flood Dragon Princess's refusal to marry him. Anyone else? Me? You? I won't hold back just because you're a girl. There's no need. We are fighting to protect our tribes. We will be too embarrassed to face our elders if we hold back. Come.
Give up. You did your best. Hmm. Interesting. Naturally, the Dragon Clan is more powerful in their true form. Hu Tinya, I'm sorry for what I've done to you, but I still have to look out for my clan. Humph. Since we've chosen to fight, let the fists do the talking. Unexpectedly, the monster clan's last dignity must be safeguarded by a female. Boring. This kid. He has a faint trace of the divine white tiger bloodline. This kid is pretty good. No wonder even the system noticed it. Hu Tinya, Immortal Master. Greetings to the Immortal Master. This disciple bows to the Immortal Master. No need, no need. If the Immortal Master pays Tianya a personal visit, he must have something important to tell me. My disciple is smart. Exactly. I've come here for two reasons. The first is to give you this communication talisman. And the second is to teach you how to revive the monster clan. Yes. This disciple will surely remember the Immortal Master's teachings. Three hours later this disciple will keep this in mind. I must cultivate hard. I'll do my best to do what the Immortal Master told me to do. All right. In this case, your master will go back. Phew. That's great. With Hu Tinya, the monster clan will be under my control sooner or later. Well then, let's check the new Four Spirit Stars Chariot reward. Congratulations on the opening of Dawei Buddha Temple. Anyone who takes refuge during the first three days will be given a red sandalwood makujio. Devil region. What? The branch of the balding cult has already expanded into the devil region? Yes, great king. This won't do. Give me 3,000 elite soldiers. I will trample their temple flat. Humph. General Moli can calm down. Why would the people in the devil region join them? Once they realize how useless their temple is, they will leave on their own. Ugh. The rage in this place is too strong. Even the sky turned purple. We should have noticed earlier. Such a sin. O.M. Mani Padni Hum. Oh? Is someone seeking refuge? Benefactors, how about coming in for a chat? Hey, hey, he is calling you benefactor. Da Zhuang. Go ahead. Just look at your hairstyle, you are a natural monk. TCH. I am not interested. Excuse me. Master. Please accept me. Excellent. What? It's him. Impossible. My king. Please calm down. Humph. M.O. Lee, such a reversal. You were so determined mind to crush them earlier. Who'd have guessed? Your precious son was the first to join that balding cult. I didn't teach him well. I will pay for my mistakes. I will capture him immediately. Master, I have fetched the water back. Do you have any other orders? Good. M.O.G.A. You are working towards enlightenment. Today... I have an important job for you. To serve Buddha. Make sure the Buddha is clean. It's a measurable merit. I won't snatch it from you. Yes. Master. I will make sure it's clean thoroughly. Don't worry. A few days later. M.O.G.A. Master. Do you have any orders? I have observed for a few days. You do indeed have a root of wisdom. Since there's fate between you and me, I will officially accept you as a disciple. Master, what's that in your hand? You mean this? This is for your tonsure. Help me. Ha ha, don't run away, M.O.G.A. Aren't you willing to convert? Please let your master shave your head. Master, I'm not stupid, don't lie to me. 
Do you really need an axe to shave? Besides, I don't have any hair. Emojia. How could your master lie to you? You have no hair, but what about the horns? Put down your horns, and you instantly become a Buddha. Is there really such a saying? He. Come out. Emojia. It's fate. Mom. I'm so scared. Emojia, come on. Cut off this horn and you will be cut off from the mortal world. Mom, I want to go home. You bastard. Come back here quickly. Shaving with an axe? I knew my son wouldn't do it voluntarily. I'm going to fight you, old Baldy. Demon General? Did you also come to shave your head? The second time will cost half as much. Old monk, what occurred today? I will never be like you. I'm going to trample your temple to rubble. Let's go, M.O.G.A. Go home, recover from your injuries, and get married as soon as possible. Be good. Father, no one forced me. I wanted to convert of my own free will. I don't want to go back. I have to finish this shaving. My son, what are you doing? What's wrong with that? Do you think I've ever been happy? Your words have always felt like an imperial edict to me since I was a child. I was only a good boy if I did what you said. You have planned everything for me. This, I use my relationships and connections to pave the way for you. Isn't this what a father should do for his son? Then what about me? Is it wrong for me to have my own ideas? Is it wrong that I want to have the right to choose my own life? Amit Ba Buddha. M.O.G.A. We owe our body, hair, and skin to our parents. You can't forget your parents' kindness. It's just that. The child is no longer a child, and the general may be unable to accept that the child has grown up. I. Today, I officially accept M.O.G.A. as my great disciple. If you don't mind, you are welcome to stay and participate in the apprenticeship ceremony. The fasting meal is enough to keep you full. With O calories and O fat, healthy and nutritious. Afterwards, M.O. Lee returned to the Demon Palace and resigned from his position. Dawei Temple was growing stronger in the demonic realm and was recruiting many talented disciples. Dawei Temple. This monk is so thoughtful. Instead of going to a peaceful place, he wants to help demons and devils. I must hold myself back. I have to find out about my mother. Eh, isn't that the evil star? He came back? Seems like it. It's him. I thought he died outside. Let's go quickly, so unlucky. Don't meet his eyes. If it wasn't for my mother, all of you would be dead now. A rare customer. Are you staying? Or just having a meal? You're not welcome to stay here. Go somewhere else to have a meal. Father, I am here to ask about my mother. Humph, you know everything from when you were a child. What more can I say? Do you even have this home in your heart? Father, if you are going to put it this way, then do you even have a son in your heart? Wow. Who's this? Aren't you the commoner brute? Are you here to get your inheritance? Xiaoming, this has nothing to do with you. You should mind your own business. Shut up. Don't talk to me as if you are my big brother. You aren't worthy. The Xiang family has nothing to do with you. Get lost. Or else don't blame me for being rude. Fine. That's fine. I'll leave once I've gotten what I came here for. Stubborn. You're looking for death. Damn it. Go. What? A sneak attack. Has the Siam family fallen to this degree? Stop. Siam Shing. If you kill him, I guarantee you'll return empty-handed. 
you will never get the answer you are looking for. Ugh. Forget it. Just a trash. Doesn't matter whether you are dead or alive. Old man. You better keep your promise. I can guarantee I won't kill anyone from the Siam family. Just tell me what I want to know. Come in. Ha ha. My son, long time no see. It appears that my father still doesn't want to see me. You were just chasing me away. Spare me the pleasantries. Tell me about my mother. Ha ha, young people are really impatient. I told you before. Your mother was just an ordinary maid. You. You went back on your word. You've always been like this. You've never cared about me since I was a child. To this day, you are still perfunctory with me. In that case, why didn't you kill me when I was a child? You had plenty of opportunities. Do you still think I'm a child? Do you think I'd come back and ask you if I didn't have any evidence? Evidence? What evidence? You didn't believe your father. Instead, you went outside to look for evidence. If I hadn't inherited this body of fiery bones from my mother, who else would it be? You? Does the Siam family have the bloodline of fiery bones? Hey, it doesn't look like you're trying to trick me. However, I really don't know the whereabouts of your mother. And it shouldn't be fiery bones. Instead, it should be the fire elemental physique. Fire elemental physique? There is no way my master could have made a mistake. But let's hear what this old man has to say first. Fire elemental physique? Then my mother also had a fire elemental physique. What else? Ha ha. I'm no longer as healthy as you young people. It's time for me to take my medicine. That's it for today. Humph. Okay, I'll find out myself. Siam Family Library Pavilion. Found it. The Fong family of the Southern Zone, direct descendants of the human king. Those with pure bloodlines all possess the fire elemental physique. It's actually the human king's family, so my mother's full name is Fong Rupying. Looks like I have to go to the Southern Zone. It's getting late, so let's set off tomorrow. Who are you? Were you waiting for me here? Humph. Bastard. Do you think you could get away with what you did today? Today? Today I let you off, yet you are repaying my kindness with hatred? Also, do you think you can win with the two of them on your side? Humph. I know why you've returned. You're looking for that cheap maid mother of yours. In any case, the family head will not allow you to harm us. Watch that dirty mouth of yours. Go get him. He won't dare hurt us. Who is it? You can call me Huaying. You actually care about this commoner. You should consider who will be in charge of this family in the future. I am currently obeying the family head. If you return now, young Master Ming, I can keep what happened here quiet. I'm sure the family patriarch would be upset if he found out. Both of you will pay for this. The old man sent you to spy on me? It appears that he is protecting you, ensuring that you are not attacked from all sides within the family. Humph! Smelly old man! Hey, hey, you are here. How about it? Have you thought it through? I have achieved the deity's body, however. Let's wait a while more. Hey, hey, you have to be resolute when you want to achieve great things. Come again when you finally decide to merge. How I am carrying the entire family's fate. How can I be resolute? How is it? Did Xiang Xing do anything that seems out of place? No, the young master didn't do anything out of the ordinary. He stayed at the library pavilion. However, he already discovered that the fire elemental physique is a special physique from the human king family. How looks like he'll head to the southern zone. Give him the travel expenses. 
how although it's my home, I feel more relaxed after leaving. Young master, wait a moment. Young master, the master sent me to. Not necessary. Thank you, Huang. I'm aware of my father's efforts, but I don't want to become a weak spot of him within the family, so goodbye. Young master, please don't turn down the master's goodwill. Aurora Technique he can still go faster while using instantaneous movement. How much has the young master matured over the years? Master, this subordinate has failed. The young master refused to accept it. How this isn't your fault, I expected this to happen. How looks like our relationship as father and son is beyond repair. This is all my fault. When he was young, I didn't fulfill my responsibility as a father. To try to make up for it now, it seems like it's too late. That is not the case, Master. The young Master didn't want you to be criticized by the family for helping him. That's what he said? It's true. He said he doesn't want to become your weak spot. It's true. He said he doesn't want to become your weak spot. But his mother's background involves a lot of people. I am worried that if he goes alone. Master, the young master might be stronger than what we think. What? Even you can't catch up with him? Yes, master. The young master has already matured far beyond our expectations. This kid, what kind of people has he been hanging out with these past few years? Seems like we won't be of any help. Let's just wait for the news. Achu, who's talking behind my back? So regretful. Why didn't I take that smelly old man's money? Such a long journey. How am I going to make it to the southern zone? Ah, I got it. Let's go find my big sister. F-1000 Mystery House is second only to Black Moon Tower when it comes to info-gathering organizations. Maybe I will be able to get some news. Oh, look at who it is. You finally decided to come find your big sister after so many days? Let's see what Xiang Xing is up to. Huh? Does this kid still have close friends? Heartless kid, you waited so long to visit your big sister? Sister Hua, how about you get down first and then we can talk? Humph. Devil. Speak, you are definitely here for a reason, right? Sister Hua, I will be straightforward. I really do need your help. Tell me all about it. You had to come looking for me, so it must be important. I want to know if you have any information on the whereabouts of Feng Xiaoqing. Who? Feng Xiaoqing. Why are you looking for him? Do you have any enmity with him? No, I am looking for him for another reason. I just need to know where he is. Oh, no problem. But how are you going to repay me? Er, how about? You give me your bones? Stop joking, Sister Hua. I prepared a gift for you. Gift? Here. I made it myself. Puppet? Where did you get it? You know how to lie now, little monster, and I know what you're capable of. Tell the truth, where is this from? No, Sister Hua, I didn't lie to you. Really? Little darling. Ah, you have learned some bad stuff as well, huh, Sister Hua? It was an accident. It's because of, of, of. Okay, okay, I will believe you for now. But you must tell me, why are you looking for Feng Xiaoqing? The human king Feng family, that's not a family you can provoke. I know, Sister Hua, I just want to ask him for information about someone. Request information from him? It won't be easy. He's a proud man who may simply ignore you. He vowed to become the Fong family's third human king. Third human king? The first two are dead. The current Fong family is unable to make ends meet. That is why Fong Qingxiao is rushing to become the human king, to reorganize the Fong family. It's good if that's the case. A proud man will honor his promises. This kid, what exactly are you planning? I am going to challenge him to a fight. Huh? Are you crazy? Is there something wrong with your brain? 
You want to challenge Feng Xiaoqing to a fight? Do you even understand the gap between you and him? Take my advice and don't kill yourself. Feng Xiaoqing will not even take your challenge. Tell me who you're looking for and I'll help you find them. This matter is complicated. I don't want to get you involved. Just help me look for Feng Xiaoqing. He will accept my challenge. Also, help me spread this information so that if he loses, he won't be able to retract his words. The best way is for him to bet on the human king family's reputation. Did you really go crazy? Little monster. I am not crazy. Feng Xiaoqing, I must find him. What? How is this possible? How old are you, little darling? Your cultivation has progressed to the Emperor Realm's ninth stage. Let me take a look. Have your bones changed? Let me cut open and examine you. Your cultivation rate is far too fast. Aya. Sister Hua, get your hands off me. Don't touch that area. Young master, we've received a letter from the Thousand Mystery House. Xiang Xing? Looks like I have to respond. What? Young master agreed? Just a commoner from a small family. How dare he show such disrespect? Is he trying to humiliate us? Third elder, give us the signal, and we'll go flatten the Xiang family right away. Let's wait and see what happens. Don't be rash. This. Master, during the elders' meeting, they suggested banishing Xiang Xing from the Xiang family. What do you think? H-A-A-A, -A -A, I didn't expect him to act so quickly. There's nothing I can do now. Let's leave it to fate. Look. Feng Xiaoqing is here. It's really him. What is he thinking? A heaven chosen from the Feng family accepting a challenge from a commoner? Do you believe the Xiang family is attempting to gain fame by trampling on the human king Feng family? For what purpose? Even within the Nine Realms, people rarely speak of the Feng family. If that's what Xiang family wants, they can go after those wealthy families. Look, Xiang Xing is here as well. Hello, Brother Feng. Oh, so it's you. I didn't expect the little monster from the Xiang family to be. It is indeed me, and I am aware of Brother Feng's arrogance. I have some questions and would like to get some advice from you, which is why I planned all of this. Please accept my apologies. My arrogance is not worth mentioning in your eyes, Brother Xiang. I have seen Brother Xiang's methods before during my trip to the North Zone. Brother Feng is being too kind. I'll tell you everything I know in response to Brother Xiang's questions. But since I've already accepted the challenge, let's fight so I can see Brother Xiang's amazing techniques. Salute. Salute. This is unexpected. Xiangqing is actually suppressing his cultivation realm to fight fairly with Feng Xiaoqing. But even so, there's no suspense in this battle. No point watching. Let's go eat. Beep your Heaven Dao plan has progressed another stage. The West region in the North Zone has been absorbed. Rewarding one stage advancement in the cultivation realm. Oh, the East region should be next. Beep, your disciple, Xiang Xing, defeated a descendant of the Human King family, spreading his reputation through the Southern region and enhanced his fortune. Rewarding Chaos Aura plus your Law of Fortune upgraded. Today has been full of surprises. The Western region has been absorbed into the Heavenly Dao plan, and Xiang Xing has now sent me another gift. Not bad. With these rewards, I'll be able to reach the fourth stage of the Dao realm. Ha ha ha. Fourth stage of Dao realm. Here I come. This feeling is wonderful. I can feel my every pore absorbing the power of the system rewards. System, I love you. I am no longer the weakest being in the great Dao group. Mister, why are you having spasms again? You have recommended information from Black Moon House. The laws in the Western region have changed. If you would like to learn more about the new laws and gain insight, please visit the stores designated by Black Moon House to purchase a guidebook. Supplies are limited, so get yours now. What kind of work is Black Moon House doing, as they consistently suggest this kind of information? I have to ask Black Moon to assist me in terminating the recommendation business when she's available. 
vibrating 12 hours a day, I can't take it anymore. Brother Lu, our western region is very popular now. Yes, all of the warriors from various areas are gathering here to cultivate in order to take advantage of this unique new law. That's right, I heard it's called the Law of Heavenly Tao. Right. The Law of Heavenly Tao, it's so powerful. I've heard of a warrior from the heavenly realm who was near death but gained enlightenment as a result of the new law. As a result, his life was prolonged and he is now getting ready to enter the next realm. Actually, we ought to visit Black Moon House and purchase the guidebook if it's so strong. It's too late. My friend said it's already sold out for today. We'll go early tomorrow. Okay, Brother Lou, don't forget about me tomorrow. No matter what, we are close friends. Of course. Five years passed in the blink of an eye. Our Chu Xian is currently. Eastern region and northern region have also been absorbed into the heavenly Tao plan. Um, not bad, not bad. These past few years. I've already advanced to the sixth level of the Tao realm, so perhaps my strength and mental health have both improved. I would have been ecstatic to hear this kind of news earlier, but now that I have. I don't feel any different though. Now that I look back, the Black Moon House is the only reason the Heavenly Tao could absorb the Eastern region. She was truly born with the genius ability to carry out the plan of Heavenly Tao. The Northern region only has the Southern Prefecture that hasn't been absorbed. Looks like I have to ask the Black Moon House to hurry up. We have to conquer the Northern Zone early. I will raise Black Moon to become the first Supreme of the Heavenly Tao, ruling over all the forces in the North Zone. That should be all for the Heavenly Tao plan. Let's use the Heaven LY mirror of 10,000 Daos to find some interesting stuff. This lady doesn't seem to belong to the three major races. Bing Luoxing, born during the fourth Dao Yuan, one of the first ancestors of the Ice Devouring Tribe, opened her own unique path during the sixth Dao Yuan. No wonder she gives off such an abnormal feeling. She is the first ancestor of the Ice Devouring Tribe, and her experiences might be more profound than Hong Yuan Chu. Let's say hello. Hello Dao friend, my name is Chu Xian. I created a great Dao group that's for the fated. Would Dao friend like to join and interact with us? Not interested. Io, so cold on our first meeting, how interesting. However, for such people, I have my ways to deal with them, he he he. Dao friend, you can just ignore the messages even after you join the group. It will not disturb your cultivation retreat. Dao friend, you don't have to try to convince me. Please keep your Dao tool. Dao friend, the great tribulation is approaching. You must prepare as well. You will benefit from joining the group and exchanging information. Great tribulation? A mere Dao Yuan great tribulation has nothing to do with me. No, 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 I am not talking about a Dao Yuan great tribulation, but the real great Dao tribulation. This tribulation is horrifying. Even a nine extreme Dao Yuan realm warrior would die. What? Are you serious? Of course. Humph. Little girl. After hearing about the great Tao tribulation, you understand what fear is. Fine, I will join the group. I still don't know Dao friend's name. Let's tease her a bit more. Hey, <laughs> hey. Bing Luoxing. Let's welcome our new Dao friend, Bing Luoxing, into the group. Dao friend Bing Luoxing reached the Dao Yuan realm even earlier than Dao friend Hong and the others. Dao friend Bing Luoxing is currently the first person to reach the Dao Yuan realm in our group. What? Impossible, another big shot. That's too heaven defying. There's someone who reached the Dao Yuan realm earlier than Mr. Hong? Oh? Earlier than me? Until now, I haven't met anyone who was faster than me. These people are ill-informed and narrow-minded. I need to educate them on the chronicles of Dao Yuan. Dao friend Hong and friends reached the Dao Yuan realm on the 7th Dao Yuan. Meanwhile, Dao friend Bing reached the Dad Yuan realm on the 6th Dao Yuan. Just so you know, Dao friend Bing was born during the 4th Dao Yuan. This. 
This group's leader Chu Xian, how does he know all of my personal information so well? If I may, Dao friend Chu, when were you born? My birth date was not calculated by Dao Yuan's. What? Is group leader Chu someone who has been around since the Nine Realms inception? Okay, everyone. I still have things to do, but you guys can keep talking. Let's quickly escape. If they ask me another tricky question, I might reveal my flaws. Group leader Chu, go ahead. Goodbye, group leader. Goodbye, group leader. Group leader, if there's anything I can help with, let me know. It's about time for me to create another group for the Dao Yuan realm experts. There are a lot of secrets hidden within the realm, and it's inconvenient for them to share with Dao realm cultivators. If I do that, I can also increase the speed of upgrading the origin Dao crystal. Dao Yuan Great Tribulation, it's finally here. Sir, what's happening? Why was there such loud thunder? Nothing much, it's just the Dao Yuan Great Tribulation. The Dao Yuan Great Tribulation is here. What should we do? Don't worry, it's just a tribulation. If you join, you can even obtain the Great Fortune Aura. Do you want to give it a shot? Not interested, I want to accompany sir. That's good, without you, I will be eating leftover food. Humph! Sir understands my importance. Sienna's cooking skill is getting better and better, hick. If I continue eating this much, I might get high cholesterol, hick. But now that I'm full, I've had a bright idea, hick. The Great Tao Tribulation is approaching, and there will undoubtedly be chaos in the heavenly law of the Nine Realms. I can take advantage of this opportunity by incorporating my Heavenly Tao plan, which, if all goes well, has the potential to absorb all nine realms. The Origin Tao Crystal nourishes the Heavenly Tao, and the Origin Tao Crystal is linked to the Great Tao. If that's the case, I can simply wait for the nine realms to return to the Heavenly Tao before absorbing everything through the Great Tao. If I manage to subdue the Great Tao, what kind of rewards will the system give me? The ancient realm is the most critical problem right now because there is no foundation for the heavenly Tao and it is the closest location to the great Tao. If I want to execute this plan, I need to take over the ancient realm. I need to trick Hong Yuan Chu and his group, give them some items so they can help lay the foundation for the ancient realm. I need to contact Ren Zhanghe and Luo Ming as well, let them go to the ancient realm to take charge. A good show is about to start. Sir, little sister Qin Ying is back. She is asking for an audience. Oh? Don't tell me she wants to turn back into a guy. I don't have a way to do that now. Master, disciple Qin Ying is here to pay her respect. Xiao Qin, Master is currently in seclusion and unable to meet with you. If there are any issues, tell them to Sien her, and I will solve them for you after I am done. Master, I want to return to train the Great Qin army so that I can reclaim the Great Qin's past glory. I see, no problem. Remember to continue your mission in the East region once you are done with the training. Hey, hey, just a false alarm. Yes, Master, Disciple bids her farewell. Good, go ahead. Sister Siener, goodbye. Little Sister Qin, goodbye. Something appears to be wrong with Sir today. Sienner, go to the small world, get two Dao fruits, and give them to Du Yuan. Tell him to consume them, then accompany him to Chaos Realm to set up the heavenly Dao talisman. Dao fruit? Sir, I have never eaten a Dao fruit before. All the natural materials and treasures you eat in the small world aren't inferior to the Dao fruit. You have to take it step by step. There is no shortcuts in cultivation. Sir, I just want to know what it tastes like. That's no problem. When you break through into the heavenly realm, I'll give you one. Thank you, sir. Today's the last day of my life. That old beast, he should be here soon. My entire life has been riddled with misfortune. Since the moment I left the small mountain village. I did my best and entered the sect. I felt so proud and lucky at that moment. Until I met the grandson of the sex ancestor, and that beast shattered my dream. He ordered a senior sister to pretend to be in love with me. 
After I invested all my feelings, that beast appeared and told me this was all just a prank to tease me. The reason why that beast did it is all because I accidentally touched his dog. After that, I became a joke in the sect. I thought he would let me off, but... That beast had grown bored of teasing me. He thinks killing me will be able to excite his perverse nature. I am just someone who hoped to enter the sect and change my life. I didn't expect to be a toy in the hands of others. In fact, even a dog lives a better life than me. However, I no longer have any regrets. At least I managed to fight back and kill that beast. But I am at the end of the road, the backing of the beast. The old beast is coming here. This means the last day of my life is also here. I feel so bored lately. Other than breaking through to the Dao Yuan realm, I don't really have any desires. Ha, boring. Let's play with the heavenly mirror of 10,000 Daos. I've gathered the sons of fortune from the nine realms except for the west and central regions. Let's see if I can find any sons of fortune that slip through my fingers. Chao Ming, central region son of fortune, started off as a negligible existence, went through a rough time. Nice. I got exactly what I wished for. But looking at him, it seems. There's an old bastard trying to kill my son of fortune. Pay for my grandson's life. This is the end. You old bastard that pops out of nowhere. Die for me. Old bastard? Are you talking about me? What? Just a roar end. Little friend, don't be alarmed. Seen you, you. I am just an idle traveler that drifts through the nine realms. A traveler with such exceptional skills, just a roar can kill a heavenly realm warrior. If he took action, I might die from the aftermath of his attack. Little friend, I already know about all the troubles you went through in your life. That's why I decided to lend a helping hand. Don't be afraid. Senior, can you see through my entire life? As a commoner in a village, you were able to join a sect. You wanted to make a name for yourself, but you were targeted by someone evil. Finally, you fought back and killed him. It's not easy to accomplish all of this. What happened today can also be seen as fate. I see that your talent isn't bad. Are you willing to become my disciple? Senior, I am not worthy. Are you unwilling? No, 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 I am willing. I just find it unbelievable. The opportunity is here. You can accept it. Yes, senior. No, I should call you master. Good, good, good. I will pass down a technique to you. I have transmitted all the suitable techniques into your brain. Go cultivate diligently. Thank you, master. No problem. I have also passed you a heavenly Tao talisman. Find a chance to set it up in the central region. I have also set up a formation in the valley you are in. No one will disturb you. You can cultivate in peace. Yes, master. Today is such a great day. One month later. Huff. I didn't expect to make it so quickly. My talent is not bad at all. But it's all because of Master. Otherwise, I'd be dead by now. Chao Ming. Master. You are here. How is your cultivation going? Any improvement? Master, I am at the third stage of the Emperor Realm now. So do you plan to leave the valley now? Disciple feels that his cultivation is still too low. I would like to continue cultivating. Good. You are worth teaching. You should leave the valley after breaking through to the third stage of the deity realm. Disciple understands. Cough, cough. He he he. Chao Tiani. You won't have a good death. You don't have to be so rude. Brother M.O., I did nothing more than what you would have done in the first place. He he. If I hadn't done what I just did, I'd be the one on the shore right now, and you'd be in my place. I just took action faster than you, that's all. Ha ha ha. Your deity body, I will take it. You are ruthless. I shouldn't have trusted you. Brother M.O., what are you talking about? 
We never trusted each other. It was due to the situation. We had no choice but to work together. You are right. We were just using each other. Brother M.O., don't worry. I will definitely help you kill all your enemies. Brother Chow is so considerate. You are welcome. Brother M.O., it's what I should do. However, Brother Chow, I think you should worry for yourself. What? Don't think about spoiling my plans. Looks like this time Brother Chow is too slow. What's that noise? Is there someone else here? Ha, huh, Master sent me here to collect treasure tools, but looking at the quality of these tools, it might be hard for me to report back. Forget it. Let's wander around a bit more. Kill. Kill Imo Hong Lu. Kill Imo Hong Lu. Chao Tiani. Kill Imo Hong Lu. So strong. How is that possible? We're both in the deity realm. I'm almost at the peak as well. Kill. Mo Hong Lu. Kill. Looks like he has gone crazy. No choice. I can only. Dao Treasure Luminous Day, Soul Destroying Mace. Come. Kill. Ah. Damn it. Even using a Dao Treasure didn't give me much of an advantage. Let's escape. Ah. Kill. So annoying. Dao Seeking Mirror Activate. Oh. This breath, the extreme Dao? Big Brother Dao Seeking Mirror, where is this guy from? Tu Wang Dao, the extreme Dao of killing and the twelfth stage of the Dao realm, previously slaughtered three kings, an extreme Dao that is not tolerated within the nine realms. Slaughtered third kings? It's unknown how long since the nine realms were created, the three races don't have a king, so he's the instigator. Such a talent, it's rare. But his extreme Dao is forbidden, such a pity. Tu Wang Dao. Who is it? Do you want to be a part of this skeleton pile? You are here to kill me because of my extreme Dao. Stop trying to deceive me with these tricks. Hey, <laughs> hey, that's not it. It's the opposite. I'm here to give you a chance to help spread the glory of extreme Dao. Currently, you're stuck at the 12th stage of the Dao realm, unable to progress. Am I right? You, how did you know? You're trying to deceive me. Humph, no rush. I will explain. You slaughtered third kings and had an explosive growth within a short time. However, that's not the correct cultivation method for the extreme Dao. The early phase of cultivation of the extreme Dao is very unstable. You can already feel it going out of control. Am I right? Your Dao principles are out of control, which means you're already excluded and may even suffer backlash. Expert, do you have any solution? There is. But we aren't related. If you are willing to become my disciple, I will teach it to you. What? You. Don't be angry. Everything is fated. If you are unwilling then, so be it. We will see each other again if fate wills it. Expert. Wait. Oh? What is it? I am willing to acknowledge you as my master. Heh <laughs> heh. I knew you wouldn't be able to hold back. Still pretending to be reserved. Good. Because we are fated to be together, I will accept you as my disciple. You must now follow my lead in everything from now on. Yes, this disciple will obey the master's orders. Very good. First things first, clean up all the bones in this hole. Handle them properly. Huh? No way. Hmm? Do you have doubts? Disciple doesn't dare. Xiang Xing seeks an audience with the phone family's head. Xiang Xing seeks an audience with the phone family's head. Noisy, noisy. Who are you? 
I am Xiam Xing. I have a matter that requires his help. The head isn't home. Please return. Eh, hold on. Anyone who comes is a guest. Huh? Young master. Humph. I previously lost to you by mistake, Xiam Xing. I didn't expect you to show up on my doorstep. Young master phone. I still haven't received the information you promised me from our previous battle. Humph. You came all the way here just for this? Why don't you tell me what information you require? The location of my mother. Oh? This is strange. What does your mother have to do with our family? My father said that my mother is from the Fong family. If that's the case, may I know her name? I have never met my mother, but I heard her name is Rupying. Fong Rupying. I know her. That's my aunt. Ah. Then I will have to address young Master Fong as cousin brother. Eh, well said. Well said. Can cousin brother tell me my mother's location? Aya, this is difficult. Even though she's your mother, it's still a matter within my family. Your surname is Xiang and it's not part of our family. However, I will give you a chance. Since we became friends through a fight, let's spar again. If the family questions me about it, I can say it's the bet for the spar. Okay. I ask for cousin brother's guidance. Yeah. A spar using assassination tools? This bitch is just trying to take revenge for the previous fight. But fourth sake of mother. Little brother Xiang's skills aren't as good as before. It's cousin brother's improvement that's fast. I admit defeat. For my mother, I have to bear with it. Again. Cough cough cousin brother is formidable. Humph. It's been two hours. I'm tired. Let's end it here today. You can return. Wait. Cousin brother should honor his promise and tell me the location of my mother. Who knows who your mother is? Don't act like you know anyone in our family. Someone like you does not exist in our phone family. Also, stop calling me cousin brother. So disgusting. Bastard. Are you serious? Humph. Butler. Young master. I am here. Send the guest off. Sir, please. What the? What happened? I didn't even have a moment to speak. Save. This feeling of despair, I will never forget it in my life. I am certain if this punch hits me, I will leave this world. But the current me can't speak, can't call for help, can't even beg for mercy. Please show mercy. Young Hero Xiang, I apologize for not coming to greet you. My family's junior has offended you. I hope Young Hero Xiang can forgive him. This old man will give Young Master Xiang proper compensation. Who are you? This old man is the family head's cousin as well as Xiao Qing's uncle, Feng Ying. Regarding young Hero Xiang's mother, it's an enmity from the previous generation. Xiao Qing indeed doesn't know, but this old man can help you. Are you certain you have news about my mother? This old man will guarantee with his head. I am not deceiving young Hero Xiang. I only plead with young Hero Xiang to spare my nephew's life. Fine. I will believe you one last time. This trash won't be a problem even if I don't kill him. Young Hero Xiang, please follow me. Please enter. Is my mother really related to the Fong family? Your mother is indeed a direct bloodline of the Fong family. Then I really am Fong Xiaoqing's cousin brother? Not really. Your mother is the cousin sister of the previous family head, so. You are Xiaoqing's cousin uncle. Senior, 
Where are you bringing me? Young Hero Xiang, don't be nervous. This old man is not lying to you. Almost there. Once we are there, you will get the answer to everything you want to know. I hope so. This old man has a question for young Hero Xiang. Did your mother ever tell you about a Dao fruit? Dao fruit? My mother left when I was young. I don't really have any memories of her. Oh, is that true? Young Hero Xiang, we are here. It's right past the door. It's been a long time since anyone has come, so it's a little worn out. I hope young Hero Xiang doesn't mind. Young Hero Xiang, please go ahead. Thank you, senior. This is Fong Family's Forbidden Ground. Young Hero Xiang's mother is being held captive here. Unfortunately, because I am not the family head, I am unable to break the seal and allow young Hero Xiang to meet his mother. All those rumors about my mother appear to be rumors. But why is my mother imprisoned? Dao Fruit? Yes. You're indeed here. Big Brother. This person was responsible for Xiao Qing's injuries. How dare you to remain here? Big Brother, how about you leave this matter to me? You're going to use your conciliation policy. Remember, Feng Ying, that I, Feng Lai, am the head of the Feng family. The child of the Xiang family. If you know what's good for you, hand over the Dao fruit. Dao fruit? Me? Who else? We already searched the entire Xiang family previously. For decades, your mother has been imprisoned here. The only thing we didn't realize was that she has a child. Big brother. Don't be arbitrary. We should. Xiao Ying. Have you forgotten our mission? The Dao fruit was meant to revive our ancestor. But Feng Ruping actually hid it. It's been decades. Our Feng family can't wait any longer. If you don't hand over the Dao fruit, don't think of leaving this place. Head of the Feng family. This junior knows nothing about the Dao fruit. Why not let me meet your mother and ask her about it? Humph. So that the two of you can flee together? You think I'm a three-year-old kid. Since you don't want to talk. Take this. Phone family head. This has ended on a sour note. I will take my leave. Want to leave? Not so easy. Soaring Phoenix's feather. Aurora. Technique. Damn it. His escape technique is superb. Gather the Fong family's elites. We are heading to the Xiang family to capture him. How about you extinguish the flames first? Ha, ha, where is this place? The Fong family shouldn't be able to catch up. But where should I go? I definitely can't return to the Xiang family. This is not a situation in which I need to bother master. I know where I should going. The next day. Open the door. If you are capable enough to hide the Dao fruit, you should be capable enough to open the door. Guests from the Fong family. Sorry for the wait. We have prepared tea. Please head to the hall to try it. Also, the father and son pair, Xiang Bang and Xiang Xing, are no longer a part of Xiang family. If you are looking for them, you have to look elsewhere. What? He gave up his position as the family head? Master, please save Sister Hua. How did this happen? What is her connect ion to you? What exactly did you go through on your trip home? My trip home. Many of my relatives tried to make things hard for me as expected. Nonetheless, I was able to glean some information about my mother from my father and the records in the library. So as to not implicate my father, I did not accept his help. Since I am alone, I have no choice but to seek help from Sister Hua. With Sister Hua's help, I met Feng Xiaoqing. As expected, Feng Xiaoqing lost to me. But he escaped. I pursued him all the way to the Feng family to continue my investigation. But Feng Xiaoqing tricked me. Of course, I got my revenge. Feng Xiaoqing would have died if it hadn't been for Senior Feng Ying's intervention. 
Senior Fong Ying helped me out. He brought me to the Fong family's forbidden ground where my mother has been locked up. Actually, everything was going well. But the Fong family head appeared and turned everything around. When the odds are stacked against him, a wise man knows better than to fight. I was also in their territory. So I got away. I had to think of another plan to save my mother. Once again, as expected, the Fong family went to the Xiang family. I wasn't there, but I didn't expect my father to leave the Xiang family so as not to not implicate them. The Fong family are indeed human king's descendants. They had a ton of manpower and managed to find me really quickly. Sister Huaf came to my aid and managed to turn the situation around. But Sister Huaf suffered a fatal injury. The Fong family appears to be willing to go to any length to revive their ancestor. I carried Sister Hua and managed to escape. I can't think of any other ways, so I had to beg Master for help. Master, please save Sister Hua. The only reason she got injured was due to this disciple. Hmm. I understand everything now, don't panic. Let me examine your Sister Hua. Her clone was killed, and she suffered an injury to her soul. Although it's a fatal injury, to your master, it's nothing complicated. She will be fine. Many thanks, master. Use the soul-stabilizing pill to stabilize the eight meridians, then supplement with the great restoration pill. Take this as well. There are too many flaws in the martial art she practiced, her clones will lower her cultivation level and provide more targets for the enemy to attack. Ask her to practice this in the future. Take the mental focus pill with the rootless water. After six hours, you can take the great restoration pill. Didn't you just say that the Fong family had to go through the same ordeal in order to resurrect an ancestor? Master, that's right. My mother's imprisonment is also related to this. Zero. If I'm not wrong, then that ancestor must be Fong Kong. Master, I don't understand. They're willing to disregard the life and death of living people for the sake of an ancestor? It seems that you don't understand, but this ancestor Fong Kong is actually the human king from the previous generation. Once the human king is revived, the Fong family's position within the nine regions will certainly have the possibility to rise. But consider how many lives will be ruined as a result of this so-called Jianghu standing. This does not sit well with me. I understand. Your mother was probably punished because she hid the Tao fruit. Master is very perceptive. That is indeed what Elder Fong Ying said. I never would have thought that this human king from the previous generation actually left behind a portion of his mind. If it can be saved, perhaps I could use it, however. Xiao Xing, after all, the Fong family are still your blood relatives, so what are you planning on doing now? Master, I. Your disciple doesn't know, the human king's family has never recognized me as part of their family. But my mother is certainly part of the human king's bloodline, no matter what reason, the fact that they imprisoned my mother is irrefutable. I think that only after I save my mother will I be able to make a decision. We'll see whether the Fong family is friend or foe. All right, because your master now knows your thoughts, no need to feel pressured, and do whatever your heart tells you, I believe you can do it. However, by no means should you be blinded by hatred, otherwise, you'll only be the next Fong Lai. Your disciple will keep in mind your teachings. All right, I'm leaving now. Farewell, master. Cough, cough. Sister Hua, you're awake. Where are we? Fong Rupying. Who would have thought that you had a son? Why don't you keep pretending to be deaf? Your son will suffer as a result of this. Your son will return all of your flaws. Did don't think that just because you remain silent that this matter will pass over. Everyone in the Fong family is eagerly awaiting the ancestor's revival. The only one who caused problems is you. You're really a traitor. Why don't you stay here and continue idling in solitude? The ancestor will absolutely be revived. Let's start. It's time. Hey, you're finally ready? That's the eighth sound. It seems that the great tribulation is about to come. 
The heaven and earth of the nine regions are becoming more and more chaotic. I wonder how the others are doing. Fellow evil cultivators, the evil palace has already collapsed. It will no longer exist. My eccentric evil palace will seize this opportunity. All fellow evil cultivators willing to pledge their allegiance to my eccentric evil palace are welcome. Eccentric evil, eccentric evil, the best in the nine regions. Join the eccentric evil and obtain the best teachings. This little demon king, he's finally obtained what he truly desired. Let's check elsewhere. Soldiers. Good news. Our great Qin territory has expanded more than 30 miles west. But for great Qin it is entirely possible. We will kick the treasured bird and punch the flood dragon. Their vigor isn't bad. Speaking of this Qin Ying really has more of an emperor's disposition compared to Qin Kiyun. Now let's check somewhere else. Change the channel. Your Excellency Black Moon. You finally returned. Your subordinates have been eagerly awaiting your return. No need for such formalities. There's only one reason why I came back this time. To expand into the southern zone. Expand into the southern zone? That's right. This must be carried out immediately. Not bad. This should have been done long ago. I wonder, who should I see next? Hold on. This kid. Ha ha damn it. I still failed. It seems that it's still too much of a stretch to try to break through. He's just a mortal. But just now, he had a flash of insight into the heavenly Tao. What kind of comprehension and determination is this? Given enough time, even without my assistance, there's no doubt he'd be able to break through. That's right. I should go check on my other disciples too. The king told me to patrol the mountains. La la la. Huh? Red mist. It seems that there's something fishy ahead. Let me go take a look. This? Impossible. I already killed him. How did he come back to life? Let's just destroy his entire body. This weirdo's soul doesn't seem to exist. To be accurate, it seems his soul and body had already merged as one. Finally dead? If he's not dead after this, I, Rong Jiahao, will escape immediately. That's not good. This strange race, if an expert appears, it will be a disaster. There's no way he can revive again, right? I can't continue to investigate. Let's return and spread the news. The blood fiend race appeared. This means the Dao Yuan tribulation is descending soon. The flow of aura in the nine realms is chaotic, and the heavenly law has also changed. This chaotic flow conceals the Tao of Luck. Inform the Black Moon House, the Blood Fiend race has appeared in the West region. Regarding how they handle this news, it will be up to them. The disciples can choose whether or not to participate in the tribulation to fight for the Tao of Luck. The 30-year deadline is approaching. I wonder what the rewards will be. As long as I remain in seclusion and do not leave the house, I will soon enter the Tao Yuan realm. You've been in seclusion for 30 years. Keep up the good work, stay at home, and set a new record. Rewarded one ancient chaos mountain. Hmm? That's it? The 30-year reward is so simple? A mountain? There must be something special about it. Inspect system reward. Ancient chaos mountain is a mountain born from chaos. After years of great changes and tribulations, it still managed to stand strong. It contains a thick intent of chaos. It has the ability to stabilize the great Tao, heaven, and earth, as well as to strengthen chaos creatures. Because it contains a thick layer of chaos intent, it will spread chaos intent to its surroundings. What a treasure, it's worthy enough to be the 30-year reward. The mountain isn't big, but it's extremely heavy. If it wasn't a reward from the system, I would never be able to move it with my strength. 
I am at the seventh stage of Tao realm and still won't be able to move it. This mountain is indeed horrifying. Let's place it in a small word. The limit of the small world is now higher than the nine realms. It will eventually be better than the nine realms. I wonder if it's just endless chaos outside of the Great Tao. What could it be? Does the Great Tao have a boundary? All of these are still unknown to me. This thread of chaos aura might not be much compared to what the system usually rewards, but it will eventually accumulate. These fragments of chaos are treasures to the Tao realm and Tao Yuan realm warriors. They can stabilize the Great Tao. Nothing happened? These fragments of chaos are too sturdy and unimaginable. Using the ground splitting book and I only barely cut off a small part. These fragments of chaos are precious treasures. Let's ask the group. Tao communication group, fellow Taoists, does anyone have a chaos stone? Chaos stone? I have never obtained one before, but rumors are that the chaos stone is a precious treasure. Never got it before. Don't have it. Is it a black color stone? It's extraordinary and can stabilize the great Tao. Long June has seen it before? Or, does he have the Chaos Stone? It can't be. He has never left the Great Tao. How can he obtain the Chaos Stone? That's right. Has Tao Friend long seen it before? Yes, I can't remember when it was. I met someone on the Great Tao, and in his hand was a small stone piece. It allows him to be very stable on the Great Tao. Based on what you said, I think that's the Chaos Stone. Chaos Stone, is it that rare? Listening to your tone, is it easy for you to get a chaos stone? L, what the fuck, I have only heard about it. I've never ever seen one. Senior Chu has a chaos stone? Not a chaos stone, I only have an ancient chaos mountain. What do you mean by only an ancient chaos mountain? A mountain? How can you compare that to a stone? Senior Chu is definitely a super big shot. What does a chaos mountain look like? It's just a bigger chaos stone, nothing too rare. Can I ask my fellow Tao friends, does the Great Tao have an endpoint? A boundary? The Great Tao should be endless? The Great Tao is formless, it's everywhere and thus endless, and has no boundary. It's time. Fellow Tao Yuan Rome warriors, let's start another group. We can discuss the Great Tao there so as not to affect the Tao heart of the younger warriors. Senior Chu's words are right. Senior Chu's words are right. Senior Chu's words are right. Shu Yang, you useless trash. Continue hanging out with the young warriors. This master is heading to the Dao Yuan realm group. Motu, this guy, does he have some kind of huge enmity with Shu Yang? Dao communication group, I like to sleep, and I haven't traveled all the way around the great Dao, so I'm not sure if there is an endpoint or boundary. I have traveled quite a bit, but I have also never seen an endpoint or boundary. Even a creature born from the Great Tao doesn't know the end point of it. Does it really have no boundary? I was once on the Great Tao and saw something blurry in the distance, but I couldn't cross over. Maybe that was the end point? Could the Great Tao really have an end point? A boundary? Maybe that blurry place is also a part of the Great Tao? That blurry place, could that be chaos? The chaos outside of the Great Tao? I should just leave this mystery for the Tao Yuan realm warriors to ponder. Fellow Tao friends, I have another quest I on. Where is chaos? Where is chaos? I have only heard about it so I have no idea. Within the chaos, is there the Great Tao? Is chaos created by the Great Dad, or is the Great Tao created by chaos? As expected, compared to a super big shot like Senior Chu, I am still inexperienced. Is chaos the result of the Great Tao, or is the Great Tao the result of chaos? Fellow Tao friends should properly consider it. Such a big secret, gaining enlightenment, wanting to improve your cultivation is not difficult. I'll let you guys think about it, otherwise you all are already bored, always thinking about the tribulation. Many thanks to Senior Chu for lecturing us on the Tao. Many thanks to Senior Chu for lecturing us on the Tao. Many thanks to Senior Chu for lecturing us on the Tao.
MMM, Dow Friends, think about it. I'll discuss the Dow with Dow Friends again. Until next time. What rewards will I receive after the Northern Region returns to the Heavenly Dow? Once I have sufficient strength, I can insert my tentacles into the East Region and start preparing to absorb the Eastern Region. The setup in the Central Region is crucial. Qin Ming is already at the first stage of Honorable Realm. By using the refinement method of the communication talisman, he is now an elder of a big sect in the Qin Prefecture, and because of that, the central region is now filled with communication talismans. The plan can be considered a success. Hu Tinya has once again been crowned as the young master of the heavenly tiger race and is also preparing for the tribulation. Xiao Liang and Ding Yu are either still inside the secret realm or entered the realm of some hidden small tribes. Their fates are strong and should break through to the heavenly realm soon. Devil Buddha is using communication talismans to bewitch the experts of the heavenly devil race and also experts who are stuck in a bottleneck or dying due to their lifespan ending. The only way to survive for them is to convert to Buddhism. This devil Buddha fellow looks so amiable and kind, wearing a white monk's robe free of dust, as if Bodhisattva himself has descended. But he is actually extremely sinister, always plotting schemes. Not bad, they are all sons of fate, born to fight the calamity, exceptional performance is expected. I should find a time and gather the disciples, let them meet and familiarize with each other. Uh, this demon Buddha is brazen L.Y. spreading Buddhism within the demon clan. I.D. What's more is that I heard that many of the strong characters within the demon clan have been secretly practicing Buddhism. But they've been hiding it too well and we can't even find a trace of it. The opportunity will come, let's just ignore the matters regarding the Buddhist clan. The Great Tribulation will arrive soon. This is a big opportunity for our demon clan that will allow us to return to our former glory. At the moment, the Buddhist clan has nothing to worry about. The more important thing we have to worry about now is to fight for the destiny of the Tribulation. But in the end, the Buddhist clan will be a hidden danger. Who cares about some Buddhist clan when they are all part of our demon clan in the end? They think they can escape from the palm of my hand just because they practice a few Buddhist techniques? Our demon clan's ins and outs are far from ordinary. The great clan elder's words are insightful. Central Zone Human King G Family, Black Moon House Who cares, that's not important. As long as I have my son, leading the G Family will be inevitable. I will bring back my ancestors' former glory. Come in. Father, the younger generation of the Ji family, Ji Shinshin. He's less than 150 years old, but has already reached the heavenly realm. The great Dao Yuan tribulation is approaching soon. What are your plans? Fight for it. Don't worry, Father. I will fight hard to obtain this great destiny not only for the Ji family, but for the whole human race. I'll let the world know that my human King Ji family is the foundation of the human race. Great. Your father believes in you, so you must strive to obtain the great destiny. Father, the Tianyue Tower is looking for her. What are your thoughts on this matter? Father, no matter if it was previously right or wrong, how can we let others interfere in the matters of our G family? Since we're part of the G family's bloodline, the Tianyue Tower is really reaching their hands too far. No matter if father likes or hates her, Tianyue Tower's rules cannot be applied to the members of our Ji family. Since we're part of the Ji family's bloodline, then how can we be bound by the Tianyue Tower's rules? Then what do you think we should do? We'll cut off the Tianyue Tower's overreaching hand because it's past time for us to show our power and remind everyone that our Ji family is still the Central Zone's ruler. The Great Tribulation is about to come, so our G family will take action and gather the will of the people, cross this tribulation together, and establish rules. The human race must not have internal conflict at this time. Ha ha. Good, very good. It seems that my son has the disposition of a human king. So go on and do it. A great wave of disturbances has suddenly appeared in the once peaceful central region. The young master of the Ji family, Ji Shinshin, suddenly emerged, 
and with three blows, heavily injured the newly promoted Saintus of the Tianyue Tower, as well as killed another Tianyue Tower elder with a singular blow. At the same time, many other successors of the other human king families have begun to take action as well. Ji Shinshin's emergence means that the Ji family is starting to prepare for the great Dao Yuan tribulation. The Ji family's young master, but he's also my elder brother. Yuer, it seems that the Tianyue Tower is looking for you. Grandfather, you don't need to worry because the Tianyue Tower won't be able to find me on such short notice. Ji Shinshin is still a domineering powerhouse. The Ji family's young master, Ji Shinshin. Back then I brought you out of the central zone, but we were blocked by the Tianyue Tower. But it was precisely that mighty young man who entered the scene in such a domineer ING manner that intimidated the Tianyue Tower so that we could leave the central zone without a hitch. Yuer, do you have any enmity towards Ji Shinshin? No, but I don't have any favorable impressions towards the Ji family, nor do I feel any sense of belonging. As for his domineering attitude, I'm afraid that some conflicts will eventually develop between us. Grandfather, don't worry, I, Black Moon, am not worse than Ji Shinshin. What's so good about the human king Ji family? What's so good about Ji Shinshin? I, Black Moon, am not ordinary either, especially with the support of my master. If the plan of the heavenly Tao is successfully applied, who cares about some human king family, who cares about some mighty and extraordinary man? If the Tianyue Tower dares to come, I'll kill them all. I will personally go and get revenge against the Tianyue Tower. The Ji family dates back to ages ago, they're an ancient human king family. I wonder if the Ji family ancestor from back then already reached the Daoyuan realm? This Dao Yuan realm, so far I only know that Kuan he has reached the Dao Yuan realm. He rose to prominence in the last era, and he's the only Dao Yuan realm we know of. From those human kings from back then, I wonder how many still exist, and how many have passed away. Ha ha ha, this old man finally has the disposition of a heavenly realm cultivator. This old man is beyond saving, isn't it just breaking through two small stages? He's actually this happy? Let me go out and display my power for a bit. Bastard, bastard, wait for me to break through to the heavenly realm. I will absolutely kill this bastard. This pisses me off. What's wrong with the family head? He's just randomly yelling every so often. This old man goes out and shows off, but he eventually can't beat them, so he comes back all gloomy and lets off some steam. What a weirdo. Whatever, in the future, I won't help him improve his strength anymore. You have remained at home and carried out the Heavenly Dao plan, bringing the northern region into the Heavenly Dao, rewarded with the 36 Dao rules. Every minuscule detail regarding the northern region is all within my line of vision. It's like as long as I want to, I'm able to know each and every thought of all living beings in the northern region. The battlefield from the ancient times, secret and hidden realms, races that are springing up, I can see it all clearly. The rumored and long-dead races, at this moment in time, are breathing their last breaths in the secret realm, however, their strength is incomparable to that of the human race. The Eighth Stage of the Tao Realm This increase in strength was really too easy, if it were not for the heavenly Tao plan, how could I have increased my cultivation this fast? Receive the 36 Tao Rules The Ninth Stage of the Tao Realm Breaking through a realm and experiencing the strength increase is really refreshing. Next, I have to create a plan for the Heavenly Tao of the Northern Region. In order to improve the Heavenly Tao, I need to make great efforts to increase the strength of the Northern Region. When I used the Heavenly Tao to look down at the Northern Region, I saw quite a lot of hidden secrets, including ancient battlefields and secret realms. The blood fiend race was the most peculiar, as they could use the blood demonic chi to revive themselves, so they could be seen as practically immortal. In addition, the blood fiend race was cruel, were addicted to killing, and were bloodthirsty, so it's really a disastrous and frightening race that appeared in the Ninth Dao Yuan Tribulation. As long as it was a battle, as long as people died, as long as blood flowed, then there wouldn't be a lack of the blood demonic chi. 
Even if it's a secret technique or rare treasures, they cannot fully purify the evil, which basically means that this blood fiend race will essentially never be fully exterminated. This is the ninth extermination that occurred in the ninth Daoyuan Tribulation, the Great Battle. The terrifying race which emerged as a result of the resentment from the ninth Daoyuan Tribulation. Before I use the Heavenly Dao to purify the blood fiend race, I need to make some preparations. I need to use the Chaos Stone and refine it into a Heavenly Dao Talisman so that it can withstand the Great Dao's purification. Then I need to integrate this Heavenly Dao Talisman into the Primordial Dao Crystal and connect it with the Great Dao. Then I need to use the Blood Demonic Chi from the Ancient Battlefield and integrate it into the Heavenly Dao to purify it. Once the Blood Demonic Chi is purified, it will become a surging source of energy that can be directly poured into the Northern Region. Zero. This feeling, it feels like I'm about to break through. When a divine realm appears, it will bring the heavenly Tao many returns, causing the heavenly Tao to make great leaps. The more powerful beings there are here, the stronger the heavenly Tao gets. Even though the northern region is part of the human race's territory, it contains not only humans, but also some small races hiding in secret realms, which are on their last legs. There aren't even that many, so let's bring these small races back to the northern region. Having a wide variety of living beings within is also beneficial to the Heavenly Tao. Spirit Child, the situation seems off. We are the Earth Spirit Race. What if they force us back to the Northern Region? You need to protect our race. You are one of our race's Spirit Child. Don't worry. If we return to the Northern Region, I, Ding Yu, will protect the Earth Spirit Race. No matter what, I've taken so many treasures of the Earth Spirit race, I can't allow them to get bullied. Don't worry. The Earth Spirit race will be fine. Great King, something seems off in the Northern Region. Our secret realm seems to be returning back to it. You must protect our race. This youth from the human race is formidable. He won against the entire winged ape race alone. I wonder if he can protect my race. Changes in the northern region, is the Daoyuan Great Tribulation starting? It shouldn't be the time for it yet. Is it maybe related to Master? Don't worry, as long as the winged ape race is not hostile to the human race, it will be alright, I won't let anyone disturb you. Thank you Great King. Our winged ape ancestors were too violent and warlike and ended up offending an expert, he hunted us down and we eventually declined to this state. Right now, we only hope to continue to produce offspring and make sure our race doesn't die out. Purifying this ancient battleground alone took me 10 days. It shows how extraordinary the Blood Fiend race is. There are still a few smaller ancient battlegrounds where the Blood Fiend race already spawned. It's just their power hasn't fully developed. I need my disciples to have a better understanding of the Blood Fiend race. They will be able to deal with them more efficiently during the Great Tribulation. Ding Yu, Wang Luo, Xiao Liang. Ping Fan can be included as well. It's only right to join the Great Tribulation and fight for fortune. He is already at the third stage of the Honorable Realm. The race that fights against tribulations, the Blood Fiend race will appear in the ancient battleground. You guys should familiarize yourself with their information. Yes, Master. His power isn't that strong. He's not even in the Emperor Realm. Since he has the ability to revive, let's wait for him. You should be able to feel it through the Heavenly Tao. After they are exterminated, they will start to emerge again. Depending on the extent of destruction, revival might take some time. But after they revive, they are no longer the one that died before. He might have some resemblance, but he is actually a brand new existence. You can consider them as newborns, and their strength will be weaker than before. That might be the only shortcoming for the Blood Fiend race. It actually makes sense if you think about it. It's scary enough that they can revive, if it's without any cost, that will be heaven defying. There will definitely be an opportunity of life in the Great Tribulation. Strange, the revived Blood Fiend race is actually merging with other fallen members and getting stronger. If it was a big battle, there would be countless fallen blood fiends. 
If a newborn merged with all of them while reviving, how strong would he be? Deity realm? Also, is there a limit to how many times it can be revived? Fallen heavenly realm can merge into the deity realm. Fallen deity realm can merge into the Tao realm. Fallen Tao realm can merge into the Tao Yuan realm. I think the blood fiend race can not only fight the Tao Yuan great tribulations, but even the great Tao tribulation. Looks like I have to reconsider the plan of deployment for the tribulation. The horror of the blood fiend race, even if they are not the race to fight against the great Tao tribulations, they will definitely be the one to start it. The blood fiend race has no limits on emerging below the heavenly realm, certain limits for the deity realm, and for the Tao realm. I can't, a mysterious power is obstructing, I better stop deducing. Regarding their merging for the Tao realm, that's definitely possible. I am not strong enough, if I am in the Tao Yuan realm, I will be able to deduce it. I have to raise my strength quickly and enter the Tao Yuan realm. Let's hope the heavenly Tao plan can proceed faster. If I can devour seven realms, or eight realms, that will be enough for me to enter the Tao Yuan realm. It's been half a month, finally one has been revived. He's stronger. He is at the first stage of the Emperor realm. He merged from countless fallen blood fiends so he is stronger. Below the heavenly realm, they can merge and become stronger limitlessly. If that's the case, then the more blood fiends that die, the more powerful newborns there will be. It's endless? Master, is there no way to destroy them completely? This is the law of the race that fights against tribulation. During this tribulation, there will be an opportunity of life for them as well. You guys will have to find a way. If it was just the Tao Yuan Great Tribulation, the Blood Fiend race wouldn't be so horrifying. They would be easy to exterminate. But now that they are involved with the Great Tao Tribulation, what's after the Tao Yuan Great Tribulation? Listening to the tone of the Master, it seems like we are not just entering the next Tao Yuan after the Tribulation. Work harder, fight for the great fate and fortune, and rise up in this Tao Yuan Tribulation. Master hopes that in this great tribulation, you guys will be able to break through to the Tao realm, maybe even. The two of you can just wander around this ancient battleground. The ghost race is special. If any fallen warriors have a thread of soul remaining, they can convert them into the ghost race. The ghost race in this great tribulation will definitely rise up. But, they still won't be able to fight against the blood fiend race. Qin Ying, Black Moon, Xiang Xing, Qian Ming, Hu Qinya, and Devil Buddha have all entered to familiarize with the Blood Fiend race. Let the disciples get used to fighting the Blood Fiend race, even better if they can discover their weakness and the method to deal with them. If possible, we need to stop the Blood Fiend race from giving birth to stronger experts. The Heavenly Tao current first choice is the Eastern Prefecture of the Eastern Region, just a small part where the Heavenly Law or Power of Laws are similar. It's slowly penetrating through, but it's still not deep enough. It will need more time. The first Blood Fiend race appearance was in the Western Region, the territory of humans, and also the location of the Tao Yuan Great Tribulation. In the Northern Region, there are a few places filled with the flow of aura, all the older heavenly realm warriors are heading over. Then we will welcome a whole new batch of deity realm experts, and the Heaven's Tao will grow stronger as well. The current nine regions have actually already shrunk due to all the great battles and losing land to the void. The Tao Yuan Great Tribulation is the time for the ancient battlegrounds to return, returning the nine realms to what it was. This will be the ninth Tao Yuan. All the ancient battlegrounds of the past nine Tao Yuan will return and the nine regions shall return to their original form. This must be the full cycle. These blood fiends are in the Emperor Realm. We plan to kill them separately so as to slow down their revival. But no matter how far away, they still manage to merge together and get stronger. There seems to be a rule within their revivals, the amount of blood fiends has to be at a certain amount. If we use the blood fiends as materials, I wonder if we can refine them into a pill. I will try it with my forging technique as well. With my current Buddhist power, this small ancient battleground, I will need a few thousands or maybe ten thousand years to purify it. 
Furthermore, the blood fiend race won't appear here, fighting against Buddhist purifying power? That's too scary. In the ancient battlegrounds, the blood fiends are all above the emperor realm, honorable realm's blood fiends are increasing as well. If this situation continues, heavenly realm experts will appear eventually. Although they haven't found the method to completely exterminate the blood fiends, they managed to find a suitable strategy. You are fellow disciples. Get to know each other and exchange your knowledge and experience. This tiger is also master's disciple? A demon race? Amiable and kind, wearing a white monk's robe free of dust, but I don't know why. It feels like he isn't that benevolent. I am Dingyu, your eldest senior brother. Greetings, eldest senior brother. Let's just go to the training secret realm. Everyone can fight and get familiar with each other. Sounds good. I, as the eldest senior brother, can't even suppress my juniors. I am losing my face. I don't have to compete with Xiao Liang. We have always been on the same level and are unable to decide a winner between us. It's unexpected that Devil Buddha and Hu Qinya are actually evildoers. Qin Ying used to be the emperor of Great Qin. Her strength is definitely not weak. But Black Moon is unexpectedly strong. She is a tyrant in battle, imposing and overwhelming. Where is my dignity as the eldest senior brother? I must break through to the third stage of the heaven-reaching sword technique. To become a real eldest senior brother. Aren't the senior sisters too strong? I can't even resist, they can kill me instantly. Amitba, excellent, such a rare gathering, why not listen to me preach about Buddhism? Monk, we are fellow disciples, don't use such tricks, it's useless. Let's have a discussion about how to deal with the blood fiend race. My light of Buddhism can purify the blood fiend race, but my sword intent can also completely destroy the blood fiend race, but... The blood fiend race, they can be killed but revive endlessly, but can we use the blood fiends against themselves? Or maybe control them? How do we use the blood fiend race against themselves? And how do we control them? Formations and Restrictions Since the blood fiends can merge after they are destroyed, giving birth to a stronger blood fiend, then let's think of a quick and efficient method where we can separate the blood fiend's aura after the big battle. Then we can prevent them from merging, arrange a formation to trap them, and slowly purify them. I think this is a more efficient method, at least in the early stages of the blood fiend race. It's not a bad strategy against them. So there is also a need for a purifying formation. But there are a few issues we need to solve, such as a formation master, materials for the formation, and also how many blood fiend race should we exterminate to get the correct proportion. For now, we just need to wait for the right time to insert the heavenly Tao into the eastern prefecture of the eastern region. If not for inserting into to become part of the law, the nine regions aura would have been much more chaotic. The deity realm experts in the ancient barren region are looking for treasures and exploring areas that have mysterious light rays. Chao Tiani is still crazy. Anyone unlucky enough to run into him were all killed by him. If they have a 10,000 domains talisman and the deity realm experts are exchanging information, it's not difficult to avoid Chao Tiani. Ren Changhe is heading towards the center of the nine regions, near to the ancient barren region to set up some things. Those small races that have been hiding are also exiting their secret realm and returning to the northern region. Let the Black Moon House spread that the Heavenly Tao contains good karma, no indiscriminate killing of the small races, no extermination of the small races, if not you will be going against the Heavenly Tao. Along with the appearance of the small races, the different kinds of living creatures in the northern region has increased, causing the Heavenly Tao to change, and also a special method of rising. The day of the Tao Yuan Great Tribulation is getting nearer as well. Qin Ying, Xiang Xing, Ding Yu, and the other disciples are all getting ready to enter the tribulation and to deal with the blood fiend race. Black Moon has also started moving for the Heavenly Tao plan, making changes to the framework of Black Moon House. Expanding their military forces, increasing their speed of gathering resources, and pushing into the southern and western regions. At some moment, a muffled sound rang through the nine regions, the Great Tribulation descended. 
The time is now. The heavenly Tao can invade the eastern region. Occupying one-third of the heavenly law of the eastern prefecture in the eastern region, this is a big improvement. Northern prefecture of the western region. A great opportunity. Let's go quickly. There must be a lot of treasures inside. This is not an opportunity, but a disaster. A disaster for the entire western region. Run. I need to run away. Our tribe is eternal. Kill our way out. Feast on their flesh and blood. Empower our race. The nine regions belongs to us. All living creatures are nothing but our food. Kill. Kill these monsters. We ran into monsters. What monster are you? You dare to offend the human race? Human race? Overlord of the nine regions? Ha ha, soon you won't be, and you will be food for my race. You dare kill humans. Immediate extermination. My race is eternal, mere human race. You are just food. You dare to talk about exterminating my race? I will return soon and exterminate your entire race. The blood fiend king is dead. Let's go. Head to the nest and exterminate them. We can look for treasures at the same time. Let's go. How many of them died to form this blood lake? I will kill all of you and eat you all. This blood fiend king is much stronger than before he died. He is just one step away from the deity realm. I will kill all of you and eat you all. Kill. Kill them all, then burn them to ashes. Don't give them the chance to revive. I am back, my food. My race is eternal. The blood fiend race is much more horrifying than I thought. In such a short time, he's already in the deity realm. The western region cannot fall, at least before the heavenly Tao invades it, it cannot fall into the hands of the blood fiend race. Or else, it will be a huge hindrance to the heavenly Tao plan. That's why, the western region's warriors have to be prepared beforehand, especially setting up defense for certain locations. Will the blood fiend race appear in the other prefectures of the western region? Quick, prepare for battle. Your heavenly Tao has expanded, devouring the eastern prefecture in the eastern region, rewarding one stage of cultivation in the Tao realm. Finally, the heavenly Tao has expanded outside of the northern region, devouring the first prefecture outside of it. The second target is the western region. It's in a dangerous state and can fall at any moment. I need to establish a foundation for it as soon as possible. I am not sure why. There are changes in the fortune of me and my race. It seems to be breaking apart and there are still changes ongoing. Can any senior explain to me why this is happening? The specter race is about to perish. Not exactly. They are going to transform into the ghost race. Yusu is one of the ancient ancestors of the specter race. She only has two choices now. To continue living as the specter race and break off all relationship with the ghost race. Or she can ride on the fortune of the ghost race, and under the influence of their fortune, eventually transform into one of the ghost race. The specter race is perishing? Your situation seems to be a sign of the nine regions specter race perishing. The Daoyuan great tribulation of the nine regions has started, it's hard to see through it. I keep having the feeling that something's not right with the current Daoyuan great tribulation of the nine regions. I need to appear to comfort you, Sue and also convince her to accept the fortune of the ghost race, making her transform and becoming part of the ghost. This is but a small tribulation. The reason you guys can't see through it isn't due to this tribulation, but because of the effects of the actual great tribulation. If you find anything strange, don't panic. Don't worry about it. A Daoyuan great tribulation can't affect Daoyuan realm experts. The thing that can affect a Daoyuan realm expert is... I am not sure whether it's good or bad, but there seems to be some changes to the fortune of the devil race. Even I, a Dao Yuan realm expert, can't see through it, so it doesn't seem to be due to the devil race, but the influence of the tribulation. I am purposely causing a misunderstanding for MO2, so that the Dao Yuan realm expert of the devil race will think that the changes in fortune is due to the tribulation.
Regarding the problem of little friend Yusu, the specter race is going through a transformation, so the fortune will change as well. It's not a sign of extinction. Little friend Yusu, you can choose to ride the fortune after transformation. Do not fight or resist it. Follow the transformation of the fortune. It will eventually be the fortune of the specter race. Everything is good as long as it's not the specter race perishing. Senior, why is the specter race transforming? What will happen after the transformation? This is fate, an opportunity, rising up after transformation, it's a good thing. Thank you, Senior, for your explanation. Little friend Yusu, did you encounter any issues from writing the fortune after the transformation of the specter race? Senior, it seems to be rejecting me. It's fine, I will give you a technique which allows the specter race to merge together perfectly and go through the transformation together. She will ride the fortune and eventually become part of the ghost race. The Tao of Fortune is miraculous indeed. The technique that Senior gave is so exquisite and powerful. It's indeed a scary senior that can guide Tao Yuan realm experts. Just a random small technique from him is incredibly useful to me. Envious. To actually get pointers from the group's big shot. Fellow Tao friends, is chaos born from the great Tao, or is the great Tao born from chaos? Do you have any insights? I am ashamed, my potential is poor, so I have no insights. Did chaos come first, or did the great Tao come first? I have no idea, my understanding of the Tao is still too shallow. Slow-witted old ghost Hong, to have come up empty-handed. Oh, reckless MO2, do you have any ideas? No. Fellow Tao friends, how long has it been since you entered the Tao Yuan realm? The Tao Yuan realm is special. Your strength depends on the strength of the great Tao path you open. How do you judge the strength of the path? It depends on the length and width of the path. It has to be stable as well. In theory, the Tao Yuan realm has no end point. You can continue to open a bigger and longer path. I am ashamed to say... But it's only been two Dao Yuan for me, so a lot less than Brother Hong. How long is the path of Brother Chu? Chu Xian is the super big shot, an ancient existence. Brother Chu, can you let us fellow juniors learn some knowledge? What should I say? How big should it be to be a real expert? A super big shot? My potential is mediocre. After cultivating wholeheartedly, I only managed to open a fresh 100,000 miles long and about 10,000 miles wide small and narrow path. I am ashamed. The group has no reaction. Not even one reply. My potential is mediocre. After cultivating wholeheartedly, I only managed to open a few hundred thousand miles long and about 10,000 miles wide small and narrow path. I am ashamed. Was what I said too little? Did I destroy the image that I painstakingly built? For Tao Yuan realm experts, it seems opening a few hundred thousand miles long Great Tao Path isn't difficult at all. A few hundred thousand miles is actually a short distance to the Tao Yuan realm experts. I was too careless. My image of a super big shot is crumbling. What should I do? How do I convince this group of path opening experts? You told a lie in front of the Tao Yuan realm experts and frightened all of them, causing them to be unable to recover from their shock, rewarding a chaos path opening axe. Huh? Is it a success? I didn't mess it up? This group of people were so frightened that they were in a daze? If I manage to frighten them, it means a path of a few hundred thou sand of miles is really horrifying. My potential is poor, so opening a path is slow. I asked my fellow Tao friends to not laugh at me. A path that's more than a hundred thousand miles long? Did he say this is a poor potential? Then what are we? Worse than trash? The path I opened is greater than anyone in the same generation. It's a thousand miles long and slightly wider than one mile. But now, it seems like my path is so narrow and short. No, no, that's not even it. After all, Brother Chu describes his path as narrow and short. I worked so hard and the path I opened is only a few hundred of miles long. After listening to Chu Xian, I realized how wrong I was. 
I am worse than trash. Maybe Hong Yuan Chu can barely be considered trash. Opening a path that's hundred or thousand of miles, and we thought of ourselves as the best of the best, a horrifying existence within the path experts. Now I know, I am just a frog at the bottom of a well. Our final wish and goal was to open a path that's ten thousand miles long. But this big shot has opened a path that's a few hundred thousand miles long? Brother Chu, please receive my bow. Brother Chu is really a super expert. Meeting Brother Chu is indeed a great opportunity. That mysterious great tribulation, even the horrifying Brother Chu is paying attention to it, it must be really dangerous. I only opened such a short path, how can I survive the great tribulation? I need to hug the thigh of Brother Chu to get through it. Fellow Dao friends are too courteous. Fellow Dao friends, how about your paths? A few hundred thousand miles, that's very common, right? Opening a path that's a few hundred thousand miles long is very common? How is that possible? Should I tell the truth, what if he looked down on me? If Brother Chu thinks I am too useless and stops interacting with me, then what should I do? Fellow Dao friends, how about your paths? A few hundred thousand miles, that's very common, right? I am ashamed to say, but my potential is poor, my path is only about 600 miles long. No wonder they got so frightened, the difference between hundreds and a few hundred thousand, it would be weird if they weren't frightened. Isn't opening a path too difficult? Or are they too useless? She only managed to open a few hundred miles long path even after two Dao Yuan? I am ashamed to say, but my potential is poor, my path is only about 600 miles long. Fellow Dao friends don't have to be discouraged, a few hundred miles is not bad as well. Fellow Dao friends don't have to be discouraged, a few hundred miles is not bad as well. You girls are indeed more useless, only a 600 miles long path. My path is 1,100 miles long, pretty normal I guess. Kuan he opened his path later than the rest, it's only 400 miles long, but he is the one who has spent the shortest amount of time doing it. Hong Yuan Chu has opened a 1,300 miles path surpassing MO2 and the others. The Flood Dragon King is on par with MO2. MO Zhan and the rest are around 8 or 900 miles long. Bing Luoxing is the oldest Dao Yuan realm expert, her path is about 3,000 miles long. As Long Jun, Gue Ran, and Yi Yue Jun are creatures born from the Great Dao, their Dao is special, their strength depends on how much power they can draw from the Great Dao. Their strength isn't determined by the distance of the path they opened. How did Brother Chu open your path? You actually managed to open a few hundred thousand miles long path. Opening a path isn't difficult, just use an axe to split it open. Axe? Is this how you open a path? Maybe this is the level of a big shot. Opening a path is actually so relaxing. End the chat. Let's check the system's reward. Chaos Path Opening Axe holds the power to open a path within chaos and can cut apart the Great Dao. A weapon to open paths. This is a precious treasure. Using this weapon to open the path will increase the speed and make the path wider. Its speciality is that it will allow you to open a path within chaos. The Chaos Path opening axe together with the Sky Split Ting Pin and Ground Splitting Book is going to make a big difference. Other than opening a path, the axe is incredibly powerful as well, able to cut apart the Great Dao. When fighting against the Dao Yuan Realm Expert, I can cut off his Great Dao which will kill him as well. After the Eastern Prefecture of the Eastern Region has been absorbed into the Heavenly Dao, it now has a foundation in the Eastern Region. I won't have to worry about the eastern region falling into the enemy's hand and causing a change in the heavenly law. The current issue is the western region. Since the Great Tribulation started, the Blood Fiend race has had tremendous momentum. It seems that we don't have any method to deal with them right now. Maybe we can be a bit more extreme. I need to let the Heavenly Dao absorb at least one-third of the heavenly law of the western prefecture of the western region before the Blood Fiend race appears. A mini version of the Great Dao is tangled around the Heavenly Dao Talisman. 
Chu Xian withdrew one-third of the heavenly Dao's power belonging to the north region and sent it to the western region to devour the western prefecture. Western region's western prefecture. Could it be that the blood fiend race is appearing? Is the great tribulation spreading to the western region? There is some resistance in trying to devour one-third of the western prefecture. It's not too strong, but it's still preventing the heavenly Tao from devouring it. If the great Tao starts to reject it, with the current power of the heavenly Tao, it won't be able to resist, it will definitely collapse. Devouring one-third of the heavenly law of the western region's western prefecture, it's done. The other matters can proceed slowly. I don't want to join the tribulation. I just want to stay in seclusion peacefully. The tribulation has too many variables. The great Tao might notice me. Heavenly mirror of 10,000 days, link up to the devil region. Increase the speed of converting the devil region into Buddhism. Blood drop rebirth technique, it will be very useful. Choose some experts from the Buddha race and condense a drop of rebirth blood for them. They can then die in battle with the heavenly devil race. They can then be reborn. Seeing such an event where they can't comprehend, the heavenly devil race will definitely panic. There will definitely be some that get affected and decide to join Buddhism. It's an extra life after all. One year later western region's northern prefecture. Heaven and earth trembles, another ancient battleground appears in the northern prefecture and the blood fiend race comes rushing out from it. Other than the northern prefecture, signs of an ancient battleground have also shown up in other prefectures of the western region. The human race, while fighting against the invasion of the blood fiend race, didn't expect that the newly appeared blood fiends would fight against the previous group of blood fiends. There was an internal strife among the blood fiend race, many died, and those that revived got stronger and stronger. During the internal strife, an even stronger blood fiend king was born. The real threat was just about to begin. The united blood fiend race appeared, with the blood fiend king leading, they started their invasion. They broke through 12 of the human race's defense formations. It got more and more intense, human territories were falling into their hands continuously. Retreat One month later, the current head of the human king's ancient family died in battle. Countless commoners who didn't retreat in time and warriors below the emperor realm were all captured by the blood fiend race. They were kept in cages and raised as if they were mere livestock. Sir, why do I get the feeling that you seem to be disturbed by some matters? Could it be you want to go out for a walk? I almost lost my composure. It must be the dog system trying to lure me out. I almost left my seclusion. Going out, why would I go out? Isn't this place nice? Composed, stay composed. Mind should stay firm and the heart still. The matter's in the North Prefecture, let's not pay attention to it. Let's focus on the Heavenly Tao plan. Sir, I am about to break through to the Heavenly Realm. Hmm, go ahead, it's just the Heavenly Realm, don't be too proud. Millions of warriors died in the northern prefecture, half of it was covered in a thick blood-colored mist. Half a year later, in the western region's northern prefecture, blood rain started to fall. Countless warriors started crying, their eyes filled with despair. The territory of the human race's deity realm warriors has fallen. The great ancestor of the human king's ancient family, a fifth stage deity realm expert, went to fight with the blood fiend king and died in battle. On the same day, the first rank son of fate of the northern prefecture, a young man with heaven defying potential within the younger generation, also died in the battle with the blood fiend race. Despair was overwhelming the human race of the northern prefecture. The son of fate of the northern prefecture has fallen. The fate of the western region's northern prefecture has changed. The blood fiend race has taken over. The heavenly law has changed as well due to it. Fortunately, I already laid a foundation for the western region's western prefecture. If not when the entire west region gets taken over, we will have to face the blood fiend race head on for the heavenly law to devour it. The blood fiend race is also the race that fights tribulation. They must have some special fate. 
Even the sons of fate are dying in this great tribulation. Your maid, Sinner, has broken through to the heavenly realm, rewarding one lump of chaos aura. Sir, I would like to return to the Sioux family for a while. Go ahead. Sir, I will return quickly. Your disciple, Ding Yu, has broken through to the heavenly realm, rewarding one lump of chaos aura. Ding Yu breaking through is as expected. With more chaos aura, the speed of tempering Dao law has increased. I am currently at the 10th stage of the Tao Realm, another 26 stages to complete the cycle of the Tao Realm and breakthrough to the Tao Yuan Realm. Without entering the Tao Yuan Realm, I am not confident. The Great Tribulation can easily affect me. Western Region's Northern Prefecture As an overlord, the human race actually got destroyed to this degree. Fengdu Ghost King Become a member of our ghost race. You are the last remaining member of the Spectre race now. Do you think you can still help the Spectre race get stronger? You see it as well. The Great Tribulation is here. Even the human race is in this state. How is the Spectre race going to get through it? Only by transforming into the ghost race can you be reborn. Maybe you are right. This is the end of the Spectre race. I shall transform into the ghost race. Fengdu Secret Realm Finally, the last member of the Spectre race has transformed into the Ghost race. From today onwards, the Ghost race will take on the fate of the Spectre race. They will fight for the fate belonging to the Ghost race in this Great Tribulation. The Ghost race will become a horrifying race within the Nine Regions. Barren Mountain A few soul avatars of the human race were gathering around the corpse of a blood fiend race. He was only at the first stage of the Emperor Realm. These few soul avatars, all at the Heavenly Realm, managed to luckily escape after their bodies were destroyed. Let's try it. If it works, this might be our way out. Stop cowering. I will do it. Soul Flame The evil aura is too strong. We need to purify it. The bead shrunk by a third. Purifying it is uses too much strength. We won't be able to handle it. We need to find a more efficient method to purify it. Pay attention. Remember to help out if needed. Whether we can refine this blood fiend and recover our bodies will depend on this. Don't worry. We will be paying attention. It's working. No, it's corroding the soul avatar. We can't strip it off the new body. Cut it off. Refining a blood fiend to recover our bodies isn't working, which means we are on our last leg, surviving with a soul avatar. One of these days, our soul avatar will dissipate. A ghastly and horrifying aura. Deity Realm Expert Isn't this master from the Spectre race? But that's not right. The Spectre race doesn't have such a ghastly aura. These people could become part of the ghost. Also, once they transform into the ghost race, they won't be weak at all. This is the perfect chance to strengthen the ghost race. As expected, the Great Tribulation is an opportunity. I am Fengdu Ghost King, from the ghost race. Ghost race? As expected, a new race has appeared. I am created by the ghost ancestor. The ghost ancestor felt that the soul avatars were helpless and thus created the method to create the ghost race. As long as they were cultivators, they can transform to become part of the ghost race. From today onwards, a soul avatar is no longer weak. It will become a powerful ghost. All of them used to be from the human race. They already transformed into the ghost race. Don't worry, you will retain your heart and consciousness, you are just living in another form. Are you all willing to become the ghost race? If it's true, it might be our way out. We are already in such a situation, why not try transforming into the ghost race? The blood fiend race is the race that fights tribulations, they are also the targets of our ghost race. Humans when you are alive, ghosts when you are dead, there is nothing wrong with it. Fine, I will be a ghost then. You all won't regret this decision. 
Find more soul avatars, transform them, strengthen the ghost race, and fight for fate in the Great Tribulation. Yes, Ghost King. Fingdu Secret Realm. The last member of the Spectre race has transformed into the Ghost Race. He is in the Deity Realm and was the strongest expert within the Spectre race. Now that he is part of the Ghost Race, the Ghost Race has another Deity Realm expert. Today, this king shall confer you as the protector of Fingdu. Thank you, Ghost King. Let's go, follow me to check out the Blood Fiend race. Fingdu's Ghost King and Protector, two Deity Realm experts headed towards the camp of the Blood Fiend race. The Ghost race you created has fully converted the Spectre race, shouldering their fate. They are currently in the Western region's Northern Prefecture, expanding their power without restraint, converting fallen souls into ghosts, resulting in a huge increase in their population. Rewarding the Ghost Dao and the Fengdu Ghost World Has the Spectre race finally fully transformed into the Ghost race? Let's check out the rewards. The reward this time is a world, the Ghost World. It's different from the Fengdu Secret Realm. In the end, a Secret Realm is but a Secret Realm, it can't be compared to the Ghost World. From now on, the Fengdu Secret Realm will belong to the Ghost World, it can be a holy ground for the Ghost Race. Other than the Ghost World, the other reward isn't just the Ghost Dao Law, but the Ghost Dao. A difference of one word, but the meaning is totally different. The Ghost Dao is a newly born Great Dao of Ghosts, and also a foundational Great Dao for the Ghost Race. As the Ghost Race gets stronger, their understanding of the Dao will also improve, which will in turn improve the Ghost Dao. A Great Dao Even if it's newly born, a Great Dao isn't something a Dao Law can compare to. A great Dao that belongs to the ghost race, as the ghost race increases its population, with more ghosts understanding it, or a deeper understanding, all these will help the ghost Dao grow and improve. It will eventually become a true great Dao. Change the law of the ghost world. The consciousness and soul avatars that enter will first go into the Yellow Spring River, after going through the river's cleansing, they will become a newly born ghost race. Only experts will be able to resist the cleansing of the Yellow Spring River and maintain their consciousness. Experts should indeed have some privileges. Bring the troops of the Ghost Race to cultivate in the Ghost World and gain an understanding of the Ghost Dao. The Ghost Race already has their own independent world? This world seems like it's created solely for the Ghost Race, a world that belongs to us. The Fengdu Ghost King brought the troops into the Ghost World and started to construct that the Fengdu Secret Realm will stay in the Ghost World and will be the main holy ground for the Ghost Race. Half a year later, Wang Luo broke through to the Heavenly Realm, rewarding a lump of Chaos Aura. Another half a year later, the Devil Buddha broke through to the Heavenly Realm as well. Chu Xian already accumulated quite a bit of Chaos Aura, the speed of his Dao Law tempering is increasing more and more. Devil Buddha already broke through, the arrangements in the Devil region need to be done quickly. The Devil race should also soon be a part of history, the only worry is whether we will attract the Tao realm experts of the Devil race. Heavenly Devil race Western region's northern prefecture. The horror of the Blood Fiend race is now known. Unkillable, inextinguishable, the more you kill, the stronger they get, there is no solution. Even the human race has lost again and again, helpless against them. How do we deal with the Blood Fiend race? The Buddha race is attacking us. Punish the Buddha race. Exterminate the Buddhist sect. Kill the group of bald. Evildoers, lay down the butcher's knife, repent and be absolved of your crimes. Impudent, you are also part of the devil race. Amidba, I have seen through worldly affairs, becoming a Buddha, I am now part of the Buddha race. Since you are looking for death, I will fulfill your wish. Final. My heart is with Buddha, with his protection, demons and devils will not be able to kill me. The monks from the Buddhist sect fell one after another. Won't die? Buddha's protection? I will personally watch how you die. All the experts from the Buddhist sect that came to provoke the devils died. Heavenly Devil Race Western Region's Northern Prefecture The bald heads that died, all of them came back to life. 
Cultivate Buddhism. As long as your heart is with Buddha, with his protection, you will be unkillable. How is this possible? Another blood fiend race? Three days later. Impossible. Dao Realm. The same realm as the king of the devil race. Why does the Buddha race have such experts? The devil race is finished. The devil region is about to fall. I must escape quickly. The devil region is about to fall. Quickly escape. The great elder of the heavenly devil race led some of the strong believers of their race, some of their sons of fate, and escaped from the secret realm. My devil race will not be exterminated. All these traitors, when the king returns, we will find them for payback. Something seems to be wrong with the devil race. Brother Chu, I keep having this feeling that something is wrong. The fate of the devil race seems to be changing. It's unceasing. What's going on? Here it comes. It's time to deceive MO2 and the rest of the devil race experts. Dao friend MO2, this is a heart tribulation. You are affected by the great tribulation. The devil race is dealing with the great tribulation, which is why their fate is changing, and the aura within the tribulation is spreading to the experts of the devil race, that's why this is happening. The aura of the great tribulation spreading? Brother Chu, what should I do? The great tribulation may not affect us now, but it has already started to affect the devil race. It will eventually affect us as well. Stabilize your Tao heart, don't be disturbed, as the aura spreads and thickens, the experts from the devil race will even have the misperception that the devil race is about to be exterminated. Not just the Tao Yuan realm experts from the devil race, as long as you are in the Tao Yuan realm, you need to stabilize your Tao heart, don't be disturbed by the outside world, or else you will be facing the same dangers as the devil race. Brother Chu, will Tao realm experts be affected by this great tribulation as well? Even a Dao Yuan realm expert has a chance of dying due to their Dao crumbling. Do you think a Dao realm expert won't be affected? Dao friend MO2, this great tribulation will affect all living creatures. Even Dao Yuan realm experts are in danger. Such a degree of great tribulation? This great tribulation, if we are not careful, all living creatures will die. You must pay attention. Brother MO2 and the two experts of the devil race, since the devil race is already affected by the aura of the tribulation and is amidst the changing of their fate, you have to restrain the people above the Tao realm in your race, so as not to be disturbed by the outside world and not to enter the tribulation. If they enter the tribulation at this moment, the devil race will become the first race to fight the tribulations and also be the first group to enter the tribulation. The first group that enters the tribulation will definitely die. That's why, you must stabilize your heart. Once you get through the heart tribulation, the dangers will be gone and it will help you in facing tribulations in the future. Thank you Brother Chu for explaining. I will cooperate with the other experts in the devil race and restrain the Tao realm experts so that they do not leave the ancient grounds and enter the nine regions. Fine, it's fate that you manage to join the group, I will impart you a technique, you can pass it on to the Tao Realm Juniors so that they can undertake the fate of the Devil Race, stabilize their Tao hearts. They might even have the opportunity to go through a transformation as well. Thank you, Brother Chu. Chant it often. It will help to stabilize the Tao heart and should have some ability to get you through the tribulation. Chu Xian passed on the fate undertaking technique and the Buddhist Heart Sutra to MO2. Luckily, I already made arrangements. This matter should be over. Even if the devil race is exterminated or completely converted to the Buddha race, the Tao realm experts wouldn't appear to intervene. It's impossible for the devil race to be completely exterminated. They are a special race unlike the specter race. But they will definitely be on their last leg, becoming a small race. A few days later. Brother Chu. I have passed on the technique to those little guys in the Tao realm. After learning the technique, they really managed to undertake the changing fate and stabilize their Tao hearts. Brother Chu is indeed unfathomable. That's good. Although MO2 is a troll, he still acts pretty quickly. Brother Chu, my devil race is not the strongest within the nine regions. Why are we the first to be affected? The human race is so strong. Why didn't they target the humans? 
Dao friend MO2, you may be a Dao Yuan realm expert of the devil race, but the devil race of today isn't the pure-blooded devil race anymore. The devil race of the past was incomparably strong, but they have disappeared from the nine regions. The devil race in the nine regions now are just the remnants of the devil bloodline from before. There's such a secret within the devil race? Oh, so MO2, you are just a mixed blood. Another way to say it is, a bastard? Brother Chu is saying we are just remnants of the devil bloodline from back then? That's why we got affected by the tribulation. Then where did the devil race from before go to? It's definitely due to the bloodline. That's why you were affected earlier than the others. That's something that happened ages ago. The devil race and some powerful races disappeared from the nine regions. Disappearance doesn't mean extinction. Maybe they will appear in the nine regions again. Dao Friend Chu, a few days ago when I was on the Great Dao, I encountered a lump of strange black energy. It seems to be able to contaminate the Great Dao. Do you know what it is? What's that? Could it be a sign of the Great Dao Tribulation? Yi Yue Jun is more active on the Great Dao compared to Gui Ran and Long Jun who prefers seclusion. He likes to explore the Great Dao so he will definitely have seen more things than them. What is that strange black energy exactly? It can't be said. Dao friend Yi Yue Jun, you must be careful. Don't speak of it carelessly. Just the two of knowing about it is enough. Why are they being so secretive? What's going on? I, a Dao Yuan realm expert, am actually like a fresh warrior. I don't know any secrets at all. Three years later. Master. Emojia, you are back. How is it? Is the devil king still unwilling? Ha. This disciple is useless. The devil king is still adamant. What did you say? You went out for half a month, and you didn't manage to recruit any help? The Great Tribulation is coming. Where do you want the devil race to go? This subordinate is useless. Those kings that used to be on good terms with us, during this life and death moment, they kept delaying and didn't answer us. Ha! This is not your fault. You can go. My king. From what I see, Abbot Juni from the Dawei Temple really do want to help us. Why not? Shut up. If anyone mentions anything about Buddha in this hall again, you will be dismissed. Please remain calm, my king. This subordinate will leave. Why is there anything important to report today? Wait. The people in attendance. Why is it less than 60% of the usual? My king. Yesterday you announced that no one can mention that religion, but many people already believed. Ah. Ridiculous. The devil and Buddha have never been able to exist together. Now this bunch of bald heads are actually parading right under my nose. Give me my blade. Today. My king, where are you going? Who dares to trespass into the hall? Amitba. How are you, my king? Uncle. Even you. My king. You have to come to your senses. You may have no fate with Buddhism. But no hatred as well. Dangers are now approaching. My king should put down your prejudice. Think about the well-being of the devil race. If uncle is here to help speak up for those bald heads, then please return. Since ancient times, devils and Buddhas. Since ancient times? The devil region has never encountered such a disaster since ancient times. I am tired. You're dismissed. My king still has not returned to his senses. I will come again. Ha! Brother! Sister, why are you up? Go and rest quickly. Cough, cough, brother. Sister should focus on recovering. Brother! This will decide whether the devil race will live on. Do not base it on your personal. No. If I also join that bald head cult and chant sutra every day, who is going to take care of you? Brother. Cough. Why can't? Cough. You listen to me. Cough. Okay, fine. Sister should rest. 
Hmm. Who is that? Who are you? Report your name. Trespassers will be killed. Damn, no reaction. Invader. Archers, get ready. Observation Tower, report. Invader is alone. Hit by two arrows, is down on the ground. Humph. It's just one person and you made such a fuss. Retreat. Wait. Leader. Leader. The invader. You. When did you climb up? Ah. Uh, huh? Green-eyed ghost? Isn't it? Over? Report, 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 great king. The border is in a state of emergency. Speak. The Kushue Pass has fallen into enemy hands. The enemies have invaded our territory. Their numbers and identities are unknown. There is only one soldier who fled and managed to return Sirius L.Y. injured. Where is he? Bring me to him. How's the situation? Great King, the patient's situation is stable for now. It's only a superficial wound, but the other wounds are unable to be healed. He's entirely in a coma. This wound? It's the same as the one my younger sister received when she returned. Just what exactly is this? This could be a good chance to fully understand my younger sister's injury as well. Messenger. Yes. Gather the troops. Get ready for war. Go. Protect the demon realm. What? Report. Great King. The city gate has fallen into the enemy's hands. So fast. What happened? The enemies, the enemies can't be killed. It turns out that there is a problem. We must protect the demon palace no matter what. My younger sister is still here. Royal City Defending Force. Follow me and engage with the enemy forces. Protect the demon palace. Don't let them pass. What? Just now I clearly. Crap. There's not enough time. Uncle Wong. Why are you? Uncle Wong. I'm fine. Hurry up and go save the demon palace. Don't worry. Look at the demon palace. Everyone. The demon realm's safety today is in our hands. Get into formation. Yin, Bota Mo. Jin Duo Mo and I. Rue Luo Hong, Yin, Bie La Tua Bo Dan Mi Hong. Yin, Bota Ma, Jin Duo Mo and I. Rue Luo Hong, Yin, Bie La Tua Bo Dan Mi Hong. Yin, Bie La Tua Bo Dan Mi Hong. Uncle Wang, this light is? Why can it annihilate these monsters? Even my blade couldn't. These are only bloodthirsty creatures. They lack a normal physical body because they were born only as a result of the tribulation's arrival, with no father or mother and only brought up by nature. They cannot be killed with ordinary weapons. Born as a result of the tribulation? That's right. So that's why their body isn't made out of flesh, but rather materialized from the resentment of heaven and earth. If you want to thoroughly eliminate them, you can't just behead them, you must guide them to salvation. Fortunately, Buddhism can do just that. So, does that mean the injuries caused by the blood fiends can be cured using Buddhism? Of course. I know why you have that question. You're worried about Emoshi's condition, right? That's right, Uncle Wang. To try to heal MO11, you've been desperately protecting the Demon Palace but refusing to cooperate with the Buddhists. Do you know how many of your clansman's lives have been wasted? 
If it weren't for Master Jingyi's master's warning, it'd be hard for the demon realm to avoid today's disaster. Master Jingyi brought the seven great Buddhists to the demon realm to set up this glorious golden light formation for three days to tide over this crisis. I acknowledge my mistake. I'm willing to make Buddhism into the honored state religion from today onward. I'll change the demon realm into a Buddhist realm. Ding dong. Your disciple has transformed the demon realm into a Buddhist one, carrying the fate of the demon clan and being reborn in the great Dao Yuan tribulation. As a result, you have been rewarded with the increase of one stage of the Tao realm. Huh? What's going on right now? That's about it, Master. I understand, converting devils to Buddhas, there's nothing better. However, keep this in mind. The Great Tribulation has just begun, do not be careless. Disciple will definitely remember. I will take my leave. Take care, Master. Ha, so that's what happened. Sir, the tea is ready. Sir, ever since I came back, why do you always look so troubled? Did you hit a bottleneck with your cultivation? That's not the case, my cultivation just had an improvement yesterday. It's about the Great Tribulation. Great Tribulation? But there was just good news that came from the Buddha region. It's just a coincidence. It just so happens that the Buddhist techniques can restrain the blood fiend race. But as for the other regions. But this tribulation concerns all creatures underneath the heavens. Why is Sir worrying about it alone? Sienner, you don't know about this, but the reason I lured all the ancient battlegrounds out was to take control of the Heaven Dao Law. If I want to control the Heaven Dao, then everything underneath the heavens is my problem as well. Oh, I see what you're saying. I noticed that cultivating has become much easier since the appearance of the ancient battlegrounds, which I attribute to Sir. Since you can change the Heaven Dao Law, why not make the Blood Fiend race weaker, or just make them disappear? Sienner is indeed smart. Straight to the point. But the problem is, the blood fiend race is born from tribulations. It's not within the control of the Heaven Dao. For the blood fiend race to be under the jurisdiction of the Heaven Dao, they first have to belong to the Heaven Dao. But, if the blood fiend race were to belong to the Heaven Dao, then I would definitely lose control over part of it. Even losing all control of the Heaven Dao is possible. Oh, it does indeed seem like a tricky situation. That's right. Aren't the Buddhas still around? Let them go deal with the blood fiend race. I am afraid that will be difficult. Dealing with the blood fiend race in their region alone consumes 70% of their resources. Ah, this won't do, that won't do. What are we going to do? Erm, this isn't Siena's problem. Siena doesn't have to worry. The Great Tribulation has only just started. We still have time to think about it. Three days later. Young Lord. Young Lord Yushu. That was more than a month ago. Young Lord, Uncle Chen He. His son is very sick. He is barging in. Uncle Chen is well versed in medicine. Why would he come here to see a doctor? Nephew Yushu. Save my son. It's been three days since Bo Yu had a high fever. I don't know what to do. Oh, oh, in this town, the decent clinics are just the two of us. Quickly save my child. If this uncle has failed you in any matters, I hope nephew can forgive me. Uncle Chen, what are you saying? Since you are at my clinic, then you are a patient, and I treat everyone the same. Uncle Chen, what happened to little brother Bo Yu? A few days ago, he went to the mountain to pluck medicinal plants with one of the workers. They were attacked by a wild beast on the way back. Bo Yu got injured, then. Wild beast attack? Where's the wound? On the right leg, the wound is strange as well. I have tried seven or eight different treatments, but there is no improvement. This isn't a wild beast attack. Uncle Chen, I understand now. Leave Bo Yu with me. You can go back and have a rest. You must be tired from the past few days. It's okay, nephew. I'm all right. If I can save my son, I don't mind enduring a few more days. Young master. 
Maybe this father and son pair is here to commit fraud. He is just eager to save his son and has overworked himself. Prepare a room for them and help them in so they can rest. Young master, this Uncle Chen always slanders you for the sake of stealing our business. Just ignore him. The reason I opened a clinic and practiced medicine is to help the people. What kind of principle is it to ignore a patient? Go get ready. I am still not skilled enough. I need to look through some ancient records. Second day. Young master, it's time to eat. Ah, it started again. Let's just leave it at the door. When a difficult illness strikes, the young master goes into seclusion mode, not sleeping or eating. Third day. Ah, the young master didn't eat yesterday. Ah, but the young master said not to disturb him when he is in his study. Forget about it. Young master is a cultivator as well. Not eating for a day shouldn't be a problem. Simply swap the food for something new. Fifth day, sob young master. You can't do this. Normally it's just two or three days, so it's fine. But this is already the fifth day. Young master, you're awake. Hold this. This is? Follow the prescription, prepare the herbs and boil them, then feed them to bow you. Aye. Young master. Young master. Are you all right? Anyone, help. Young master. You're finally awake. How long was I asleep for? Four hours. The prescription you gave me, I already fed it to bow you, and his fever went down quite a bit, but he isn't awake yet. Good. Invite the immortal teacher Huang to Cheng Dong. Immortal teacher Huang? Isn't he a fraud? Go quickly. Immediately. Make sure you invite him over. Ha! I actually fell asleep during such a time. Young master, why are you back? Didn't I send you out? Young, young master. Immortal teacher Huang has been waiting outside for a long time. A long time? Could it be? Co-nephew Yu Shu. It's an emergency. So I won't bother with the etiquette. You must have realized it as well. Senior Huang came for this matter? Of course. The danger is imminent. Let's start. This old man came here without an invitation. Is he scheming against the young master? Two hours later. This, this is? Go to the north, south, east, and west of the town and deploy these talismans. Immediately. The quicker you deploy them, then the earlier the town's safety is ensured. But this, this is. Listen to immortal teacher Huang. We are dealing with a calamity. Yes, young master. I will get it done in an hour. I will be back. Immortal teacher. We should get ready as well. I will leave the rest to you. Ah. Uh, what? These blood fiends are a tribulation fighting race. This old man is a waste of time. The trials must be dealt with by the younger generation. The torch must be passed on. The mission of this old man ends here. Senior. Looks like I have no choice. Young master. Wait for me. As swift as the law. The final one. Unfathomable ancestor of heaven and earth, myriad chief from the primordial origin. Cultivating through 10,000 tribulations validates my remarkable powers. This. Is this the young master doing this? Myriad deities pay their respect, obeying the sounds of thunder. Ghosts and demons tremble in fear. Evil spirits lose their forms. Formation deployed. I succeeded. I am not sure if it will be useful. Young master. Uncle Chen is awake. Uncle Chen, how are you feeling? I, uh, I, I fell asleep. Bo Yu. How's Bo Yu? Bo Yu isn't awake yet, but he is in a stable condition. 
I have been going through the ancient records these past few days. I already found a treatment method for him. But what's happening right now is much more serious than what we thought. Lucky we managed to make it in time. After not training for so long, this is so tiring. Who is it? Such a weird feeling. Save me. Bo Yu. My son. Uncle Chen, don't be anxious. The effects of the treatment are already showing. Young master. Young, young master. Many, there are many red-colored monsters. So soon. If we were any slower, the town would be. Young master, what are they? How did you know to deploy the formation? For that, we would have to start from Bo Yu's wound. Great Tribulation That's right. A great tribulation that affects everyone. When I saw Bo Yu's wound, I had a premonition that the Great Tribulation was about to descend. But I still did not expect for it to be this quick. Luckily the Golden Light Formation was deployed in time, but this isn't a long-term solution as well. We need to quickly find a solution. Nephew, if you need any help, please let me know. I will thank Uncle Chen in advance then. Young Master, Young Master Yushu, is there something wrong with the formation? Young Master, Bo Yu is awake. Is that so? Let's quickly go take a look. Dad, this medicine is too bitter. There's also a pasty taste. Bo Yu, you just recovered. You can't just stop eating the medicine. Uncle Chen, how's Bo Yu feeling? Nephew, it's all due to you. Thinking back on my past actions against you, I am really not fit to be called a human. Haha, <laughs> Uncle Chen, no need to bring up the past. Bo Yu, let me take a look at your wound. Brother Yu, can I not drink this? As expected, it's starting to heal. Immortal Teacher Huang is right. This isn't a wound, but a tribulation. Only the combination of medicine and talisman charm will work. Great. It's effective. Uncle Chen, how much more medical herbs do you have left? Erm, um, about three warehouses worth, three warehouses? Hey, hey, previously, I was trying to raise the prices so I collected and stored them all. Bring them all to young Master Yushu's residence, then listen to his instructions. Brother Yu, how many do you have to draw? I have been grinding ink for the entire afternoon. My arms are sore. I am your patient. Are you sure you should be making me do this? I am worried that if this spreads, it will affect your reputation. Are you tired? That's right, Bo Yu. I forgot to ask you, how did you get the wound on your leg? Wound. That, that day, the herb master and I lost our way. Then, a red-skinned monster appeared. It was so scary. All right, all right. Bo Yu, you can go have a rest. I don't know how much medicine we will need. Let's prepare as much as we can. Sir Yu Shu, where are you? This voice is... Head of Vast Spirit Sect, Yu Xianqi. T Head of East Mountain Alliance, Shi Qing Ling. Brimming Heaven Dancer, Li Faming. Seniors, what are you all? Sir Yu Shu, we know of the things you have done for the commoners. We can't pretend that this doesn't concern us and just rest easy. That's right. How are we going to face anyone if we do that? I am ashamed. My capabilities are limited. I am just handling the minor matters. Fellow seniors, let's gather and discuss this in the hall. This means... The golden light formation is only a temporary measure? Yes, senior you, the utmost priority now is to find a solution to deal with the great tribulation. Let's just fight them head on. If we all work together, why would we lose to a bunch of monsters? Remain calm. Then what do you think we should do? Sit here and wait for our deaths? 
fellow seniors. I have a method. Maybe we can try it out. Can this prescription really treat the wounds caused by those monsters? That's right. This prescription was made after I went through the ancient records and also listened to the instructions of Immortal Teacher Huang. Immortal Teacher Huang? That wandering alchemist? Does it work? Senior sure don't have to worry. It's already tested. Little brother Bo Yu was wounded by those monsters and recovered through this prescription. Why did he mention my name? Did he realize I was pretending to be sick? Since that's the case, let's believe in Sir Yushu. But the scale of the Great Tribulation is huge. How much medical herbs are we going to need? Seniors don't have to worry, Uncle Chen. The boss of Chinji Pharmacy has already sent over his herbs from his warehouses. Normally, Boss Chen was always fighting with you. I didn't expect him to be helping out so much. Regarding the monsters, does Sir Yushu have any ill strategy against them? I haven't been in contact with those monsters, Bo Yu was too frightened to remember anything, so. I have some information. Oh, sect leader Li has hidden deeply. When the dancers from my sect were performing around the different regions, they ran into them as well. The report said that they weren't particularly strong, but they are immune to physical attacks. Their wounds healed almost instantly. Oh, let's just kill it a hundred times. We will see whether they can hurt another human. Although it's crude, we don't really have any methods better than what Alliance Hitcher said. Sir Yushu, we will leave the safeguard of the medical herbs to you. We will have to delay the time with our superior battle power and find a method to vanquish them before the medicines run out. Understood. Senior Yu, give me the medicine. Give me two portions. I have children. Give me. Give it to me quickly. Fellow villagers, the medicine is prepared for the Great Tribulation. The herbs were planted by us. Why are you not sharing them with us? That's right. Are our lives not important? Those monsters are already here. Do you want us to wait for our deaths? Bastards. You want the medicine? Fine. When the formation breaks, you will be fighting alongside us. Senior sure, you stay out of this. I will be the bad guy. If we allow this mob to do whatever they want, everyone is really going to die. Fellow villagers. Fellow elders. I understand your feelings. I am also someone's child and also someone's father. We would also like to give everyone a portion of the medicine. But the Great Tribulation this time is not normal. The road ahead is uncertain. One less portion of medicine equals one less warrior, which equals less hope for us all. Everyone should return home and be at ease. Leave the defense of the village to us. Please trust us. We will do everything in our power to ensure everyone's safety. Let's unite against the common enemy. We shall advance and retreat together. We shall share the same fate. Hey, hey. It's been so many years, but you are still such a smooth talker. Haha, ha, Alliance leader sure overpraised me. Without you being the bad guy, my good guy act wouldn't be effective as well. Ha ha ha. Such a wily old fox. Actually, we are just giving them a path of retreat. All right. Crisis averted. Let's continue preparing the medicine. Ugh. We are working so hard here. Those commoners only care about themselves. They don't even know what this medicine is for. All of them joined the crowd without knowing anything. During peaceful times, everyone thinks of themselves as heroes. When the actual calamity comes, how many can actually put others ahead of themselves? These are all due to Sir Yushu and the hard work of all of us here. Two days later, Ah. You shoo. Did you feel that? Yes. Senior sure. What's going on? Senior sure, calm down. Let me calculate. It's the entrance on the south side. 
No need to calculate. My disciples have reported. There are cracks in the format ion on the south side. Southern part of the city. Why do I only see commoners running for their lives on the way here? Could the blood fiends? Everyone move quickly. We definitely cannot allow the blood fiends to break into the inner area of the city. It's here. Everyone, how are you doing? Madman Wong. Are you the one who destroyed the formation? Senior Yu. It must be a misunderstanding. If immortal teacher Huang wants to destroy the formation, then why didn't we see a single blood fiend within the city? Also, immortal teacher Huang was the one who taught me the golden light formation. He can break the formation without any effort. He doesn't have to wait till today. But immortal teacher Huang, why did you leave without saying anything? Humph. Because the only person I trust is you, Yu Shu. Unlike other people, who came here and started to bite their own allies, just like a dog. Junior brother you. I remember the year you were born, you are of the dog zodiac, right? Junior brother. That's right. Sect leader you and I are from the same heritage. We are disciples of the vast spirit sect. In the past, we were fighting for the position of the sect leader. We created so much unrest within the sect, almost splitting it into pieces. For the sake of the foundations of the vast spirit sect, I chose to retire and vanish from the cultivation world. I have been observing all these years, Yushinchi might covert power and authority, but he did not do any evil deeds. Which is why I did not interfere. All right. We have no time to reminisce about the past. Let's deal with the problem in front of us. According to my investigations, the blood fiend race isn't made up of flesh and blood. Even if you chop them up into pieces, they can use the air or the ground as a medium and revive themselves. Immortal Teacher Huang This is exactly the same as what we have deduced. Looks like you all haven't been lazing around. Then let me talk about the latest discovery. You see the one in the middle. According to my observations, his strength is above the deity realm. But he doesn't really take any action. My guess is their physical form can be reconstructed, but their souls don't take over the new body. That's why the ones in a higher realm are now afraid of death. Madman Huang. So much nonsense. How are we actually going to kill them? Heh <laughs> heh. Stubborn little lion. You manage to catch the important point. Senior brother. The calamity is right in front of us. I hope Senior Brother doesn't hold back any information. I will definitely invite you back to the Vast Spirit Sect. Ha ha ha. That's not necessary. Inviting a madman into your sect, I am afraid the sect will become a laughingstock. There's indeed a method. It's something I just comprehended right before all of you arrived. I can only demonstrate it once. Make sure you pay attention. Senior Huang. What are you doing? The blood fiend is like the river. No matter how many you kill, it flows endlessly. But what if the river has dried up? Dao perishment. Dao perishment. Senior. Gua will die. Ah duo. Scared. Agu duo lua. They will all die as well. Humph. This old man. What did he mean by demonstrating once? Blood fiend. We are. Who? Don't hold me back. I am taking revenge for Senior Huang. Protect your own life. Yu Shu. Your life is more important than anyone else here. I have never seen the different great sects being this united. This is something we didn't achieve our entire life. It's all because of you. Senior sure. You are still young. You have time. Let us old men be in the limelight for today. Sect leader you? You this, I, am just holding back. Humph. No wonder Madman Huang didn't fight with you. 
Even after becoming a sect leader, you are still a coward. So meaningless. Grandpa sure is here. Who wants to fight? How about you? The leader. Your subordinates are too scared to come out and fight. ASI Lu Dao. GA La Hun Du. There's nothing to be afraid of. I will prove it to all of you. Humph. Good. Compared to someone, you are more like a sect leader. Earth Spirit Race. Yes. Formation. Today, I, Ding Yu, will kill the blood fiends and use them as an offering to the departed spirits of my race. A sword cultivator from the northern region, he is younger than me, his realm is lower as well, but his power is horrifying, not weaker than me at all. Western region's top-ranked heaven's chosen, young master Yushu. What sword technique is this? It can actually extinguish and split apart the aura of the blood fiends. Without the aura lingering, the fallen blood fiends are unable to revive themselves. Blood Fiend Races Deity Realm Expert What's the point of bullying a junior? Ha ha, great, you guys did great. Human Races Deity Realm Expert Fellow compatriots of the Western Region, separate the Blood Fiend Army, split apart the Blood Fiends, dilute the Blood Fiend's aura, this will prevent a stronger Blood Fiend from being born. Quick, follow his orders. The savior from the western region is so strong and handsome. Ah, uh, I want to be his Dao partner. Woman, stay away from me. Don't interrupt me from killing enemies. Your disciple Ding Yu has forced the race that is attacking with the tribulation to retreat, obtaining the fortune within the great tribulation resulting in a great increase in his cultivation. Rewarding Fortune Dao Law Upgrade after Ding Yu obtained his victory, the system reward is here. Eastern Region's Western Prefecture. Qin Ying, the exceptional heavens chosen from the human King Luo family, the beauty that shocked the Eastern Region, she led her brothers, together with an army, and started to suppress the blood fiend race. Obtaining victories in three consecutive battles and ensured the safety of the Eastern Region's Western Prefecture. Your disciple Qin Ying, rose up in fame during the Great Tribulation, shocking the Eastern Region, facing the Blood Fiend race without a single loss. Rewarding Fortune Dao Law Upgrade The Fortune Dao Law got upgraded again. Ding Yu and Qi Ning have both entered the Great Tribulation. Once you enter, you won't be able to retreat. Both of them managed to obtain the fortune within the Great Tribulation. The Blood Fiend race appeared in the southern region as well, but the current goal of Xiam Xing is still to rescue his mother. Wang Luo has already started to head towards the southern region. Xiao Liang headed towards the western region. The situation in the western region is more intense and dangerous. Naturally, there will be more opportunities. The chaos region is really in chaos right now. Hei Yu is currently there. Chu Xian controlled the Heavenly Dao Talisman, establishing foundations in both the Chaos and Demon regions, and started absorbing their Heaven's Law. Currently, within the Nine Regions, only the Ancient and Central Regions have not been penetrated. I need to change the strategy to spread out more arrangements for the Heaven's Dao, not just using the Northern Region as a starting point and expanding outwards towards the other eight regions. Using the northern region as a starting point and expanding out wards, although that will allow me to do everything tacitly and not attract any attention. The speed is too slow. I need to quickly raise my cultivation. The demon region has started to become chaotic. Different from the western region's blood fiend race, the blood fiend race in the demon region are more beast-like. 
The central region, as the strongest region within all nine regions, is also the core region of the human race. Its strength is definitely strong without a doubt. Ji Shinshin? He's a bit out of the ordinary. Ji Shinshin, the young head of the Ji family, top ranked within the younger generation in the central region. A heaven defying talent. Could he be a son of fate of the nine regions? Or is he someone that shoulders the fate of the human race and fights the tribulations? Ji Shinshin is unimaginably strong. Within my disciples, no one in the same realm as him can win in a fight. No, there are no more sons of fate within the nine regions. You have to fight for the qualification to become a son of fate. But Ji Shinshin, he's a bit interesting. Brother Chu, there's a certain Dao Realm Jr. in my race. I don't know why, but he became a baldy. It seems like something is wrong. It's pretty quick for a Dao Realm Devil race, because they started shouldering the fate of the Buddha region and are cultivating Buddhism, they have now started to become a Buddha. This is normal. The Devil race is transforming. After shouldering the transforming fate of the Devil race, it's natural for there to be changes. Although he became bald, didn't he also get stronger? His strength did indeed increase a little bit. Then it's correct, he became bald but also became stronger. The other Tao Realm experts will also go through the same changes, no need to panic, this is a sign of getting through the tribulations, when the great tribulation is over, they will recover. Such changes are beneficial, they might be able to avoid being affected by the Great Tribulation and pass through it more efficiently, this change is also known as the form of tribulation. Many thanks, Brother Chu. No wonder I am balding, and sometimes I can hear chants of Amidba, so it's due to the form of tribulation. Dad friend MO2, you must inform the juniors, stay calm and transform along with the tribulation, do not resist, Encountering the form of tribulation is a good thing. It will increase their chance of getting through the tribulation. Brother Chu don't have to worry. I will definitely instruct them not to resist the transformation and to go along with the tribulation. Based on what he said, it seems like my devil race is almost guaranteed to get through the tribulation. All thanks to Brother Chu. Otherwise, the devil race would have been in so much danger this time. The lump of strange black energy on the Great Tao has gotten a bit bigger. That strange energy is indeed connected to the Great Tao Tribulation. I need to deceive Eiyu Ajun. You can try to deal with the strange energy, see how it goes. Alright, I will give it a try. It's been three days, and Eiyu Ajun hasn't replied yet. Could it be that something bad has happened? See in the Origin Tao Crystal, Eiyu Ajun's aura is still there which means he's alive, but whether he's trapped somewhere, or if something else happened, nobody knows. After the arrival of Ding Yu, and the subsequent arrival of Xiao Liang, they have been using the strategy of diluting the Blood Fiend's aura to restrain them. Leading a group of warriors with outstanding comprehension, they managed to suppress the experts of the Blood Fiend race, achieving victory stage by stage. The Blood Fiend race had to change their strategy. Within the Blood Fiend race, a ridiculously strong Heaven's Chosen was actually born. He specifically went after Ding Yu and Xiao Liang. On the battlefield, Xiao Liang, holding the God Destroying Star Spear, was fighting a great battle with one of the Blood Fiends. During crucial moments, using the power of Creeping Vine is very strenuous and the power of Creeping Vine doesn't last very long as well. Before the power of Creeping Vine disappears, I need to completely annihilate my opponent. Everlasting Battle Form Extinguish Finally, I killed the Heavens Chosen of the Blood Fiend race. Your disciple Xiao Liang has killed the first Heavens Chosen of the Blood Fiend race, obtaining the fortune within the Great Tribulation resulting in a great increase in his cultivation. Rewarding Fortune Dao Law Upgrade My disciples did not disappoint me, obtaining the fortune within the Great Tribulation. The Fortune Dao Law got upgraded again. The human race's morale greatly improved. 
Ding Yu and Chao Liang are now famous in the Western region. Their reputations have already surpassed Su Yu Shu. Who's the strongest in the Western region? Ding Yu's sword, Xiao Liang's spear, both are unrivaled. The Daoyuan Great Tribulation is indeed both a tribulation and an opportunity. Ding Yu and Xiao Liang have both obtained fortune and have greatly increased their cultivation. They are already at the ninth stage of the heavenly realm. Qi Ning is still conquering the eastern region. Both her fortune and strength is getting stronger, once again demonstrating her elegance as the great Qin's empress. Hey, you might seem quiet, but her arrangements in the Chaos region are still ongoing according to the Heaven Dao plan. As of today, the Heaven Dao law has already penetrated into three prefectures of the Chaos region. Hu Tinya in the Demon region is also preparing himself. He didn't make a move from the start, but is waiting for a good opportunity to obtain a great fortune in one move. In the Buddha region, the war between Buddhas and blood fiends is still ongoing. In the central region, Qian Ming did not make a move. The central region is really too quiet. The first Dao realm blood fiend, it's not going to appear in the central region, right? You stayed in seclusion for 40 years, staying calm and deploying great strategies, moving the heaven Dao plan forward, and nurtured great disciples. Please continue to work hard. Rewarding 10,000 Daos Reincarnation Sutra. Hmm? Check the reward. 10,000 Daos Reincarnation Sutra. A Dao is birthed, then extinguished, and then birthed again, an endless cycle of reincarnation. Only the Dao is eternal. The fundamentals of the 10,000 Daos Reincarnation Sutra isn't about the person themselves, but the construct of reincarnation. Reincarnation doesn't seem to exist in the nine regions. It might mean that the Great Dao of Reincarnation doesn't exist within the Great Daos. If I construct the Great Dao of Reincarnation, withdraw the 10,000 Daos Reincarnation Sutra. My cultivation broke through to another stage. 15th stage of Tao realm. Comprehending the reincarnation Tao law means I have the foundations to construct the great Tao of reincarnation. Southern region. Do you really plan to do this? No matter what, I must save my mother. So you don't plan to save your family's ancestors? Actually, we don't need to ask for master's help. I can refine a pill that can save your family's ancestor. Fong Kong is a former human king, an expert above the deity realm. Can you actually refine a pill that can save him? Wang Luo's pill refinement technique is indeed unusual, but he is only in the heavenly realm. How can he save a Tao realm expert? Are you looking down on me? I am a pill god. I might even become a pill ancestor in the future. It's just saving someone. How difficult can it be? Furthermore, I am using Tao-level spiritual medicine as the base. Saving a Tao realm expert isn't a problem. You can already refine a pill using Tao-level spiritual medicines? Of course. We will look at the attitude of the Fong family first. The blood fiend race is pretty scary. The western region almost fell. They already lost half of the western prefecture. The Great Tribulation is here, and the Fong family is still not releasing her, damn it. The Fong family's human king is the savior in their hearts. The Great Tribulation is here, and the Fong human king is still in deep sleep. That only makes them even more angry at your mother. The aura of the blood fiends is seeping over from far away. This is an ancient battleground, and the blood fiend race is about to appear. Do you really have to do this? I have to. I know what's going on. If you do this, you are breaking a great taboo. Aren't you worried you will become a sinner of the southern region? Being labeled as an enemy? Sinner? So what if they treat me as a sinner? I, Xiang Xing, have a clear conscience. You, her Dao heart isn't up to par yet, so why bother explaining? You must remember, if there is no woman in your heart, your weapon refinement will be godly. Don't be distracted by beauty. First senior brother Ding Yu is the most unique. After him is definitely Wang Luo. They both pursue abstinence.
They are here. Fiend refinement. Let's go. Your disciples Xiang Xing and Wang Luo refined 10,000 blood fiends and exterminated a branch of the blood fiend race, obtaining the fortune within the Great Tribulation resulting in a great increase in their cultivation. Rewarding the Dao Law of Fiends and Fortune Dao Law Upgrade. Refined 10,000 blood fiends and exterminated a branch of the blood fiend race? Wang Luo and Xiang Xing are so ferocious? Wang Luo and Xiang Xing, when they were in the small world practicing the formation, they used up quite a lot of resources. The formation they set up seems to be the fiend refinement formation. Feng family forbidden grounds behind the mountain. The great tribulation is here. Are you satisfied now? If the ancestor had recovered, he would have been able to lead the human race and get through the tribulation, ensuring the rise of our phone family as well. Because of your selfish decision, during this tribulation, the human race doesn't have a peerless expert to fight against this crisis. The western region is about to fall. Countless humans are either injured or dead. The southern region's northern prefecture has already lost half of their territories. Are you satisfied? Regret? Guilt? I don't feel them at all. Since my father, grandfather, and brother all died while searching for treasures to save the ancestor, why would I feel any regret or guilt for what I have done? Foam rupeeing, you are a sinner. Heh, sinner? Is the ancestor very strong? He can fight against the crisis? If he really is peerless, how did he end up in his current state? All of you are unable to accept reality, the failure of the ancestor, the decline of the phone family, your own helplessness, that's why you want to revive the ancestor. If the phone family got stronger with every generation, the current phone family would be stronger than the ancestor, all of you are just looking for an excuse for your own helplessness and uselessness. You are not allowed to insult the ancestor. Phone family, release my mother, or else I will exterminate your entire family today. Impudent. You sure have a good son. Phone family, either you release my mother, or I release the blood fiends and will exterminate your whole clan. Do you know what you are doing right now? Are you betraying the human race? The fear and trepidation I feel while facing that lump of blood fiend aura. How did Xiang Xing condense them into a lump? Betray the human race? Are you worthy enough to label me unjustly? Just because you are from a human king family? You are not the only human king family. Release my mother. If not, I will exterminate your phone family. Great grandfather. Feng Rupian committed a grave mistake and deserves the punishment. You are demonstrating such an unfilial behavior and digging your own grave. The blood fiends might be horrifying, but they are not enough to exterminate my Feng family. Furthermore, your mother is also here. What grave mistake? For the sake of your family's human king? What do you know? Peak of Deity Realm. Old man, if you release my junior brother's mother, I will save your ancestor. How about it? With your ability? Are you looking down on me? Human King Phone Kong, the extent of his injuries, you all know best. Even a flame Dao fruit will not be able to save him. You don't have to look at me this way. This kind of secret isn't a big deal for us. All the secrets within the nine regions, what we know is definitely more than the Phone family. Human King Phone Kong can be considered lucky. He isn't completely dead. The Demon King and Devil King from back then is already completely dead. The Phone family's Human King's loss is the shame of the family, and now a young Ling has actually torn open our wound and is pouring salt on it. The opponent is too strong. 
Huaziing. She not only recovered, but got stronger. What's going on? Release her, or else don't blame me for being ruthless, even if the blood fiends cannot exterminate your Fong family, I, Xiang Xing, can. Wanting to kill me? Your Fong family is not qualified, even if Fong Kong is here, your family still isn't qualified. The Fong family is determined not to let her go. Even with the threat of the blood fiends, they refuse to compromise. The Fong family's elder is at the peak of the deity realm. He is too strong for us. If he makes a move, Hua Ziying will not be able to block it. Why don't we ask the master to make a move and exterminate the Fong family once and for all? Exterminate my Fong family? Do you even know the significance of a human king family? Who can bear the consequences? So what if you are a human king family? My junior brother Qin is also a descendant of a human king family. My senior sister Hei Yu is even a descendant from an ancient human king family. What does your Fong family count as? In this world, everyone speaks with their strength. Don't you understand this logic, old man? Furthermore, it's the time of the Daoyuan Great Tribulation. There's also another Great Tribulation after this that's even more horrifying. The name of the human king family is no longer useful. Don't talk about the human king family. If we are not careful, there's even the possibility of all the living creatures within the nine regions getting exterminated. Is he lying, or is it the truth? Your Fong family's foundation isn't that strong. I'm still unsure if you will get through the Daoyuan Great Tribulation. Release her, I will save human King Fong Kong since he had contributed to the human race before. You are not qualified, arrogant junior. Do not insult the Fong family's ancestor. Even if I die, I have to block the attack. Why bother? The Fong family's foundation is indeed weak. You are just holding on to the name of a human king family. Xiang Bang. That's your father? He's pretty powerful, but he looks like a villain, the appearance of a schemer. You've grown up and know some tricks now, not bad. If you possess such strength, I am only just in possession of it now. Release her. I will take into account Rupiang's feelings and will not make it difficult for the Fong family. Xiang Bang, it's all because of a vile, despicable man like you. You must have tricked Rupiang. If that's what you think, so be it. Initially, I had a good impression of Fong Xiaoqing. I thought the Fong family was powerful, but now it seems like they are just a bunch of idiots. I already said that everyone speaks with their strength in this world, but they are still immersed in the name of the human king family. How lamentable. Hey, hey, fine. My phone family is indeed in dire straits. I also would like to know whether the human king's writ is still useful. Why don't I activate the human king's writ? Let's find out if the other human king families and the experts that respect the human king, whether they will appear to deal with you, Xiang Bang. The great tribulation is here. Does your phone family want to create internal strife right now? I would also like to know. Compared to the human king in the past, how big of a distance is there between us? My son, you've suffered enough. You. Hey, I imprisoned myself in the Fong family. Consider that as me repaying the family. From now on, I have nothing to do with the Fong family. Is it worth it? Is it worth it? Send it to the northern prefecture. We don't need it here anymore. How have you been treating my son? I had no choice. I was worried about attracting the attention of the Fong family. With my situation in T, he passed. I couldn't handle the Fong family. Humph. You are half a foot out of the deity realm. Little friend, you're also out of the ordinary. It's just all right. My master taught me well. Your master is? Don't ask too much. All you need to know is, even with your strength, my master can kill thousands or tens of thousands of you with his breath alone. 
I know you don't believe me, that's not important, I am just giving you a kind reminder, don't always try to set schemes, especially regarding junior brother Xiang, or else you will have a tough time someday. Above the deity realm is the Tao realm, your half step into the Tao realm really isn't a big deal at all. How about a chat? All right. Previously in the northern region's southern prefecture, I was shocked by Wang Luo and the others. It's only been a few years and they are so much stronger than me. I, Feng Xiaoqing, became inferior to them in the end. I can save your family's ancestor, I am not lying. The Daoyuan Great Tribulation is here, looking at the Feng family's human king's past contributions, I am willing to save him, it's up to your family whether you want to trust me. Every human king is a peerless senior. They possess heaven-defying talents. If Feng Kong can be revived, then he can definitely lead the warriors of the southern region to fight against the Blood Fiend race. If I save Feng Kong and he fights the Blood Fiend race, the fortune he obtains, I will have a share in it. Also, I need to fulfill the entrustment of the old Pill King. I will need an expert on the journey and Feng Kong is my first choice. I believe in Brother Wang but I am not the one who can make the decision. Then are you able to meet your family's ancestor? Yes, I can. Then it's not a problem. The pill inside will be able to awaken your ancestor, but it's not a full recovery. After he's awake, tell him to look for me. All right. You are not worried that I am trying to harm your family's ancestor? The burden is too heavy. It's a good thing to be able to unload some of it, regardless of the method. If Brother Wang really wants to harm my ancestor, then you must already be prepared to be hunted down by my phone family, and I will still be able to unload some burden. If I really manage to wake the ancestor, then I will still be able to unload some burden, it's the same result. Seems like his conviction of saving his ancestor isn't really firm. The Dao Yuan Great Tribulation, it's a tribulation, but it's also fate, Brother Fong, you have to seize the opportunity. All the experts within the family are outside right now. This is the best chance to meet the ancestor and awaken him. If not, those old fellows will not agree to it so easily. I finally saved my mother. Now that the heavy responsibility in my heart is over, it's time for me to enter the tribulation and fight for the great fortune. I am going to the northern prefecture. I will accompany you. No need. I am going to enter the tribulation and fight for the opportunities within it. All of your schemes were just to break through the shackles of the deity realm? Unfortunately, you were one step away. If you don't go through any trials, you will be worthless. Out of all the siblings, you are the one with the highest potential. My original plan was to break through the deity realm, then come to the Fong family to obtain the cultivation method for the fire origin physique and also the exclusive cultivation method for the Fong family, but I didn't expect you to get your own opportunity. Whether that's true or not, it doesn't matter to me anymore. I possess the natural fire bone, not the fire origin physique. If you want to break through your shackles, the tribulation is an opportunity as well. You can decide for yourself. It's all your fault. You didn't treat my son well. Pampering him will only turn him into a useless trash. You already paid back whatever you owed the phone family. Let's go. Fong Human King, what a pity. The northern region is starting to change, the ghost world is also starting to change, and so is the Buddha world. Within the Yellow River, a mist of ghost aura will sometimes appear and float outwards to transform into a creature of the ghost race. The ghost race is no longer the sole occupant in the ghost world. These creatures might be weak, but they are similar to wild beasts. They can be considered as ghost beasts. These ghost beasts were born though the reincarnation law of the heavens Tao, the living creatures that died in the northern region got transmigrated into the Yellow River and went through rebirth. Due to the incompleteness of the reincarnation law, after transmigrating them into the Yellow River, there aren't any channels and bridges for them to go through reincarnation. This needs to be improved, but it's not something that can be perfected in a short time. At least, before the reincarnation law transforms into the reincarnation great Tao, it can never be perfected. How are things in the southern region's northern prefecture? 
Xiang Xing and Wang Luo are there, using the Fiend Refinement Formation, they manage to prevent the invasion of the Blood Fiend race and also weaken and dilute the Blood Fiend aura. In the western region's central prefecture, Ding Yu and Xiao Liang are leading the human race experts against the Blood Fiend race, weakening the Blood Fiend aura at the same time. But something's wrong with the Blood Fiend race in the western region. They are changing, they're no longer reckless and killing wantonly, they have consciousness and awareness now, and are transforming into a real and proper race. They want to fight for the great fortune of the Nine Regions, to become the ruler of the Nine Regions. Deep within the Blood Fiend race consciousness, they probably know the meaning of the Daoyuan Great Tribulation, they are already planning and making arrangements to become the ruler of the Nine Regions. I don't know why, but I'm getting a sense of abnormal unease. Could it be that there's someone plotting something in the dark? If it's true, that person can even affect the Blood Fiend race, his strength is horrifying, he is definitely in the Dao Yuan realm. He must be at the peak of the Dao Yuan realm as well, even Dao Yuan realm experts like Hong Yuan Chu and Mo Tu cannot directly affect the race that fights tribulations. I need to remain calm and not advance prematurely. Can that person only affect the Blood Fiend race in the Western region, or can he affect the Blood Fiend race in all nine regions? Stay calm, stay quiet, before breaking through to the Dao Yuan realm, I cannot be swayed. The Heaven's Dao should also stay hidden, there cannot be too much of a difference with the Heaven's Law, flow along with the tribulation instead of resisting it, this can cover up the changes that occur when it replaces the Heaven's Law. I gave every disciple the Heaven's Dao Talisman. If the disciples manage to obtain the fortune within the tribulation, the talisman will be able to make use of it and devour the Heaven's Law. With the Heaven's Dao Talisman, the disciples will also be able to use part of the power of the Heaven's Dao. The Heaven's Dao will become their support. Fighting the tribulation and obtaining the fortune within it is the same as the Heaven's Dao obtaining it. It will improve the Heaven's Dao as well. I shouldn't interfere too much with these worldly affairs just in case some hidden expert detects the expansion and improvement of the Heaven's Dao. I will just leave them to my disciples. Except for the northern region, the current most peaceful place will be the central region. The blood fiends should spread to the central region soon. The moment the tribulation spread to the central region, that will also be the moment for the Heaven's Dao to penetrate into the central region. Heiyu is making the arrangements for the Chaos Region. Once the foundations are set, Heiyu will start to make arrangements for the Central Region. Great Dao Group, last message, a long time ago, Hong Yuan Chu and the others, especially the Devil Race experts like Mo2, are all pretty settled right now after knowing how horrifying the Tribulation can be. They don't really care about the Nine Regions anymore. Yiyu Jun went to test out that strange black aura on the Great Dao, it's been quite some time since he contacted us. Is he trapped? What exactly is that black aura? The origin of the Great Dao Great Tribulation? Unfortunately, I can't go to the Great Dao myself. But even if I go to the Great Dao, I can only remain where I am and can't explore the Great Dao. I can't leave the area of the small courtyard after all. Many thanks to the Lord for your generosity. Now this is what living truly is. Compared to before, we were essentially not living creatures, but rather violent monsters. Did you succeed in occupying the western region? Reporting, Lord, it was unsuccessful. The human race produced a heavenly genius who was extremely strong, and so for now we still do not have an advantageous position. Lord, don't worry. We have already started raising our own heavenly genius and we will surely be able to seize the western region. The human race? They're innately born frail, their physical bodies aren't strong, and they're an inferior race with a short lifespan, but you're telling me that they became strong? Lord, the human race is now the overlord of the nine regions. Even if you can't seize the western region, you must make sure to hold onto the northern zone. Yes, Lord. The nine regions will change, and if you all can grasp it, the position of the future overlord shall be yours. 
you too shall practice this technique thoroughly. Yes, Lord. This technique the Lord has bestowed upon us must be extremely powerful. Don't be rash, wait for the right time to strike. Yes, Lord. I think there's something amiss with the Blood Fiend Clan. Yes, there is something strange going on with the Blood Fiend Clan in the Western region. Could it be that there is something unusual with the Blood Fiend Clan that has entered the Nine Regions? Perhaps. Now that the situation settled, there is no way for the Northern Prefecture to be taken back, and the Southern and Eastern Prefecture have just fallen into enemy hands. In addition, there are still some people from the human race who are still desperately trying to support them, so we can launch a counterattack. The Southern Prefecture, let's launch a counterattack in the Southern Prefecture. The Western Prefecture is special, as it has been incorporated into the Heavenly Tao, so once we launch a counterattack in the Southern Prefecture and take it back, we can merge it with the Western Prefecture to make it a whole. Inform Yushu and the others to defend the Central Zone, and we'll lead a few people to launch a counterattack in the Southern Prefecture. The Northern Prefecture has restricted the majority of the Blood Fiend Clan, and so the Southern Region's defense must be weak. Let's take this opportunity and launch a counterattack, as there's a very high likelihood that we'll be able to forcefully take back the Southern Zone. There's no time to lose, let's go launch a counterattack in the Southern Zone. Your disciples Ding Yu and Xiao Liang, with the Heavenly Dao's power, have launched a counterattack against the Blood Fiend Clan, achieving a great victory, obtaining great destiny, and dramatically increasing their cultivation. Your Heavenly Dao has also nibbled away at the Dao Yuan Tribulation's energy, your rule has increased, and you are rewarded with an upgrade in your Dao of Fortune. Ding Yu and Xiao Liang launched a counterattack against the Blood Fiend clan. Also, the Heavenly Dao actually nibbled away a bit of the Great Dao Yuan Tribulation's energy, as well the rule increasing. Not bad, it seems that they have some ability. Worthy of being the strongest disciples under my command. Now, these two have reached the peak of the Heavenly Realm and are half a step into the Deity Realm. It seems that this cultivation speed is really too fast. No wonder every time a great tribulation occurs, there will always be an evildoer who quickly rises to power to the extent that they break through the Tao realm in one go, stepping foot into the Tao Yuan realm. The Human King Fong Kong The Fong family sacrificed geniuses after geniuses for his sake, with their only goal being to revive him. Life or death, at this moment, no matter the result, the burdens I carry will all be taken off me. I, Feng Xiaoqing, should really live for myself for once. Even if I die, I'll have no regrets. It seems that Wang Luo's elixir had no effect. Sigh. Feng Xiaoqing greets the ancestor. I, how long have I been immersed in deep sleep? I don't, don't know. This elixir is unusual. Where did you get it? It's. Was it worth the trouble? It seems that the younger generation has suffered many difficulties. Let me borrow your body. Don't worry, no matter how useless I am, I wouldn't even think about stealing the body of one of my descendants. It seems I've made a mockery of myself in front of the ancestor. Everyone, gather around. Ancestor, you, you've recovered? There's not a single person I recognize. Could it be that the descendants from back then have all died? Begin with the situation of the nine regions. How much time has passed? Great-great-grandson greets the ancestor. Nowadays the nine regions. The great Dao Yuan tribulation. Thinking back on my matchless power, standing as the honored human king of the southern region, and back then, I was the sole human king of the entire human race. However, back then, who would have thought that a king of slaughter would emerge out of nowhere? Now that I've woken up, it's actually the great Dao Yuan tribulation. Let's enter the tribulation. All descendants of the Fong family will enter the tribulation, will protect the human race, protect the western region, and rise greatly in the midst of this tribulation. Go find that young fellow Wang Luo, I am only conscious for now, but I'm unable to make it last. 
Yes, ancestor. There's still no reply from Iwa June. If it weren't for Iwa Jun's aura still being apparent, I would have begun wondering if he had died. Just what exactly is that dark aura on the Great Tao? Let me take a look at the destinies of the nine regions. Now that the western prefecture of the western region, as well as the central prefecture, have been incorporated into the heavenly Tao, the heavenly Tao has already permeated into the southern prefecture, so being included in the heavenly Tao is only a matter of time. However, the western region of the northern zone is very strange, a portion of it is hazy and is unable to be seen through. Regarding the northern prefecture of the western region, it seems there's someone behind the scenes controlling the situation, so we must be careful. Phone Kong has regained consciousness? Wang Luo is going to save Phone Kong? Let's see how Phone Kong is doing. Phone Kong is in the first stage of Dao Realm. If that's the case, then the other human kings should also be in the early stages of Dao Realm. The current state of Phone Kong is just left with an origin soul. It's tangled with murderous intent and being weakened continuously. If he wasn't protected by a great treasure, his origin soul would have already dissipated. The Tu Wang Dao indeed possesses a peak killing Dao, powerful and special. The previous Demon King and Devil King have both fallen. Only Phone Kong managed to survive with the help of a great treasure. Phong Kong is unordinary. Being able to awaken during the Dao Yuan Great Tribulation is already considered as a great fortune and opportunity. He will definitely be able to rise up this time. This crystal globe is extraordinary. It's definitely a great treasure. It's different compared to the current great treasures within the nine regions. Both the form and breath don't seem to belong to an item of this Dao Yuan. In fact, it doesn't seem to be from this era. Should I incorporate Phong Kong into a part of my power, or maybe, I can let him test out that hidden expert. The more I look at it, the more I feel that the crystal globe is extraordinary. Heavenly Secret Origin Probing Technique Crystal Jade Palace, a seclusion room for the experts, Dao Yuan Realm, of the immortal race during the 8th Great Dao Era, created by condensing an entire Dao Yuan within the Great Dao. It contains the residual immortal aura of the experts of the immortal race. Left behind in the nine regions during the Great Tribulation, it's currently in a dormant state and is slightly damaged. Good guy. Phong Kong is really someone with great opportunities, but unlucky at the same time, with the disposition of a main character, yet he was oppressed by Tu Wang Dao. If nothing goes wrong, Phong Kong should be able to wake the dormant Crystal Jade Palace through the coincidence of opportunities. By obtaining the residual immortal aura of the immortal race expert, he should also be able to obtain the inheritance of the immortal race. If we base it on a normal development, Phong Kong will rise up and get his revenge by killing Tu Wang Dao when he meets him again. This won't do. Tu Wang Dao is now my loyal lapdog. How can he be? It's decided. I will take Phong Kong into my sect. It's impossible for him to become a disciple, but he can still run some errands within the sect. As for his grievances with Tu Wang Dao, we can think about it in the future. Phong Kong's injuries are too serious, outside of my expectations. The pill I prepared earlier is unable to help him fully recover. I need to think of another way. Don't panic, it's a wisp of murderous intent within my body, I will suppress it. How many years have passed? This wisp of murderous intent still hasn't been erased or dissipated. This won't do. If we don't get rid of the murderous intent, even if you recover, there will be some leftover effects on you. As long as I recover, I just need to spend some time and slowly erase it. Senior Fong won't be able to obliterate it even after you are fully recovered? Back then I was a peerless expert, but now, even a junior is doubting my strength. This is not a normal murderous intent. It belongs to a peak killing Dao. It's different. With my previous strength, I can easily suppress the Demon King and Devil King, but the Killing Dao of that guy. Ping Fan is not cultivating the Peak Killing Dao, but it's also a Peak Dao. A Peak Dao is powerful and special. It's indeed horrifying. Senior Fong, to recover back to your Peak and erase the murderous intent, I am afraid only my master is capable of it. For your master to help me, what are the conditions? The past in the past, I only want to recover right now, even if I have to beg for help, so be it. 
It depends on the master's mood. The conditions probably don't matter. Maybe Senior Fong might need to enter the sect and run some errands? Greetings, Master. Greetings, Senior. Being able to meet is fate. You fell to the hands of Tu Wang Dao and managed to luckily survive till today. Meeting me is also due to your fortune and opportunity. Tu Wang Dao embarked down the wrong path previously. I have already corrected him. Your grievances with him, the two of you will settle it yourselves. Senior is? Could this horrifying senior be the master of Tu Wang Dao? I am not his master. He had his opportunity and managed to enter my sect. Many thanks, senior. If senior has any orders, I will walk through water and tread on fire to complete it. You are a human king with contributions to the human race. I won't be harsh on you. If you are willing, you can enter my sect as a retinue. If you are not willing, then you need to complete three tasks for me. A retinue? I used to be a human king. Countless people wanted to be my retinue. But now I have to become a retinue of others? You don't have to worry. The three tasks that I asked of you will definitely be within the scope of your abilities. Whether he can grab this opportunity, it will be up to Fong Kong himself. If I choose the three tasks, am I missing an opportunity? This senior is incomparably powerful. Can I even reach that level? Can I still catch up to Tu Wang Dao? If I only rely on myself, can I even aim for a higher realm? I, Fong Kong, might be a human king, but I am also a failure of a human king. I am indebted to senior for giving me a new life. I am willing to enter the sect and become a normal retinue. Fong Kong being able to let go of his pride, that's a good start. You won't regret your decision. My sect has no name. Address it as you like. Yes, thank you, Master. You are at the early stage of Dao Realm. How much of an understanding do you have of it? Reporting to Master, I broke through the shackles of the Deity Realm and stepped into the Dao Realm not long ago. I don't really understand much. But right before I fell, within the darkness, something seemed to be calling out to me. I am afraid most of the Tao Realm experts only understood the secrets within the Tao Realm after entering the first ancient battleground. There's 36 stages in the Tao Realm. Every stage is a layer of heaven. By tempering the Tao laws and understanding more Tao laws, that's how you build up the foundation. It's only the rare few who can step into the Tao Yuan Realm. The 36 stages of the Tao Realm is an obstacle for countless experts. You still have a long road ahead of you. I made the right choice. The thing calling out to you within the darkness is the first ancient battleground that lies in the heart of the ancient region. It's rumored that the first ancient battleground is the origin of the nine regions, the place closest to the Great Tao. The Great Tribulation is already here. Tao Realm warriors will also have to enter the Tribulation. Make sure you grab the opportunity and improve your strength. Yes, Master. Fong Kong is a Tao Realm warrior. He definitely has to enter the tribulation and fight for the great fortune that will also help with the penetration of the heavens Tao. This is Chaos Aura. It will help with the tempering of Tao laws, increasing the speed of metamorphosis of Tao laws. Many thanks, Master. The Jade Crystal Palace within your soul, its origin is extraordinary. If you can activate it, you will be able to reap the rewards. Jade Crystal Palace? That crystal house? Master, the crystal jade palace is something I obtained while I was exploring the ancient region in the past. Although it's mystical, I never figured out its actual usage. It's a seclusion room for a Dao Yuan realm expert from long ago. It's definitely extraordinary. You can ponder on it. When the opportunity comes, it will be activated. The crystal jade palace being left behind in the nine regions is definitely not as simple as an accident. Maybe the immortal race wanted to leave behind their inheritance in the Nine Regions? It doesn't matter what their actual aim is, since it's in the hands of Fong Kong, then the secrets hidden within will also be inherited by Fong Kong. Yes, Master. Watch out for the Blood Fiend race. If you obtain the fortune within the Great Tribulation, then you can rise up quickly. You all should work hard. Yes, Fong Kong. As expected of a human king. He understands things quickly. 
Let's take a look at the changes of the nine prefectures. System. Appear. Sir. Sir, you are indeed here. Sienner. What are you doing? Sir, I am leaving. Oh, haha, where are you going? Why do I feel that you are unhappy? Anywhere is good. Better than being here. It's chaos everywhere. Sir, you are the only one who is calm during such a crisis. Ugh. If I am not calm, the chaos might be even worse. All right. Going out for training is also a great thing. I am leaving. Remember to ask the Chu family to deliver your meals. Sienna, you. Wait. Gone so fast. Is my place so unwelcoming, anywhere you go is fine. As long as it's not the northern zone, it's really chaotic over there. Moreover, another ancient battlefield is going to appear. It should be over this time. Such annoying monsters. Such a tough battle. I suffered so much, a victory isn't even worthwhile. I killed the majority of them, the remnants managed to escape, they shouldn't come back any time soon. Old man. Shinger is still in the northern prefecture, why don't we go? Go over four? To work nonstop? Do you even know how old I am? Why are you so anxious? There is only your son in your heart. You were locked up for tens of years. I kept preserving my integrity. You don't even think about how much I suffered. Quiet down. Other people can hear us. Why are you afraid of people hearing it? I want everyone to come and judge if I am right or wrong. Senior Xiang. Cough. Yes? I thought you weren't afraid. Why are you coughing? Senior Xiang. Family head Xiang. The family is like running around like headless chickens without you. Since you are here, why not return to the family? Hey, <laughs> hey. When I was leaving the family to protect all of you, no one tried to get me to stay. Now that there's a crisis, you want me to return? You abandon me when you don't need me, and then come look for me now when you need my help. Aren't you all being too obvious? Hey, <laughs> hey. What is Senior Xiang Bang talking about? We are here to sincerely invite you. Humph. What you want isn't me but my method of dealing with the blood fiend race. Everything that you people do is for your benefit, all your scheming, and this is what you end up with. Senior, all right. You don't need to say more. For my wife and son, I wouldn't go back anyway. But don't worry. I won't do anything to harm the Xiang family. My surname is Xiang after all. This aura is. Humph. It's been a while. How are you? Since the Xiang family's matters are settled, let's talk about the Feng family. Who are you? He is Feng Ruhai, the youngest brother in my generation. Since you are Rupiang's brother, I should call you brother-in-law. It's been tens of years. It's better to squash enmity than to keep it. Hmm, squash enmity? Indeed. How do we settle regarding my injuries then? What? What does this have to do with Rupiang? When she stole the Dao fruit. Just because we were in the same generation and shared a close relationship. The family tortured me. Some of my brothers even became handicapped and are unable to cultivate. Do you know the amount of disdain you get when you are unable to cultivate in a human king family? I understand. What brother-in-law said is reasonable. This debt is something Rupiang should repay. But as her husband, I can't let her suffer. I will repay this debt in her stead. Don't. We still need to go look for Shinger together. Rupiang. Don't stop me. This is karma that we have to settle. Come. Brother Ruhai. I am willing to give up my cultivation. I will take ten attacks from you. To repay you for the torture you went through. Ten attacks? Do you think you can take ten of my attacks with your body alone? I don't know. I will leave it up to luck. Even if I die, I won't have any complaints. Fine. 
I will show respect towards you for being a real man. I will grant your wish. Husband. Don't. How am I going to explain this to Shinger? Rupying. Don't come over. These tens of years, I wasn't able to do much for you mother and son. There's finally a chance today. This is the only thing that I can do for the two of you. Humph. Are you done talking yet? Hand over your life. Husband. Stop. Why are we doing this? Rupying, don't come over. We should put an end to this matter with the phone family. If they still come looking for trouble with us after this, I will slaughter them. Brother Ruhai. Carry on. Five more attacks. Puff, I didn't expect you to hold on for so long. Humph. You will understand when you are at my age. Some things in life, you just have to hold on to them no matter what. Rupying, if I can't protect you, then everything I have done will be meaningless. Don't interfere. Come. Five more attacks. Humph. I won't need five more attacks. I will annihilate you with the next attack. Haha, -ha, if this can put an end to the grievances between the phone family and Rupying, then it's a worthy death. Hmm? What's going on? It's an ancient battleground. Rupying, run. Husband, are you all right? You have to run quickly. This ancient battleground might have. Phone Ruhai. This isn't over. Stronger blood fiends. This, this is. Weren't they chased away just now? Phone Ruhai. You are so capable of bullying us. Why don't you kill the blood fiends then? Husband, stop using your true chi. Humph, if I can't save you, what's the point of saving my true chi? Mother, mother, save me. I am still a child. Run quickly. Rupying, I will block them. Go find our son. No, we will look for our son together. Rupying, it must be together. Fine. Together it is. We will go after we deal with these two. Come. Siam Bang. Siam Bang. Are you all right? Cough, cough. Rupeeing, it seems like the five attacks from Rohai have given me some internal injuries. Husband, I will bring you away. No, you can run quickly. Bringing me who is just a burden. I have also been a burden in your heart for tens of years. Since my son was born, you have been the one protecting us. It's my turn to protect you. It's only fair. Cough, don't, rupeeing, you. Run, run quickly. Rupeeing. This is the unique skill of the phone family. Are you guys all right? I am late. Get lost. What a disgrace. Please quell your anger. It's been hard on you too. Go treat your injuries. Leave the rest to me. Greetings, human king. The two of you contributed by fighting against the blood fiends. Please get up. Ancestor. Previously, she was the one who, shut up. A trash that can't do anything right. I am a human king. Not the ancestor of the phone family. The great tribulation is here, and all of you are focusing on such grievances. Everyone is here. Listen to the human king's writ. The great tribulation is here. The human race is facing a crisis. All humans should be fighting against the blood fiends. Put your grievances aside. Do not mess up the plan of fighting against the blood fiends. Whoever goes against it, their leader will be publicly executed. We will follow the human king's writ. We will follow the human king's writ. 
We will follow the human king's writ. We will follow the human king's writ. A new ancient battleground has appeared. The miasma is overwhelming. There must be demonic creatures within. Brave warriors of the human race. Join my crusade. Everything is as I expected. With a human king guarding the place, I feel much more relieved. But, none of the places have completely exterminated the blood fiends yet. It's not hopeful. Ding dong. Your disciples Wang Luo and Xiang Xing have completely refined the blood fiends in the southern region's northern prefecture and managed to refine a blood fiend great treasure resulting in a great increase in their cultivation, stepping into the deity realm. Rewarding Fortune Dao Law plus 2, Chaos Aura plus 2. What? Such a slap in the face. One month ago. It should be here. Seems like it. We are still quite a distance away. How about a bet? Let's see who can reach first. All right. Truth or dare? Of course it's a dare. The loser has to confess to Sinner. How about it? Humph. It's a deal. Not bad. You can actually keep up. Humph. Don't look down on me. I see that you are interested in Sinner. I am giving you a chance. You should appreciate it. Nonsense. This is your idea. You must have thought about it for quite some time. Wait. Did you feel that? Of course. There's a group of blood fiends in both the southeastern and southwestern area. We can't forget about the mission that Master gave. We must exterminate them all. Let's split up. We will meet at the blood fiend palace. Let's split up. We will meet at the Blood Fiend Palace. Who? Settled. Luckily, there aren't any high-level Blood Fiends here. I wonder how are things on Wang Luo's side. He shouldn't be faster than me. I am me after all. Hmm, I can't feel his aura. Is he really faster than me? I need to rush over. Why is there a weird feeling beneath my feet? How can this be? Damn it. I was so focused on rushing that I didn't search for any aura. But the amount, it's too unusual. I understand. This is already the periphery of the Blood Fiend Palace. The surroundings must be filled with their defense mechanism. Damn it. There's too many of them. A drawn-out battle is disadvantageous to me. I must settle it quickly. Ha! This move was meant to be a last resort. I didn't expect to use it this early. By releasing my true chi in all directions and creating a small area explosion. Destroying all the enemies surrounding me. Using the space created by the explosion to escape. There's no time. Let's escape. My guess is this group of weak blood fiends are sent to defend the periphery. As long as I am out of the defense area, they wouldn't chase after me. Heh <laughs> heh. I am so smart. Let's see how Wang Luo is going to clear this stage. Wait. That's not right. If Wang Luo also came here, he would definitely have been surrounded as well, but I didn't hear any activities. Where is Wang Luo? Hello. I, Kaka, learn your language. I am Shwejie. Hello, I just learned your language. I am Shwejie. Don't waste your efforts. No matter how good you are at it, you aren't human. Moreover, you are not planning to coexist with the human race. Ha ha ha. That's right. We will destroy all of you. But, people resisting. More and more, I feel a need learn your culture easier to destroy all of you. Wishful thinking. There will definitely be humans who won't yield. And there will definitely be people who can exterminate you. 
natural, selection, survival of the fittest. These are your words. It's obvious. We are a stronger race. And you are a prisoner. You shouldn't talk to me this way. But Puff, you guys plotted against me. Let me go if you dare. We will fight another 300 rounds. This, I know. What is it called, right? Psychological taunting. Taunting is useless. I won't fight a meaningless battle. You have no means to fight back. I am here to talk about another matter. In your history, there's people called traitors. Are you willing to become a traitor? If you become a traitor, I will make sure you are the last survivor of the human race. Humph. Some things are more important than staying alive. Stop your wishful thinking. More important than staying alive? You are a race that doesn't experience death. You don't understand death. We, the blood fiends, experience growth through death. We also grow stronger through death. Trust me, it's an experience you wouldn't want to go through more than once. Although I am alive right now, within my body, is the accumulation of countless memories of death. Their pain and death, I feel every moment of it clearly. But all of you, because you are afraid of death, you run away from it. As time passes, it becomes an ignorance and lack of respect for death. Death is not a topic that you can casually discuss within yourselves. Your intention, I understand it. But I will come back again. T for you to have such a realization, I am having a whole new level of respect for your race. But you shouldn't look down on the determination of the human race. We can't fuse together like you all and experience their feelings and memories. We might be the two races that will never be able to understand each other. But the virtuous cause in our heart is the same. Our virtuous cause is to bring together the isolated people. And traitors are isolated people. They might be alive, but their hearts are already dead. Ha <laughs> ha. Your realization makes me respect you as well. If it wasn't for the circumstances, we might be friends for a long time. It's an honor to be able to converse with you. Let's end it here today. Let me share some news with you before I leave. The human comrade that came with you has already been discovered by us. Even though the energy is very weak, I can still sense it. Wang Luo is here. What? Wang Luo. What are you doing? Isn't it obvious? Your brother here, he made the right choice. I hope you're as smart as he is. You strange being, it seems you understand our language. Wang Luo. Just what exactly is going on? Hey, he's already on my side. Wang Luo. Speak for yourself. Just what exactly was your goal in coming here to the Blood Fiend Palace? Today you must give me an explanation. Humph. Don't even dream about laying a hand on my ally. I also advise you to quickly think it through. Just obediently cooperate with us. How strong. He's in another world compared to the blood fiends outside. How is it? Youngster from the human race, take a moment to think it through. You've probably already experienced the strength of my race. Sooner or later, the whole world will serve my blood fiend race. Those who hold different principles will not come to a common consensus. Even though you've gone through all the trouble to learn our language, it'll be more suitable for us to speak with our fists. Hey, <laughs> hey, as expected. Then how about this? How will you deal with this? Even though it's my ally, I don't really mind killing another one from the human race. Humph. You should have done this long ago. Palace Master. Shwejia, it seems you're truly worthy of being my advisor. Not only did you manage to learn all of the human race's knowledge in a little over a month, you also expertly controlled all aspects of the situation. But your policy towards the human race is still too passive. The human race cannot be left alive. Palace Master Shui Li. No need to make such a big fuss over this. They're all ready. Don't worry about me. 
You should hurry up and kill his friend. You. Shwejia, I order you. Take action. Wang. Ha ha ha. Good job. Shwejia. The laughable bonds between humans. It's so beautiful when it's broken. No. I didn't make a move, moreover. Moreover, that imitation was one of your people. Oh. Another rat came in. Humph. The more the better. What do you mean another? Wang Luo. He he. I am the winner. I got here first. Great. I knew you wouldn't die that easily. Just now that was an imitation using a blood fiend. Puff. Stop demonstrating your concerns of a hypocritical friendship in front of me. Humans are a race that only think about their own benefits. One more human being here is fine. If there's one, I will kill one. If there's two, I will kill both. Palace Lord. Since we already learned so much about humans' culture, why not? Shut up. You might want to be a rebel that dies from talking too much. I am not willing. Wang Luo. The strength of this blood fiend is not to be belittled. Palace Lord. Two fists will not be able to rival four hands. Stop interrupting me. They are just mere humans. What? A moment of carelessness, whirlwind, and tangling roots. Kick. Palace Lord. I am fine. It was just a small mistake. Giving them an opportunity. You can leave. I don't want to see either side dead or injured. Forgive us for not complying. Our mission is to destroy the Great Tribulation. And your race is born from it. Hehe. <laughs> Even with thousands of years of culture being passed down, it seems like humans are just as warlike as us. Take a look at this. This is. It's a blood core. Every ancient battleground only has one. You can think of it as our lifeline. It's the crux to completely refining the blood fiends in an ancient battleground. Also, the blood core holds the memories of all the blood fiends under the same lineage. Shui Li has so much hatred for humans, but he still managed to master the human's language earlier than me. Don't you think that it's strange? Maybe he is the one who's right, and I am the one who's overly naive. So naive that I thought that there's a chance for our two races to coexist. Why don't the two of you take a look at Shui Li's memories? What are you trying to pull? Let's trust him. If you wanted to pull some tricks, I wouldn't be alive right now. He is different from the other blood fiends. Let's do it. Thanks. Looks like our conversation from before wasn't totally in vain. Shui Li was the firstborn of the blood fiend race in this land the Great Tribulation hadn't arrived yet, so the rage within Shui Li hasn't awakened. The miasma from the blood lake was diffusing, it should be somewhere off the beaten track, but when Shui Li was born, a recluse happened to pass by. The recluse saw that Shui Li possessed spirituality and thought the meeting was fate, so he brought him back and treated him like his own child. Although the recluse is a nobody, he is proficient in the four arts and five classics. Shui Li's childhood was enriching and filled with happiness, but mountain bandits broke into the recluse's house and killed him. This incident caused Shui Li's bloodline to awaken, our race was born to fight, and a few mountain bandits are not Shui Li's opponents. But the death of the recluse caused Shui Li to have incomparable hatred for the humans. Shui Li is actually even more similar to humans. Due to the care of the recluse, Shui Li didn't actually experience the death and rebirth of our race. No one here is able to surpass him regarding cultivation and knowledge. After that, I had an encounter with Shui Li on the battlefield. I am not sure why he chose me. The me at that time was no different from a wild beast. The interaction between Shui Li and the recluse should have been a good story that spread far and wide for our two races. It might have even been possible to dissolve the Great Tribulation. 
but because of the fight for benefits between humans, it has caused Shui Li to stand on the total opposite side of the humans. That's why, both of you, my race is born to fight tribulations, but where did the tribulations come from? I hope the human race can ponder upon it. No matter what, it seems like I and Shui Li no longer have a chance. The chance to dissolve the grievances between our two races and to work together to put an end to the Great Tribulation. I am also unwilling to see any more meaningless deaths. I will hand this blood core to the two of you. But, if you don't have the blood core. Hey hey, my friend of a brief period, knowing you was one of the best things in my life. You don't have to feel sad about our fate. The meaning of life was never based on the ending. You two should leave quickly. This palace was supported by the mental strength of Shui Li. It's already about to collapse. I have already sent the order to the guards outside through brainwaves. They will not obstruct the two of you. What about all of you? Let's leave together. Humph. Where can we go after leaving this place? Forget it. Shui Jie. Is the fight over? Can I go see Dad now? Yes, Palace Lord. You will see him soon. We are finally rid of the curse of rebirth. Today is a great day. Worthy of celebration. Take care, my friend. Blood Fiend Great Treasure This is the Blood Fiend Great Treasure. All the essences of the Blood Fiends have been refined and fused together. They obviously possessed wisdom and have already become living creatures. Maybe there really was a way to coexist. It's a pity we didn't manage to find it. Take it. It's the final present given to you by Shui Jie. Completely purified. Not bad, these two fellows. We finally got a victory. The rest of the places. Southern Region Central Prefecture. Northern Region. Chaos Region. It's not hopeful. We are heavily outnumbered. We can only keep on pushing through the challenges and hold on. I am not sure whether the southern region's northern prefecture is a good start for us. This is a heavy load and a long road ahead. One year later, central region. Looks like something troublesome has happened. Ed, what happened exactly? Every single day, nonstop. A meeting. Although I don't feel like it, I still have to go. I don't want to be the disobedient bird that pokes its head out. Lang Ge Li Ge Lang Kong Long Kong Ge Lang. Everyone, don't you feel that separating from each other is necessary? Today, we summoned everyone, gathering here, the reason for it. He's here. It's him. He came. He's here. It's really him. It's my first time seeing him. It's similar to the legends. I, Shinshin, pay my respects to the Alliance leader. Young Hero G, you don't have to be so polite. Please have a seat. Everyone can sit as well. Did you not hear the Alliance leader? Sit. Ah, uh, let's go. Find a seat. Where are the people at my table? Central Regions, Human Alliance, Top Ranking Heavens Chosen, Ji Shinshin. Central Regions, Human Alliance, Rank 247th Heavens Chosen, Qian Ming, so unsightly. Why is my seat near the door? We summoned everyone here today. To discuss a matter. According to rumors, ah, uh, no. According to reliable news, the Great Tribulation is about to descend upon the Central Region. Ah, uh, it's really coming. I heard a lot of people died in the South. That's why we must put down our prejudices. Come together to face the common enemy. Fighting together against the enemy, that will allow the Human Alliance to continue to stand tall and strong and also for the central region to once again attain glory. We need to defend the important pathways of the wide boundary mountain to the death. Make sure the enemies stay outside of the central region. 
Then we can protect everyone's lives. Cough, cough, cough. Must defend to the death. Cough, cough. Cough, let me catch my breath. The Vice Alliance leader, Bao Lao, will talk about the assigning of the guarding duties. Hello everyone. I will now announce the defense plan. If you have any questions, you can ask them after. Rank 13th Heaven's Chosen Jugaluo will be in charge of the defense of the Southern Big Pathway. Rank 27th Heaven's Chosen Morong Chan will be in charge of the defense of the Northeastern Bridge. Rank 19th Heaven's Chosen Yao, he will be in charge of the defense of the Southern Mountain's high ground. Rank 3rd Heaven's Chosen Gui Long will be in charge of the defense of the Eastern Big Pathway. Rank 100th Heaven's Chosen. Rank 247th Heaven's Chosen Qian Ming. Ah, uh, damn, I almost fell asleep. In charge of the defense of the forest's small pathway. Announcement over. Anyone have any questions? Me, me, me. The forest's small pathway has no room for armies to march. I don't think a defense is needed. Then where do you want to defend? As the bottom ranking heavens chosen, do you have the ability to defend a big pathway? I, I. Save me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Vice Alliance Leader. I don't think I heard my name just now. Where am I in charge of? That's right, as for you. Top-ranked Heaven's Chosen Ji Shinshin will be the overall commander for the defense battle. Hmm, I finally stopped coughing. I will be in charge of the Intelligence Vanguard team. The Alliance Leader will oversee everything from the back. All right, we will gather at the Wide Boundary Mountain in two days. Every Heaven's Chosen should be leading their own team. Two days later. Wide Boundary Mountain. Everyone, head to your location according to the plan. Wait for the information from Vice Alliance Leader Bao. Before the information arrives, hold your positions. Forest Small Pathway, hmm. There's only the three of us on this pathway? Hello. Don't be anxious. If you ask me, it's good to have fewer people. I am Ji Shinfu. Ji Shinshin is my cousin. You can probably guess from our similar appearance. I shall give my cousin some face. Today I will bear the responsibility and lead you guys. I am not a morning person. I will go take a nap. You guys keep a lookout. See you. Aya. I told you not to tie me up so tight. It's too tight. My blood circulation is slowing down. Although I am not anyone outstanding within the Alliance, I will not commit any mistakes. If you leave your position, then you are a deserter. And you? Have you been eating since you arrived here? Confiscated. I will return it to you during meal time. I am in charge of this pathway. Anything that happens to you guys will be my responsibility. I will go check it out. You guys stay here. This is Bloodstains. It's fresh. Someone's here. Hey, are you all right? Which team do you belong to? Vice Alliance Leader Bao. Senior Bao. How did you get injured so badly? I will help you stop the bleeding. My clothes, within. There's information. Take it, give it to Ji Shinshin. Or else, the entire army might get annihilated. He's back. Why is there one more person with him? Doesn't matter. Tie him up. It would be bad if we got discovered. Ji Shinfu. Ah. I, I. You are a descendant of the divine acupuncture fact ion of the Ji family. Quickly help Vice Alliance leader Bao treat his injuries. Ah. Okay. All right. Why is the Vice Alliance leader here? I will go deliver the information. You guys keep a lookout. Take good care of the Vice Alliance leader. Wait. Leader, why don't I deliver it instead? You? All three generations of my family specialized in information transmission, but we kept our identities hidden, so it's normal for you to not know about it. Then, I will leave it to you. 
Secret movement technique. Mountain collapsing spinning top. Qian Ming. You both need to be prepared to face the enemies as well. The enemies this time are unlike any we have ever encountered before. They are not humans. Everything that we care about means nothing to them. Their life never ends and can undergo rebirth infinitely. How long until we reach the central region? If we use the Great Tribulation as a means of travel, we can arrive instantaneously. But the army can't do that. They need at least another one and a half days. That won't do. It's too slow. We didn't find the corpse of that scout just now. He must have already gone back to report our movements. You should have let Minmi go after him. Such a problem wouldn't exist. Stop talking nonsense. Assemble the army. Now? A complete preparation will slow us down even more. No. You will understand soon. Assembly completed. Good. What are you doing? Helping them to be faster. We should go as well. Let's make the central region rain blood. Commander. Urgent report. This is... A letter from the Vice Alliance leader. It was suddenly delivered. He is exhausted and is currently resting. Suddenly? Forest small pathway. Why was it delivered to them first? He said the Vice Alliance leader is at their location. He is injured. The enemies are called blood fiends, neither man nor beast. Their skin is crimson. Such thick clouds. Why is it red? It's getting redder. Once killed, can be reborn through blood. It's raining. A blood rain. An ominous sign. Blood rain? Blood? Once killed. Can be. Reborn. Through blood. Quick. Alert everyone. The enemies are here. What? Ah. What kind of monster is this? Ah. Miscalculation. A great miscalculation. That is. This aura. Dao Realm. No. I can't let them join the battlefield. Block them. Forest Small Pathway, Vice Alliance Leader, are you feeling better? I am fine. The enemies are almost here. You have to be prepared. Ji Shinfu is keeping a lookout. I will take over for him soon. Bad news. Below the mountain, they have already started fighting below the mountain. What? Why so soon? According to my calculations, it should be another one and a half days at least. Frontline Battlefield These few monsters They are not affected by my attacks at all Even if I can protect myself But the battlefield is behind me I can't allow more people to die This is bad Damn it. Looks like my cultivation is still too shallow. To have to depend on this armor to protect my life. Come. If you want to enter the central region, you have to go through me. Don't even think about getting past me. Stop running. Damn it. They split themselves up. It's here. It's finally here. Let me take a look. Is it good news? Vice Alliance Leader Bao, 
These are all the herbs we could find in the mountain and forest. You have to make do with it. Why not? Let me do it myself. No need to be polite. I used to always cause you trouble. Leader. Vice Alliance Leader. The front lines sent a report. What's the news? The first line of defense below the mountain, completely and utterly defeated. Leader. Where are you going? Take care of Vice Alliance Leader Bao. Without my signal, do not leave the cave. I should have taken action earlier. Damn it. Luckily they sent me to this forest. If not it will be hard to deploy. This place will do. Congeal your heart. Illustrate the form. 10,000 Transformation Harmonization. 10,000 Transformation Rule, Frontline Battlefield. Team Leader. We already lost more than a tenth of our men. The group will prepare for battle. Focus on defense. Cough, cough. Luo. Gue Long. Have the Eastern Big Pathway fallen as well. Cough, cough. Dao Realm enemies are joining the battles. You have to be careful. Got it. Go get your injuries treated. We have Yao He on the high ground. People who can still fight. Follow me. The southern big pathway leads directly to the Alliance's main hall. We have to defend it. Protect the Alliance. Protect the Alliance. Move out. Front lines of the southern big pathway. What's going on? The battle is over. Where are the monsters? They retreated. Team leader, can you send the injured people back? The injured can head back to the rear. People who are fine will stay. Who made them retreat? We were about to fall just now. The monsters were right about to break through. Suddenly, many Qian Mings appeared. Those wooden Qian Ming are not only on par with the normal blood fiends, he could also turn into tree roots to trap and immobilize them, stopping their rebirth. With the support of those wooden Qian Ming, the blood fiend army was forced to retreat in a short time. I didn't expect Qian Ming to hide so deeply. Since we have some time now, quickly get the injured treated. People who are fine shouldn't be careless as well. Gue Long said that there are Dao Realm blood fiends on the eastern side. Ha, ha. Damn it. No. I will not depend on the strength of others. Puff. Why are you taking your clothes off? It's just false bravado. I am not a child. Do you think you can scare me? Cough, cough. That. That thing came out again. Damn it, but this is not the time to be tangled with such things. As long as it can defeat the blood fiends, it's fine. I wonder how the others are doing. Shinshin. Shinshin is back. Is everyone alright? 
It's all thanks to Qian Ming's wooden puppets. If not, we would have been in trouble. Qian Ming? Wooden puppets? Phew, that's weird. Although the 10,000 transformation rule can restrain the blood fiends, they shouldn't have retreated so quickly. There must be some other reason. That's right. The two of them are still in the cave. Vice Alliance Leader Bao. Shinfu. You can come out now. Today during the hour of Shur, our army forced the blood fiends to retreat. About a tenth of our army suffered casualties. Our resources were almost completely used up. This is the report for the battle. My command of the army was too poor. I asked the alliance leader to punish me. Where is Vice Alliance Leader Bao? Vice, Vice Alliance Leader Bao, suffered heavy injuries. He is in the forest's pathway. Bao Lao went to the forest's pathway alone. Yes, Alliance Leader. Vice Alliance Leader Bao suffered heavy injuries and collapsed. Team Leader Qian Ming was the one who found him. Which means, other than Vice Alliance Leader Bao, everyone else in the Vanguard team is dead. Alliance Commander of the Vanguards, Bao Lao Is here to report Alliance Leader, I am back too Vice Alliance Leader Bao Take a look I told you to rest before returning Now I still have to assist you by the arm How are you going to salute to the Alliance Leader? Heh <laughs> heh Little friend Qian Ming, no need to be a stickler for formalities. Every time someone comes back alive, the burden in my heart lightens a little bit. Alliance leader, the 12 people in the Vanguard team. No need to say more. The Vanguard team are the most courageous and insightful people within the central region. Everyone in the Vanguard team will be conferred as a hero. Their families will be rewarded and taken care of. A cenotaph will be erected. Thank you, Alliance Leader. The Blood Fiends are not completely exterminated yet. All of us need to get ready for the next battle. Ji Shinshin, contribution for killing the leader, maintaining top rank. How Yuan, prevented the Blood Fiends from getting past the line of defense while having the least casual ties, maintaining second rank. Yao He, contribution for saving the injured, ranking raised by three. Wow. Am I dreaming? So tiring. Vice Alliance Leader Bao should lose some weight. Qian Ming, contribution for supporting other areas, ranking raised by four. Huh? What did I just hear? Alliance Leader, that. Today's dispatch is considered a military call. It's irrefutable. All right. From now on, no more interruptions. Let's continue. Mi Sun. Contribution for fighting against the enemies, maintaining fifth rank. Worthy of being the central region. Full of talents. The rise of Qian Ming is within my expectations. The unexpected one is Ji Shinshin, who possessed the ancient devil bloodline. Interesting. The Heaven's Dao has penetrated the central region and is secretly devouring the Heaven's Law. This should be enough. I just need to wait to reap the rewards. Whether the deity race made any arrangements, whether they are returning to the nine regions to pave the way, as long as I am strong enough, even if the three big races return, they won't be able to obstruct me. The current nine regions, except for the northern region, the ancient region is the only one that hasn't faced the blood fiends. The ancient region will definitely not be peaceful for long. Everything has been arranged in the periphery of the first ancient battleground, according to the, the orders of Master. Good. Once you are done with your mission, return to the northern region. It's about time for a Dao realm expert to be birthed by the Heaven's Dao. Great Dao group, I have been feeling restless lately. It feels as if a great opportunity is waiting for me. After being reminded by Dao friend Chu, I don't even dare to leave my seclusion. I have been suppressing that enticing feeling from who knows where. I had the same feeling. Me too. This is a sign that the Tao Realm Warriors are about to enter the Tribulation. Stabilize your state of mind. This is a crucial moment. You have to hold yourself back. Don't let your state of mind be disrupted. Do not leave the ancient region and enter the nine regions to fight for opportunities. The speed of development of the Great Tribulation is too fast. Something's not right. 
How long has it been since the Taoyuan Great Tribulation started? It hasn't even been a hundred years, and it's already starting to affect Tao Realm warriors, enticing them to enter the Tribulation. Yi Yuajun, Senior Chu, it's horrifying, I almost died. What's going on with Yi Yuajun? He is a great Tao's creature, it's not so easy to perish, how did he almost die? The strange black energy on the great Tao, what exactly is it? Tao friend Yi Yuajun, what happened? The black energy on the great Tao, that strange power is horrifying, once I entered, it started to corrode me, I had to block it as I explored around. In the end, I myself seem to have undergone some changes. That strange power is ominous. After my dark rock physique got corroded, red feathers started growing on my body. What the hell do you mean you started growing red feathers? Then what happened? Don't tell me, he is now a red-colored great rock? A great Dao's creature wouldn't transform into a blood fiend, right? I was quite happy in the beginning. I managed to grow feathers of a new color after all. I didn't mind it. In fact, I became brighter and more beautiful, but after a while, half of my feathers started to take on the colors of the rainbow. I got so bright and beautiful, but I didn't expect that the feathers of different colors would reject and clash against each other. I felt that something was definitely wrong with me. That's when I realized that black energy is really strange and ominous, so I started to expel the black energy. When I was expelling the black energy that was corroding me, there was some conflict with it. With my strength, I couldn't expel it from my body within a short time. I was so frightened that I didn't dare to continue exploring and decided to leave, but I realized I couldn't recognize where I was. I was trapped. I only managed to get out after quite some time. After I came back, I went into seclusion to get rid of the rest of the ominous energy. I molted and regrew all my feathers to get rid of those ominous colorful feathers. Dao friend, what do you think of that black energy? To be able to corrode a Dao Yuan realm expert, moreover it's a great Dao's creature talkless, that should indicate how horrifying the black energy is. From within the black energy, I can feel an aura of disaster filled with ominosity. I suspect that it's the legendary great Dao anguish aura. Before I was born, I possessed some inheritance within my consciousness, it's regarding the great Dao anguish aura, filled with disaster and animosity, once a Dao Yuan realm expert is corroded by it, they will turn into an ominous monster. Great Dao anguish aura. Able to corrode a Dao Yuan realm expert, that's too horrifying, is that the great Dao great tribulation? Once the great Dao anguish aura diffuses, every creature below the Dao Yuan realm will perish. Dao Brother Chu, the appearance of the Great Dao Anguish Aura should be the start of the Great Dao Great Tribulation you were talking about previously, right? That's right, this is the start of the Great Dao Great Tribulation. Dao Friend Yi Yuajun should pay more attention to it. I need to prepare some countermeasures. All right, I will pay attention to it. I thought that the Great Dao Great Tribulation would be quite some time away, but the development of the Dao Yuan Great Tribulation was too fast. This means, the Great Dao Tribulation will be arriving in the near future. This won't do, my cultivation is still shallow, I am unable to interfere with the Great Dao and the Great Tribulation. I need to quickly increase my cultivation. Let's hope Hei Yu and Qin Ning can give me some surprises. Right now, Ji Shinshin is in control of the Human Alliance. If nothing goes wrong, Ji Shinshin will rise up to become the Human King in the Central Region during this Tribulation. Ji Shinshin, the reincarnation of a half-saint from the deity race, if he becomes a human king, what will he do? Will he let the humans become the vassals of the deity race? I can't allow Ji Shinshin to be too satisfied. There has to be a heaven's chosen of the human race that can go up against him. Among my disciples, there isn't anyone that can go up against Ji Shinshin yet. I will wait for one of them to appear, then I will send him to fight against Ji Shinshin. I wonder if Ji Shinshin being reincarnated into the Ji family has anything to do with the ancestors of the Ji family. If it does, then that means the Ji family is connected to the deity race. Dao Friend Hong, do you know about the Ji family of the human race? Ji family? The Ji family has a long history. When I was still a nameless warrior, I was already hearing legends about the human king of the Ji family. 
He was a human king during the period when the human race was still weak and led the human race to become one of the strongest races. The Ji family actually has such a long history, even an antique like Hong Yuanchu who has gone through two daewans, the human king of the Ji family is actually a legend to him. Do you know where the human king Ji is? Is he a Dao Yuan realm expert? Human King Ji is definitely a Dao Yuan realm expert, but he has disappeared for a really long time. I have never met him. I have also asked the descendant of the Ji family, but still couldn't get any information of his whereabouts. That's right. We shouldn't be the only group of Dao Yuan realm experts within the human race. The Dao Yuan realm experts before us, where did they go? I might be one of the people who led the human race to become the dominating race of the nine regions. But during the past, when the human race wasn't as powerful, all the experts that led the human race seemed to have disappeared. We have no idea where they are. Dao Brother Chu, I just remembered something. When I was about to enter the Dao Yuan realm, there was an expert from the devil race that tried to kill me. It was an expert from the human race that held him back. Although I only had a momentary glimpse, I heard some rumors later that the one who helped me is the son of human King Ji, an expert in the Dao Yuan realm. Hong Yuan Chu is a Dao Yuan realm expert. His memory shouldn't be so bad. Even if I didn't mention it, why didn't he think about it on his own? There must be some kind of power interfering, making his memory about it hazy. The power that interfered with my memories, it didn't appear after I entered the Dao Yuan realm. It was interfering even before that. If it's man-made, then it's definitely scary. It's definitely done by a Dao Yuan realm expert, which means I have been under the surveillance of a Dao Yuan realm expert all along. What's his goal for doing this? Dao Brother Chu, do you think this is the work of someone? How would I know? I am not even in the Dao Yuan realm. Dao Friend Mo2 and the others, do you know of any devil race experts that entered the Dao Yuan realm earlier than all of you? That's right. Does Mo2 know about it? If even Mo2 doesn't know anything, that means it's not man-made, but the influence of one of the laws of the Great Dao. In the first ancient battleground, were there any Dao Yuan realm experts from the Ji family? Or any little fellows in the Dao realm from the Ji family? There were a few Dao realm warriors from the Ji family. I am not sure about the Dao Yuan realm experts, if they really go into hiding, unless they willingly show themselves, or they are heading towards another region, we will never be able to find out. The waters in the nine regions are deeper than I thought. Dao Brother Chu, why are you asking about the Ji family? I discovered something interesting, so I thought to ask and see if you know anything. Looks like the Ji family history goes way back. There's a high chance they will rise up to become a great family during this great Dao era. Human King Ji was one of the crucial figures that led the human race into becoming one of the strongest races. The one who helped Hong Yuan Chu is the son of Human King Ji, which means that there is more than one Dao Yuan realm expert in the Ji family. The one who reincarnated into Ji Shinshin might just be one of the Dao Yuan realm experts from the Ji family. I need to pay more attention to him. Mo2 and Mo Zhen, do you remember any of the Dao Yuan realm experts of the devil race in the past? No, if you didn't mention it, I wouldn't have thought about it as well. Does the Dao friends of the demon race not remember anything as well? My understanding of the Dao Yuan realm is too low. The duration of being in the Dao Yuan realm, there must be a boundary that separates them, a difference between them. They think that opening a path 10,000 miles long means you are invincible. Maybe it's a threshold. All the experts that disappeared reached 10,000 miles and then left. To further explore the Great Dao? I said I opened a path that's a few million miles long. Isn't that too big of a lie? But it's too late to retract it. If I fulfill it, then it's no longer a lie. As long as I can increase the level of the Heaven Dao and devour the laws of the entire nine regions, the path I open might be more than a few million miles. A huge amount of living creatures in the Chaos region have already disappeared in such a short time. Let's just use this chance and escape. I heard the little evil king is on a killing spree. He wants to find a great treasure that can help him recover his fifth limb. Is it Yao Rao the evil king? He is famous in the Chaos region. Fighting for great fortune is something that belongs to the experts. It's good enough that we manage to survive. 
Ha, huh, I heard the Black Moon House is setting up pillars in the many prefectures of the Chaos region. I wonder what their goal is. Seems like they are playing chess. Let's go. We will leave it to the strong factions to fight the Blood Fiends. After entering the three prefectures, the Blood Fiends seem to have lost their way. They are also not as violent and crazy as before. Ji Shinshin in the central region managed to rise up and killed the Dao Realm Blood Fiends. Too strong. Too heaven defying. Although I have no enmity with Ji Shinshin, but the things I want to achieve, with his current position, he will definitely be an obstruction. I need to do my best to catch up and close the distance between us. Yuer, are you confident? Are you sure this will work? 90% sure. Grandfather, I have an innate divine soul. Even if it's badly damaged, it's still special. I don't do things that I am not confident of. The enmity of the past, with her stubbornness, will she let it go? Am I willing to let it go? Even being in the deity realm is useless here. Grandfather, I know, don't forget, I have master's guidance. Being in the Tao realm doesn't mean you won't die. Shall you, everything is ready. Then we can start soon. Shall you, you should smile more and display more emotions. If not, you will seem like someone without a heart. I am used to it. As expected from the maid of master, she has so many treasures, all kinds of weird and special treasures as well. Shall you, can we really succeed? The reincarnation law still isn't strong enough. The requirements to establish it are also lacking. The warriors that died are lacking a passage for reincarnation. The heaven Tao isn't strong enough as well. If I want to establish reincarnation, I have to merge the nine regions into the heaven Tao. The level of the heaven Tao also has to be increased. It has to be almost on the same level as the great Tao. Only then can reincarnation be established. Strength is the foundation. Without sufficient strength, it's just wishful thinking. The Dao Yuan realm experts of the past, where did they go exactly? No one has any information. They might have already left the nine regions. Or does this great Dao only belong to the nine regions? Are there other great Daos outside of the nine regions? The Chaos Great Dao? The Dao Yuan realm experts of the past include the immortal, deity, and devil race. Did they leave the great Dao of the nine regions and go to the lands of the chaos great Dao? If I want to know the hidden secrets, my cultivation has to reach that level first. For the fifth decade, what will the rewards be? Your disciple Hei Yu caused the descent of the heaven law, thus helping the heaven Dao replace the heaven law, killed the blood fiends of the three prefectures, gathering the blood fiend aura into the scouting spirit pillars, obtaining the fortune of the great tribulation resulting in a great increase in cultivation, changing her fate. Rewarding fortune law upgrade. Your disciple Hei Yu has entered the deity realm resulting in a great increase in cultivation. Rewarding chaos aura. Your maid Su Siener helped your disciple Hei Yu in killing the blood fiends of the three prefectures, obtaining the fortune of the great tribulation resulting in a great increase in cultivation, changing her fate. Rewarding fortune law upgrade. Your disciple Hei Yu has entered the deity realm resulting in a great increase in cultivation. Rewarding chaos aura. As expected from the people I valued, responsible for speeding up the heaven Dao plan, they didn't disappoint me. After making arrangements for so long, it's finally time to reap the rewards. Su Siener lent Hei Yu a helping hand and managed to obtain her own opportunity. Hei Yu actually managed to find such a special scouting spirit pillar formation from reading the Great Tao San Tools book and 10,000 Formation Scripture. Using it to absorb the Blood Fiend Aura, it can suppress the Blood Fiend Aura within the scouting spirit pillars, preventing their rebirth. The only shortcoming is that these special scouting spirit pillars are not easy to craft. You will need special materials for it. It's definitely rare even within the entire nine regions. You can't utilize them on a large scale. There's also a limit on how much blood fiend aura they can absorb, but killing the blood fiends that gathered in the three prefectures of the chaos region, that's already enough. Hei Yu's fate has already changed. She is also a child of fate of the great Dao. Su Siener might just be a helping hand, but she also contributed quite a bit and is now also a child of fate of the Great Tao. I am also not sure of the changes that come with being a child of fate of the Great Tao. 
When Su Siener comes back, I can examine her closely, then I can know what's so extraordinary about them. That's too terrifying. Exterminating the blood fiends in the three prefectures with one move? How did the Black Moon House do it? Moreover, such a huge amount of blood fiends were killed, the thick blood fiend aura, wouldn't an extremely horrifying blood fiend be reborn? Does the Black Moon House have a method to deal with the blood fiends? If that's true, wouldn't Black Moon House be able to hold supremacy in the chaos region? The blood fiend aura in the three prefectures are dissipating, which means Black Moon House really has a method to exterminate the blood fiends. Everyone, to be able to fight for fortune, shouldn't we? The arrangements of Hey Yu are ingenious, one links to another, and the timing is impeccable. When she returns to the central regions, I believe she can make the arrangements and help the Heaven Dao devour the central region faster. The only obstruct ion that is concerning right now is Ji Shinshin. Hopefully Ji Shinshin will be tactful. If he really wants to obstruct me and make me his enemy, if there's a chance in the future, I will kill him. If it's necessary, I will have to provoke him, or maybe I can reveal a bit of information to Ji Shinshin about the man hidden behind the scenes in the western region. Some races in the Chaos region are cooperating to go against the Black Moon House. Hey Yu has definitely already planned for this. Hey Yu might be using them as stepping stones to further increase her own fortune. In the Demonic region, Hu Tinya has gathered the Heavenly Tiger race, roped in some of the Demonic races with special abilities, and is current L.Y. staying dormant. They are waiting for the perfect timing and opportunity to turn the tide. Hu Tinyao's bloodline is constantly changing. It's starting to have the prestige of a divine beast. The entire heavenly tiger race can be suppressed with his bloodline. I hope Hu Tinyao won't disappoint me. I don't expect him to be at the standards of Heiyu, but at least be able to give me some surprises. In the western region, Din Yu and Xiao Liang are still fighting against the blood fiends. But the blood fiends in the western region are no longer invading. They no longer have the plans to take over the western region. This situation is abnormal. The blood fiends seem to be plotting something or waiting for an opportunity. In the southern region, Feng Kong together with Wang Luo and Xiang Xing are thinking of a way to resolve the ancient battleground in the central prefecture. Wang Luo is preparing to enter the central region and he needs Feng Kong, a Dao realm expert, to accompany him. If they don't resolve the ancient battleground, Feng Kong can't leave. The situation in the southern region is more or less stable. Xiang Bang is also going around killing all the blood fiends, controlling the situation as well. He has realized, the more blood fiends he kills, the more his fortune increases, he is not far from the Dao realm. Your heaven Dao has devoured the three prefectures in the chaos region. Rewarding three stages of cultivation in the Tao realm. The cultivation reward is finally here. Receive rewards. Nineteenth stage of the Tao realm, I have taken another step forward towards the thirty-six stages of the Tao realm. After breaking through to the deity realm, I was just looking for someone to test out my strength. We have no intentions of becoming enemies with Black Moon House, but the Great Tribulation has descended. The Blood Fiends are harming all living creatures. They are the common enemy of all living creatures in the Nine Regions. All of us have the responsibility of exterminating Blood Fiends and returning order to the Nine Regions. Since Black Moon House has the method of exterminating the Blood Fiends, I hope Floor Master Hey Yu can share it with us. Of course, we don't plan to obtain it for free. We will exchange it for treasures. A race of ants dare to covet the secret method of our human race? It's still unknown whether the human race can get through this great tribulation. You shouldn't be so insolent. If the human race is no longer the ruler after this, he he. What a joke. We have a secret method. Why would we not get through the great tribulation? All of you tiny races should be tactful, surrender obediently, and serve us. Otherwise, when the human race dominates the entire nine regions, you won't have a chance. Whether it's the foreign races or the human race, all of them have ulterior motives. There aren't many good people in the chaos region because the good people are already dead. Floor Master Hey Yu, how can the secret method of our human race be given to the foreign races? The Great Tribulation is also an opportunity for the human race. 
Floor Master Heiyu is a heaven's chosen of the human race. She is rising up for the human race and creating the secret method to exterminate the blood fiends is a great contribution. But, Floor Master Heiyu is alone. She might not be able to display the full power of the secret method. The other races might also target her. Why don't you pass it to us and we can work together to help the human race rise up? These people are so hypocritical. Just say that you want the secret method. Why be such a hypocrite? Whether it's the human race or foreign races, don't be greedy for things that don't belong to you. Greed will cause your death. I am giving all of you a chance. Go back. I won't hold it against you. If you still plan to obtain the secret method, then leave your life behind. Since that's the case, don't blame us for not showing mercy to our own race. Such a hypocrite, so annoying. Since you are not willing to hand over the secret method, then don't blame us for using some ricks. Since all of you seek death, I will fulfill your wishes. This power, it feels familiar. Hand over the secret method. If you don't, we will take action. Go ahead and try. I am used to the tea that Su Siener makes. Now that she isn't here and I have to make it myself, I am not used to it. As humans, it is indeed easy for a thrifty person to become extravagant, but difficult for an extravagant person to become thrifty. Su Siener has already entered the deity realm and changed her fate. She should be back soon. It's been a while since I had delicacies made by Su Siener. I knew this will happen, but it's out of my expectations for so many Deity Realm Warriors to cooperate against her. Are there actually so many Deity Realm Warriors in the Chaos region? Now that I think about it, the races that are able to have a foothold in the Chaos region, surely they have a Deity Realm Warriors supporting them? Hey Yu has used the Heavenly Tao Talisman together with her Heavenly Tao Scripture to control the common people and is merging together with the Heaven Tao for the first time. The three prefectures are already under her full control. Of course, Hei Yu is still pretty weak right now, even in the deity realm. She won't be able to completely control the powers of the Heaven's Tao, and would also be unable to exhibit its full potential. Hei Yu is preparing to head towards the central region. I can make use of her Heaven Tao powers in my future plan. Hei Yu should have a method to make the Heaven Tao penetrate into the central region faster. Although I am not sure of Hei Yu's exact arrangements, these aren't important as long as the Heaven Tao can expand faster. But Hei Yu didn't immediately kill off these Deity Realm Warriors, it's not as simple as that. The other seven prefectures in the Chaos region are all a bit abnormal, the Heavenly Law has tangled up with some of the fates of races. The few bits of Heavenly Law that managed to penetrate in, they seem to be gathering momentum and waiting for an opportunity to quickly devour a part of its Heavenly Law. As expected from a disciple that I look highly upon, if Hei Yu's method is successful, the speed at which the Heaven Tao devours the other prefectures of the Chaos region will be greatly increased. Maybe I should improve the foundations of Hei Yu so that she can improve her cultivation quicker and be able to fight against Ji Shinshin. I cannot allow Ji Shinshin to be the overall winner in the fight for Fortune during this great tribulation. I will warn you once more, do not be ruined by greed and send yourselves to death. Who are you trying to scare? We have so many deity realm warriors here, even if you are above the deity realm, we are not afraid. Since that's the case, then die. What kind of lightning are these? Why did lightning suddenly descend? Is this the heavenly law's lightning? Ignorant greed will eventually take your lives, this is heaven's punishment. Even the heavens can't stand looking at you all and wants to punish you. Spare me, I know my mistake. As expected, when deity realm warriors die, the fortune belonging to their race will be seized and transferred to the other seven prefectures. To put it more accurately, they are returning back to the seven prefectures. Just a tiny bit of disorder was enough for the penetrated heavenly law to quickly devour and expand itself. It's such a pity, all these deity realm warriors, if they were transformed into the ghost race, they would be able to strengthen the ghost race quickly, and also the ghost Tao and ghost world as well. 
With this group of deity realm warriors, most of them are from other races, after transforming to becoming part of the ghost race, it will also increase the different species of ghosts, as the number of species increases. The ghost Tao will also improve, which is a good thing. I don't need a complete soul, just a broken piece of it will be enough. After being cleansed in the Yellow River, they will transform into a ghost race. The Ghost Dao is just in time to be connected to the Heaven Dao of the Chaos Region's three prefectures. Now it will be able to welcome the broken souls into the ghost world, modify some of their memories, but maintaining the memories of their previous species identity and cultivation. The broken souls of those dead deity realm warriors, after transforming into the ghost race, their fortune will be severed, so there will be no influence on the penetration of the Heaven Dao. These broken souls that transformed into the ghost race will quickly regain their deity realm cultivation and become an expert of the ghost race. In this way, the ghost race will become more powerful, then they will be more confident running around in the nine regions, and it will be easier for them to fight for the fortune in the great tribulation and quickly rise up. Did the master make a move? This feeling after killing so many deity realm warriors in one go, isn't this bad? But it can't be right. Master isn't the kind of merciful and indecisive person. The Master must want to transform those deity realm broken souls into the ghost race to increase their strength. Heavenly Punishment? Why did Heavenly Punishment descend? Luckily, we were slow and didn't charge into it. Could it be, because she killed the blood fiends and obtained great fortune, the crowd then surrounding her caused the Heavenly Punishment? The legend says that a heavenly punishment is the descent of heavenly thunder, killing the punished. Another legend also says that someone who survived a heavenly punishment will become a child of fate, a peerless expert in the future. I will run first. I haven't lived long enough yet. Run, run. Although I knew she was hiding her hand, I did not expect it to be so horrifying, instantly killing numerous deity realm experts. Heavenly punishment? The legendary heavenly punishment? She may be the only female disciple under Sir, but when it comes to killing people, she doesn't even blink. Before going to the central region, return first. Yes, Master. With Heiyu's arrangements, I no longer have to worry about this place. I wonder how the other's plans are going. The little evil king in the chaos region has also become renowned and is quickly rising up. But with the evil cultivators gone and the great evil palace dissolved, he can only focus on raising his cultivation. It's still possible to find a treasure medicine that can recover his fifth limb if we look for it. Du Yuan is also in the chaos region and his strength is increasing quickly. He managed to get some fortune during this Dao Yuan Great Tribulation. Although it's not comparable to Ding Yu and the others, but compared to the other experts, it can be considered to be quite a huge profit for him. The entire central region is under attack from a great wave of blood fiends. If not for the central region being powerful, it would have fallen long ago. Qin Ming has already risen up by killing the blood fiends in the Qin prefecture. Even the heavenly realm blood fiends aren't a match for him. The blood fiends has descended, the skies are dyed with blood, the heavenly laws are also changing, it's getting harder for the heavens Dao law to devour them, it seems to be affected by something unknown, it should be related to the Dao Yuan Great Tribulation. The ghost race is also active within the central region, many of the surviving souls of experts chose to transform into the ghost race. A talented human when I was born, a heroic ghost when I die. Even as a ghost, we will fight for the humans. A hero when I was alive, a heroic ghost now I am dead. This battle is an opportunity for the ghost race, the ghost world has expanded, the ghost Dao is improving, the ghost king's strength is also improving. Feng Kong, Wang Luo and Xiang Xing are working together to settle the problem of the ancient battlefield, they should be leaving soon and heading towards the central region. After the two of them head for the central region, the southern region will be the place where Xiang Xing rises up. Heavenly punishment? How is that possible? It's impossible. How can there be heavenly punishment? The current heavenly laws simply don't have the laws of heavenly punishment. Also, instantly killing numerous deity realm experts. What's going on? Could it be that the heavenly laws of the chaos region have changed due to the Dao Yuan Great Tribulation? 
impossible, a region's heavenly laws, no matter how it changes, it will never leave its core. The current heavenly laws simply don't have the laws of heavenly punishment. Moreover, it doesn't have the power to display such a strong heavenly punishment. Could it be that the heavenly laws of the nine regions are going through changes again due to the Daoyuan Great Tribulation? The so-called heavenly punishment is established by the immortal race, divine race, and devil race, the three great races. They are secretly controlling part of the nine regions' heavenly laws. Even when it's used to target certain races or powers to prevent them from surpassing the three great races, it's also to let the heaven's prides go through certain experiences and select the best among them. Since the changing of the previous great Tao period, the three great races have been banished from the nine regions and the heavenly punishment also disappeared from the nine regions. How did the heavenly punishment appear again? What heavenly punishment? It must be some kind of great formation. Hey you! Are you coming back to the central region? I didn't expect her to return so quickly. Hey, you coming back. It must be to seek revenge with the heavenly moon house. As for the G family, there shouldn't be any grievances. The premise is that the G family did not intimidate or target Hey, you. What should I do after Hey, you returns? I can only wait for her to be back and then decide based on the situation. There are more Devil Race Dao Realm experts becoming bald, thanks to Dao Friend Chu's advice. Those who become bald are even more powerful now. Other than them occasionally placing their palms together and chanting Amidba, there are no other issues. This is a kind of sign. You have passed the first wave of Great Tribulation. They will recover from these remaining symptoms once the Great Tribulation is over. I see. I need to quickly open my Dao. And I need to be really strong, at the very least stronger than MO2. Otherwise, once MO2 discovers something's amiss, and that those devil race Dao realm experts are not transforming into the devil race, but the Buddha race, I am afraid he will come looking for trouble. Of course there's a chance he doesn't dare to do so. The heavens Dao in the chaos region is quickly devouring the heavenly laws currently. Hey Yu has completed the arrangements and is preparing to return to the northern region. Your disciples Wang Luo and Xiang Xing suppressed the newly born blood region, transforming their fortunes and greatly increasing their cultivation, rewarding fortune Dao Law upgrade. The region of the blood race, it can endlessly give birth to the blood race, it can even let the blood race become a true race of the nine regions. The region of the blood race, it can endlessly give birth to the blood race, it can even let the blood race become a true race of the nine regions. Feng Kong, Wang Luo, Xiang Xing, the three of them cooperated and suppressed the newly born blood region. Now that two of their fortunes have transformed, they already possess the great Dao fortune. After the two of them, He Yu and Su Xiener, come back. I should be able to see and find out what the great Dao fortune really represents. Ding Yu and Xiao Liang seem to be slacking a little bit recently. Is it due to the blood fiend's wisdom improving in the western region and also the person hiding behind the scenes? The heavens Dao already penetrated into the western region's southern prefecture, but up till now, it still hasn't fully devoured it. The eastern region isn't making much progress as well. Half a month later, your heaven's Dao has devoured the heavenly laws of the southern region's central prefecture, rewarding one stage of cultivation in the Dao realm. After suppressing the newly born blood region in the southern region's central prefecture, Wang Luo and Xiang Xing have transformed their fortunes. The heaven's Dao is also riding on their fortune transformation, increasing its speed of devouring the heavenly laws in the southern region's central prefecture. The southern region's central prefecture is finally a part of heaven's Dao. Receive rewards. I am now in the 20th stage of the Dao realm, only 16 stages away from completing the full cycle. I need to devour another 16 prefectures. Sir, we're back. Greetings, master. Hmm, nicely done. One who possesses the great Dao fortune. I understand now. Someone who possesses the great Dao fortune has opened their door into the Dao realm. Obtaining the great Dao fortune is equivalent to having a key. Stepping into the Dao realm will no longer be that difficult as when you are unable to find a way through. As long as you possess the great Dao fortune, you will be able to break through into the Dao realm. 
now it makes sense why so many Tao realm experts emerged during a Tao Yuan Great Tribulation, why so many Heaven's Prides broke through into the Tao realm during a Tao Yuan Great Tribulation. The blood fiends in the central region are ferocious, one in the Tao realm has appeared, you can meet up with Wang Luo once you are there. Feng Kong is also in the Tao realm, moreover he is in the second stage, he is much stronger than those Tao realm wastrels in the central region. Ji Shinshin is not a normal person, he already possesses the strength to step into the Tao realm, for now, try not to provoke him if possible. As for what he is planning, that's not important. Ji Shinshin is not a normal person? If even the master is saying Ji Shinshin is not normal, then he is definitely not just simply the heaven's pride of the Ji family. Master, is he special in any way? It's just the reincarnation of an expert from a powerful race that has disappeared from the nine regions. Whatever he is planning, it's not important. Him reincarnating into the G family, there must be some reasons behind it. The ancestor of the G family is not just an average expert as well. G Shinshin is the reincarnation of an expert? Moreover, he's not an expert from the human race. No wonder he is so heaven-defying. What's his goal for reincarnating into the G family? Master, can you tell us about his origin? A half sink from the divine race, it's the peak of the Tao realm. If you want to fight against him or to thwart his plans, you need to catch up to his strength first. It doesn't matter what kind of intentions Ji Shinshin has, it's necessary to have someone who can go against him. Since the three great races have already left the nine regions, why are they back now? In the future, the nine regions will be my. Let's prepare some more precious treasures for Heiyu and strengthen her foundations. Master, I am going to get ready to head towards the central ridge ion now. Go ahead. I will stay behind to accompany, sir. With a pretty maid taking care of me, the days are so much more comfortable. Your disciple Qian Ming has stepped into the deity realm, rewarding one lump of chaos aura. Your name, Disciple Qin Ying, has stepped into the deity realm, rewarding one lump of chaos aura. Your nephew Chu Pingfan demonstrated the might of the extreme Tao, killing blood fiends and improving his fortune, resulting in a great increase in cultivation, stepping into the heavenly realm, rewarding fortune Tao law upgrade. As my fortune Tao law continues to upgrade, I can vaguely detect the changes. It seems to be advancing into becoming a fortune Tao. Maybe after upgrading a few more times, it will transform into the Fortune Dao? Although the Fortune Dao Law is upgrading in succession, I still can't see through the fortune changes of the nine regions. Central Region Qian Mountain Phew, it's finally done. How are the arrangements going? Wang Luo Transformation, undo. I just finished the arrangements. How about you? Undo. Already done. I just want to take a look at the side of Heiyu. I wonder how effective it will be for the next attack by the Blood Fiends. It's fine. With your 10,000 transformation rule, no matter how many Blood Fiends come, they won't be able to return. M, do you want to tire me to death? Ha ha ha. Just kidding. But according to your previous performance, getting first ranked within the Heaven's Prides is just a matter of time. Aya, don't mention it. Now, I can't even lay low even if I want to. So many social interactions. Speaking about this, I have to quickly report back to the Human Alliance, otherwise it will be suspicious. Ha ha. Why? At such a timing, the blood fiends attacks. Qian Ming has risen up. But my demonic blood is active ally. Jijiji. Where are you? Jijiji. Ya. Yeah. Where are you looking at? What? We have always been together all the time. You have already witnessed my strength. If we work together, the world will definitely fall into our hands. I, I don't want to. You should disappear. Jijiji, what are you saying? We are of the same body and heart. 
if we were to only allow one person to control this body, then it should also be me who's stronger. Demonic bloodline. It's indeed hard to control. I better keep an eye on him. Your heaven's Tao has devoured the central region's Qian prefecture, rewarding one stage of cultivation in the Tao realm. The Qian prefecture has finally been devoured by the heaven's Tao. Based on my calculation, within the nine regions, only the ancient region hasn't been penetrated by the heaven's Tao law. Although the heaven's Tao hasn't fully formed yet, there's no rush as long as my cultivation rises and steps into the Tao Yuan realm. With a strong foundation in my cultivation, I can slowly gather the heaven's Tao into its full form. Could it be other than the blood fiends? There are other great tribulations coming? Hmm. What is this? Hey, hey. Look. The blood fiend race seems to be going through some changes. Ah. The enemies are getting stronger. This won't do. We won't be able to hold on. Retreat. Create some distance. The blood fiend aura created by the blood rain is it making the blood fiend race even more berserk than before. Things have become more troublesome. The blood fiend race will be even harder to fend off. The aura of the ley line is opened. Is the sacrificial Tao formation going to begin? All according to plan, the blood fiend race are being lured towards the ley line. But, is this really worth it? Sending people towards the ley lines of the southern region and forcefully activating them, luring all of the blood fiend race that are in the eastern region over, then finally we will detonate the ley lines and destroy the majority of the blood fiend race. This is definitely a suicidal attempt. Although the people we sent are people who are near death from their longevity ending or heavy injuries, they are still an important part of the fighting force of the eastern region once they are gone. The eastern region will definitely suffer from a deficit of manpower. However, this is also the eastern region's only hope, or else the eastern region will definitely fall under the fierce attacks of the blood fiend race. But there is another solution. What do you guys think the young lady of the Luo family will do? Will she become soft-hearted and abandon the entire plan? After all, giving up the eastern region is a way to survive. Humph, if Chining gave up on the eastern region, even if I can stay alive, I wouldn't follow her. Someone without courage like her is not worth following. Chining from the Luo family, let me see how bold you are. Seniors of the eastern region. Fellow warriors who did not hesitate to sacrifice yourselves and fought till the end for the eastern region. I, Chining, sincerely thank everyone. This is a battle for the entire human race. I, Chi Ning, am the only one, no. In this battle, identity is not important. What's important is that we gather the strength of everyone in the eastern region and wholeheartedly fight against the enemies. No matter what the future will be, as long as we get through the Great Tribulation, I believe. I also hope all of you will believe. Our eastern region will only grow stronger once again. Everyone don't have to worry about the ley lines. Once everything's over, I will definitely give them a proper burial. I might be young, but please believe in me. I will not let everyone's sacrifice go to waste. I will definitely lead the eastern region to rise once again. That's why, everyone within the ley lines, please go ahead and die. Ha ha ha. I like this little fellow. The future of the eastern region will be in your hands.